His name is Thomas Middleditch. Oh. Tommy Middle D. That's right. Thomas Middleditch is back. <laughs> the uh, cutting room floor. Oh, singing along. I love it. Baseball legend Raleigh Fingers fingered me in Raleigh. Welcome to <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang. <laughs> Thank you to Horse for a Brother. <laughs> wonderful, That's great. wonderful name for that catchphrase submission. Hello, early mornings. Early morning, bang bang. Early morning, bang bang. Hey, look, is this early? Yeah, well, it's early for us. You, you know, the listeners probably listening to it early in the morning. So yeah. why shouldn't we record early in the morning? Like right? That. Yeah, you're you know. Right. So ten, 10 a.m. Crack of dawn. <laughs> well, <laughs> my name is Scott Ackerman, and uh, welcome to the show for another week. And uh, I have two great guests who have never been on the show together, and yet they do a show together. Every month at Largo in in LA, mm. and uh, I thought that, uh, well, I, and this is all my idea. Oh, really? I thought, uh, hey, why not have these guys on together? Oh, that's oh. a funny idea. I thought it happened. Is that how it happened? It did happen with. Why don't I do one with Thomas? I don't believe so. I think that. Uh, oh. The germ of the idea was planted in my head by oh, wow. me just being smart. Oh, okay. Oh, smart and tort. <laughs> smart and tort. I get to the gym and get real tort and I smart. I tort and I make my tort tight. Oh, man, your tort is so tort. My tort is tight. <laughs> and I got tight hammies. Is this a rap song? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you want to hear it with the beat or you <laughs> yeah, fine? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, let's hear it. Ready? <laughs> My tort is tort and my tort is tight. My tight tort is torty tonight. And when I'm torting tight and tightened with torts, you better hop in because I'm tightening your tort. I got hammies that go all the way up. And I want to see your motherfucking butt. I got tort and tight and tight and tort. So get off your back and get on my shorts. <laughs> Very not. Wow, that's a number one hit. Number it is. one hit. We just already hit. Yeah, you did it. Yep. Oh, we have a song about being a number one hit. Hit that your beat. Hit that beat. We got a song for being number one hit. Do you like hits? So do I. Put those hits in the sky. And if you open up your thighs. I'm going to climb inside. Okay. Guys, can I talk to you for one yeah. second? Yeah. So, is everything good? Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Do we have another number one? <laughs> you had a number one hit single. Yes. Okay. And then the follow-up, I got to say, you just rush released it. You never even checked with anyone. No. Really? Uh, of yeah, not. Usually We're artists. We don't need to check with anyone. You have to go We're through the, the record label and the PR departments and just at least a simple quality don't control. don't let us do what we want. We yeah. want to have these pauses. Heck no, dude. We want the <laughs> Did real you say music. Techno or heck no? Techno, techno, dude. Techno, heck no. <laughs> <laughs> Go home, electronic music. Oh, oh freak out. Bam, 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 bam. Techno. Techno. Bam, 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 bam. Okay, this, this for real happened. Okay, mm -hmm. on the, uh, when I was coming over the border. For once, real? When I was coming over the border from Canada to the U.S., mm -hmm. someone said, okay. the, the Border Patrol guy uh, pulled me to the side. He's like, okay, I have to do more searching on wow. you, well, you mm -hmm. and your vehicle. You wow. know, because when you. And when he said vehicle, did he mean your butthole? <laughs> Yeah, and for real, uh, yeah, Whoa. he tried to get. I'm sorry, in. I was. Can I? He was making a in. joke. Did he? Really? Hold on one second. I was making a joke, and he, you, no, he tried to get in. You flinched like you had been triggered. Yeah, I'm telling you, he tried to get in. I'm so sorry. And I my hole in my hunger, and I said no, and I stopped and I screamed Jesus, and he kept going. Oh my so God. then I reached for his gun and I got it out and what? I shot him. And I, no. I shot him again and again and again. No. You shot a police officer? A border patrol. Border patrol. And there was, <sighs> then three more came out. No. And they were like, oh, you're not done yet. We're going to get in that bunger, too. They wanted to get in the bunger? <laughs> Wait, said, even oh. after seeing what you did to the first yeah, one? Yeah, and I only had two bullets and three <sighs> guys. So, so what did you do? Two of them. Uh -huh. And then the one guy came oh, after no, me. No, Thomas. He just started saying the right things and kissing me in all the right spots. Oh, well, and that's then nice. I let him get my bunger. Okay. <laughs> so three men died, but one person got in your bung. Yeah. It sounds justified yeah. to me. They didn't say the right things well, and kissed you in the right because places. Because I let one guy get in, mm -hmm. yeah. I was let 
Uh, let go. You were let go. Yeah. Oh. One bunger gets you off of three deaths. Oh, yeah. If you're ever in a jam. <laughs> That's like a get out of jail that bunger. Three. Let, let that bunger. I was going to say get out of jail three because of the three That's deaths. funny. Get, That's have funny. you seen get, get Out of Jail three? Who's yeah, in there? I have. Oh, it's amazing. Oh, uh, Kevin Hart. Well, oh, yeah. It's good. Uh, the Rock didn't return. Everywhere. He did one and two, but okay, then he was he like, I, 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 gotta, "I gotta take it's one Bruce off." It's Bruce Willis, and uh, Bruce that Willis part and is Kevin kind of Hart. a bummer. Okay. Yeah. yeah, is a bunger or a bummer? And he said, uh, "That's very funny." Thanks, no, buddy. it is a bummer. Okay, got it. Well, you flinched again when he said bunger. Oh no! What uh, happened? Something, like, something else happened with Kevin Hart. Something else happened during with Kevin this movie. Hart? Kevin Hart. Um, so he and I are voices in an upcoming animated film. Sure, sure of Captain course. Underpants. Of course, Captain course. Underpants, right? Based on the Scholastic series. Sure, sure, of course. Yeah. So we were doing a voiceover. Um, this is not too recent. Over what, by the way? What? You were doing a voice over voiceover. what? Coffee? Over lunch? <laughs> no, we were just doing That's what like, you're going for, right? Yeah. This, this, like, this is kind of a voiceover. Like, this is a voiceover. Putting your voice on a microphone. And oh, recording your voice. I thought it was just sure. recording. Okay. I thought. But it's well, a, okay, we were recording our voice. Okay, okay that's and better. We were in a... Uh, the uh, the DreamWorks Sound Studio. Sure. Mm, love it. And uh, he said, hey... Oh, you, God. I don't want to come off as inappropriate. Oh, no. It's sure. Kevin Hart's. Sure. Okay. Kevin you, Hart. When someone the says, hey, you don't want to say, Jumanji. I'm going to stop you right there. Yeah, no. It's you want to let him hey, continue. Yeah. 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 He's a star. You're going to let him talk. Yeah, he said, yeah. look, all, all this session for our recording session, yeah. I've been eyeing that bunger. Kevin Hart oh, said to Thomas Bennett, I've been no. eyeing that bunger. Yeah, and I thought, oh, my God, not it's again. Happening. This is after wow. that. Wow. Yeah, the yeah, next yeah. day, was, was it the next day or no? No, no. It was years later. The Border Patrol thing was years, years ago. ago. So you had time to get over it and finally get normal again. Yeah, I was going through therapy. I went sure. through, hey, I shot the Border Patrol. I shot the Sheriff uh, Anonymous. I shot the Sheriff. I, went through, I shot the Sheriff Anonymous. Anonymous. Me. Yeah. And uh, anyway, he said that, and I just started crying. I was oh, weeping. Shit. I was a wow. real mess. Fuck. He didn't make any moves. Kevin's he didn't. like that. He's so okay. He's, so he's, nice. he's polite. He's, he's very polite. He's a he, dude. he put it out there, sure, and who wouldn't? I, mean, I, don't, I don't know if you've seen my bunger. I'd, I'd love to. <laughs> Let's check it out. Is that that big of a deal? Do you mind yeah, if we just check it out? Do you mind if we just check it out? Well, you know what's weird? When you've been through so much, you actually uh-huh. it like, kind of desensitizes. But then so maybe you're just, fine with it. Okay, yeah, so maybe just, like yeah, a sneak peek. Just okay, like a sneak peek. Okay, yeah. Okay, take down your pants. Holy shit. Why did it make that noise? That is so disgusting. What was that? What was that noise? There's a couple things in there. What? It looked like a tongue came out and licked around your ass. Yeah, yeah do you? It, bunger, please. I'm sorry, bunger. I'm sorry, 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 sorry. Wait, you have a complete, like, you have like a monster m- mouth? You have a monster mouth down there. Inside yeah. your bunger? Yeah. I I probably shouldn't be saying this on the on a podcast. On, in a VO session. In a VO session, not for the internet. Right, but, of course. Uh, I actually am paid by the government to house extraterrestrials. Don't say this, Thomas. Oh, Do not fine. say this. It's How okay, much do they you know pay what? you? Eighteen dollars an hour. Whoa! <laughs> really? Wait, and so yeah. you're making money while you sleep? Yeah, that's the thing. It's, it's twenty four hours a day. Are there any negatives? Know. So far, the only negative I see is that a tongue comes out and licks your entire ass. It does. It eats half of what I eat. So it's kind of like a stay away, Yeah, it's sort of like a Japanese toilet, though, in a way. You know, well, take, just me like, cl- take me through that. Well, you know how it cleans your your butthole. Is yeah. it, I bet it's very bunger, sanitary. Bunger, yeah, please, bunger, 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 please. It cleans my bunger, but it also needs to have waste. Sure. And so the its waste comes out of my bunger. Oh, so you get double. The amount of waste. I get double so, waste. So you have like two streams. Bunger. Yeah. So it's sort of like a soft two swirl. Two waste, one bung. No, no, no. Not like not Is like it, that it's sort of the mix. vanilla mixer. <laughs> it's no, the it's swirl. No. Oh, it's no. one. It's one then. It, it's well. I mean, oh, it, it only have, it didn't give me a, an, an additional. Bunger. I see. It so gave it's, me a bunger within a bunger. How right. do the, how then do you separate your poop from? Thank its you. Poop? Thank you, Scott. I, I I do like to know whose poop. Of course. Sure. Because you pick it out of the toilet. You have to go to the bathroom night. Well, I and I also keep a log book. Well, also you know that's funny. Log is a pun for. For uh, shit, yeah. so that's, oh, that's funny. I didn't even think about that's that. That's so funny. Run with that. Run with that. Okay. Well, yeah. maybe I'll draw a little, you know, a little, turd a little log on, the front. on it. Yeah, that would be it. so that's fun. Pushing it, but it's maybe cute. some ants it's like it, doing the sort of like they're balancing on the log. Yeah. That's funny. That's you could also do like bit. fake reviews on the cover of the book. Oh, I like that. Like AO AO shits gives it four out of five things. Yeah, that would be really fun. That's fun. Um. So, but you can tell the difference even if they mix. Oh, what? How can you tell? Thank you, Scott, for asking. So now I know what your shit looks like. We all know what your shit looks like. Yeah, we all know. Yeah, you can watch. Every we day. watch Silicon Valley. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We've seen you shit on the show. Yeah. yeah. So, <clears throat> well, um, the aliens' waste uh, is a little bit bubbly. It's bubbly, um, like wow. it's carbonated. Carbonated or? shit. 
it bubbled. Did you see Princess Bride? Of course. Uh, yes. Anybody I mean, want great a peanut? Film. First of all, uh, Mandy Patinkin, love one him. of his best, best roles. I love mean, it. people love him as Saul on Homeland. Great, but? But Inigo Montoya, I think uh, one of Celluloid's greatest heroes. I agree, by the way. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Don't they go to a kind of a fart swamp? I don't know. I, 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 I turned it off it? after the first two minutes. Okay. I think so you gave Mandy, Mandy's performance off a trailer you saw? Uh, you can just tell that okay. he's amazing, but that film is not for me. Not for you. Give yeah. me one of your films that you do watch. Because you almost ever you said Forrest Gump. You saw the first part where he was a kid. You don't know how it ended. Yeah, I, I love it when he was a kid because I'm like, ha look at that little cripple boy. And right. then uh, I just gets... turned it off. I was like, yeah, I get this. Okay. He's a lifetime of misery. Is there any movie you saw? No, it was through? actually a lifetime of... He was. He actually. Yeah, he's crippled. Of, he's crippled. He has a bad time. No, he, he, he he went to college football. Sure, as a cripple. No, no, he no. at one point <clears throat> breaks out of his crippledness. <laughs> now that's funny. It's not supposed no, to be funny. No, he literally <laughs> breaks out of the. Cripple. He has these leg that braces and he ridiculous. breaks out. He runs out. What of is them. this like a modern fable or something? That doesn't Kinda. make any In sense. In a sense, yeah. Oh, okay, no, I, I don't. Well, that's is there a movie you did see all the way through? Yeah, um, you know that one with the train coming towards the audience. The first movie ever made. Yeah, yeah, I love that one. I got so scared. I was like, ah. Right. Okay. I just uh, ran out of the theater. I never looked back. Okay. Uh, yeah, I saw that yesterday. You, that was the first movie you saw. <laughs> yeah, was first that one yesterday? Saw, well, well I, I've seen the first two minutes of a lot of films. Right. Oh. Uh, yeah. But uh, yeah, love. I love uh, just films in general and celluloid. Celluloid mainly. I uh, love just celluloid. Oh, okay. It's very flammable. Oh, you like burning so they're not even yeah. watching. You oh, like yeah. To feel uh, the touch and the burn. No, I'll go into. Remember that uh, fire at the Universal Studios vault? That was me. That was wow. mine. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah, destroyed some pretty good ones. Guys, we're saying a lot of stuff that the government should not know about. A lot of people, you know, they don't realize knee starts with a K. That's funny. Isn't it funny? They think it's just N-E-E. That's crazy. Isn't that weird how many people think that? How do you know? Where do you get the stat from? Where is this coming from? (laughs) This is from weirdstatistics.com. Weirdstatistics.com. Weirdstatistics. Farmersonly.com. Oh, you like farmers only. You used to be a farmer, uh, you were telling me. I got so much snatch from farmers So much farmer pussy? Yeah, dude. Really? Dude, those farmer girls... Love it. Hmm. Farmer ever, girls, they got, got it going on. They Guys, can I talk to you about your follow-up to your number two single? What's yeah. up? Okay, first of all. Nailed it, we're back. <laughs> we're back. <laughs> Neither of you knew the lyrics, it seemed. You kind of both mumbled. Uh, I don't know. Na- literally Farmer name girls. any song and we could sing it. Name any famous song any and we could do a song? cover of okay. it. Okay, yeah. uh, how about uh, yesterday. yesterday? Yesterday by the Beatles. Here we go. Start it up, Thomas, whenever okay. you're ready. Ding, 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 ding. Yesterday, yesterday, the Beatles. Okay, let me stop you there. Uh, Most songs have more lyrics than just the title of the song and then the artist. We'll give another song. Stop being weird. Yeah, you're being Uh, you're being you're being a fucking bunger right now. Blue suede shoes by Elvis. Got it. Bing ding 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 Okay, guys, can I first say, at least you sort of did an Elvis impersonation at the end of that. We did not. <laughs> the Wonder so, Years. One of us. One yeah, of we're, you did. <laughs> we're doing. Wait, what, the I Wonder was, Years? You think a, that. I was doing an impression of the Wonder Years. Yeah, so was I. <laughs> wait, the Wonder Years, the TV show? The TV program, yes. sure. The program. So you were. Uh, wait a minute, who's this now? The television program. Oh, I like this. The Wonder Years. Have you ever heard us doing audiobooks? I would love to hear this. Do you guys do audiobooks together? Yeah, we oh, do. Oh, this it. is crazy. Do you do that for uh, new books, old books? Uh, Scholastic mostly. Yeah. Oh, okay. Great. So, uh, what do you, yeah, do you have any tapes of you doing yeah, audiobooks? Yeah, this is, or? Okay, I don't know if you guys ever, this is a children's book called um, The Apple in the Sky. The Apple in the Sky. All right, let me turn on the tape. Here we go. <clears throat> Little Timothy loved his apple. But how far away could the apple be? The apple could be a few feet. Maybe the apple could be a meter. Oh, the apple could be a mile. Or okay, hold on. Let me. D- I just want to pause that right that's there. Such, that is a classic. That uh, classic children's bee. I know you guys are just narrating this, but uh, I have to say the writing itself is not. First of all, why is it two different voices doing it back and forth? We tag team in the it. actual book. Just no, like we do our them. impro shows. Yeah. We tag team. Oh, okay. these books. So yeah. when it's written, it's actually just one voice, but you guys want to do it just two separate voices. They, hey, look, we've been hired by Audible.com, and mm-hmm. they. Really? Yes. How much are they paying you? 
$65,000 per word. Per word? Yeah, we're making bank on this. Oh, my God. So you're making, tw- uh, what was it, $18 an hour for the monster in your... That's just uh, my side hustle. I'm getting my side hustle on. Right. Seems almost like why are you doing yeah, it? Why you're do barely you getting need... paid for that, and you're getting paid so I much for this audiobook. I love animals. They don't have to be from Earth for me to love them. I mean, yeah, it is true. like $400 a day, which is, you know, not a bad gig. I mean, That's cash money. That's true. That's real. That goes right in your pocket. You know, every pocket, 10 days. And it's from the government. 4, it's tax free. Oh, that's true. You don't even have to take taxes on it. It's yeah. actually more money, I think, than the scholastic thing. Yeah, there's because, so much taxes. Because let's see how many more words you have. Ready? Here. The end. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's uh, it's six, still not more money. No. $65,000 per word. You had probably no. 25 words in that whole book. Yeah. And you guys got to split it. This is, yeah, this uh, the monster in your, your booter. <laughs> way, way, better. way, way better. That's way, way better. That's way better money. Fun. It's going to be a it, bunger. You know, yeah. My bing bonger. Yeah, a bunger. Hey, what mm-hmm. happens if someone wants to play with your bunger for any reason? Let's to say, get in, let's like say on a, 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 a girl a uh, wants woman. to play yeah, so with let's, your bunger. Let's set the scene, okay? So she doesn't know. Yeah, Do you want to be the girl or do you want to be you? You're... What do you mean, be a girl? Uh, let's take her through the scenario. Do you want to be the girl going to your bunger, or do you want to be you? What happens if in I be time? the girl? Who are you? Me? I do a pretty good impression of you. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I'll be okay. the girl. So let's set the scene. Uh, ben, uh, you're I'm playing play Thomas. Thomas He's stepping out on his wife. He's got a <laughs> side piece going. Okay. Yeah, I okay. got my side hustle on. Yeah, okay. right. Okay. So and I'm going to where I usually find. Oh, I'm entering a GameStop. Uh, <laughs> hi, hi guys. Um, oh, you're a fancy, you're a fancy girl. What's your name? Um, my name is Trishiana. Hey, Trishiana. I'm I I I'm a gamer girl, but I'm also really sexy. Oh. Why don't we go to the back and mess around? Yeah. Do you want to watch Splinterheads first, or this is fine? <laughs> I'd love to watch Splinterheads. Splinterheads, the movie where uh, I starred in it with Rachel Taylor. I Taylor, believe. yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, well, we can put that Hi on guys. the background. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm going to have to ask you to get out of the store if you're not going to buy anything. Is that Ben anything. Schwartz? Yeah, hi, I'm Ben Schwartz. What are you doing uh, here? Well, I work here. Uh, things have not been going great for me. Uh, okay. My uh, show, House of Lies, got canceled. Oh. And, uh, you know, I, that I was all I had. I you were on that show, um, Shameless. I Yeah, I wish I was on that show, Shameless. Really? You yeah. do? Oh, man. So oh. much better. Okay. But uh, anyway, so I work here at the GameStop Isn't now. Shameless but- just sort of like on... Yeah, I, I feel mean, like we're getting off topic. <laughs> look, I feel like I we're mean, getting yeah, off it's topic. No, it's no Silicon Valley. Well, that's the truth. What look, is, though? Guys, so, guys, I like you too, Mr. Schwa. And, um, wait, you like the band you too, or you? No, I like you oh, as well. Oh, okay. You, you like, oh, do you I like hate the Tom. band you as well? Yeah. I don't like the band you as well. Okay. okay. But do you guys both want to mess around? Hey, do you mind if we go in your. Hey, hey, do you mind if we go in your office and do it up? Wait. It's me, Thomas Middleditch. Do you mind if we go to your Why did you suddenly change your voice? Yeah, well, because been Thomas I Middleditch. got the girl, and now I oh, can that, finish wait, her so off. so all the blood is rushing to your boner. Yes, I have a very funny boner. It looks like one of those okay. Tetris pieces. Oh, um, I can see it right now. Wait, it's which huge. one? The one? No, you're looking it's at my massive. hand. No, you're, you're hand way too pocket. close to it. Step back my to my perspective. Yeah, oh, wow, it's even bigger. Step a little bit further away. And see. Okay. And 10 more minutes. Is that how you guys met? Wait, we never even got to the what it looks like when I see that asshole. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, I don't okay. know, man. And scene starts again. Okay, come to my office. Op- can we use your office? Yeah, come on in. All right, right. wow, this is a nice office. It's nice. Hey, this is what I usually do. Do you want to get it? You want to get it? Yeah. Uh, but I want to give it first. I want to look at that bunghole. Oh, you're dirty. You want to look at my bang Wait, huh? you, Okay, what do I do while you guys are doing this? You um, diddle yourself in the little corner, and if you have to pee, just go in the waste paper okay, basket. Okay, I, I do have to pee right now. Okay, so. then pee now, but Ben. But pee here. Pee, okay, yeah. now that's getting me hard. Yeah. Males peeing gets me real hard. You yeah. want to see that bing bong? Yeah. Sure okay, now I'm taking down my pants. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, my God. There's a tongue. Do it. Do it. My favorite thing is when women stick both of their hands in my assholes and say lines from my shows into my own bunger. Uh, go, say it. Um, That's not an algorithm. This is an algorithm. Oh, one more. Give me something from a different show. There's something. Um, uh, Anything I've said. Uh, The campaign. God. God. Oh, oh God. That was God. a good pee. Whoa. Big pee, Ben. Oh, my gosh. Oh. And, and 10 more minutes. Guys, it's going terribly. This, is it really? <laughs> well, speaking of going terribly, we need to go to a break. Yes. You know perfect. what I mean? You know yeah. what I'm saying when I mean go to the break? You want to sing go to I've the break? I've actually song? I've used promo codes before from various PCasts. Have you really? Have you yeah. used mine? Um, um maybe MeUndies. 
Oh, MeUndies? Have you, you been doing MeUndies? Me I, I I've got MeUndies me undies on right now. Really? I, I think I have MeUndies no, 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 on right are now. Are these MeUndies? I don't know. Let's take a look. <laughs> Is that a MeUndie? I don't know. It could be a, I think it might be a MeUndie. I have also have, I got uh, a, one of the wine clubs. That's from um, mm-hmm. uh, Savage, Dan Savage. Mm-hmm. Dan Savage. Mm-hmm. What, why are you listening club. to uh, Dan Savage? What, I only listen, what do you, I listen what do you need hand? help with in your life? Well, for- I thought, oh, yeah, I used to enjoy it. When I used to, lived in Toronto, I used to enjoy his articles. And now I uh, I thought, well, let's listen to a podcast. Mm-hmm. So what's it's going fine. on in your life that you're like, oh, this is advice I need? I don't know. It was a long road trip. He does a lot of, like, it's very, when you're into, like, you're, sex. You're getting very defensive about this. Wait, when, when you're, you're into, into sex? Like, sex identification there's I've realized there's so many terms like some someone will call and then he'll be like yes uh, that's a that's a, a sub you know mm-hmm. sub inger or something like that sub inger there's some like there's some oh, term like a for you like any yeah a cis right. sub you know what would you classify yourself man. as uh, I, I believe I'm a cis white male a cis white what does that puss. mean cis I cis white puss is that what you said it. yeah I don't understand You're, you what have a cis, cis white puss because doesn't cis sound like sissy yeah so then why is it's it's cis guy. it's cisgender yeah, what does cisgender mean? Uh, look, I don't have time to explain this to you. <laughs> no one knows. We are <laughs> being called it, and we don't know what it is. <laughs> I love it though. I, I don't. I, I love I, it. I get to be. I'm the nor. I'm this. I'm the standard. So I get to just be. You male. get to be normal. I just no, I just wait, get, you I don't think get, that I you're normal. I don't get you're to be standard. normal. I don't get to be quote unquote normal. I just get to be a guy. You get to I be like I don't, I don't have to be cis white guy. I get to be guy. You everything just, else because everything else is is weird and different. No. Not that everything it's else. It's just you start at A Shh. and then you go sub A A B B B B A A. This is gonna get in trouble. A. Yep, sorry, Thomas, but you're getting I more care. tweets about this than anything yeah, you've ever done. True. You better watch out, <laughs> including whatever that GameStop thing. And you, you had did. a chance. He was going to a break. You could easily cut uh, yeah. this part out if oh, you want. Oh no! Oh no! You this can is save all right now. You and can keep it out. in. Oh whoa! Dan Savage. When you listen to this, you can... And you, we know you're listening, Dan Savage. Danny, we know you're listening. We know about you. <laughs> All right, let's sing the Going to the Break song. Here we go. Going to the break. Going to a break. Going to a break. We'll be right back with more comedy bang bang after this. <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, we are back here with uh, with uh, no one, actually, uh, because Ben and Thomas had to leave. Very rude. Very, very rude. But uh, we uh, always have backup guests in case this happens, and today is no exception. We have uh, – he's an entrepreneur – which is very interesting. I'm always interested in small business. I don't. I don't know whether you have a small business or a large business at this yeah. point. You okay. could have uh, uh, Thomas Middleditch was uh, uh, is a cast member of Silicon Valley. Maybe you have one of those uh, internet startups. <laughs> uh, no, no, you don't. I okay. don't real, uh, Well, I th- I would like to have a website at one point. You don't even have a website. This is this is a very I'd small love business. To then you have a website, but I don't know how to make one. Oh, okay. Well, you know, if Thomas were here, uh, he knows how to do those things, being yeah. the uh, lead of Silicon Valley. But uh, he's not, and you are, so let's get to it. Let's introduce you. Uh, he is an entrepreneur of a small business, I'm guessing. Please welcome Alan Buchanan. Hello, oh. Alan. Hi. Thank you so much for having me on here. Yeah. My name is Marcus Quiddlebit. You're, you're what? Marcus Quiddlebit. Marcus Quiddlebit? Yes. Okay. I'm famous for trying to become a superhero by being bitten by either a spider or rolling in toxic waste. Maybe you've seen my pictures. So the difference is the jazz jelly zippers. No! Damn it! How much money? Damn it! I owe him $60,000! Whoa! This what are you going to do? Fantastic. What Mr. Are you gonna Ackerman, do? I can't tell it. you. I was about to lose my oh, home. Oh, God. All I, right. I, had, I was default on my mortgages in my home Where in Arizona. Is your home? Look, Where in is your Arizona. Home? In Arizona. Is it in a river or no? <laughs> it's by a river. <laughs> okay. okay, look, look. We need to take a break thank to pay you. for this. Ackerman, thank well, you. Okay, look. Uh, we'll be right back with uh, Alan Buchanan and Mark. Marcus Quiddlebit. We'll be right back. <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang. We're back here. We have entrepreneur Alan Buchanan, and uh, 
he I, um, he's independently wealthy at this point from <laughs> from me. This is the most money I've ever had in in, in one go. Yeah. I went to a, a casino in uh, Nevada, not Vegas. It was a side casino. Mm-hmm. And I walked away with about $78 right. uh, plus this netted. Quite a bit more. Oh, wait, netted. Net. When you say netted, do you, how do you mean? You, you the, paid the taxes right then and there? In the black. In the black. I see. I see. Uh, and I did a uh, blackjack. It was fun, but it was a bit scary. This one was exhilarating, yeah. and the profits are. Well, here you go. Here's a couple of duffel bags uh, wow. with Jesus your money. Jesus Christ! In. Yeah. How do you get so much money? Yeah. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Are you sure? I look. Unless I want to take it, but I, I, I unless mean, we do it double or nothing at some point. Uh, but I can't imagine that'll happen. Of uh, course, we also have Marcus Quiddlebit here, who is ninety four years old. Ninety four years young. Going to be sperm in about a week. I got a week left before I turn into sperm. And can I tell you my story? Maybe that is your superpower. By the the way, ability I, to at one point turn irreversibly turn irreversibly into, into sperm. sperm. Yeah, and we think it'll be irreversible. I'm gonna keep fighting when I'm sperm. I don't think that the fight yeah. ends when you're sperm. No, the you, fight just begins. Some you, say if there's an egg in front of you. Can mm-hmm. I tell you? Yeah, I want to hear your story, and I also want to hear how you were burned. But uh, oh. if, Marcus, you go ahead with your story. I was, I was four years old. And I look like I was 125. So this is 90 so, years ago. This was back in years the tw- ago. This is like in the the 20s or the 30s. I just want to also say mm. there's some logic to be said that if you were four and looked 125, that you have approximately 129 years on Earth. You may not be sperm next week. You what? you never know. You, yeah, what? that's true. Yeah, so you, you mu- know exactly the day I'm going to die. Well, I'm just going off of some logic. Do you know what that means? That means that you're my villain. What? That means that you're my fucking super villain. I Wait, you're, you, you 100% are. are. You've taken all this money from Scott. You look at me right in the eyes and I, you're telling me you know when I'm going to die and you're I, saying that you're not my villain? I don't. Sounds I, pretty villainous. All I, you know is that people die in rivers and you pretend like you don't even care. I have, hey, Wait a minute. I there is something jams. specific. Ab- you make jams in death. There's no, something suspicious is what I meant to say. Crotch syndrome. About W-C-S. everyone dying in these rivers. What? What? How did all these people die in these rivers? Yeah. One fell and drowned. Okay. The other coughed and couldn't stop coughing. Okay. Couldn't stop coughing. Died. And as they lay down, they lay down in a bed, and then the bed slipped into the <laughs> Sounds river. Sounds very okay. suspect. All right. And the other one who died on the ba- on the boat said, look at me, I'm the captain, I'm the captain now. I remember those were her last words. <laughs> that was, wait, from Captain, captain Phillips? Phillips? Yes, yes. That's evil. And then had a heart attack, a cardiac arrest, heart failure. Sure, no, we know the various it's the heart ways. The yeah. heart stops beating. <laughs> yeah, no, we know exactly how this works. These are very way. convenient deaths. And then passed away there on the boat. Name one more time someone has ever passed away around you, because I have a feeling it's going to be weird and made up. No one else has passed away around me. No one else. No one else has died? Well, I had a lizard when I was eight How did the old. lizard die? Well, also in the fire? or I never said it was a fire. I thought you said you were burned. You can get burned through other means. Oh, wait, did, like a cold burn? No. Like a chemical burn? No. Like a cold Thor? My step- Stop making us guess. Just tell us. I will. My stepfather, as a practical joke, and now in hindsight, I can say it was funny. Okay, you see the humor in this. Is he alive? No. How did he die? He Drowned in a swimming pool, so that's different. Where was the swimming pool? Adjacent to a river. <laughs> you okay, have to this stop is... this. You are a villain. I am not. How I did am you get a burned? man with WCS. <laughs> Let me tell you how my story started, because it may tie into how this guy okay. got burned. Okay, yeah, I'd like to hear I this. I promise you it will it not. It may have. Okay. If it you... does it, don't blame me. Okay, wait. Let's do it in 60 seconds, though. I, don't, I only need 30. I'll get 30. He gets 30. Okay, so 30 for 30? Okay. So Let's do a 30 for 30. All right, here we go. program. All right, here Great we go. program. Ready Tell me and go. go. I was four years old. I acted like I was way, way older. And I saw my dad. We were walking down the street, and all of a sudden, someone pushed him into a river. And he watched him in the river and said, ooh, that looks fun and sweet. A river runs through it. Looked me in the eyes and said, you're next. How much time do I have? You have 20. Uh, you're at 20, so you have 10 more. And then he looked at me one last time and said, I got to go get to my jams. 
Whoa, that's time. Let's hear how you got burnt. Okay, yeah. Well, first now, of all, hold on. I've only been a jam enthusiast and a jam maker for the past three years. Oh, okay. So that's coincidental. I see what you're trying and to how, do. And uh, how long ago was this? I mean, it must this have been 90, how many years ago? Well, but you, you were- 89 years 89 ago. 89 years ago. Well, are you sure it was 89 years ago because your time was? Oh, backwards. I don't know. It could be anything. No, it no, you been, said you No, are, I think it could have been anything. No, <laughs> I think you're right. No, you don't said get excited. you're I think 93 years old. Oh my God, it could have happened old. a couple weeks ago. Yeah, that's what I'm Could saying. The no. day that he got burnt. You, it's yeah, in, that's no. what I'm saying. Is no. you take oh. me through it? What happened? Start the clock. And by the way, if you old. can do it in 30 seconds or less, I'm going to give you ten thousand dollars per second. Oh my god, this oh, is huge wow. for you. If you want to risk, uh, sure. Yes. Wait, why didn't I get any money? <laughs> because you, you, you never asked. Fuck. All right, ready? I, to be honest, did not ask either, <laughs> no. but I will take it. <laughs> gotta just give the money away. So, $10,000 per second. You got $300,000 oh, on the line. If, if you want to risk your $60,000. I, and, and I'm to tell you how my armpits were burned. Yes. yes. All right. And how it has <laughs> nothing to do with me. All right, here I we go. And I think the audience will make that conclusion. And go. Well, uh, when I was seven, my stepfather decided to play a fun practical joke, which in hindsight is now very funny. He held me down. He said... He said, Alan, you little turd, this is what I do to turds. And he held up my arms and he, po- he poured boiling water on my armpits and, the bur- and it burned my skin so severely it sealed them up. Damn it! God damn it! I am so sorry. God damn it! $300,000! <laughs> Here, let me get the extra two hundred forty thousand, Mister Ackerman. What is this go. from? Where do Mr. you get this Ackerman. money from? Thank you so Sorry. much. Well, you know, I have some go bags. The go bags. Yeah. Thank you. So this is incredible. Are you sure? I'm sure. Yeah, a deal's a deal. I don't welch on a deal. Uh, Ooh, Welch's grape. Mm. Welch's make terrible jams. Oh, uh, why? Whoa, 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 whoa! Sit down. Sit down. They're known for their bad, poor quality, and and they use that high fructose corn syrup. Can All my jams, something? jellies, and preserves are natural. Okay. Can I okay. tell you something? Okay. When I make a peanut butter sandwich every single day, and I put jelly on top, I use Welch's. You're a, f- you're a fool. You're a please, fool. Please, please. This is gratis. All of you, gratis. Okay. My jams. My Gratis, jellies. you just got paid two hundred fifty thousand. dollars yeah. Yes, but oh, not I would for the hope jams. so. I would not hope for the so. Jams. Not Still, for the jam. To be free. fair, not for the jam. By the way, you try that jam on your sandwich. How do I know you didn't poison it like you poisoned my dad? I didn't poison your father. I don't know who he is. Fine, please. Guess can his I... name. Guess his name. Uh, Saltoid. His name is Saltoid. No. His name is Saltoid. <laughs> Guess his middle be. name. Wait. <laughs> Have you ever met a man named Saltoid before? No, I made up, I tried to Go. say the wackiest name I could his think of. His middle name is very normal. That's the wackiest normal. name you can Say his of. middle name. If you get this right, then I know you killed him. Uh, tiki 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 Tembo, Tiki Tembo, Tembo Nota Rambo, Cherry Berry, Pippi Pembo. You son of a bitch. That's impossible. That is a child story about a Chinese boy with a very long name. Give it to me. Give you what? <laughs> the yes, jam. Let me more I will. Information. I have. He, he Listen. wanted to. <laughs> I'm going to turn into a sperm and I'm going to burrow into your head. And I'm going to take you all can't. of the memories. That's not how sperm works. <laughs> yes, my sperm is going to go into your head and steal your memories. Sir, That's you not are how sperm works. Charles, enough. porn would be very disturbing to watch. Can I please tell my story about how I made love to a woman <laughs> from a candle store? Yes. What? And meanwhile, Wait, what? <laughs> yes. That was hours ago. I didn't give get me to the, the jam. end. Give me the jam. Is you want to give us the Jam. There, you. Which would you like, jam, jelly, or preserve? Well, I guess preserve is thicker. Jam is a little bit thick, less, and then jelly is just basically gurbly gap. I would agree with you, but some people like jelly. All right, let's there go. you get a preserve, and you will have a, a jam. A- I'll take the jelly. What's happening? What's happening to me? Nothing. What's Don't be an to asshole. Me? What's happening to me? Nothing is. I'm <laughs> sorry for swearing, but <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> it looks like he's. <laughs> Are sort you? of turning into a sperm? <laughs> I can't tell. Oh, this. <laughs> well, a week has come early, I suppose. <laughs> and I do mean come. <laughs> I don't, I, was that Wait, a joke? Is that I funny? Do that you think funny. that's funny? Oh, it's a talking sperm. Oh, my God. This is put me terrible. in some water. Put me in some water. Put me in some water. Here we no, go. Here. Let them dry out. Put me in some water. Put here. me in some Quickly, quickly. Pour me out. Pour me out. Oh, you son of a bitch. Your jams. 
You're jelly. You're preservative. And that's not true. They're simple. I think it was gems. coincidental. He's, you mentioned you, you were turning yeah. into sperm. <laughs> Mr. Ackerman had a taste of my jam, and he's fine. I'll never now, forget this day for the rest of my life. Can I just tell you my cautionary tale? Please, please tell us the story. When he's done, go. put me in his ear. I know. When he's done, put me you, in his ear. Uh, Mr. Ackerman are quite the ladies' man, and I Certainly. know I want to warn you against something like this. Okay. I, after three long God, years... that sperm is looking good. Oh, man, stop looking at me, Scott. Stop looking at me. Stop playing. Put something in your hand in the water. Please. Scott, don't lift up the glass. Scott, what are you... Scott! Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare oh, drink it. Looks it looks so good. Don't you dare so drink good. it. Okay, no, you, you go ahead. Mr. Ackerman, you are lasciviously <laughs> eyeing a glass of water with a single <laughs> sperm in it. <laughs> And if this is meant to be funny, <laughs> it's I am not meant so to be funny. sorry. I do not get it. I don't understand. Tell it. Us it, your could story. it could be my WCS. What's your story? It could be. Don't blame it on your pissing. It, it's not urine. It's sweat. Shut up. See my scars. Ew. Oh God. Jesus Christ. That's yes. what your father put the boiling water. Stepfather. On it. Stepfather. Now look. It's All the right. surface of the moon in there. Now look. I was intimate with this woman. It had been three years. Did now, you show her your armpits? Mm, well, she saw them when we were topless together. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you, you both got topless at a certain point. Yes, but we still had our bottoms off. <laughs> okay. And then we no tops, but bots. And then we got our we got our bottoms off, and then we proceeded to make love. Was it consensual at this point? Of course. Okay. <laughs> Prove that it was consensual. There's no way to do that at this. Oh, point. Well, I see. Okay. Oh, Classic okay. Classic Cosby. Yeah. No way to do it. There it. We could get her on the phone, but it, it did not Let's end. Let's get her, get on, her the on the phone. Give her. Call. It didn't end. Give her a Please, call. Can, I just, Ryan, where, can her, I just finish? Get her on the phone real quick. Just so you know what you're walking into. Yeah. Let's call her up. I, just please, Scott, yeah. please. Yeah. Do you want What's her name? To, are you just, talking to her? Or please. Talking? You're talking to her? Scott. Yeah, you talk to Scott. her. Scott. Okay. What is her name? T li li I just... When you're with a woman and you have WCS, it's not okay to say, I'm so wet right now. Hello? Hello? Oh. Hey, is this, the, is this the girl from, hello? Oh, yeah, from Candles, Candles Everywhere? Yes. The one who, buys, a, uh, who buys stuff there and yes. tries to make their own candles? I'm here right that's, now with Buchanan. Her. Do you 100%. remember Buchanan? Oh, Buchanan. Hi, hi, it's, oh, hi Linda, well, it's well, me, well. Alan. Hello, Buchanan. May I hello, say? Oh, so, uh, so yeah. finally I get a call out of you, huh? But it's got to be one of your dumb shit friends calling. You were the one that stormed off and said, don't ever... Don't ever sure. sweat inside of me again. Sure. That doesn't well, sound consensual. That doesn't. Maybe I just wanted you to come after me. What? I had no idea. I would have loved that, Linda. I Shut thought you up, were. I'm on the phone. Who's Who's there? Who's home? That's a new man I got, and he's a real man. Oh, and this he is... loves me, and he fucks me good. Hey, he fucks me all night. Do you want to know? Do you want to know what a real man feels like? Hey, wait. Is this Quiddlebit? Yeah. Is this Quiddlebutt? Yeah. 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 <laughs> Linda, oh, yeah? I'll have you know that Quiddlebutt is now a single sperm you in a glass villain. of water. You fucking I'm villain. I'm not a villain. You are she not has a villain. the right to know. Fuck you. A single sperm would be better than what you did to me, you son of a bitch. All I did was get excessively sweating during lovemaking. Oh, he was disgusting, this guy. Can I ask you a question? I don't need was this. Was he sweating I'm... or was he pissing? I couldn't tell, but all of a sudden he just pulled out and sprayed all over me. It There is. There are times when it builds up and it needs to be released. That sounds like piss. <laughs> no, I swear. It sounds like piss. I, swear I don't know why I you. find this funny. It was disgusting. I will have God, the doctor. I'm so glad I'm not a contestant on Make Me Laugh. I would never laugh. I will I will get my doctor on the phone. If we can call make your calls. Doctor. I'll, call okay, I'll three-way him. I'll three-way oh, him. Okay, boom, 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 boom. Doctor, <laughs> Dr. Solomon? Yeah. Hi, uh, I'm is a, this uh, Buchanan? It is, Alan Buchanan. I'm on a radio Hi, show. Hi, I uh, three-wayed you. This is Linda. And also, oh, if you're uh, a doctor, I have some serious questions to have. Uh, yes, <laughs> of all the syndromes to doubt, you doubt my WCS over your Benjamin Button. You disease. villain! Okay. Stop trying to shit on me! Please, Dr. Uh, Solomon, explain to these uh, fine folks that my WCS is not your urine. Well, I have the wisdom of Solomon, and I say that uh, your WCS is, uh, I mean, I, I don't really know. I'd have to uh, apply a taste test. You'd have to, I'd, you have to drink it. You've have done a million point. tests. You informed me years ago that this was sweat. I, yeah, well, I was trying to Are let you... you down easy. 
What are you implying? I'm implying that we don't know whether it's sweat or urine. We've never tasted it. Could it be a third option? It certainly could. It could be a mixture of two uh, poops. You know, I, I may be over $300,000 richer today. Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. You're $300,000 richer? You owe me so much money. I for will. All how much money does he owe you? $299,000. And Linda, how much money does he owe you? He owes me a dollar. So what does that equal together? $300,000. You villain. Uh, how am I a villain? You villain. You owe someone almost $300,000. And Pay up, you deadbeat. And I have grand uh, balances due for my mortgage. I have not lived a nice life. Look, I don't have anything to do with your mortgage. All I know is you owe me $299,000. please pay them in installments? In installments of one, certainly. All right. <laughs> it's a deal? Yes. Okay. What? You just fucked yourself over. What? No, an installment of one of two. Oh, I thought you meant a dollar a day. No. What? A dollar a day. That Sir, be... I have a question. Yes. Uh, is this qu- a quiddle bit? Yes. What's going on, man? Hey, man. How is everything? Oh, everything is so fine. Quick. Fucking Ooh. Dr. Solomon in the house. <laughs> I think I'm going to get a new doctor. <laughs> nope. Yes. Well, you signed you, a contract, no, motherfucker. I, yeah, you did. You That's signed a doctor was? contract. Yeah. Oh. Obamacare, motherfucker. I don't understand. Hey, it's Mark and Quiddlebit. I need yeah. to know how do I reverse from a sperm back to a person because I need to get back into the world and take down Alan Buchanan. Okay, you, do you see any uh, eggs lying around? Yeah, there's one hard-boiled egg next to the jams and preserves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, have have uh, the host of the show pour that in you. Scott, can you pour this on or me? Pour that on top. Oh, wait, you want the actual egg, like a woman's egg? No, no, a, r- a real egg is fine. Okay, here yeah, are... A real know. egg. Okay. Not a fat egg. Not a fat egg. Not a fictional woman's egg. Not a fat egg. Not it's these a, things that they pretend to have a, in order to throw us off yes, the set. Yeah. A cis female. Just because they bleed out of their pussies. Egg. They just they bleed out of their pussies and they want to blame it on something. Hey, hey, Cisgender Linda, egg. shut up. Hey, I'm a sperm. Hey. Linda... Eat a, eat a crow. Whoa! Uh, you know what? I don't have to take this. Good. I didn't want them to call you anyway. Well, if I hang up, then that's going to hang up on Dr. No, Solomon. No, 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 no. I need to know how to turn into a boy. What do All I do? Right. Do yeah. it, Linda, you bitch. No, you fucking asshole. You villain if you make her hang up and I stay a sperm forever. I tried to be kind and courteous to you people. You brought me on your show Thank to make you. fun of me. No! <laughs> Oh, that's the sound of uh, oh, hanging she up. She hung up. Alan Buchanan. I was very quiet during that. I, was I just had the awe. opportunity to turn back into a human being. Well, he said, pour you onto that egg. Do it, Scott. Yeah, pour the egg onto him. Oh, Do it, Scott. He did say that, but I think he might have been mistaken, but I'll pour the egg onto him. I don't know. Do it, Scott. <laughs> Look, do it, I'll Scott. Do, look, I'll do it. I'll do it <laughs> the letter so of the law, the yeah. exact way that he said it. You want it. Trust me. You want to follow Dr. Solomon's orders. <laughs> Dr. Solomon's I suppose <laughs> crack that chicken egg <laughs> All right, and here pour it into that glass of water with a was single... Hard boiled. All right, here we go. Single sperm. Put it on me. <laughs> Is it burning? <laughs> See, we've done the wrong thing. Oh, who could have guessed? <laughs> oh. Whoa. Oh. Wait a minute. Ah. This is a David Lynch movie I in front of us. I didn't do it. I oh, is that Richard no, Nixon, Nixon or something? Don't you say what? Is that Bobby's World? Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure what is happening right now. <laughs> is that Bobby's World? <laughs> Quit a bit! Quit a bit! Quit a bit! What's happening to you? Please! You're scaring everybody! Auga! Auga! Please, sir! Oh my god! Quit a bit? Where am I? <gasps> you're here in this voice. You're here. Studios. You're a real person. You're no longer who sperm. Who are you? Who are you? You don't know who we are. This no. is, he's as dumb as a brand new baby. Oh, uh, what's going on? The dumbest thing in the world. Oh, My name who are is you? Alan Buchanan. What do you do? Currently, I'm trying to get my jam business off the ground. Yeah. I have WCS. Do you have a daughter? Them. Not anymore. How did she die? I believe she was the one that drowned. <laughs> And you with your whole a deal. <laughs> I d- host of Comedy it's, Bang Bang. Uh, do, uh, it's a famous voiceover it's, it's comedy a voiceover hour. thing. <laughs> Why am I here? I, look, that's I a mean, great that's question. Already with the philosophical questions right off the what bat. What am I doing? How old are you? I don't know. I feel 195. Ah. That's well beyond my original guess of 124. Uh, yeah, that's. Or nine. Uh, Hold on. Yeah. Is this a charade? What? Is this a charade? Great question. Is, is this, this a, charade? a charade? Much like you doubted the truth of what substance my 
Sweat was. Do you have some it. sort of charade going Is on this here? Farce, are you pretending? What well, you've seen me turn in from a sperm to this? That could be a common ma- magician's trick. Yep, it could be misdirection. Like, hey, look over there, and suddenly you run and out so, the door and, and you, you uh, get a chicken body. Yeah. Yes, and you've got someone else's sperm in your pocket, and you mm. slide it into the water. <laughs> <laughs> Open your pockets. Empty Open out your pockets, pockets right no, now. I can't. Empty I, out I your pockets empty right empty now. Your oh, pockets. Oh, oh, look at all this sperm. Look at all this loose sperm. Loose sperm. Right. It's out of. The, the seminal fluid just loose. <laughs> and if you can, uh, no. Maybe I should take up a side job as a private investigator. Not bad, not bad. Well, look, we're running out of time, guys. We've we figured out that uh, Marcus <sighs> Quiddle. Are, are you an actual musician? Uh, are you a musician? I am first a musician. Of all? Can I think? Think of my thong. Yep. Here uh, we go. Okay. Here we go. Oh, give, me, give me a beat, here we go. Please, here we go. please. I want. No, I want Buchanan to give me a beat. I can't beat. Try your best. Try your best to give me a beat. Right. Want to hear what it I, sounds I like I'm when you're beatboxing? I'm not very musically talented. Just do it, Buchanan. I'm mainly, I should be entering data, but I can't get a job. Okay, but try Go, this. just try. Uh, there are there are second acts in American lives. All right. A boom, pa, boo, ba, doo, boo, That's good. Pa, pa, boom, good. Boom, 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 good. Let me find that rhythm. Boom, 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 try to stay with the same type of rhythm. Boom, Don't boom, keep changing boom, boom, it. I am. Go. Boom, boom, ba, da, ba, doo, ba, doo, boo. Bum, 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 Good. Bum, bum, bum. This is very different. Okay. Da, ba, doo, da, Scott, can you give me a beat? <laughs> okay, yeah. Over <laughs> yo, his beat. Oh, oh, boom, ba, da, ba, doo, yo, here I go. Yo, yo, yo. My name is Marcus and I'm here to say I'm going to get you one fucking day. Buchanan, look me right in the eyes because I will be your big demise. You're my villain. I'm the hero now. You don't look at me. Have a cow like Bart Simpson. Says, look at his face and then I'm going to put you in your brain. I'm going to kill you every day. I'm going to fight. Where you live and get in your hay I'm gonna put you in the river and watch you drown And then I'm gonna get you down right to the ground I'm like, yo, get in the spot Or I look at myself and then I take some pot And smoke it up through my nose because I'm big old sperm Now baby, get on to then do the worm I'm a fucking sperm, I do the worm I'm a fucking sperm, do the worm I do the fucking sperm, I'm a worm I do the... So if you see me one more time And you say, no, that I'm gonna get in your face Everybody knows I'm not a person who fucked around with the side? Give me one more time. I'm gonna give you one pop. Don't get up. Get through the crowd. Jump your cannon. Look at my frown. You're dead. I wow. Highly regret taking part in that. It's <laughs> an, an extensive threat towards my life. <laughs> I'm getting a restraining order easy on If you. you can find out where I live, stupid. I don't oh, need do to know where you live. Where do you live? In order huh? to get a restraining order. 1942 uh, North Alexandria 1942, Avenue. 1942, terrible year in our history. I know, I lived through it. Checkmate. <laughs> All right. Speaking of checkmate, we just have one left, one left thing. One left thing. One left thing. Another thing, thing. another <laughs> mystery. I hope it's not left. I'm a Republican. <laughs> You're oh. a re- you dropped that at the last second of the I'm, whole show? Well, I, we don't I'm, have time I'm to get into this. I'm what you call an alt-right. Do you have, okay. Do you have, we don't have do you time, have we don't 30 have time seconds? for this. Okay. No. All right. No, no, no. I think I will go ahead and pay the $65.49 a month to have a website. Okay. So well, where, that's are way more get, expensive. where are you going to get the Websites money for this? Ten bucks a month. Well, didn't I? I get uh, just over three, three. Yeah, but you have to pay it all, all to Doctor Solomon. I pay three hundred thousand, but then and I owe Linda what one two ninety nine, and then one. Yeah. But did did I make any? I no, that was it. No, you're bankrupt. No, you're, you you're are bankrupt. Shit uh, out of luck. Well, SOL, you can't afford that website, Alan. When I find the money, I will be getting a website called Jelly's Jams and Preserves from Alan's Jammery. Alan's Jammery. Dot com. Wait, that's that's your website? That's not the title of your actual product. I know. <laughs> what are that's you not doing? a good that's website. The only, then, I've looked up. That's the only domain that makes sense that I can get. Buchanan's Jams wasn't available? Buchanan's Jams is spoken for. Buchanan's Jams.com. Buchanan's who has, Jams.net. Buchanan's who is it? Who has all those? Do you want to know who has them all? Oh, Quiddlebit. No. Me. Quiddlebit. Marcus Quiddlebit. I bought them all so you could never have them. It sounds oh. like you're the villain. Oh, maybe that's what I am. You're not a hero. Now now that I think about it. You're not a hero at all. You're You're like Mr. Glass or something. I'm just a man trying to get a... (laughs) Just... Who ha- make a living. Who has suspicious, unusual circumstances regarding all you of your loved of ones' bitch. deaths. That's just coincidence. Uh, and you happen to live by a river, so things are going to happen by in the this river. only river in Arizona. In the river of the night. <laughs> let me, don't let me like some that stuff. song. Really? Why not? I think it's a little bit taboo. 
Wherever you are, I shall be. Whenever you feel fear, I shall be there. Whenever you see a river, like Marvel movies. I will find. Um, okay, how about this? To, to, to meet me at the top of the Empire State Building, kiss me. Isn't that from Big? No. No, no, Sleepless in Seattle. No, Big is this. I want to be big. Meet me at F.A.O. Schwartz. Meet me at F.A.O. Schwartz and play the piano with oh, me. But that one was from Sleepless in Seattle. You are doing Tom Hanks movies. Well, how about this one? Catch me if you can. That's from Catch Meet Me, me at the can. FBI office. Okay, how about this one? Meet me at the FBI office. That's also Catch Me. Okay, how about this? Leo, what are you putting checks for? That's Catch Me If You Can. Okay, I'll do a different one that you've never even heard of. Oh, Christopher Walken. You're in with this movie as his dad. When was Tom Hanks and Christopher Walken in a movie? Was it I Cat believe it was Catch Me If You Can. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I also like, hey, what is this Russian guy doing here? You're a spy and I'm a spy. Bridge of Spies. Yeah. Okay, what about this one? I'm a lady killer. Mm, uh, that's tough. I'm a lady killer? I'm a lady killer. I'm a lady killer. Huh. Uh, One lady. of several lady killers? Could be. Ah, uh, still not ringing any bells. You don't know it? Mm, no, I can't. Lady yeah. What about this? Every time you're doing that lady killer. Oh, it's doing that thing you do. Correct. Ah, right. Or that thing you do. Thank I you. I believe it is. Guys, let me plug something. I just we don't want to keep doing time <laughs> I don't think so. How many more can we do, do you think? I think we could do a bunch. Toy Story? Let's keep going until we run out. Toy uh, Story. Well, hey, we got a uh, toy, toy Story. We'll be like, uh, I believe the quote Okay, is. tell you what. If hey, you, we got some If uh, you guys can toys. name Tom Hanks movies and never repeat and keep naming new for ones real? for 60 seconds, I'll give you $10,000 every second. Okay, let's oh, do it. I need this. Please, right, Quiddle Bit. I will fuck it up. So 60 seconds straight. We just can't seconds. name anything that's Quiddle not bit. Tom Hanks. Please. Okay. Let's and we have to get in there through the quote. No, no, just, no, the, no, titles. just the, the titles. titles. And, you, and you give us every 10 seconds. Out. And if we do it through 60 without naming something that has... That, it already, has to, that you've already named and correct, it has and it to be you be. and it has to actually have him in the movie. Ready? Yeah. Quiddle bit, please. Can we start Can we start with the... We, we're we starting blank slate. 60 seconds is a long time. Blank yeah, slate. Yeah, yes. Okay. This will be, okay. If this can go, and this will be enough money for me You can't do it to, slowly. We won't do it slowly. This All could right, be enough money for me to break my contract with my doctor. Please. Okay. Right. Here we go. Ready? Okay. Oh, and go. You go first. Go. You can say stuff we already said. Oh, okay. Can we t- say TV shows? Oh my god, I'm gonna start I'm from gonna the start beginning. No, not okay. TV shows, just movies. Okay, I ready? can't say TV. You can no. say anything you've already it's only said. Only one TV show. That's what I say. I've got to go from the bottom and work no, my way up. There nope, we go. Nope, no TV shows. Okay, all movies, and you can't. You can say stuff you said previous to all this. All right, but okay, here, we here we go. go. Six and go. go. Big Toy Story. Toy Story two. Toy Story three. Saving Private Ryan. Catch me if you can. Um, uh, splash. Um, ten seconds. What? Ten. Um, uh, Money Pit. Sleeveless in Seattle. Bachelor Bat. Bridge of Spies. Um, um, Terminal. Da Vinci Code. Forrest Goomp. Da Vinci Code 2. <laughs> no, not the title. Oh, not the title. What? No. It's Da Vinci Code 2. Well, give it to him, give it to him. The secret code of Da Vinci. Angels and Demons. How much time do we have? We'll give it to him. How much time do we have? 25 seconds. Angels okay. and Demons. Angels and Demons. Right, Angels go. and Demons will work. Right, we're still back in it? Yep, you're back in. Oh, that was close. Okay, so all I have to 30 do seconds. is name a Tom Hanks movie. And if I don't name it, you don't get any of the money. <gasps> Wait a minute. What are you doing? All I have to do is name a Tom Hanks movie, and I know a couple more right now. Like Quiddle I know, bit. I know Lady G- I'm not going to finish it. A little bit. Please. I know many, many more. What have I done to deserve this? I know that one when he was on, he was on the bike Ten with Gugu Mbata Ra. I even know that one. Please. All I have Five. to do is name one. Four. So here I go. Three. Ready? Please. Please. Two. Up. One. <gasps> he wasn't in Up! You fucking idiot! Oh. I'm the villain! You oh. are nothing! You have zero dollars! Give me my 300000 back, bitch! You piece of shit! Wait, I need that to pay back my bill! <laughs> no, I don't sorry. care! Nope, please! Nope, give it I'm back! I'm just a man with WCS! Give me oh. the jams and preserves! Give me everything! Sorry, Take Buchanan! It. Take it all. <laughs> Take it all. Alright, I'll split it with you. Thank you! Here you go, here's 150 thou. Thank you. Ooh, it's uh, a lot of money. <laughs> I'm ruined. <laughs> really? Is, like, someone, is someone gonna get upset with you? Let me call him and find out. Oh, Here we go. Christ. Hey, Tony, is this you? Solomon. Where's my money? 
uh, Dr. Salem. Where's my money, the, bish? The money has been uh, rescinded. Rescinded? How do you rescind money? You lost it? What, did you go to Vegas again? Did you go to that side casino in no, Nevada? No, again? no, no. I didn't like gambling, but I got sucked into doing it again. You made $78 on that, you told me. I know, but now I... Uh, today, and I didn't see a dime of that either. Today I won and lost over $300,000. Dr. Solomon? Wait, is this Quiddlebit? I have one hundred fifty thousand dollars. Do you want to sign a contract right now for me to be your doctor? I'll exclusive, do it. Exclusive, exclusive access. If you right now on this podcast tell the world that Alan Buchanan is had been pissing his pants the whole time. That's not true. One hundred fifty. One hundred fifty thousand. If you if you and it's a contract for life. A contract for life and one hundred fifty thousand dollars. If you tell Dr. the truth, Doctor Solomon, just please. tell the truth. Don't. All you have to do is tell the truth. I have nothing left. I'm bound by. The doctor's it's, code. It's, it's the doctor's code. You fuck know. the doctor's code. Solomon, I'm the doctor now. Please. I'm the doctor now. Fuck Don't. It, fuck it. Yeah, it's piss. It's yeah, piss. He's <laughs> been pissing everywhere. I haven't. Oh, You're the fine. villain. You're the villain, Dr. Solomon. I love you, bye. Love you, bye. Wow. It's not true. It's so true. It's not. <sighs> This is terrible. Terrible only for me. Yeah. Well, hey, them's the breaks. You know what I mean? I think I made Tom, Ben, you guys have been very quiet during this. Hey, sorry about that. I just can't believe what just happened. This is crazy. I feel so bad for that guy. Who was that guy? He seemed like such a good dude. When you say was, did he just die? I mean, he went to the river. I don't know what he did, though. Oh, no. (laughs) What was that? It sounded like a gunshot. It sounded like someone imitating a gunshot almost. Like, is that how gunshots sound? Is Did it... you guys hear that? <laughs> what was that? I was imitating a gunshot. <laughs> oh, you I, wanted us to think? I wanted you to think that I killed myself. Oh, oh come, come on. Come on, Did you trying to get that in? money from your life insurance? No, I just want everybody to know how sad I am. I wasn't oh. sad for one second. How does that make you feel? <sighs> Even worse. <laughs> yeah. I went to Mozambique on a solo vacation, and I got an insect infestation in my WCS area. It's not a WCS not area. WCS. They were attracted to the scent, and they laid eggs. Ew. Oh, oh, Jesus God, Christ. The scent of urine? <laughs> the fuck is <laughs> wrong sweat. with you? I have this it's very specific <laughs> body odor. <laughs> Already been like debunked. It. Someone needs <laughs> to fact check you. It's sweet. It's sweeter than urine. Oh, God. <laughs> Wait, you think urine is sweet? Well, it could be for some. Okay, look. If you're a diabetic, I believe your urine is sugary. All right, look. Can I just say one more thing? Yeah. Please. I've just updated my website, BuchananJams.com and .net. Yeah. It'll direct you right to BuchananIsAPisser.com. Oh, man. And it's just a picture of his fucking dick pissing into Piper Poops. I'm going to sue you for public defamation. I believe these are libel Where are you going to get the money? We're going to get the money for a lawyer. Yeah, you don't have any money anymore. After the successful lawsuit, I'm going to sue you for all your $150,000. Good luck. By that time, I'll be a sperm again. <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, JJ and Murphy O'Malleman, um, who, uh, they're teen, or not even teenagers, they're kid detectives, and uh, uh, I'm starting to feel like uh, they're also weirdos because they, they've described how... Uh, they love to watch the Challenger exploding video and how thinking about mass murderers give them boners. And uh, I, I have to ask you guys, uh, are you really trying to solve this crime of your mother being flayed alive and, and, and eventually leading to her dis- demise? Well, wouldn't you want to solve it if your mommy was flayed? Sure. Wouldn't you want to know who did that to your mommy? Sure, but are, are you sure that maybe you guys didn't, you know, you know do it? I don't. We've mean never have, had sex. I don't mean have no sex way. With each other. We're brother and sister. That's my sister. We've only finger banged. Yeah, that's my brother. I really jerked him off. Okay, guys, <laughs> wait. You're ten. So you're sh- ten. She's eleven. <laughs> oh, okay. And that kids got to get it on. All right, all right, <laughs> guys, guys. If there's one thing we know, kids got to get, get it, it on. on. After you poured salt on your mother. You guys didn't do any like weird stuff over the body, right? I mean, mm, not, not weird, unless you think it's weird to ride her like a pony with my brother's arms around my waist. <laughs> <laughs> I I don't know where that falls on the weird spectrum. I'm not really sure. I yeah, never imagined my, it. I was just holding on. And sometimes the ride gets real bumpy. So I got to grab her breasts. Okay. It's cool. All right. Did you happen to do this with everyone in the book club? Huh? Oh, what? yeah. All the, the skin ladies? ladies? 
You could say that maybe we rode them around like horses or cows. Yeah. Or bulls, depending on how alive they were. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was fun. You should try it. It's the best way to get clues. <laughs> okay, no thank you. And I, I yeah, have... we got a lot of good clues after yeah, that. Yeah, what clues could you get? Well, well, first of all, number one clue is if you stay on long enough, you can get a boner. <laughs> <laughs> if you stay on long enough. Yeah, if you stay on the body long enough. Okay. And they'll try and buck you off because if they're still alive, it hurts. They don't like having someone on them because their skin's all exposed. Yeah. Raw, raw, raw. <laughs> <laughs> Rah, 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 rah. Are you, have you just moved on to cheerleading at this point? <laughs> oh, she tried to make the cheerleading team. Didn't make it. Oh, really? Don't so remind sorry. me. Yeah. The other kids, the other <laughs> girls, they said she wasn't good enough. We'll show them. Yeah, we'll show them. What are you going to show them? What do you mean? You well, well, recently I fell into a, a, a big pit, and at the bottom <laughs> there was a, a rock, and I touched uh, it, and I got some mind powers. <laughs> and everybody's going to see what I can do later on. Okay. <laughs> All right. What mind powers do you believe you have? Well, I can give people nosebleeds. Okay. Do it to him. Yeah, do it to me. No. If you no. Really? Yeah. I don't, I don't think that you have mind powers. I don't I think that you actually... Triple dog dare you on top of a horse. Uh-oh. Can't deny that. Yeah, Get ready, Scott. I think that you're just a disturbed child who... Who fell down a well, maybe hit his... Oh, my God. What is this? You're bleeding, sir. Oh, that's just a booger, actually. Oh, really uh, red. No, you guys drippy. are not... Oh, God. <laughs> Ugh. You taste it in your throat? Oh, God. Wow, what are you doing to me? How did you do that? How did you do that? <sighs> oh, God. Oh, God. You Pretty cool, huh? You released your hold upon me. Yeah, I can do a lot more than that. I broke a dog once. <laughs> you broke a dog? It was running, and then it split in two. Yeah? Oh, my God. Just cleaved down the middle? Yeah, well, not cleaved. Sort of ripped. Oh. Yeah, shredded wheat. Oh, my God. Do you have any powers? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Asked and answered. All right. Uh, God, you kids. Scott, do you like shredded wheat? The cereal? Okay, okay. This yeah, not we're talking the dog. about the cereal, then yes, certainly. Man, I don't. We haven't had a real breakfast since our mommy died. Yeah, and our daddy ran away, which is just last night. Okay. So, <laughs> so you, we didn't eat today. You haven't eaten today. All right. Well, sorry. <laughs> but uh, you haven't eaten, eaten today. today. Four, Four words for <laughs> Washington <laughs> Avenue. The next clue is in the White House. Why do you guys want to go to the White House so badly? <sighs> I saw a vision. Okay, I now I believe it because you obviously <laughs> have some sort of extra sensory powers here. Yeah, yeah. I we saw, saw something. <clears throat> yeah, we saw something because so, I sh I mind shared it with her. <laughs> Okay, that's one of the powers that you have? Yeah, doy! God, what an amateur! Oh my god, it's like he doesn't even know what's going on! Have you even skateboarded before? Uh, yeah. Have you even done an alley-oop on a skateboard? Yeah, do you do longboard or shortboard? I do, oh, it's shortboard. Oh, what, a mini board or a regular board? It's a regular board, obviously. Goofy but regular! It was goofy! Ollie, huh. kickflip or just regular? I kickflipped it! Do you ever do a dark grind? Of course I did. Shredding off the side or no? No. Tabletop. One tabletop. Spinning wheels on a fire. I have not. Okay. Story checks out. Well, look, <laughs> I had a vision, and this vision was Barack Obama. Okay. Okay. And he said, I have the next clue. Find me. <laughs> <laughs> he giggled like that? <laughs> Yeah. yeah, and he was wearing really tight shorts. Yeah, and he skipped away like a little pansy. <laughs> yeah, and you could tell he had a butt because his shorts were so tight. Pretty good butt, I'd say. Yeah, the seam of the shorts went right up his crack. Must have been wearing no underwear. Oh, yeah, because you could see the front, too. It was rock hard. <laughs> All right, so you had this dream. Was it a dream or a vision? How would you the characterize vision. it? vision. Okay, God. it was during the day or? Yeah. What time? Uh, class, oh, during class. During class, so you just like yeah. some sort of dead zone situation where you just like. Yeah. And and uh, had, you, had you ever had a vision like this before? Um, no, I only touched that rock like two weeks ago. Yeah, oh, okay. this is pretty new. Two weeks ago or two weeks earlier from this story? <laughs> Huh? <laughs> you seem to have the same problem as my friend Thomas Middleditch. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? Yeah, he sounds like a dweeb. Have you ever seen Silicon Valley? Never. We don't have TV. Oh, it's not TV. Since our mom died. It's HBO. Oh. <laughs> they have HBO now. Oh, we have that. Yeah, we got HBO now. <laughs> we have our dad's password on our laptops. <laughs> What's the password? 
Um, Pen 15 Club. <laughs> <laughs> Your dad's password is Pen15 Club. He's a member. Okay. Have yeah, you ever his thought username it? is Wait, get it? A member of the Pen15 yes, Club? I understand. Wait, get it? Um, member of, of Pen15 Pen <laughs> for, for Washington work. Lane. Yeah. You so wait, you know where the next clue is? <laughs> I think it's at the White House. Yeah! It. Let's go bro trip. Just us three. Um, have you guys thought about logging into your dad's computer then and seeing logging into the mainframe? We can't do that. Hold on, you got your laptop right here. I do. Accessing. I'm hacking in. Accessing. Oh, there's a firewall. Oh, I'll break through it. Pew. <laughs> Typing in the password, pen15 club. What about the proxy server? It's on. Download it. Man, look Downloading at all those pictures. Look at all those gigabytes. Growing, growing. Memory counting. And, and we're, we're in. in. Wow. Whoa, lots of porn in here. Mm. Yeah. What kind of porn? He's got weird girls bending over. Weird girls, meaning they're that's, like mentally that's weird? That's one folder. One folder is called Weird Girls Bending Over. Okay. <laughs> one folder says... This one says, um, all my aunts. <laughs> uh, so your great aunts? <laughs> or is it A-N-T-S? Is it like ant porn? <laughs> Let me open it. It's ants with tits. Like bugs. <laughs> uh, so it's like, like ants with human tits? <laughs> yeah. Cool. <laughs> you, you think this is cool? Oh my ants! He's got kind of like he's got like a honey I shrunk the kids fetish, <laughs> in which he's shrunk and all these sexy ants are around. That's pretty cool. Our dad's the best. He's gonna feed him pieces of Oreos. <laughs> okay, this one says my little ponies with a Z. Okay. What do you think? Let's double click it. That's how you get in a folder. Opening up. Accessing. <laughs> Subfol <laughs> subfolders. How many gigabytes? Man, 14. 14? 14. <laughs> 14. <laughs> Opening the folders. This is taking a long time. So many different folders within folders. <laughs> I'm opening. I'm accessing. <laughs> it's just a text document. Wait, wait, is there a firewall? No, it's a text document, sir. It says, <laughs> one day, it says my dream would be to have times with a My Little Pony grown up big that I could ride and hold my brother's waist with. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Daddy was like us. Daddy, <laughs> we, we gotta go see Uncle Ken. <laughs> Who's Uncle Ken? <laughs> Our dad's brother. Oh, sorry. He works at the White House. <laughs> he does? Yeah. yeah. What does he do? He's a chef. He's the executive chef at the White House? Yeah. <laughs> He knows how to make all kinds of macaroni. He knows how to flay meat. Yeah. Okay. Wait a second. Flay, flay meat. meat. Dinner. M, M E A T. Four, four letters, letters for Washington, Washington Lane. Lane. The next the clue is at, at the, the White, White House. House. Why are both of your noses bleeding right now? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Uh, Wait, I, sip, sip, sip. I have to ask. Uh, oh, hold on, uh, Murphy. Can I ask you something, JJ? Can you just take a breather here for a second? Yeah, just sure. Take off your headphones. I'll I don't like to stop holding his hand, but I'll do it for a second. I'll go into my mind world. <gasps> What's up, Murphy? Are, are you? Do you? Do you ever get the feeling you're being mind controlled by your brother? No, I'm pretty sure he wouldn't want me to think that. What's the last thing you remember? Being born. <laughs> <laughs> being born. <laughs> Or is that the first thing I remember? <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, that's a that's an important distinction. First or last? The first thing I remember is being born. Okay. The last thing I remember is nine months after that. Nine months. Oh my god. I, okay. I, am I talking to? What do it mean? Am I talking to <laughs> JJ right now? No. <laughs> JJ, are you inside Murphy's mind? No. Okay, great. <laughs> Just wanted to know. All right, JJ, come on back. Hey, guys, what were you talking about? I don't know. Hmm, cool. Uh, okay, hi, JJ. Uh, Lost JJ. JJ Abrams. Lost JJ Abrams show. Forwards. <laughs> hey, do you, ever got, do you guys ever want to see the world burn? <laughs> what, a, what a weird question to ask. I mean, what if there was just a movie, and it was like eight hours long, and it was just footage of the world burning? 
Uh, well, I, I guess I'd watch that. I don't know that <laughs> cool, I would watch too. that. I, well, um, we would. We're kids. <laughs> yeah. What so it, what we say goes. What if it wasn't a movie and it was just like news footage? Oh, man, that'd be best. What, like the Challenger exploding? <laughs> yeah. God. Tell me about this rock you touched. Oh, I'd rather not. Okay. It's private, sir. <laughs> yeah, it's private. It was down this hole and, um, well, there was a rock and uh, I touched it. No. Is it private or not? You're telling me about it right now. <laughs> I'd rather not get into the details. Oh, okay. what are the details? Though? Well, um, I held up my finger, and the finger touched the surface of the rock. Okay. And then I blacked out for a bit. Okay. How and long? I, um, couple. I don't know, because I woke up and I was floating in the air. Oh my gosh! Can but, you can you uh, float right now? Or are you are you able to? Uh... I'd rather not. Uh, yeah, right. I love floating. Whoa! Whoa! Look at you! <laughs> Check me out! I'm floating! This is like Willy Wonka, where they uh, eat those bubbles. Yeah, he has to burp to get down. <laughs> uh, I can't burp. Oh, no! He's going to be stuck up there! You have to fart, then! <laughs> oh, he's back. <laughs> oh, man. I don't feel so good. Uh, well, guys, I got to ask you. I just got to ask this question. I, ha I have to. Did you guys kill your mom? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you did. How else are we going to ride our skinned body and hold each other? What, what I mean to say is, what I mean to say is, not did you kill her once she was in pain and putting her out of her misery, but did you flay her originally? Look, school's pretty tough. You got to make friends, and sometimes that's pretty hard. And when the teachers are riding you about homework and kids are picking on you and they just won't stop, Sometimes the only solution is to get rid of your parents. Hmm. Yeah, I guess you could say we committed an act of murder. <laughs> yeah, the only thing you can really count on is your sister. Yeah, or your brother. Hmm. And the love that you have, romantic or otherwise. Stop making out, please. Stop, 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 it. stop mm. it, stop mm. it, stop it, God. Hey, Scott, want to see me? Finger make my sister? <laughs> no, I do no not. No means yes, it's opposite day. <laughs> no, it, it is not opposite day. Wait, that means it is. No, stop it. Mm, that was nice. Oh, Ooh, I liked it. Okay. Hey, Scott. Yeah. Do you want to feel pleasure like you've never experienced? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, Just I do. let me get in your mind for a little bit, okay? okay. All right. Oh, God. Uh, I'm controlling you. Ah, uh, activating pleasure centers. Oh, God. Oh, my God. You released your hold on. Why are. Oh, my jeans are all wet. Pretty oh, cool, huh? I pissed on you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, she just pissed on you when you were out. That wasn't pleasurable. <laughs> you liked it. Yeah, you seem to like it pretty fine. <laughs> Pranks. All right, guys. Well, gosh, I, I you are the weirdest, creepiest, most frightening children I've ever met. Thank you. Thanks. What's yeah. next for you? Well, we gotta still solve this crime. Yeah, I might. I, I'm gonna try and get some sun. My skin's pretty white. Yeah, I've noticed that. Can you see my veins? Yeah, I can. <laughs> cool. Sometimes we call them powder. <laughs> you but guys I know about that movie? I don't like it. Okay, sorry. sorry. Don't call me powder. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. You call me powder, Scott, you're going to regret it. Try it, Scott. I don't want to try it. I just, just said I would you regret it. You better not. Okay, I'm not just going see. to. No. Just try. Uh, all right, well, hey, powder. He's really upset. You're crying. I you not to. Okay, I thought something bad would happen. Yeah. I guess I regret it now because I didn't realize the emotional damage I inflicted upon you. I hope, I hope the regret kills you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's pretty bad. I didn't, wa I didn't want to make a little boy cry today. I can't help it. You know, I was born with pretty thin skin. Yeah. yeah. Is that what gave you the fascination with skin? Oh, I don't know. That Maybe would... that sounds like the biggest clue of all. Because you could see what was underneath your own, and you wanted to see what was underneath everyone else's, and you were like, why aren't they like me? Let's see what's underneath that skin. Wait, skin. S-K-I-N. Four letters for Washington Lane. The next clue is at the White House. Okay, good. We're back. Full circle. All right, guys. Fantastic. Well, um, you know, you're weird, you're creepy. I hope your business does not succeed, but, uh, you know, thank you so much for coming on. Uh, yeah, okay. And if you guys are ever looking for White House picks, just Google image search White House. 
<laughs> yeah, and if you ever want to see a horse, just Google image search horse. Okay, great. Yeah. great. And if you ever want to see some cool pics of me and my sis hacking to my dad's computer. <laughs> yeah. Penis 15 Club? Pen 15 oh, Club. That's right, that's right. Dude, he's not a pervert. <laughs> okay, sorry. We want to plug, plug our cow penny. Cow penny? Company. Company. Oh. <laughs> He, uh, murders are us. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, that's I never asked you the name of your business. Murders, murders are, are us, and our motto is we commit murders. Oh. <laughs> yeah, and you solve them. Wait, so okay, so it's it's a reverse detective agency where you guys are murdering people and other people have to solve your crimes. Mm. How do you think detectives work? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I understand now why you th- consider yourselves to be detectives. You're reverse detectives. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. I see. Well, so. You have a um, wide swath of uh, swath of crimes that you're out there committing. It's a wide swath. <laughs> it's a swath. <laughs> and uh, you're going to be killing people all the way to the White House if if we're if, lucky. Yeah, and including the White House. Oh. Well, thanks to you, Obama. <laughs> Obama. <laughs> Which of his policies do you disagree with? Why do you? Um, it's just about everything. Uh, public health care. Yeah, we don't want anyone to have that. Yeah. Um, yeah, because people might get better after you attempt yeah, to murder. Yeah, restrictions on the free market. Yeah. It all mm-hmm. sucks. Mm-hmm. Okay, great. No cars on the street. You don't want any cars on the street? No, and he lets them. What, yeah. <laughs> what, do you, what do you want on the street instead? Ponies. <laughs> mice. Rideable mice. <laughs> giant rideable mice. Wait, giant, giant rideable, rideable mice. mice. Let's go ride a bull. Wait, we were wrong the whole time. Five. Where'd you get five? Giant <laughs> ride a bull mice. Oh, you're right. Five. Five, five words. Washington, five Washington, Washington Lane. Lane. The, the president, president is not a, <laughs> the <laughs> Smithsonian. Thanks so much, guys. Uh, really, uh, you know, didn't enjoy getting to know you, <laughs> but it was an interesting time to listen to you. Well, that's too bad. We really liked it, getting to know you. Really? Yeah, a lot. That's so yeah. nice of you. Thank you so much. Why don't you get in a horse position? Oh, I, hey, what, why am I doing this? <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! Why? I'm going to hold on to you now. Get, <laughs> get off of me! No. Ah! Yes. Gallop. Oh, Gallop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Ah! Yeah. Ah! <laughs> I'm slicing off his skin. Mm. Ah! I'm wearing it. Man, look at my boner. <laughs> so April 12, uh, people should just leave their TVs on after Game of Thrones, right? Yeah. Or turn it on after Game of Thrones. Is that show any good? I mean, is that show any good? Well, the cool part about HBO is that you can also watch all your favorite shows on HBO go after the fact. Even during the fact. Even during the fact. And yeah. they're pretty. They're going to release something even cooler pretty soon. What's yeah. that? There's H- HBO went? It's called it's HBO ca- Now, kinda. actually. Really? Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> it's of. called HBO Now. It is a tense. It's a thing? It's a thing, and you, you don't have to have HBO Now. You what? can just, no, you have to have HBO you Now. You have to have HBO Now. God, you're, you don't have to have you're confusing it already. Okay, cable. let me, I'll be clear. Didn't they take you through this before you got you on the show of what you're supposed to say about it? Uh, here, yeah, I've got it. All day yesterday we went over it. We went over it all day yesterday. I've got it. You don't have to have, you don't have to have HBO Now. You can get HBO Now. now. See, so See? if that doesn't clarify it, <laughs> I don't know. I don't you can know. just get it. You can just get it streaming. Uh, no, no cable whatsoever. You can have it on the internet. For but does it? But does it just show what's on HBO then? No, HBO no. now. now. <laughs> <laughs> and previous titles and catalogs. But, like, say Silicon Valley's on it at uh, 10 p.m. Uh huh. Sure. Say, say some fantasy world where it's on at 10 p.m. It sure. is. It is actually on. But it actually is on this at This is 10 no PM. fantasy? It's real. Best of this all possible real? worlds, Voltaire said. <laughs> okay, so say it's on HBO, HBO Real. HBO Regs. <sighs> Regs. At 10 p.m. on it's Sunday. It's called Regs S HBO. It's okay. called HBO Fat Natties, but go <laughs> okay, ahead. Okay, so <laughs> HBO oh, Fat God. Natties, April 12th at 10 p.m. I have uh, HBO. I turn it on exactly at 10 p.m. You guys start. Yeah. What about the people with HBO now? Can they turn it on exactly at 10 p.m. and watch hey, it? Hey, 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 hey. This is Me, not- no, no. Ew. Okay. All me do is me put pee pee in Coke. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> now, you're the guy who originally did that? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's all, that's you're, all I've been you're up to. You're famous. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. You don't even a, need a TV yeah. show. Kids have sung songs about me for <laughs> eons. I thought you were 
Chinese. Oh, me am. <laughs> That's one thing that people don't know when they watch Silicon Valley. Yeah. Is you have, well, they have eye widening. Oh, oh uh, no. We got to go. He I, we got to go. I'm just saying. He's just a good actor. I don't think, uh, I don't think HBO <laughs> wants us here anymore. No, they, they want, they want we here. Um, <laughs> but ser- for, for the uninitiated, and I pray they get initiated, what is this show even about? It's about three guys who come into a podcasting studio and talk to me? That's, that's what this show that's is about. That's this show. <laughs> yeah. Oh. That's, that's we'll bang talk bang. about Silicon Valley then. Why are we talking about this show? The Silicon Valley show is about, uh, well, you know, trials and tribulations of many startups. Manhood. Silicon Valley. Not so much about sorry. manhood. I'm sorry. Um, and it it's follows a little bit of manhood. Yes, yeah, of manhood. I mean, it, essentially, one one uh, character. Uh, my character has uh, an algorithm that is that can, has value to it. Essentially, he you figures know, algorithm out algorithm. Okay, has Al Gore in so much of that word and rhythm. Also, so Al Gore and rhythm. So it's wait, weird. Hold it on. Sounds and like Al Gore does bent. play music, hold and he on. does play music. Al Gore has rhythm. In three, four times, three plus four is seven. Seven Washington Avenue. That's where the national treasure is. Let's go. Let's go. Hello? Hey, who's this? It's the the treasure hunting squad. Where? Oh, God, you got me. Come on in here. Uh, great. <laughs> All right, guys, you're cleaning up today. I have to open the door if you say you're here for the treasure. We are. Now open it, old man. Let's see what you got. <laughs> I'm so old, it was so hard to open this door. Those are just your bones. Open the door, damn it. <laughs> All I did was open my skin flap to show you my bones. Yeah, we see them. Now what's in the door? <laughs> Here you go. All the treasures. Wow, it's beautiful. Some say this treasure was lost when the Spanish ships were sunk in 1221. Oh, uh, you brought <laughs> enough pockets. Oh, yeah, we brought enough pockets. Wait, mine are full. No thanks to you, Obama. And that's what we're talking yeah, about here. Yeah, that's, that's what, what we're Silicon saying. Silicon Valley is. Yeah, it's anti-Obama. Finally. Oh. Yes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> a couple of weeks ago, we had a fan of this program come on the show, and uh, we did a show with that fan. And uh, we have uh, uh, someone who's a fan of your show, and I thought I would invite him. Uh, please introduce yourself, sir. Hey, can I talk now? <laughs> hey, you're. Yeah. 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 Sure. Yeah, Joey Tortellini. Joey Tortellini. Hey, Joey. You seem to what's be. What's going on? May I ask, are you uh, of Italian descent? No. Okay. Well, uh, what's your heritage? I'm, ref- I'm from the Sudan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I- I'm unemployed. Oh, really? What did you used to do? I used to be a firefighter. <laughs> In the Sudan? Yeah. Uh, you're looking for work now, though? Yeah. Uh, I'm, an- I'm a good pediatrician. You're a good pediatrician? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a professional DJ and make $70,000 a show. <laughs> okay. Still, it's nothing compared to your life as a movie. My life ain't no movie. Wait, what is happening? Are you goleming? <laughs> Are you okay? Wait, was the character Gollum based on you in the... Yeah, of course. <laughs> I know Petey Jacks for a long time. You know Peter Jackson as well. An amateur pediatrician, firefighter from the Sudan who fought his way out, has won the lottery 222 times, yes. and is a DJ who makes $5 million a year. Yeah. And you bet all your money... Yes. You bet a billion game. dollars on yes. one game and, and you won it. it all back. Yeah. And you know Bob Durst. Yeah. <laughs> hey, and as is your right as an American citizen. I ain't no American citizen. Never wait, will. You, <laughs> wait, you're not? You still have Sudanese? Yeah. <laughs> what am I giving? I love the country. <laughs> love what's going on. What's over your there? favorite thing about it? Genocide. And what is going on over there? <laughs> What is going on over there? <laughs> Just a bit of cold out of genocide. <laughs> Tell us about the Sudan. What's it like over there? It's great if you're part of the government. We go around, go to little villages. You know. Wait, you were part of the government? Oh, so yeah. We- I was the general that gave him the idea. <laughs> Wait, so when you <laughs> say you had, to, well, had well, to fight your way out of the Sudan, you're fighting the citizens? Yeah, they were not happy. <laughs> <laughs> they wanted to execute you? Yeah, all for, for a little bit of ethnic cleansing. For your war, war crimes? crimes. Oh. Nah, not total war crimes. War and misdemeanors? Yeah. <laughs> a real war crime is... Uh, 
is not finishing the job, eh, America? <laughs> all right, all right, calm it down, calm it down. My uh, gosh, you are you're uh, a fascinating guy. I mean, uh, uh, Joey Tortellini. Joey Tortellini. There's yeah, we know your name. Well, it's, he didn't. He Do you know Tony around. Macaroni? Yeah. You know him? <laughs> yeah, he was on, from a previous episode. He's been yeah. on the show? Yeah, uh, we've Tony, talked about him a lot on the oh, show. Oh, Tony McElroy's the I best. think he was on the show? I can't remember. Anyway, Tony yeah. McElroy's got this big old belly. I like to squeeze it. Oh, yeah? You know, uh, you could just buy like an inflatable, you know, or a beanbag couch or something. Yeah, but you, you, don't get, you don't get Macaroni's laugh. Oh. oh. you live for it. You could record him. You have a lot of money. You could probably just even buy him. I don't know how to work all that. Okay, good. Um, and uh, uh, Silicon Valley coming up April 12th. Um, and are you guys doing a crossover episode with Game of Thrones, by the way? Yep. Yeah, we get murdered in the first 20 seconds. Yeah, yeah. I read this, I read that script. You like, did you like it? Yeah, you guys sort of hack into like a secret website on the internet, which is a time portal to another dimension. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. That's cool. You go to Karth. <laughs> yeah, you go to Karth, and yeah. then and then uh, which one of you guys, which one of you guys becomes one of them merchants? You know, them fancy merchants. Yeah, I have sex with Daenerys. Yeah, you could, yeah you have sex with her. <laughs> yeah, and a dragon kills Martin. Dragon kills Martin. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and drag, dragon kills everybody else. You're the one that's kind of you come become the ruler of Karth, and it's, you marry Daenerys, and you but you also have a harem. Yes, yeah. I also have a harem, and they're all even more attractive than Daenerys. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and they and they, they they call you by your actor's name. They call you by. Kamel. <laughs> they call me Kamel. <laughs> yeah, Kamel, that's your actor name, Kamel the Great. It's yeah, the name Kamel of my the... character I'm playing in there. Yeah. Oh, so you so you get zapped in, and they're like, "Who are you?" And you don't want to say Daenerys, so you go Kamel the Great, and they go, "Holy shit, he's great!" Yeah, let's give him everything. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> that's the story of my life. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is that what happened to you? That's uh, Yeah, that's why I got to America. Uh, who are you? I said, uh, Joey Tortellino. Uh, Tortellini, uh, and I'm pretty great. And Did you say, uh, for a really long time before yeah, yeah, you said yeah, Joey yeah. Tortellini? I mean, come on, come on, on the spot? Come on. <laughs> but <laughs> but that's, your, that's your actual name, you said. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, why are your eyes darting back and forth? It really? don't matter. Oh, okay. God, I gotta know this guy's real name, Camille. That's it. I they, think he's hiding it. for war they crimes. Ca- they caught you. <laughs> wait, wait, who are you talking you to? Have done it. <laughs> oh well, let's get to New Orleans. <laughs> wait, New Orleans? Let's put on a disguise. And, oh, oh. All right. woman. <laughs> yeah, let's dress as a woman. <laughs> I gotta ask: Is it true? You guys, you guys get like computer secrets on that show, right? Like because you're there. You, do you go to Silicon Valley and take like a field trip every we year? We like a guy on set that is a, like a specialist. But we don't. Yeah. I don't feel like I've learned any real secrets. Did about he tell you computing. about the secret, the secret internet that you access through Wingdings? What? The yeah. If you just the type dark net, go on. if you type in Wingdings dark instead net? of actual letters, you get it's a secret internet where there's more stuff there. Or there's just more websites. Yeah, yeah. and it's think, and it's faster. I think there's enough. And now websites. you're telling every. But now you're telling everybody it's not secret anymore. Oh well, you got to know what to type. Wingdings. No, but you got to know what to type in Wingdings. Wingdings. Oh, yeah. It's wingdings.com. Yeah. <laughs> but, <laughs> wingdings.com. Oh, in Wingdings. Said. Yeah. Shit. Whole new internet. Oh, um, yeah. So this is, <laughs> I right, mean. You got the, I was on this on set that day when. <laughs> You've been around these guys a lot. Yeah, I hang yeah. out. They're personal friends of mine. I don't recognize you at all. I don't know how he is. I've been hanging out, out with you. You haven't been hanging out with me. You know what I mean? I've been <laughs> no, we don't. What I've, does that mean? I've been in the shed. I was creeping and crawling. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> but the, you guys, we saw that one Google, Google, uh, Google phone or something. They, 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 it's all you take it apart, you piece it together, and stuff look pretty cool. What you, it's a phone in three pieces, and yeah. if you put it together, yeah, it locks. It, it locks. Yeah. Okay, but what are the three pieces? It seems like it would be easy to lose one of the pieces. Well, you got a banana. What? You got a piece of wood, and then a uh, severed penis of a human male. <laughs> okay, so a banana. The, a two of these male. Two of these things are, the, are, are very are, phallic. Yeah, very similarly shaped. Well, One is an actual phallus. Well, yeah, and... it's got to be a phone at the end, you <laughs> idiot. <laughs> okay, got it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, so now it must be a very small human penis and a small banana. What's small to you? <laughs> I don't know. Anything smaller than 10 inches to me is like, why bother? I like this guy. (laughs) Do you? Hey, Hey. nice high five. (laughs) I enjoyed that. (laughs) So, uh, 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 Mind if I sample that? Use it on my show this weekend? Please do. Here we go. Uh, 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 u
that's nice. It's a nice throwback to like Jock Jams or something. <laughs> you are, are you known as the Jock Jams DJ? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no. no. Asked and answered. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, we uh, we have time for one of our favorite features on the show, uh, and uh, uh, it's time to play a little something called Would You Rather? Nice. Well, it's Hollywood Facts, and we're going downtown. Going to Inglewood now. Everybody do your facts and know your stars. There's glitz and glamour and lots of bars. Get a drink at a club. Then go walk in front of Chinese theater. Hollywood Facts. Take out your dick. Check out the facts. It's the Hollywood Facts. Bro. All right. That is the <laughs> Would You Rather theme by Andy Samberg. <laughs> Uh, we all, we play it every time we uh, play the game. Would you rather? Of course. Oh yeah, sounds great. <laughs> yeah, so that sounds good to you. That sounds fantastic. <laughs> all right, very good. We all know how this is played. Of course, Martin, you're a, an old pro at this, right? Oh you man, played in Austin. Remember that? I one rather time? do and, all kinds of shit. Yeah. yeah. Okay. No, I didn't mean like that not came out not wrong. as opposed to this. That, no, that, I know what you yeah, mean. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. when when you're doing something, <laughs> you would yeah, most yeah, yeah. anything one does, <laughs> one is thinking about the thing that they're not doing, right? Oh, man, I, 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 mean, I would rather be doing whatever. Really? Yeah, don't you think so? Everything. Are you oh, never if you're like, would you rather eat Chinese food or get fucked by a rhinoceros? While you're eating the Chinese food, you'd be thinking about getting fucked by a rhinoceros? If that's what you are into, certainly. I, no, I just I'm mean, just a- I'm, I just I'm mean asking any, you. Which would if I rather? If I said, do? would you rather eat Chinese food or hmm. fuck a rhinoceros? Okay, open the floor for questions. Wait, are you, fu- you fucking the rhinoceros? rhinoceros? You're getting fucked by the <laughs> rhinoceros. Rhinoceros. Wait, but wait, okay. rhinoceros. Wait, yeah, how do you call it? What do you call it? Rhinoceros? <laughs> it's a rhinoceros. Rice- yeah. Rhinoceroni. Rhinoceroni? <laughs> the floor is you're, open, you're I fu- The floor is open fucked. for questions. You're getting fucked. Is, yeah. he, is he fucking you with the horn or just his rhino penis? Oh, penis. I mean, oh. that's, I mean, in the whole rhino penis, you know, that's the nothing. course of human events. Worst things have happened. <laughs> yeah, have you seen a rhino penis? Yeah, it's are barely they, there. Are they small? They're barely there. It's, they, like, it's like a, it's about the size so of it's a horse a, penis. It's that's like big, yeah, penis. <laughs> horse penis. Horse penis got biggies. It's not that big. Horse, yeah, horse, horse penis got biggies. Horse penis got biggies. <laughs> That, you never, I mean, yeah, you horse never, penis got biggies. <laughs> you never seen a horse penis before. They got biggies. <laughs> the horse penises do. Horse penis got biggies. It's like, like, a, a, chi- horse it's like pe- a child watching a, and a horse get an erection. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Horse penis. Hey, got wait, biggies. is that something that you have made the children you uh, I to? didn't make them, but that's you know, <laughs> believe it or not, some of those knock 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 knocks have turned into some pretty great friendships with me and the kitties. Yeah, and sometimes you know we watch the Nature Channel and that happens, and you know this next is thing not. I know Jimmy's saying horse cocks we have biggies. W- what is the <laughs> website of the Nature Channel that you're showing this to them on? By the way, horsedicks.com. <laughs> okay, that's not the Nature Channel's website. Uh, trust me, you get what you pay for. <laughs> okay. Wait, this is a Paid subscription? Twenty ninety nine. For how much? For a month? Yeah. Wait, two thousand and ninety nine dollars. <laughs> <it's But> just <laughs> to a billionaire like you, you know. Oh, it's a fart. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fart. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, it's time monetary to, fart. Yeah. It's time right, to play Would on. You Rather. Uh, we all know how this is played. People send you Would You Rather scenarios to our Twitter, which is at CBBWYR. I'll say the uh, scenario out loud or aloud. And uh, I'll open the floor for questions. You're free to ask me any question you like about either of the two scenarios in order to help narrow down your choice. At a certain point, I will close the floor for questions. There will be no questions after that. And there will be no warning as to that fact of when I will do it. There's no time. It's just up to you. Just up to – well, I mean, there is a time, but it's in my head. I'm, okay. I'm counting down – while I'm talking, I'm counting down – um, one Mississippi, two Mississippi, oh, three Mississippi. Oh that sounds like you're counting up. Yeah, you're counting up. <clears throat> okay, but I'm doing it backwards is what okay. I'm saying. <laughs> okay. Excellent, excellent. From what? <laughs> I don't want to give it away. Okay. That's, okay. The, right. that's yeah. why I did it the way I did yes. it, yes. guys. Yes. yes. What, yes. you think I don't know what I'm doing sometimes? No. Um, and uh, then you'll vote. We'll tally up the points. There we go. It's really oh. easy. All right. Jib Elliott uh, at Jib Swinesburg asks, would you rather be my grandpa or my grandma? All right, I've opened the floor for questions. Are they both alive? 
Great question. They are both alive, yes. Okay. Okay, what's this guy like? What kind of guy did he end up turning into? What, uh, meaning, what was the he like as a, as a child, and the, what did he end up turning into? Well, like, what's... Yeah, sure. What? No, what's he like... Yeah, before and after. Before and... Okay, so you want a before and I after. I want the product of, of these grandparents. Okay, well, the grandparents, of course, had... Uh, they had a son. Yes. And that son went about 25 years. Okay. Uh, you know, uh, went to puberty, not dating anyone, and then at puberty, you know, just kind of sowed his when wild did he, oats a little When bit. did he lose his virginity? He lost his... At uh, 13 in one day. Wow. Mm-hmm. 13 at one he day? All, what does that mean? He, he lost it one day. One day after his 13th, 13th birthday oh, okay. party. Yeah, yeah. It's like all in one day. It's like, yeah, no duh. He had an all day. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> took him two days to lose his virginity. <laughs> he had an all day rager at his 13th birthday party. And uh, the thing that happened at midnight, they brought out strippers and both strippers had sex with him. Wow. That's okay. Okay. It looks good for him. But that's that guy's pe- <laughs> dad. Yeah. No, that's a different That's a different guy. They also had another son. Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay. Uh-oh. Okay. Oh okay, boy. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Who's Jib's? We want to hear about Jib's dad. Yeah, that's who we're talking about now. Okay, now we're going to Jib's dad. <laughs> okay. okay. Yeah. That's okay. Jib's yeah. uncle. <laughs> yes, exactly. Great. I just wanted to talk about him because I think that's an amazing story. Yes. To lose, yeah. your, to lose your virginity at 13 in one day? All in one two day? Strippers? Two people at the same time. Two strippers? You lose your virginity in a threesome situation? You unheard of. Usually usually two 12 year old strippers. It was crazy. Oh, okay. Wow. Let's not explore that any oh, further, boy. Okay. <laughs> now you're talking my way. No. Wait, no. Oh, which language? Your first language or the one you learned? Out of sight, my man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. So I'm getting that you learned English from watching episodes of Good Times. You got it. <laughs> All right, great. Dynamite. Hey, uh, hey, hey. Okay, that's fat, Albert. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> All right, so Jibs. <laughs> Honest. <laughs> do either of them suffer from any ailments? Ah, uh, yes. I haven't answered the other question, but oh, right. uh, 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 let, let's move on from that. Sure. But yeah, they both suffer from uh, hereditary Alzheimer's. They disease. both have Alzheimer's right now. Yes, currently. Any of them got uh, bad knees or joints? Um, they share a bad knee between them. What uh-huh. does that mean? Yeah, how does that happen? As a couple... Oh, they, so one of them has a bad knee. Yeah. Who, which one? <laughs> I don't have to answer that. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. I, I don't. You don't have to answer yeah. nothing. <laughs> All right. Did, uh, did any of them... Uh, did any of them... Uh, uh, wait, wait a minute. I think something's wrong. With, are they still together? I think something... Oh, oh, I think so. uh, oh my God. Uh, He's, his eyes are rolling into the back of his head. Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, he's pro- oh. Oh, sorry, just oh, okay. got something in my throat. Oh, yeah, is your airway blocked somehow? It was. Mm. Okay, Kumail, you were asking? <laughs> Are they still together? Are they still together? No. They both live uh, exactly at opposite ends of the earth because they can't stand to be around each other. And so they always check in with each other. They have global uh, positioning, tracking. Uh, so they move around? So that, so if anyone moves, they move the exact opposite They way. have to be the they furthest, be furthest amount of where, where, where are they right now? And they better be opposite. <laughs> yeah, tell us. Because you tell us and I'm going to Google it and make sure. Okay. They are, one of them, of course, no. is in, of course, we all know where one of them is. One of them is right here in, in Los Angeles. In Los Angeles, okay. Okay, California. So where is the opposite of L.A.? The, or where's the other one? We'll, we'll, the yeah. other one, of Because I wouldn't even know what I would need to look up in my phone to find that out. Yeah. yeah it's uh, The other one, of course, is uh, near the island of Mauritius in the Indian Ocean. Mauritius? In East, Mauritius in the Indian Ocean and east of the Republic of South Africa. Hey. <laughs> Which one's there, boy or girl? Do you mean grandma and grandpa? Yeah. <laughs> um, grandpa, my- grandpa's on the ocean. Grandpa's in the by Mauritius, mm-hmm. and uh, Grandma is here in LA. Oh, I just realized one of them's a guy and one of them's a girl. Yeah, it's a grandpa, it's grandpa and Grandma. Grandma, oh. and grandpa. <laughs> Wait, do you're very slow on the upkeep. I got Uptake. it. I know who I want, but go ahead and ask. Questions. Wait, is that all? <laughs> that was the only thing that you wanted to know is Easy. What, which one is a boy, which one is yeah, a girl. I got it now, but go ahead and ask questions. Oh, okay, all right, here we go. <laughs> Oh man! I feel like I yeah. I don't. I don't need to ask any more questions. Is it just based on the sex of the person? That's all you guys really want to yeah. know? Yeah. If you just yeah. we didn't know that there was a guy and a girl. And now that we know it's a guy really? and a girl, I, so, I knew it. Okay. All right. I've, clo- I've closed questions. the floor for questions. All right. Okay. Let's let's vote it up. Uh, Kamel, let's start with you. Who, who do you want? Uh, I want to be the guy. Why do you want to be the guy so bad? You've been a guy your entire life. Well, he's in Mauritius, and I've yeah. never had an old guy's body, so I'm excited <laughs> about gonna. that. You're going to. Yeah. God that's, willing. 
I'm excited about it. Yeah. In Mauritius. Yeah. So, but you've never wanted to experience the pleasure of uh, being a something woman? hitting your G spot? No, thank you. Really? You don't want that? Why mm-hmm. is that? I She's think... already been through menopause, too. She's already been through menopause. Who's going to have sex with an old lady? Wait, hold on. But she's not going to have babies, so you're going to fuck all you want, bro. But who's going to want to fuck her? What's the question? Meanwhile, an old guy, people (laughs) still would. What's the question again? Who do I who, who do I want to be or who do I want to fuck? <laughs> it's who do you want to be? Oh, oh, you shit, gotta rethink shit, this. Shit, 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 do shit. I need to reopen the? Here, I'll reopen the floor for questions. What? Who's got the best tushy? <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Wait, it's who you want to be, not who you want to fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, so this is important to you. All right. Yeah, okay. The, the, All right. The, who's got a better tushy? The grandpa de- or the grandpa? Definitely the grandpa. Grampy. <laughs> Yep. Does the grandpa have kind of old man titties, or does he just have kind of like, you know, just your average run-of-the-mill saggy skin? They both have old man titties. Oof. This grandma's looking pretty rough. (laughs) She got nice lips still, or are they all withered? Uh, They have the lines on them, you know, meaning she's pursed her lips too much. Yeah, she smokes, yeah, yeah. She got short hair or long hair? Uh, I would say it's pretty short. It's only down to her knees. She put leaves in it? Yeah, definitely. All the oh, time. She's back. She's back. Okay. <laughs> come back. The guy, does he have a fuller head of hair or no? His is is uh, on the short side as well. It's down to his calves. They both got all their eyes? Uh, they have all their eyes and a few others as well. Ooh, daddy, daddy, daddy. Like potatoes? They No, they collect human eyeballs. Oh. yeah. They both do? They yeah, should they get back do. together. <laughs> yeah, guys, they, they found well, each sets, other. Yeah, you know, I don't know. They Sometimes it's someone with whom you share a lot of common interests. You you just don't yeah, have that spark. I get that. Does the guy <laughs> still wait, have... Wait, who do you date? Oh. Who do I date? Yeah. Everything what? under the sun. <laughs> <laughs> How about things under rain clouds? <laughs> no. No? Don't so, be an asshole. <laughs> okay, so it has to be sunny. Yeah. Anyone you ever date. Do you ever go out at night and date people? No, no, no. I saved that for helping out the kids with oh. my pediatrician. <laughs> okay, business. so just exclusively day dating. Yeah. Yeah, beaches? Sure. Yeah, that's where most of the sun is. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's why I live here in Los Angeles. Uh-huh. Yeah. It's not about me. It was, <laughs> okay, I'll be the, I'll be the <laughs> grandpa. Okay. okay. All right, so you're voting? Sure. Okay, I didn't cl- reclose the floor for questions. Oh, I'm gonna I, don't, have, I don't give a shit. I'm, I'm going to have to I'm dock a, you a point. I'm a billionaire. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Winning or losing this game doesn't mean anything to you, does it? It's nothing. Do you want to put a billion dollars on it? Oh, how, what are the? What do you mean? What are the consequences? The consequences, if you lose, you, you pay me a billion dollars. You lose all your money. You lose all your money. Sure. If you win, I pay you a billion dollars. Do you have a billion dollars? He's got really good luck here. I don't know if you want to. I don't care. I don't care. Yeah, I have a billion dollars. Okay. Uh, what, what's the bet, though? The bet is that you are you are betting you're going to win this game. Okay. All right. All sure. Right. Sh- okay, shake on it. No, that's a high five. Just shake on it. No, stop it. Just stop hitting my hand. Just shake. Ow. 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 Why are you guys shaking on the microphone? Yeah. How else are they going to okay. know we're shaking? <laughs> All right. All right. Billion dollars on the line. I have to dock you a point for asking or uh, for voting early. But uh, now I've reclosed the floor and now I go to your votes. You're voting for who? Grandpa. Grandpa. Want to S- be him. You want to be him. Why is that? The tushy well, aspect? You got a tushy. He has multiple eyes. Got great old man poobies. <laughs> and uh, old man what? <laughs> boobies or poobies? <laughs> 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 Great question. <laughs> and uh, I just got a feeling about him. You got a feeling. Okay, we'll see if your vote pans out. And you voted the same as Kumail. And uh, now we turn to Martin. How do you vote? Uh, I'll be the lady. You'll be the lady. Lady is Jerry Jerry Seinfeld? No, Jerry. Jerry who, Seinfeld. Who nice lady. I What's think that the was... deal with this lady? That's yeah. Jerry Lewis Seinfeld. Jerry Lewis Seinfeld. Yes, Let's yes. get John Daly on it. <laughs> yeah, Let's get him. Um, you'll be the lady. Why is that? Eh, I'm going to die soon anyway if I'm one of these two old people. Yeah, so why not explore the, how the other half lives? Yeah. You know what I mean? Fuck and wi- don't women live longer than men, too? Or, yeah. is, that, or is that not true? Uh, Some of them don't. That's true. Uh, I guess it's person Good by point, person. Kumail. I would say it depends <laughs> on the woman. <laughs> it really? you got to take it on a case-by-case case basis. I think it's totally case-by-case. Case. <laughs> <laughs> well, you um, think you're going to look in the mirror, like down there, like Madonna? What do you mean, like Madonna. Well, Madonna would squat over a mirror and just check herself out and stuff. Mm-hmm. Really? <laughs> so you, yeah, it's in her book. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, sex. Yeah. So do you right. think you would do that? Is that the first thing you would do? Uh, 
you know, I'd probably get like a boob job first. Boob job? You're lucky to survive the <laughs> surgery. <laughs> what? At that age. <laughs> Yeah, you don't want to go undergo any kind well, of procedure. How old are you? You guys don't get to tell me elected. what to do. <laughs> I'm going to be the old lady. I get to decide what happens to So you're to getting a boob boobs. job. Okay. I'm going to get a boob job. All right. So, But you're not going to check out your vagina before unless, the boob job? Unless they're like real nice and perky for my age. Then I'll say fuck it. Well, you got the man the man boobies, you the have, old man boobies. You have boobies. male breasts. Know, I'm a woman. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but we talked to you. got to listen. You got to listen. I don't listen. Even right. the girl and the guy both have old man boobs. All right, so I'm definitely getting a boob job. Yeah. All right, very good. Just accept your body. All right, let's tally up the- I will, <laughs> after I get a boob job. <laughs> let's tally up the points. Uh, we have, of course, uh, we all started zero. Uh, Camille, you have zero. Martin, you have zero. And uh, over here we have Joey uh, got a point docked because he asked a question. Uh, no, he voted early. That was so he's negative not, one. So he's not, negative one. Not worried. All right. <laughs> Billion dollars on the line. We ready to go? Sure. This is all your money. Most of it. Mm-hmm. The correct answer is the man, oh. the grandpa. Hey, all right. We and you get, a, you get 100 points for choosing the grandpa, which means, Kamel, I... you're at 100, and Joey, you're at 99. Whoa. So is... he lost. He lost. I'm so sorry. So you lost all your money. What are you talking about? <laughs> you all your a... money's gone. You owe me a billion dollars. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> What, what, what are you talking about? You, you, put, you, you bet all your money. I won. I have 100 points. You have 99. You have to pay Scott. Oh, my wife is going to kill me. Wait, who's your wife? Uh, Ghost to Dom DeLuise. <laughs> <laughs> who's still alive, I think. No, Dom DeLuise passed oh, years, uh, ago. years ago. Bless his heart. <laughs> so oh, he's going he's gonna to kill me. Is this some sort of insidious situation where a ghost is going to kill you? You or? don't want all I can say is. Yeah. Spend that money quickly because it's cursed. Oh my, how long have you had this money? Uh, you know, 10 years, and I've been running from it ever since. Oh so my. go ahead and have it. But, uh, you know, you're going to just, uh, you know, not yeah. be able to sleep very so well. So you wanted to lose this money? <laughs> I didn't say, I'm not going to say I wanted to lose it. I'm just How many say hours I, a night do you sleep? Two. Only two? Every night. Do you sleep? Uh, do you sleep the two, and then you wake up, and then you sleep some more? Yeah, I sleep <laughs> six more hours. Okay, well, this doesn't sound so bad. I mean, I usually get up after a couple hours and get a glass of water or something. Yeah, same here. Okay. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know that this is a curse as much as just you're waking up in the middle of it. So, so your curse is. Uh, you wake up two hours in, and then you go to sleep for six more hours. In return, in t- for this curse, you get a billion dollars. Hey, good luck. <laughs> okay. Good luck, Scott. I wouldn't right. want to be you. I would just, I'd play the lottery again if I were you. Nah, I'm done with that game. <laughs> what, what about the DJing? Done. Really? That's it for you? Yeah, I told you guys. My passion is in children. All right. Well, oh, oh God. Well, that's how we play uh, Would You Rather, of course. Nice. Well, it's Hollywood facts, and we're going downtown. Going to Inglewood now. Everybody do your facts and know your stars. There's glitz and glamour and lots of bars. Get a drink at a club. Then go walk in front of Chinese theater. Hollywood facts. Take out your dick. Check out the facts. It's the Hollywood facts. Bro. All right. Great game. That was really, I'm, I made out like a bandit. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. And boy, to, but knowing that I'm going to wake up two hours after I And then you'll be able to sleep. Yeah. I don't and know. you have a billion dollars. I don't know. Camille, do you want it? Yeah. I'll, really? I could just yeah. have it? Just give it to Camille. Instead wait, wait, wait. I wake up for two hours, after two hours. How long do you wake up for? Yeah. How long are you up for? Uh, I don't know. Couple minutes, couple minutes depends. <laughs> Sometimes it's like two, two, three minutes. Sometimes I go right, right back to bed, like <laughs> forty-five seconds. I'm up. Okay. Uh, it's yeah, it's, it's, it's not worth it to me. I don't it's want hell. it. It's I don't want it. Uh, Martin, really? please. I don't want take, it. You want this money, Martin? Please. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay. Yeah. Just oh, wait. You wake up every night. Oh no, I heard everything you guys. Two hours about. after you yeah. sleep, I'll take the money. Uh, sure. Get out your computers, by the way. I want to make sure this wire transfer goes through. You, okay. everyone, bought their own. So PCs. it has to go through from him to you to me. Me to, to Martin. Yeah, okay, here we go. Okay. All right, I got my computer out here. Okay, right. click, 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 right. click, click. <laughs> you don't have to <laughs> hey, say don't it. Don't say it. Just do it. <laughs> it's radio. How are they going to know? <laughs> click, clack, click, 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 click. He actually is typing and he's saying clickety clack. Yeah, clickety clack, clickety clack. He's, he's got a MacBook Pro. I don't know yeah. why. I, I guess I'll do it too. Let me let me log on to my website. Let's see. Click, clack, click, clack, wingdings.com. Click, clack, click, clack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I got the money. I got the money. All right, very good. Camille, let me send right. this over to you. Yeah, send it to me? Yeah, okay. Click, clack, click, clack, click, clack, click, click, click. All right, I'm going to log into my computer password. I am here, one, two, three, four. I am and here, one, two, three, four. Enter. Do you, you got to remind yourself? That's my password. That's, him, that's, him, ta- that's him talking to his computer, I think. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I am here. And, and giving it four one, seconds one, to two, prepare three, itself. Three, four, <laughs> enter, and... It's starstruck constantly. <laughs> oh, my God, it's Kamehameha Nanjiani from the meltdown. <laughs> I can't believe it. He's logging into me. <laughs> Look at the screen. It's full of autographs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy, you can't even read what's on no, your screen. You've I signed should, it so many times. Yeah, I should have used a dry erase. Jesus. <laughs> Instead of the... Show. And Oh, I got the money here, and I'm going to send it to you now. Great. Hey, can I borrow your computer, Joey? Yeah, sure. All right, great. Thanks, sure. buddy. Quack, 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 quack. Oh, man, that made a weird quack, sound quack. going across the table. <laughs> All like right. A cat dying. <laughs> All right, All I sent right. it to you. Uh, I'm just going to log into Joey's computer. Okay. Um, mm-hmm. Click, clack, click, clack, great, click, great. click, clack, click, clack. Mm-hmm. So it's the computer. <laughs> <laughs> Click, yeah. click, click, click. That's what a computer says. Like, man. I don't see anything. Nothing's changed, I don't think. I just sent it to you. Yeah, you have to log into your own account. Like, wait, you, really you logged. It? Wait, you logged into my computer? No, no. no oh, I, it went right back to me. No, no, it didn't. Oh. You didn't get it. It's huh? Not, it's not here. Wait, wait a minute. Don't you get it? What's happening here? There never was any billions of dollars. What? Wait. <laughs> well, I don't get it. <laughs> Rip. It's me, you guys. It's Tommy Middleton. Hey! Oh, oh my all, God. You d- all you did was rip off your Hitler mustache. <laughs> yeah. And it's you. We never commented on the Hitler mustache. <laughs> yeah, well, that's classic Joey Tortellini. <laughs> oh, my God, it is you. Yeah. How did you pull the wool over our eyes for so long? A silly voice and a fake mustache. How much money do you have, Thomas? Couple bucks. <laughs> nice, bro. <laughs> yeah, man, let's get some spring rolls. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, what do we want to plug? Is it silicone? So Valley? Like, no. no. It's not? Because <laughs> no. I'm more interested in that show. Yeah. We all are. Yeah. With the are boobies. Are, are, you are? You're, you fake boobies? No. Yeah. You like the... You like the uh, fake uh, boobies? I like, I like, you know... You know hey, I'll take them where I can get them. <laughs> Go down well, some, you know. well, you know, I like ones that, you know, uh, Mother Nature g- gave to you. A plenty. <laughs> plenty. Either a plenty... <laughs> They're or, still or, there. Or, Either a plenty or not a plenty, just as long as they, they do right. <laughs> but what Mother Nature doesn't give you, it's okay to <laughs> let man take care of. <laughs> okay, Scott. <laughs> huh? <laughs> I, I'm hey, sorry, I just... Hey, I, man, I, I'm a pretty staunch feminist. I'm sorry, Thomas. I... I you, nothing you've said in this podcast has led me to believe anything like that. And your whole character seemed really disgusting. Well, that's a character. Okay. I'm an actor. Oh, I, okay. I can play a character that's unlike myself. Really? I've seen no evidence of that oh. in Silicon Valley. Oh, really? Well, what do you really like? Well, I'm a smooth-talking skateboarder. Oh! Feminist. Feminist. <laughs> <laughs> Not a lot of you out there. Not I'm, enough of you, I should I'm a say. Smooth talking feminist skateboarder. Okay. <laughs> Professionally sponsored. Mm. Oh, are you guys talking about Tommy Middleton? By, uh, yeah, baby. All right. Shredding the half pipes. Mm-hmm. Who uh, whom sponsors you? Bust magazine. Right? Bust magazine. <laughs> okay, this is. Um, I don't believe you when you say you're a feminist. Then. Pussieseverywhere.com. <laughs> okay, I don't know. Uh, all bitches are sluts. Okay, come on. <laughs> Dot Org- truth. Organization. <laughs> Dot truth. Is the meltdown back on? Uh, the meltdown is going to be back in July, like a late summer, and uh, July to me, July is midsummer. Okay, well, July to late. Talk summer. to Shakespeare about this. He'd agree. Is that a thing? Yeah. Shakespeare loves July. <laughs> <laughs> he has a lot of season-based stuff. July oh. Diaz, who listens to these episodes, <laughs> just perked up, by the way. July <laughs> is when it airs. <laughs> he's, yeah, he, if he's yeah. falling asleep while he's yeah. listening to this. Yeah. He's, July <laughs> is when Meltdown airs. <laughs> <laughs> I just got to sleep two hours ago. <laughs> this damn money. <laughs> <laughs> do you guys want to do a movie like Entourage did a movie? Yes. Do you, what about <laughs> what about a co movie with those guys? Yes, Vinny Chase, man. I just met you, Jerry Ferrara. Yeah, how's Jerry he? Jerry Ferrara. You t- you, wait, you talking about Turtle? Yeah, I met Turtle. You blew Turtle in me. I just, I just. You blew Turtle? 
I didn't blow, Turtle. I just <laughs> met the guy. Oh, well, I that's thought he how asked you met. and you nodded. Uh, which, which, when you, you met me, you blew me. Yeah, that's different. <laughs> oh, why? Because <laughs> you're you, you and he's Jerry Ferrari. Oh, okay. you, where'd you but you also blew me when you met me. Yeah, that's you. Wait, so that's not a thing that you do with everybody? Not with Jerry Ferrari. You told me you did that with everybody. That's why I let you do I had at that point done it to everybody I'd met. So why is why, when, why, why did, he, how did he change it? Huh? Off the hook, literally. literally. He, why <laughs> he didn't change it? I changed my policy before I met him. When did this happen? When I met my dad. <laughs> what? And that's how I met my father. I didn't want to. I didn't want to blow my dad. Kids coming, coming to oh you. Fall on <laughs> ABC. Kids, I didn't want to blow him. <laughs> Um, what, what if you guys did like a co-movie where it's like Vinny Chase needs money for Aquaman 2 and he, he comes to see you guys? That's, and, and we're like, we'll p- privately finance the m- m- movie. If you <laughs> introduced us to some of your friends, ghosts. Why do we want to introduce to ghosts? I was expecting girls. Girls. Oh, girls, it's another show on HBO. Yeah. Anyway, so you guys are. Anyway. April 12, Game of Thrones, the Targashi. Or whatever, uh, keeping up with the Targaryens. That's what not, is it? Oh, uh, that's keep, a uh, call funny or die, guys. Keeping up with the Targaryens. Let's call funny or die. Oh, we get him on the phone right now. Let's get him on the phone. Bring, 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 bring. Funny or die. We're always looking for new videos. How may I direct your call? <laughs> hey, 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 can you get us to maybe like Owen Burke's office or something? Owen Burke. Oh, can, maybe, we, actually, can we talk to Will Ferrell? Yeah, well, let's yeah, talk to Will Ferrell. You call funny or die to okay. get to Gary Sanchez, then to get to Will Ferrell. Certainly. Yeah. May I connect your call to Will Ferrell directly? Yeah, I think we have to go through Owen Burke first. All right, here, yeah. here's Mr. Burke on the line. <laughs> hey, hey, guys. Hey, Owen. Hey, it's so. How's it going? Man, it's so good to hear from you, man. I just, I, I'm, so, I'm such a big fan. Oh, yeah, thank well, you. Well, uh, Who yeah. is this? Oh, this is uh, <laughs> Tommy Middleditch, uh, Kamal, and, and Martin. Martin. From Silicon Valley. I'm such a big right. fan. Thank you. Hey, is well, Will? F- can can you connect us to Will Ferrell? Yeah, no problem. Bring, bring, bring. Hi guys, this is Will Farrell. Are you taking a shit right now? I'm doing Harry Carey now. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. permanently? I'm practicing for Broadway. Oh, cool. You're, You're doing, doing a doing... one-man Harry Carey show? Yeah, just like my George W. Bush show. Oh, cool. Okay, we have a great idea Didn't for you. you. Did Hit me. <clears throat> Ask you a question first. Do you know Game of Thrones? No. All right. Oh, fuck. <laughs> we made it. Hit we me said... with what it is, though. Uh. Uh, we'll call you back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, Shit. we killed him. <laughs> wow. What a missed opportunity. Uh, oh, man. We should have had a backup idea. Oh. <laughs> we were oh, on the well. phone with Will Ferrell. Oh, well. Yeah. Anchorman 3. What? Just, uh, just say Anchorman 3. Oh! You guys could have been millionaires. Oh, shit, man. Oh, oh, man. We really yes. fucked that up. How many reels is this film? Seven? It's digital. I'm pretty sure. Oh, uh, okay. All right. Oh, zero, zero reels. Digital. Mm-hmm. But ones and zeros. A lot, a lot of yes. zeros in okay. that regard, yes. Very good. <laughs> About half of them, I would imagine. Yeah, have uh, they, have they broken down digital things of like what percentage is ones and what percentage Did is zeros? Did you just find out about ones and zeros today, <laughs> <Yeah>. Scott? <laughs> it feels it feels like you're really, by it. You're is, it like, is it like men and women where it's 51% women and 49% men? You wait, know what I mean? T- the no, ones wait. get paid more. Is I will the world say that. still 51% women? I think so. Uh, tell that to China. Okay, what? I will. Yeah, China. Can you get them on China the phone has for like, me? China or? has like a shortage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, yeah. I'm gonna call a massive shortage. China. Okay. Ring, ring, ring. ring. <laughs> Hello. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Claire, hang up. Hang up. Hang, oh, up, no. hang, up, hang oh, up. Hang up. Hang up. Okay. Why did they call no, me? No. <laughs> hang up. Hang up. Stop. Uh, why oh. they call me? No. no. Now the line is <laughs> now the line is still open. Please end. Please Wait, wait, wait. Hashtag. We gotta get this line fixed because it's still open. How do we hang up this phone? No, let's talk to her. Am I on speakerphone? Excuse me, ma'am. Ma'am, I'm a I'm a big boy. Uh, sir. Yes. Uh, we call. We are calling from the United States of America. That's correct. Welcome. Um, Welcome. Why, We've I'm been curious. Here forever. This is. We're calling China right now. Yeah. 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 I'm, what's your name? I'm, <laughs> what's your name? My name is Shrashen. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You spell it with a wing ding. 
Oh, oh we know the wingdings. But that's how you get to a secret internet, so... Why did you answer the phone in English? That's what I'm curious about. Yeah. Because English is so hip and cool. <laughs> okay. Please, we have to hang up no, on this. No, no, no. no I need to ask. That's why you call? I need to ask. No. I was well, come on, don't waste my time. Hey, don't be an asshole. What do you guys think of, like... Female babies there. We oh uh, well we like them now, but before because you were only allowed to have one. So you want your family? Never, never with a female. Mm -hmm. So you throw you, them in a river or whatever. But you need females to make babies. Nah, you throw nah, them in the river or whatever. Man, relax. It's China, baby. You sound sexy. <laughs> oh wait, Camille, you have a fan. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm straight okay. <laughs> what? All right. Hang up. Hang up on this guy. Oh, boy. <laughs> Hang up on this big boy. All right. Click. Click. All right. Whew, boy. That, that was fascinating. <laughs> that was great. Sorry. I stepped out to the bathroom. What did I miss? <laughs> uh, I want to oh, plug. No. Oh, my gosh. Comedy Bang Bang TV show is back this Friday. We have uh, Joseph Gordon-Levitt this Friday along with uh, uh, John Gabris and Allison Tolman from Fargo. How was he? Is he a nice guy? Uh, Joseph Gordon-Levitt? Yeah, he's great. Yeah, he's very funny on the show. He's a nice guy? Yeah, yeah he's, he's great. <laughs> yeah, he's awesome. Um, and, uh, he's cute, knows how to dance. Yep, knows how, knows how to do everything. He's, should we he's, should find out what China thinks of Joseph Gordon-Levitt? <laughs> yeah, let's call him up. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Why you call me again? Wait, you know who this... Oh, caller yeah, ID. Call ID. Uh, what, hey, we, we're not, we're not, this is not old China. This is new China. We have older, <laughs> older uh, technology. Hey, 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 hey. What hey, do you hey. think of Joseph Gordon-Levitt? Oh, he sung and danced man. Do everything. <laughs> Inception... <laughs> okay, we don't want his resume. What do you uh, think of him? Oh, I like him. Never met him. Okay, I met him. Oh, what's he like? He's great. Okay. <laughs> okay, click. <laughs> Good call. Hey, we gotta get this phone fixed <laughs> oh, now. The line is open again. God damn it. Why do we always have it open? Click. Click, I say. Uh, click. <gasps> click, I say to you too. <laughs> no, click. <laughs> click, click. Okay, okay. I hang up on my end. Okay? All right, you hang up. One, two, right. three. <laughs> click. Click. No, one, two, three. <laughs> no. If it ha if it don't happen at the same time, okay, we'll we never hang up. We'll All be right, in ready? a loop forever. All right. One, one two, two, three, three four. Cl click. click. Why you do four? Uh, I don't know. Oh, I don't you know try to you try to trick me. You try to trick me. No. Okay, what, is it click on three or click on after three? One, two, three, click. That's okay, how it always go. go. You don't know. You don't watch Little Weapon. Okay, sir. Here we go. Uh, Danny Glover. All right. Here we go. Ready? <laughs> okay. One, two, one, three, two. click. Why are you doing so fast? <laughs> oh, my God. You're so fat and stupid. How do I you know? I bet you don't go do you, 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 Your school is so ashamed of you. They have your <laughs> they have your photo up on the wall to say, look how fat and ugly Scott Ackerman is. Wait, how do you know who I am? Because I know everything. Oh, caller ID. God yeah. damn. All right, here we go. Ready? One, two, two three, three, click. click. <laughs> Guys, ah, what I miss? <laughs> oh, man, you missed a lot. <sighs> what was that? I just have hiccups. Oh, <laughs> uh, you laughed him into a state of hiccups. Oh my God, what happened here? I just when we were talking to China, something bad. Yeah, I feel like we should okay. call China again. I know how to get rid of hiccups. Here, <laughs> yeah. give, give me your hands. Uh, I th really? Mm -hmm. Okay, I gotta read. read. Oh, okay, look in my eyes. If this doesn't work, we should call China and ask them their strategy. <laughs> All right, you guys have to shut up. All right. <laughs> what is your name? Kamel. Where were you born? Wait, are you doing Scientology to me? Yeah. Don't do Scientology this to guy, me. This guy's an SP. <laughs> I, don't this guy's a suppressive person. Let's shut him down. Let's let's ostracize him. <laughs> yeah. All right. Get out of here. And remember, <laughs> if you were offended by any of those Chinese accents, email kumailnanjiani at hotmail.com. <laughs> yep. That's yeah. my actual email. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Please welcome. He's an amateur barrister. Oh, oh that's wow. interesting. A barrister is a lawyer, by the way, Jason. I'm so, aware uh, of that in England. Okay. I just wanted to make sure that you knew. Or you're kind I guess of maybe in person. Canada as well. I'm not sure, well, actually. you can be a barrister here as well. I mean, you can really. Well, I mean, you can be one in England, but you're still known, you know, known as one here. Yeah, but you wouldn't be practicing. Sure, but I'm saying that you, you know, if someone were to vacation over here, okay, and, and a barrister, a barrister, and you would say, well, yeah, sure, Isn't what do you do for I'll... a living? The person wouldn't have to say, I'm a lawyer because no, I'm in America. Of course not. Of course not. But they could not say, I am practice. I'm a practicing barrister. 
<laughs> sure. But well, one could only say they're a practicing barrister when they're actually in the middle of practicing law. And why would they ever say that in the middle of a court case? No, they could say it if they were home for the night after nope. having done it. Nope. I'm a practicing barrister. The minute you I did clock, it today nope, and I'll do it tomorrow. The minute you clock out, you cannot say it anymore. I don't think that checks out. Anyway, we'll ask him all these questions. Please welcome Edmund Carlyle. Hello, Edmund. Hello, everyone. <laughs> it's so it great to meet you. Lovely yeah. to meet you. Yeah, it's a pleasure to be here. Can you settle this argument that Jason and I are having? Are you a practicing barrister right now, even though you are in... Uh, in the States? I am a practicing barrister, but that's only because I'm practicing currently. You're, now. Oh, you are right now? What are you doing right now? Why I'm on you're, a case. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. I'm hot on the case. Here in Los Angeles? Yes. It, but in the podcast, you're saying you're, you're practicing right now, like right this minute? Well, I've got my books here. Oh. And I've got my papers. Is being on the show part of your case? I'm not allowed to say. Interesting. Oh, attorney-client privilege or barrister-client privilege. Yes, I'm not allowed to say. So are oh, you? Okay. So interestingly, you are like on a case, like um, almost like a like a detective or something. Like, is part of being a barrister like really figuring out the legal cases? I know a couple of detectives, by the way, who come by the show every once in a while. You're not like them, are you? No, no, no. Oh, I no. see. Yes, I see. I didn't make that connection. <laughs> Definitely. You're nothing like that. Yeah. No, no, no. Totally, and, totally and different. And I must remind you, I am amateur. I don't have a license. Oh, you don't? Okay. I what, I do what, is a, what I do as a trade is I've got a small hobby shop in um, Essexton in northwest Chestershire. Oh, that's okay. a beautiful part of the country. Beautiful, beautiful. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I've got all types of tin soldiers and lead figurines and sure. remote control. Priceless items. These are your hobbies? Helichopters. What? These are your hobbies you have these? I sell them. Did you oh, say helichopters? In a way, I sell dreams to children. Oh, wow. Yes. Oh, wait a minute. So that you have a store have that a does store. this? I see. Also an, also okay. an online oh, oh, Wait a minute, though. So you're using... <laughs> this is your story. You, in trade, you are giving... Well, how do you trade the tin? Do you get money for this? Is of what course. he's trying to ask. To okay, be, an, cool. to be a, an amateur barrister, yeah. meaning he's doing it in his free time. Got it. Oh, okay. This There's is a, what he does for I'm a living. I'm a member of the ABA, the yeah. Amateur Barristers Association. Of the course, ABA. yep. Right. As well as the uh, North West Cheshire Royal Reenactment Brigade. Oh, wow. What do you, do you reenact? Well, anything from the English Civil War to... All um, wars, or is it anything that... Uh, there was a nice dinner party in 746. You reenact that? Yes, that was between the Chunts family and the and the, Blum, the Blums. The Chunts and the Blums. <laughs> Chunts so, and Blums. So you reenact... Chunts, that is like the Hatfields and McCoys oh, of, yeah. of oh, yeah. North West for Yes, if you're familiar with... Is the with Chunts the, and Blums feud of the, of yes. the you 700s. You reenact the, the conversation that was had at the dinner party? Well, yes, it was quite well known that it was well documented. We still have the papers, the transcripts. Mm -hmm. And in those instances, do you usually play Chump or Blum? I've played both. I've played oh, all wow. the members so far. The only one I haven't played is uh, Toglin, the do the small dog. Oh, yeah. Oh, sure. okay. Yep. Do they usually get dogs for that? Usually. Although I have a bit of a rivalry with a man in the troop um, he's played the dog a, a few times, but wow. he's a. Oh, that must really make you oh, crazy. Yes, but he's a small man. He's um, one of them. Uh, well, let's know, not. It's okay. Small. We, we get what you mean. Small. <laughs> he's, he's a tiny man. Yeah. He's a t <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Got it. So it's so you know he's a natural. There's fit. not a lot of parts he can play. Well, other yes. than the dog. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I mean, of course. There's plenty of parts he can play. He can play any part he wants. Well, not realistically. Good boy. <laughs> No, it's true. Realism <laughs> is quite important to a reenactment. Take to the forums, yeah. everybody. Start, <laughs> start trying to straighten Scott out on this one. <laughs> um, um, that's so interesting. So, so how often you're you're living a life that is so rich? These right. three things: the reenactments, and then there's my sex parties. Oh, you also have sex parties. Quite, quite a lot. Did you attend, them. host, both? I Film? host. I'm the I'm the Grand Chancellor of the <laughs> West. <laughs> Coxburg, uh, you well have these named. in West Coxburg. West, well named West Coxburg, uh, fuck parties, <laughs> fuck parties. Oh, wow, yeah. so you guys leave oh, nothing the, to the imagination. You're the Grand Chancellor of the fuck parties. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've noticed this book. You've written down. I'm sort of flipping through it here. Sure. You've written down almost everything that's ever happened to you in your life to yes. the second. Yes, there's a lot there. Uh, this is written in like a dark fluid. Yeah, they are dead. 
they are all dead. Oh wow. yeah, I was um that's written in my sheets. <laughs> and oh, I'm referring did to you, wait, hold on. I'm <laughs> referring to the turds that I put out my butthole. <laughs> so uh, they're all dead because I flashed them and they're gone. <laughs> what, you bring your writing implement into the bathroom with well, you? I don't I try not to do a lot of writing <laughs> while I'm on the toilet. Sure. But they were they I finally got them out. I finally flashed finally. them. Finally. How long did that do? How long did that Those take? Those little turds were in there for about <laughs> ten years. What? Ten, wait, ten, ten years? Ten years. Yeah, was, did you age test them? I just know that I'll ha- you, you know when you, you haven't know poo- when you, got when you haven't a couple had a mo- rattling around in there. <laughs> you haven't had a movement about no, ten why, years. Why? Why ten years between bowel movements? <laughs> I don't know. As I say, I've had a lot of things happen to me. One time when I was eight years old, nothing's got, ever scared the shit out of you. <laughs> I got scared really bad, mm. and my. My my colon just clenched up. Oh, you know, it just tightened to, up yes. like. But like you have been, I'm assuming, <laughs> eating for the last ten yeah. years. So it's just been like piling up. Yeah. Or do you only eat what you need in order to sustain yourself? So there's no waste. Have you been able to balance that out? I I, I eat. I mean, I drink rainwater. Sure. And I eat uh, bird seed. <laughs> bird seed. Yes. And, and I so eat, so there's have, not I, enough I, to make waste. So those yeah. little poos that have been rattling yeah. around but I like, for ten years since you were years old. I like to take, you know, you get a pop tart, you know, yep. pop tart, and sure. you scrape off the little bits of icing. Yeah. Sure. I eat that. <laughs> you eat the icing or you eat the that, the thing that, that has been scraped off? You eat off? that and rainwater. Yeah. <laughs> I scrape off the little icing shavings. And that's, like, that's, that's a pretty so like, nice But here trick. in LA, like, we have, like, all this great, like, sushi or Mexican food or stuff that is so, like, uh, particular to Southern California. Do you, have you been ex- uh, going out and do, uh, experimenting with any of that kind of food? Can you or? try to consolidate that question? Can you just say, hey, have you eaten anything else? God. Listen to the way that yeah. rambled on. I'm still like, good with it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still good with it. <laughs> well, I will say it's it's a bit. I'm in a bit of a of a transitional period. Well, yeah, you just shit I, I two just, days ago. I just had a movement, mm-hmm. so I am contemplating. But you're you thinking know, about eating again? Yes. And but you if anything, better not get scared. Again. If anything spooks me, <laughs> oh well, right. no way. Well, I don't think anything's going to spook you while <laughs> okay. you're here, so uh, right. I wouldn't worry about that. <laughs> yeah, it'd be nice. Did you inherit this hobby shop? Or I built it. I built it with my bare hands. You, wait, you built the shop? Yes. So you're sort of in construction as well. I uh, yes, you could say it's not built very well. Oh, right. it does stand. <laughs> Wait it. a minute. So okay, you great. So it's almost like you're an amateur builder, and it it's like a makeshift lean-to or something. I circumnavigated due to my studies as a barrister. I circumnavigated a bit of the regulational law. Okay, it's not up to code, in other words? <laughs> in some ways. Why are you <laughs> looking at us like that? You know what I mean? <laughs> no, you're trying to hint very strongly at something, and I don't know it exactly It sounds what like it's a very rickety, unsafe structure that you've just barely, because of legal knowledge, been able to get away with legally keeping open. You could say that. <laughs> why do? Why did you even want to start a hobby shop? Is that a passion of yours? It's where the money is. Oh, a hobby shop? Yes, I huh. make. I make a lot of money. A lot much? of pounds sterling. Okay, how much? Uh, okay, well, I get paid in gold. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I only do business in bullion. Oh, <laughs> really? Yes. Okay, and I've, so far, I I don't have the exact um, currency number for you but I've got it in tonnage okay okay how many, how many ton- tons, how many of, tons gold? of gold yeah I've got about 450 tons of 450 gold. tons that is quite a, wait a ton is 2,000 pounds from just the hobby shop yes Yes. Well, and cover charge at my sex parties. Oh, okay. well, how much is that? Are you it's, combining it? Well, it's even all still, under the same. What's the more it's all under the same LLC. What's, yeah, okay, <laughs> so what's wait. What's that company called? <laughs> <laughs> Miniatures and cocks. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I don't think a lot of the people at the sex party want those two things side by side. <laughs> Speaking of side by sides, though, you ever get a side by side? I bet there's definitely been a side by side at one of those parties. Naturally. Oh, we of do course, side by yeah. sides, fronts to backs. F you to do bees? fronts to backs, really? F to Bs? F to Bs. Not, we, not yeah. Bs to Fs, though. Oh, yes. Back to front? And That's back, dangerous. And back to back. Somebody's going to get a yeast infection. Top to downs, bottoms to rounds. Yep. Actually, I wonder if you know a side-by-side that we know. Who's that fam- Who's that side-by-side that we... Uh, I'm not going to remember. <laughs> e- uh, 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 <laughs> can I ask you this? Yes. When, 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 which, which, which rather is more lucrative for you? 
Uh, Chip you're- Gardner. Oh, Chip Gardner. Chip Gardner was a side-by-side, side, yeah, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. Yeah, do you know Chip Gardner? Has he ever come across the pond, as he they say? He was an honorary mayor of New York, of, uh, of, of, Lus- of Hollywood. Of Hollywood, Hollywood. yeah. What does he look like again? He, he uh, has blonde hair. Glasses. He uh, <laughs> wears a brown coat. <laughs> oh, yeah, Chip Gardner. Yeah, yeah. yeah Chip Gardner. Yeah. yeah, we've had him. Good guy. Yeah. Good guy. Yeah. yeah. Great at fucking. Yeah. Yeah, I would imagine. Well, he's got both things. Yeah, yeah. he's a true side-by-side. Side. <laughs> yeah. Um, how how much money are you? I mean, are you pulling in for each? That's what I'm wondering. Like, is the hobby shop? Oh no, this is the four, sex. The sex parties are what's paying for it. Four hundred tons of gold. Yeah. No, you uh, you must. Do you blackmail all the people who are in these sex parties as well? No, no, it's all above board. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. That's yeah. what I like about England. It's such a, like a a repressed kind polite. of class based polite system, but everybody's just fucking each other's brains out. Yes, mm-hmm. you Quite. know, and with, like guilt free, no shame, no nothing. Yes. Do yes. you have guilt, or is there no guilt about it? Only for the men I've slain. Okay. Slain. Slain. So maybe you. What you is meant that, to is say that is a slang word for sex. No. In, what in obviously, the UK? Jason, what he meant to say was men I've lain with. Yeah, in a way. <laughs> Wait, did you mean slain? Do you know what that word means? You're an 18 year old boy. Maybe you don't know what that well, word no, means. No, I mean, uh, you know, there are men that part of the whole thing for them is to be uh, ritualistically gently, murdered. <laughs> gently murdered. Gently. As you, as you would uh, like a goat you really like. And you want to, you have to eat it, but you but don't. But I want just to. want to make sure for listening, this is a consensual murder. Naturally. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm not walking around killing people willy nilly. Wi- not willy nilly. No, but I've got a conscience. Willy, you know. mi- willy nilly did just turn up dead. Yeah, by the way, do you know anything about his murder? <laughs> I don't know. Resident of Cockburn, unsolved murder. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know anything about William Nilly. William Nilly. <laughs> willy nilly. <laughs> <laughs> Our good friend William Nilliam and, was missing. And I am very upset that his his murder is going unsolved, but this is interesting that you, what you're saying. Yes. Well, no, I don't know. He I, I, he, I never really ran into him all that much. He kept to Got himself. Okay. Willi- William Nilliam. How do you murder of. these people? I mean, you, well, I've only murdered two men, so okay. it's not as if I'm rampant. Okay. But they do these two. But both. You're, you are in the double digits in the sense of like. You know, no, if you is not I'm assuming, no, if you're if you're doing it uh, like with little slices, like the little Roman numeral. <laughs> yeah. I'm assuming you've done it in a way. <laughs> I'm assuming you've done it in a way that you you're know in that you won't digits be if legal. You've done three. You what? won't be legally implicated. I'm assuming you've done it in a way they with your barrister's forms. knowledge. Yeah, they yeah. had their forms filled out by the by the. Um, oh yeah, by the amateur barrister himself. Well, yes. Well, I mean, they needed help. There's a lot of neat legal navigation. Wait a minute, are you remember ju- that case of the guy? And the, uh, they found, these two guys found each other on the internet, and one guy wanted to eat a man, and one yeah. guy wanted to, to be, be eaten. eaten. And they yeah. found each other. They yeah. found each other, they got together, they cut the man's penis off, yes. mm-hmm. they cooked it up, mm-hmm. and then they both <laughs> ate some of the penis. Yes. Wait, but the guy who wanted to be eaten ate his part ate, of his penis? He tried his own penis He was like, as this well. looks too good. Yeah. <laughs> I've, got, I've got to have some. <laughs> could you, I wonder if you could make that come. <laughs> Interesting. I'm, t- I'm telling you, Scott. You can make anything come <laughs> with a little bit of sauce. So you wait. So you drew up these contracts. Well, yes. And well, they, with you, forms. with you, of power of barrister or power of attorney, did you sign them for the person? Well, yes. There's a two two one uh, subsection four yeah. form. That you've can got I talk to, to Jason out. here for a second? Yeah. Do you mind taking off your headphones? And yeah, just I'll be talk? here. Hey, Jason. Hey, what's up, bro? This guy this is guy's made... cool as shit. No, he's right? not. Cool as shit. I love this guy. You've got to pick a pocket or two, boys. You've got to pick he's a pocket or two. He's singing from Oliver. Yeah. What is he? Why is he which singing Bill like... Sykes' song from Love Oliver? Which I feel like, by the way, you would love. This guy's like right up your alley. Jason, I'm worried that he's going to try to convince you to go to a fuck party, go to a fuck oh, party, and then yourself. be murdered, and he's going to fill out all of the paperwork on oh, your behalf just because be murdered, he wants to be murdered. Why would I want to be murdered? Oh. You wouldn't want to be murdered. I'm saying he's covering it up by by making these legal binding documents that he signs Scott, from power of attorney. Scott, don't worry, I can take care of myself. Okay, we've only here just made a new best friend. Okay, who I, know, I worry about. I am you. only suspicious. May have killed Willie Millie. House. Oh, guns are the other. I kind of want to hear the rest of the song. <laughs> yeah, let's just great. pretend we're talking sure. and hear the rest. Oom papa, oom papa, that's how it goes. 
Whom papa, whom papa, anyone knows. I'm sorry. Oh, hey. Are you done talking? Oh, oh uh, wait, were you listening to us, bro? I just saw you <laughs> silently looking we at me. We should have moved all. our mouths. <laughs> we should have moved our mouths He's listening silently. to us like we were on a treadmill or something. Oh, that's it. I don't know. Uh, hey, we were just uh, talking. Um, uh, and I know that you uh, and Jason are really hitting it off here. Um, yeah. If you if you do want to come by any of my party, I would love to come by a party. It sounds like it sounds fun, and you know, and will... interesting. I, I I'm going to be honest. I'm not going to poop or pee. Like, that's, okay. that's not my bag. It's only you know? if the if the evening goes there, really. Sure. And how but often you, does it go there? You did say it goes there every evening. Of the time. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But you can also do that privately. You can do it in the loo. Oh yeah. Well, oh, that's wait, where you're, I... you're allowing people to go to the bathroom in the actual bathroom in these. As parts? a man who's really had a lot of trouble doing that. Yeah. You understand I, it. I want to make sure that everyone does do it. <laughs> okay, wait. So, you, so you're just trying to clean out the system. I just want to make sure everyone's parties. healthy. Yeah. Okay, yeah. and if it happens on someone, That's all the better. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, uh, is there any sort of papers that Jason needs to sign? Wait, in now order you're to- trying to get. <laughs> wait. Okay. So, can I talk to you for a second? Okay. Yeah. Edmund, can you just take your headphones? Do off you want to sing a different song? <laughs> yeah. Sure. Hey, hey, man. Hey, what's up? The thing you said you were nervous about is exactly what you're trying to get. I just want to make sure you're legally covered. I, I don't want to sign any papers because then he'll kill me. He's not all I have to do is not you sign You convinced me. He's, he's not going to kill you. I don't this think guy he seems chill. Sometimes I don't want to sign any papers because he only kills the people that sign the papers. Well, you want to be legally you're trying protected. You're to kill me. Wait, yeah, you know what this is about? You know what, Edmund, put those back on. You know what this is about? What, what is this about? This is about the fact that you want me dead before you die so that I don't inherit the kingdom. Okay. This well. is, you know what this is? This is, oh, this is. Did you guys go halvesies on a kingdom? We, no. He, this is why That's you invited this guy. I have holesies until I'm I die. I'm sitting here wondering, why did you invite this guy to do the show? Here we are. This is your setup. Your setup is, here's this random guy. Uh-oh, he's a murderer. Uh-oh, sign these forms. Because we have a deal. A verbal deal, a binding ridiculous. oral contract that we Don't have. Don't listen to this guy, Edmund. Wherein, when Scott dies, very soon, I will inherit Comedy Bang Bang the podcast, Comedy Bang Bang the TV show, and The Widow Kulop. This, this will is all ridiculous. become mine. Yeah, we have oh, this deal, but that's deal. not that's not going to happen. Look, I mean, it's not like I met Edmund at a sex party this last summer when I was in England and noticed they, that he had this thing where he would murder people and then, you know, worked out some way to make him a fake guest on my real talk show so that he would invite you to a sex party knowing a sex party would lure you over to England wherein he would murder you. It's not like that. Oh, okay. Right? I actually am legally obligated to tell the truth. But you also... We as have an amateur bar- barrister! We have barrister-client privilege as well. Yes. So which side are you going to land on? This, as an amateur barrister, I never thought I would be put in this position. And we'll find out when we come back. No, we're not taking We're going break. to a break. No, we're not. This has been Comedy Bang. No, we're not. No. That? Edmund, please continue. Well, <laughs> um, it reminds me of a story. Oh, I'd love to hear the entirety of it. Um. <laughs> Are you okay? Start at the beginning, I don't end feel, at the end. I don't feel well. Oh, You don't no, feel well? No, I don't. Oh, no. I feel lightheaded. Can I ask you a question? Yes. Did you write the story in your ledger? Yeah. Scott, you can read it. <laughs> Here you go. Well, let me pass that right over to Jado. Oh, there no, you I go. Can't, I can't read. There you go. <laughs> you know I can't read British. <laughs> <laughs> All you have to do is add seven hours. <laughs> I can't do any of that. Oh, you know, we need Danny. Danny. <laughs> Danny Mahoney? Danny Mahoney here. He's a good the reader. The guy? Yeah. yeah, that would be good. He's... Here, I'm passing you back over here to Edmund. <laughs> <laughs> there you are. This is your book. It's your property. You belong. Yeah, there I'll put it go. back in my bank. Look, guys. Yeah. The point is, if you've got contention here, we can settle it in court. We can oh, talk to the we can have a court scene right here. Okay, sure. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Do you want to be the adjudicator? Yep. Yeah, I will. Because you All have right. legal... I'm the only one with legal powers. Okay, okay here okay. we go. Okay. Should we present our cases? Yeah, wait, absolutely. wait. Order, order. Okay, now we've got order. Do That's you, typical judge stuff. Do you Very tell, good. Do you want this to is tell, exciting. Do mm-hmm. you want to tell the truth, Scott? Um, if I say no, do I have to? Nope. <laughs> The no, I don't want to tell okay, the truth. Okay, and Jason, do you want to tell the truth? Um, I, you know, yes, I will. Okay, noted. I'm just going to write that down. Oh, cool. Jason wants to tell the truth. Now, what liquid are you writing that in? 
I can't say on air. <laughs> Wait, we have said some. What must that be? <laughs> yeah, we, what must that be? You don't want to incriminate yourself. Let's just say it's of a it's something from a very famous individual. <laughs> it's worth a lot of money. Oh wow! Oh my gosh! Let's just say it's an athlete who who's got a lot of money pending on this cum. <laughs> on his cum. On his cum. Is it Hulk Hogan? Yes, it's Hulk Hogan's <laughs> jizz. <laughs> he has money pending. You're on writing his in jizz. What's interesting about that is that it's a white liquid. Yeah, but I've, got, white... I've got a UV light. Oh, they, oh, oh okay, wow, that's great. cool. Got it. Yeah, let's wow, turn out all the lights and just turn on that UV light. Why? You know what's happening. I'm just recording what will happen. <laughs> okay. I mean, there are other things in here written by Hulk Hogan's cum. Yeah. I've got a direct supply. Let's turn, let's turn out the lights and turn on the UV light. Oh, for uh, fuck's sake. I well. thought we were doing cult, courtroom. <laughs> oh, my God. so many unfinished look at, <laughs> threads. Look, look at all of this uh. written in Hulk Hogan's cum. Yeah, there's a lot. Oh, there's my lot. What is that? That says, that's, uh, that's, uh, oh, that's, that's from a couple just, of weeks ago, Hulkamania running wild. Yeah, that's just, oh, this is a reminder. Pick up some vegan meatballs. <laughs> why, in, why do that in his cum? Just use a pen. You don't have to hide it's it. It's all I had lying around. <laughs> I can afford it. And 400 you, tons of gold. And, and, <laughs> and you just put it into a fountain pen like Wait, that. Wait, is that the yeah, cum? Yeah, yeah, Is that the cum from the sex tape? Yes, that I was That must have there. been expensive. I was there between you were there. the sheets. You were, <laughs> you're like a zealot of sex. You were just like present at all the major sex. Were you there, were you there Ray doing Ray and uh, Kim Kardashian had sex? Yeah, I was having a laugh in the closet. <laughs> Are you having a laugh? And, ah. we're, we're, <laughs> and was that for reenactment purposes so you could know how to reenact? They just wanted to make sure there was a legal overview of what was going on. Okay, let's turn the lights back on. Okay. Okay. Uh, so I've got noted Jason wants to, Scott doesn't I don't want, want to. to. Now, no. um, what is the argument of the defense? Who's the defense, by the way? I'm not, I'm not quite sure. <laughs> Flip a coin here. Yeah. Good right. question. Yeah. I'll be, I'll be Scott. Oh, okay. Scott is the I, defense, so that that means, okay. That you're pro- okay. Um, yep. So you're prosecuting me, which means that you have an argument against me. Yes, but so what yeah. is your argument? But in English court, but, the defense but, goes the first. The defense goes first. Well, I don't know what his argument is, but this dude's crazy. Okay. Um, he, right he's not to be trusted. He's a known liar and braggart. And uh, Yes, but you have, I'd like to remind the court that you have elected to lie. Yes, I have elected okay. to lie. No one <laughs> likes this guy over here. Okay. And he's okay. not popular and not famous. Now, Jason, as a prosecution, what would you like to, okay. would you like to say? This is what I would like to say. I find myself in a position that so many do today. Yeah. <laughs> trying to do the best that we can for ourselves, for our friends, for our country. And I Scott, exist please, in a world. Please, when he's talking, it's important. I exist. In, do not play me off. Order. I exist in a world Order. where Order. when I give my word to someone Scott, to take please. over their empire, and the lovemaking duties to their wife yes. when they die, I mean that as a binding promise whether I want it or not. Whether it's, I think it would it's be... It's hard not to want it, though. I, I, you and me agree on that, of course. Oh, I mean, oof. But when this person... Scott, please. ...plots against my health and well-being via a guest on a podcast with murderous intentions, I cannot sit idly by and just take that. Because we are going to make America great again. Okay? Thank you. Okay. The prosecution rests. Okay. Um, okay. Well, you've heard our cases. Yeah. Uh, I've, I've no, got those a, are just opening statements. I've got, no, I've got a verdict. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow, okay. And we'll this hear it good. when we come back We don't have to break. take another break. No. You're listening to Comedy Bang Bang. Nope. You're still Talking listening. Tang. No, dripping milk. Not dripping milk at all. Uh, are you lactating? Yes. You yep. are? Yeah. Wait, this is an episode yeah, of Drippin' Milk. This is an episode milk. of Drippin' Milk. I'm, I'm, a, a, I'm a wet nurse for about <laughs> um, four orphans. Oh, my. Four orphans? Italian orphans. Is oh. that why you were saying yeah. you got to pick a pocket <laughs> yeah. or two? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was wondering. I thought you were just really sweaty. No, no. It's all coming out my nips. Oh, okay. yeah. What that's, is your that's verdict? That's the good stuff My right verdict there. is... I'm on pins and needles. Well... Uh, the contract I had for Jason wasn't necessarily to kill him. It was to make sure I got a bit of his essence so that I could give it to Scott so he could make sure you were around to take his empire. Hmm. So that's the truth. Interesting. It turns out he really loves you. Oh, wow. Well. I love you, man. I love you too, buddy. So who's guilty? I am. <laughs> 
of being too cool. Later, dudes. Goodbye. Whoa. Later, dudes. He just skateboarded off. He took off, man. Whoa. That guy was cool. Cowabunga. (laughs) He came back to say cowabunga. That guy is so cool. Hey, guys. Who is that? Hey, Hey, Tommy. Tommy Middle D's back. That was a skateboarding, uh, I guess, amateur judge. Dude, you just missed a whole thing. You would have loved this guy. I don't think so. I've never seen a judge say... I I am guilty of being too cool yeah. and skateboard <laughs> yeah. off. And he was. He, he was. was too cool. He proved it right Middle then. Ditch, I'm so bummed you didn't meet this guy. He's he's like a quintessential a dude Thomas Middle Ditch kind of character. <laughs> I doubt it. That you just missed. Wow, this is wow. crazy. Wow, we Well, guys, thank you so much for being here. This is a lot of fun. Always great hanging out with my bros on a Saturday afternoon. Just three best friends. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. I'll Let, see you what? at the best friends party. Yeah, definitely. You're going to be there, right? Yeah, I'm okay. hosting. Yeah. Okay. Uh, BFP. <laughs> I'm doing, a, I'm doing a tight six up top to get new guests on. <laughs> Wait, is, this is not a, a party where people perform, but you're just doing a tight six? No, people are performing. People we perform are? At the be, as the best friends party? At the best friends party, we people have to always perform? always perform, yeah. yeah. Oh, no. That's how we communicate. I'm singing, an Elliot, I'm singing, singing an Elliot Smith song. <laughs> yeah, oh, no. Exactly. no it's not have to, it doesn't have to always be jokes. This is how we do yeah. it. That's not Elliot Smith. That's not <laughs> Elliot Smith. <laughs> And I took a 40 and I turned it up. Turned it up. Turned I it really up. Am that, if, you, by that. if you can take one thing from the show, you turn up a 40. Yeah. yeah. You don't drink mm-hmm. it. You, you turn don't it drink up. it. You turn it up. I think it's to be like, you know. No, no. Yes, Chuck you can style. stop miming it. Yeah. Yes, we know. Chuck's I didn't you, get it we, until <laughs> Thomas did that. So I'm glad. Thank you. All right. No <laughs> um, what is your hat? This, this is why people listen to this show to, f- you know, hear the, the tough interview questions like, what is your hat? Well, this is a Chicago Cubs hat. Okay. And if you know, I've, I long suffered with the Cubs. And if you know any Cub fan, you know that they're it's a very sad following until recently when they won. And so, this is this is the only time I've been able to wear any uh, Cubs stuff is with pride. With pride. Right. Yeah. Before and, it was with shame. And this is not the traditional Cubs hat. This has a little picture of a little bear. Yeah, it's cute. Like a little it's bear a cute cup? Little, like, it's cute. For toddlers, too. They call, everyone can enjoy this. Yeah, everyone can enjoy this. You don't have to be a Cubs fan to no, enjoy this hat. No, you can be a toddler. Toddlers, <laughs> Cubs fans. <laughs> Old ladies. Sure. Um, yeah. And uh, hats. Let's talk about them. Are they good for keeping the sun out of your eyes, or are they good for hiding messy hair? What do you primarily use yours for? If I'm walking my dog, I use it as a sun shield. Okay. And if and if, but mostly it's because my hair's messy. Yeah. And I don't want to, you know, mess with it. At what point do you think did hats become messy <laughs> hair hiders? Because it, it used to be you would do your hair and then put on a top hat or, or whatever. <laughs> but at some point it seems like maybe in the 1970s, hats' sole purpose now are messy hair hiders. <laughs> You know me. I think it happened uh, when when baseball hats became very popular uh, around the time that uh, baseball. Yeah, around the you turn know of the it's century. interesting. It's interesting because baseball was invented, and people were like, "Hey, let's put on a hat on these players." And so they do. They create these hats, baseball hats. They put them on players, and it's to keep the sun out of their eyes when they're going back for a uh, uh, you know a, a, a long pop, fly, pop fly, a pop ball. fly. Um, and then people are like. Oh man, I gotta wear one of these. And so they go, they put them on sale to the general public. And then the first, I would imagine for the first three months or so, you'd see someone wearing one on the street and go, Pardon me, aren't you a baseball player? Shouldn't you be out on the field? And people, no, 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 these are for sale to the general public. And then they become popular to the point where now I would say more uh, people in Gen Pop uh, wear these baseball hats than actual baseball players. Would you agree? Yeah. Yeah, they do more because you don't want. Also, you don't want to be a baseball player who's when he's off the field, he's also wearing a baseball hat. Like going to the concert with so the, those guys exclusively don't wear baseball hats after right. uh, off the field. So what happens though if they need to keep the sun out of their eyes or hide messy hair? Do, what kind of hats do they wear? I know a lot of the Dominican players are wearing pith helmets um, <laughs> when they go out and party. Like a Jumanji uh, pith helmet. Y'all are forgetting some big hats. I know I'm not supposed to talk. Oh no, you're oh, here you're you're uh, you're able to talk. This is our, our our next guest, the entrepreneur that I was. It doesn't matter what I do now. Y'all are forgetting. 
fedoras. Y'all are forgetting them floppy hats that French people wear. The berets. Barrets. Y'all are forgetting them rice paddy hats that come from other from other countries. I don't, I don't, I mean, I guess. Yeah, what are those called? Uh, rice I, paddy hats. I, I guess, although it doesn't sound right coming out of your mouth. Why? Just, hey, especially rice with, paddy hat. Especially with your, your dialect. <laughs> rice paddy hat? I don't, How am I maybe, supposed to say it? Maybe that is the technical term for them, although it just makes okay. me feel weird hearing well, I wish that. I wish so I could Google do. right now. Upside down, upside down saucer hat. Okay, perhaps. How's that work? Do you want me to, to introduce you now that you're, you I just wanted, talking? I just, you can keep talking. I just wanted to make no. sure y'all knew we, we, about fedoras. We do know about I guess them. berets mm-hmm. and rice but sauce plate hats. Okay. You, no, know, you know why we, rice rice patty hats are so popular? Because I wish you're we supposed would stop to, saying this. You're supposed to eat your rice out of them and then put them on your head when you're finished. <laughs> no, you're yeah, not. It's waste not, no. want not. No, and you're forgetting cowboy hats. <laughs> What type of hats? Cowboy hats. Cow- oh, cow- oh, I thought you said cowboy hats. Uh, no, cowboy. <laughs> cowboy hats, yes. Yes, sir. Please, let us not forget cowboy hats. Let, lest we not forget the cowboy hats. Now, that's another one. Uh, suddenly, in the especially in the 1980s, people started wearing cowboy hats when oh, they weren't God. cowboys. I it just you, causes confusion. You do not want to see any photos of me back in the 1980s. I was wearing just a, 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 nothing but a cowboy hat. Oh, do you have Sometimes. any photos on you? Sure, here you go. All right, let me take a look at there you go. Okay. That's me oh. in 1981. Sorry. Wow. That's me in 1982. All of these photos, they, they're they trifolded like a Playboy centerfold. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> I had to. Get, I have to fold them up. Sometimes they let loose. Right. Well, pandemonium oh, strikes. Oh my gosh! This is, uh, Raji, yeah, wants to see these? This is sexual content. Yeah. This it? is. Uh, I, it's I, pretty suggestive. Me a, it's suggestive. Should have given me a warning. Well, a it's a good warning. thing it's a podcast. Otherwise, the other listeners would be <laughs> pumping true. their damn stereos or well, something. Well, let me introduce you because uh, <laughs> I I do want to to make sure that I say your name because when I call you your name, I don't want the listeners to be confused. You understand that, right? Of course. Course. That makes sense. I don't know why anyone. Uh, what, what's she saying? I'm saying that I need to introduce you and tell the listeners your oh, name, just yeah. on the off chance that were I to say your name, people wouldn't be saying, "Who the hell is he talking about?" Oh, it, so an introduction. Is an introduction. You, yeah, okay, is yeah, what I'm talking ahead. about. Yeah. yeah. Um, he is yeah, a man. He is an entrepreneur. Uh-huh. He is sitting here in front of uh, Horatio uh-huh. Sands and I, and he uh-huh. is. Uh, I can't tell if he's starstruck or not. Uh, please welcome. Reasonably. <laughs> great. Please welcome <laughs> Lyle Cummings. Hi there. How y'all? I really want to give this guy a break. I feel. <laughs> well. How do you mean? Do you mean like a Kit Kat bar? What are you talking about? Oh, that's funny. I feel funny. like a Kit Kat bar, and I've been trying You're to You're reaching into your pocket. That's why I'm saying. Oh, no, no, You said, no. I really want to give this guy a break, and you start reaching into your pocket for something. <laughs> <laughs> the amount of times I've seen that in my life, and it has not been a Kit, a Kit Kat bar. bar. Boy, I, I would say nine times out of ten, it's not a Kit Kat no, bar. No, it's anything but. I'm rooting for you is what I'm saying. But oh, that's the tenth time. Jeez, you're about the only one. Um, now, you are an entrepreneur, is that correct? I sell Sherbert currently. That's my latest game. Oh, that's the latest in a long yeah. line of well, uh, goodness. I, I mean, we'll get into businesses? that for, in a bit, but okay, maybe sure. I just, I've got a so Sherbert truck. Currently, you're sur- oh, a, a truck in a truck. I go around the neighborhoods and I sell Sherbert out my damn truck. So it's sort of like an ice cream truck. But exclusively Sherbert. Exclusively Sherbert. Do you like Sherbert, Horatio? You're a big Sherbert guy. I'm not a big sherbet guy, but I do enjoy it once in a while. If you let me ask you now, I want you to a- answer me. My dad um, was a so big, that yeah, um, typical Sherbert asking guy. question kind of thing. Okay, you, you want now, to answer, answer you. me? Answer me now on this question here. <laughs> I come to you. I got two cups. One's ice cream filled with cow blood and piss and shit. I don't know yeah. that that's really the case with ice cream. And then the other one's sherbet. It's cool. It's refreshing. It's clean. What you gonna have? I'm going to have that shitty one because I know from memory that it tastes better. Oh, God dang it. <laughs> but this one, this well, sherbet is... Sherbet's great. It's mandarin orange flavored or lemon. Mm. Or, Why are all the sherbets, they seem to be all fruit flavors? Is that the only way to get flavor into them? It is. Technically, it is. What is the difference between sherbet and ice cream? You're asking questions you don't want to know the answers no, to. No, I, I like you Because, buddy, this goes all the, the way answers. to the top. <laughs> Who, the top of your organization? The top of the goddamn uh, government, Illuminati, whatever you oh. want to believe controls this here world. Okay. Well, I, I think it's uh, random chaos. And, uh, oh, we got another one of these liberal L.A. random chaos heads. <laughs> well, tell, Cry babies. T- tell me, I, I, I don't like to be characterized as such, but uh, if you could just stick to the questions that have been asked, what is the difference between Sherbert and... And ice cream. 
One is made from cow's titties, <laughs> and the other one isn't. That's the big difference. That's okay. So cows uh, udders <laughs> titties. <laughs> Each cow has six tits. <laughs> I guess I've never. I actually don't know. I don't I, know the answer. To that. I, I've never I, counted them. Hold on one second. One second. This is exactly why you have an iPhone. Okay. Hey Siri. <laughs> hey Siri. <laughs> hey Siri. Siri. Oh, God, oh let me do. Let me. Have, I'll ask. Yeah, Bixby. you guys are okay. I'll ask Bixby what he thinks. How many titties are on a cow? Oh, it thinks I'm saying TDs. Oh, touchdowns. How many touchdowns does a cow have? <laughs> I, hey, there's nothing in the rule book, so it wouldn't surprise me. Cow? Okay, well, it's so just Horatio, search in Google and say I want her to riddle you me want, this. Yeah, you want her to actually say it. It you, doesn't matter. She's a goddamn bitch. And can, oh my god, no! Please, have you ever uh, forced Siri to say something like "I love you" or something that every uh, day it, of my life? Yeah. <laughs> uh, Horatio, do you have the answer on this about how many uh, uh, udders a, a cow has? Thirteen. 13? 13 titties? Unlucky number. <laughs> no wonder cows are eating all the time. You're all telling me you want to <laughs> get essentially the devil's the devil's animal, have a bowl full of its titty cream flavored to God knows what, vanilla, chocolate. Yeah, sounds great. Yeah. Instead of something clean. Precious and pure, like what, sherbet. What is, what is sherbet? Is it is it just like ice that's crushed up, and then you add a little bit of fruit to it? What what exactly is sherbet? These again, you're going down a path. It's almost like you, you don't, don't know. <laughs> no, I'm telling. I'm trying to protect. You're the you, expert. Man. I'm trying to protect you. Also, it seems like like ninety percent of sherbet you see in stores is in a big bucket and it's swirled together. <laughs> that's not my problem. <laughs> is that, that is that, that the type of sherbet it? that you serve? On your truck? Well, yeah, but it's it ain't my problem. That's the problem of the consumer. Right, but so on, in, on your truck, you can get different flavors. They're all mixed up together. You can get <laughs> mandarin orange, lemon, lime. But all mixed up together? Raspberry or the big kahuna, which is all of them mixed up together. Okay, but uh -oh. you can get them separately. That's if great. If you want. Okay. and how Nobody does that. <laughs> Why do you Trust have it then? Me. Yeah, options. Right, okay. You got to provide the customer with choices so that they feel that they've made a special decision in their life. So how's the truck doing? Are you, is it successful? Hey man, I honestly I don't give two squirts about this damn truck. <laughs> Why are you it's doing it? It's anything to get me off the street. Re so you've you've had trouble being on the street. Goodness. I started on the straight and narrow. I okay. mean, we can one, two, skip if you get right to the early 90s when I was sucking dick all up on the North Carolina coast just trying to get by. Okay, I, I just guess. Just getting by. Just trying to get by. This is like groceries. <laughs> just, <laughs> just groceries, basic rent, cable bill. Netflix. <laughs> Wait a minute. This is in the early 90s when Netflix was expensive. <laughs> right. When they were beta oh, yeah. testing when Netflix. They were beta. Just sending out DVDs. Oh, my goodness. Um, so this is just for your basic expenses. This is just basic expenses. My right. party month. Now, listen. Before that, my very first job, I was hired by the superintendent of the local school to go into the middle school and ch strangle the teens. To, st to strangle the, the teens. You to, know what how, is What would be the possible <laughs> reason for that? It seems... Uh, that, you know how... You know how them teens like to choke each other or make each other pass out okay, and they I come mean, to when it's a real rush, right? You know how yeah, that's happened. I guess so, yeah. I guess, oxygen going up into the brain is very euphoric, as they say. It, it, you want to you wanna hear it play Bill Nye for me? You you can. I, I, I'm just here doing, well, you, I was just doing my job. Anyhow, that time at that school, this is called uh, Trenton Downey, Middle school, uh, <laughs> middle school. His, yeah, this was I. I took this care is of getting the, them early. I took care of the seventh and eighth graders. Okay, because uh, uh, there was another person who took care of the ninth graders. She's a big old lady, big three hundred three hundred plus pound. Who woman. would hire you? Is what I'm trying. I'm to... trying to get to it. Okay, please. These kids, at the time, you have to understand this is eighty eight, eighty nine. These kids were doing it every damn day, multiple times a day. The whole school. 
In class? In uh, class. They were okay. sneaking off to the back during the lesson, strangling each other, <laughs> passing each other out. It got to the point where a couple kids died. Oh, no. And so superintendent hired a couple people, myself included, to do it for the kids supervise. So in a safe environment where you were able to... How, how are Once you a, a medical time, professional? Absolutely not. It was you have to understand. It was an epidemic. These kids couldn't stop passing out. Okay, and so they hired. I didn't have any qualification. I was fresh out of college myself. I came you're, in. You're barely older than them. Way in over my head. Right. But here I am, beginning a lunch, all these kids lining up, 7th, 8th graders, and I'm just They're doing this on their them. lunch break instead of during class. <laughs> I just, yeah, look, we had to organize it, create some structure to it. Okay. Now, there's a bit, there's a reason I didn't take care of the 9th graders, because they're big kids. That's okay. why I got to have that bigger lady. Right, right. So, so then so they what thrash was, around. You could get seriously injured. What was your technique then? You would you would clasp your hands around you their know, throats. I or? wish I could tell you that there was something to it. So it was uh, like uh, you said. So instead of the kids doing it, you're like, I'll do it. Tell I, me what you want. Tell me who you want me to choke out. <laughs> I saw. The help wanted sign in the paper. Right. There's a help wanted sign. There was a sign. help wanted sign. Oh, well, symbol. No, what am I trying to say? Yeah, uh, well, an ad. An, an ad. ad. <laughs> there was an ad in the paper. When, I, I, was, when I see strangle, I, I, I turn the other way if I see that ad. It just said help wanted. It just said help wanted. That's so you had, to, you had to go to... Oh, <laughs> did it, it have any strangle? information about the school? <laughs> Who to contact? It said, help wanted, come to this, come to, to the Trenton okay. Downey <laughs> Junior Middle School. I can imagine that's, not, I mean, <laughs> just asking people to come there is not, I mean, that's an unsafe environment. Are you telling me? You're telling me. Anyway, I, I, I was only but a, one of but a few that replied to the advertisement. Hmm. There was supposed to be one for each grade. Okay. But the other fella didn't work out, so they plucked what seventh. To him? And he was a known child molester. <laughs> he was he was known. He was renowned. <laughs> renowned. So so this famous this ad back, famous for it. This had really backfired on them to just have he was like celebrated coming by. For it. <laughs> come on, I don't think real so. famous guy. No, no, real famous I, guy. I think he was probably reported in the papers. Is what you're talking about? Oh, I don't he, know. he was. Running for mayor and all kinds of things. So that, was, does, that does so happen. Conflict of interest. So, so he was kicked out he was, uh, yeah, immediately. So yeah. you had to take care of two of the grades. Yeah, and I tell you, it, you know, nothing to it. You want to say, oh, it's you know, it's this, it's this technique. We had to take training on it or anything like that. No, you, <laughs> teenager, young teen lines up, plays your, plays your hands around his neck. Bam, they're out. Ba- they're Squeeze out. as hard as you can. And then what, do you have a, a first aid kit or a defibrillator on yeah, you? Yeah, there was something or? on site, but I got so good at it, I can make them go out two seconds. Don't, okay, it's don't not hurt. the going out that I'm concerned about. It's the waking <laughs> them back up. Well, sometimes the- they take a bit, but uh, all that means is they're going to have whatever they want to have happen in a better way. I don't, out, I, don't, I don't know what that The higher means. you come back up. Okay, sure. But so, so then if you're... <coughs> It, what is the purpose of having you there if you don't have medical equipment, if you're not uh, undergoing any kind of you're safety equipment? You're going to have equipment? to call the superintendent. Okay, let's uh, let's call him. Here we All go. Right. What's his name? Peppers McGilly. Peppers <laughs> McGilly. All right, let's call him. Can we get Peppers on the line? Here we go. You have his number. Great. Okay, you're putting it in. Peppers McGilly. Hey, superintendent, and I believe, I don't know if he still is, but at uh, 88, 89, he certainly was, and this was his pilot right, we'll program just call the to school. these kids. We're calling the school right now, and... Uh, Hello. Hi. Hey. It, it, this, Hello. This Peppers, Peppers McGilly, do you remember my voice? It's Lyle Cummings. Hi, Lyle. How are you? <laughs> hey, buddy. I was, uh, uh, I, you know, I strangled oh, the team. Oh, man. This is a great, I, it's nice to hear your voice again. Pleasure to hear your voice, too. Oh, heck. We were just talking the other day. I was over there at Barnum's, and uh, they were saying, where, where did that guy go? And I was like, well, I don't know. probably choking kids out in some other town over there. <laughs> no, I got out of that game years ago. I'm selling Sherbert now. <laughs> Oh, good for you. Good yeah. for you. Out and of a truck or something? Out of a truck. Anyhow. All right. I've always said, might as well have a boogeyman. <laughs> might as well have a boogeyman. Well, might as well have a might boogeyman well to you. <laughs> might as well have a boogeyman. <laughs> 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 all right. Bye, well, guys. All right. Bye-bye. 
Oh my gosh! Wow, if that ain't one of the most charming men you've ever met in your life. I don't know what it's, a strange fellow. I mean, I, when you came in here, I thought that you were kind of an odd, uh, odd bird. But well, you uh, know, it's better to be weird than to be dead. I, <laughs> and I, I guess tell so. you, I don't know why that's a binary that's choice. True, that's true. Uh, man, he's yeah. just an angel. He, the things he's done for the children. Like what? You've heard them. Oh no, those you are bad. Those examples. are all bad things. You need more examples. Sh- and yeah, strangle, if you have some. And organize strangling and the removal of seance pages and children's books. I mean, well, I, yeah. and then erecting a memorial wall for all the people who have post-strangle syndrome, and then a boogeyman statue for the homunculus. You need, all right, I, you I guess, need I guess you're right. And then uh, the selfless act of assuming the role of his mother for 30 plus okay. years. I don't know that it's selfless. Marrying just... his own stepfather and assuming a normal life with his mother as his child. I wonder why he stopped. Uh, he, he's he enjoyed 94. it so much. He's got, yeah. Yeah. At one point, the rug's got to come off. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Uh, well, look, Lyle, uh, you know, we haven't really gotten into, uh, anything that you've done post no, uh, that job. It's I fine. mean, from, I'm fine from, with the, from the nineties through, uh, through, through however long ago I, you started. How long have you been doing this? It. I can yeah, summarize it. Just it nutshell it for us. Well, plenty of drugs and plenty of chasing demons, which is why I found comfort in my sherbet. So, okay, good. So know, everything's back on track for uh, you? Yeah, if more or less, but I'm telling you, you, you end up. You end up strangling about two, three hundred teens a day. It, it, it sticks with you. A day? Uh, to every. Yeah. We tried to paint the picture of the epidemic it was, Scott. Okay. Every teen. Every day. In the whole county was strangling each other. So, okay. you know. We so, so 300 a day in front of a large audience. That's just the seventh and eighth graders. Okay. Now, we had yeah. about 20,000 ninth graders. So, the, the bigger lady. What was her name, by the way? Oh, shoot. I just know her as the big one. The big one? Do you think we can get her on the phone? Uh, I do have her number, <laughs> you do? but it's under big one, so it's I don't not, okay. want, I'm not going to say, hey, big oh, okay. one, Okay, let's call you? her up. Let's call well, her up. Just as long as you feel comfortable asking for her I, name. I, I, I introdu- will do it. I'll tell you what. I'll introduce myself. I'll say you, I'm on okay, some radio great. show. All right, let's call her up. Let's see name. what we got here. Hold on. It's, Here's uh, the, this is it's the number. It's 221-921-6868. 6868. 1,000. 1,000. Okay, we got it. Front slash big one. Front slash big one. Got it. Okay. We're connect. Oh, okay, here we go. It's ringing. Hello. Hey, Hello? hey, hey! I don't know if y'all remember. If you remember me, it's Lyle Cummings. Oh, uh, you and I used to. Hello, how are you doing? You and I used to strangle the uh, teens. Oh, God, those are the days, aren't they? Hello, hello, ma'am. <laughs> ma'am, hello. Hello. I'm uh, Scott Ackerman from Comedy Bang Bang. Hello, how are you? To, to whom am I speaking? Big one. <laughs> Oh, it's a real name. Oh, that's a real name. Oh, my God, that's a real name. That's oh a real name. Uh, big one. Hello. How are you? Uh, I'm really, really good. Oh, is everything all right there? You seem to be sort of choking. Uh, or are, are you being strangled currently? My girth is strangling me from the inside. What's that now? My girth is strangling me from the inside. Your girth is strangling her from the inside. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, big one. It's been so nice chatting with you. <laughs> it's great to catch up, boy. It's been years. Uh, it's been y'all, great. Y'all want to hear my pussy? <laughs> no. So nice. So, so nice to talk to you. All right, hate to hang up on you. But we'll see you later. All right, thanks. Bye. Ooh. Yeah, that was close. <laughs> We got real. We got away by the hair on our chinny chin chin. Wow. I think she was about seconds away from putting the phone up to her big old pussy. A real rogues gallery. I uh, tell you, who worked out there and making. <laughs> wow. Well, you know, you don't get a lot to choose from. It's a small county. Yeah. Well, it's one of the bigger counties in Georgia, but there's not a lot of people. You understand? Know okay. Wait, so you mean there's a lot of landmass, but not people? That's true. So you know, it's slim pickings out there. But mm. she was. She had a kind soul. She did uh, do a lot of pussy work, but. Well, I don't know what you mean by that. She was, uh, she sort of, we always said that there goes a girl with three hands because she was holding things with her left, her right, and the one in the middle. (laughs) Okay, so she used used her vagina to clasp things. She had like opposable. (laughs) 
She just an opposable had a lot of, vulva lips. Or? She had, <laughs> she, <laughs> did she have opposable <laughs> vulva lips? Look, uh, all I can tell you yeah, is please. by the end of it, she was writing. By the end of what? <laughs> for time with the school, she was writing stuff with she her. Was writing stuff. Giner. Okay. She had her. She was holding pens and pencils and stuff. She was. Mm. She actually. Uh, she started. Uh, as the pitcher for the women's softball team. Oh, that's oh, uh, and that's she pitched wonderful. with her pussy. Okay, she was the pussy pitcher. <laughs> okay, great, fantastic. Well, Lyle, it's it's been so interesting getting to know you. <laughs> it's such a treat to meet uh, uh, a troubled soul such as yourself. But well, I, I well, I tell I, you what, I have a lot less trouble in my life thanks to yeah. pouring my heart and soul on this shirt. Burn. Well, I, I, like I wish you peace. A cool representation of the South these days. Yeah, you know, it's it's a nice. Get a it's nice a, well, feel for so many times when you hear uh, or, or you're watching a piece of media and you see a southern character, they're uh, some sort of broad caricature. Right. <laughs> it's so nice to see someone like Lyle here, who's just a nice normal guy oh, yeah. who, who comes from a small town in the south That's, or a, a, a large county with not a lot of people. It, a it, town not unlike the ones we grew up in. That's sure. true, y'all. Y'all, it, hey, I, from my bottom of my heart, it's nice to see some Yankee. Cucks who <laughs> just, wait, that's us. Just <laughs> really have a have, y- y'all have y'all open your door to me, and uh, I don't know I why you gotta say, call us cucks. That I just want to say, <laughs> if you're complimenting, I just want to say uh, thank you from the bottom of my heart. I'll leave right. a tub with y'all. It, what uh, does that mean? Uh, tub of sherb. Oh, thank you. Tub oh, yeah, not the swirl kind though. If you won't, if you won't swirl, I'll give you swirl. No, we don't want the swirl. We want just uh, uh, Horatio. What, what flavor do you want? I guess orange. Yeah, did mandarin you say orange? Yeah, mandarin yeah. orange? Yeah, can you leave the mandarin orange with us? Sure. My okay. pleasure. Great. My pleasure. And it, this is uh, frozen or? It's liquid form. Okay, you I don't, do, you don't do have refrigeration? Sherb. What? Do. You don't have refri- refrigeration <laughs> this in This is the straight truck. out the mines, you understand. <laughs> I do wet, unfiltered <laughs> sherbet. Okay, straight out the mines. Do we freeze it up or? If you want, you, you can, y'all can do it. Hey, beauty of America is when you buy sherbet, you yeah. can do whatever you want to. This looks, this looks just like a tub of orange juice. Like it has pulp in it. I, I don't know what you want. You I, want me to take it back? I, I don't know. Horatio, do you still want it? Oh, is that like a green highlighter at the bottom of that? Yeah, what's good? What's good? It is, it's a, you have to put a highlighter in it, otherwise it goes bad. <laughs> you don't know much about <laughs> Sherbert, do you? This is disgusting. I guess we'll try it. I, yeah. yeah, if yeah. you want it, I, I don't know that yeah. I'm going to you have to. You have to take the cap off a highlighter, put it in the, put it in the tub, <laughs> otherwise it does go bad. Okay, yeah, I don't know. All right, Something well. in a highlighter that keeps <laughs> Sherbert fresh. <laughs> All right, Lyle. I don't know. Do you do any business? Does anyone buy anything from you? Uh, it, it's slow, but last year I made, I netted in the green about $36 million. <laughs> $36 million? But it's slow. But you, but no. It's slow. You said this is less money than you got for, you know, sucking D all up and down the Carolina down the coast. coast. Yeah, yeah, And yeah. that was just covering your basic expenses? What are your expenses? I have, <laughs> I have a privately funded Marine Corps. <laughs> <laughs> so a private army? What what do they do for you? Oh, they protect me. <laughs> they protect me from the troubles of the world. Okay. And uh, I, I I have this summer. I am launching my very own summer offensive in uh, well, small country hmm. of uh, Italy. The, it's not the smallest. I mean, it's not I the have biggest either. To, but. I first um, just following the Allied invasion, mm. and I uh, landed at Sicily. Okay, and well, I'm making my way up, and I'm going to conquer Italy. So you're invading Italy this summer with your own with private, private, Marine private Corps. mercenaries. Yes, sir. Okay, well, good luck to you. I mean, you have well, a lot of you. money to, to do it. Well, thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. You're sweet. You're man. quite welcome. And if you are considering a, 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 a change in your telecommunications service provider. <laughs> <laughs> I hear that uh, Verizon, is that the one that's the good one, or is it Sprint? I, I can't remember. Know. Some guy who just will not get off my damn TV set. Same old eye bulger as the Silicon Valley. Yeah. It's also when like you're playing a game online, like Words with Friends or yeah. something, it's also like constantly it, comes yeah. up there, and too. It, and now if you go to a movie theater, oh, God, it's going you to, can't it, escape it. it. Yeah, sometimes you I hope, just want to tear your own mind out. I hope he was well compensated for that because it's ruining his career, in my opinion. <laughs> I agree. It's something that keeps me up at night. 
just on his behalf. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, uh, Lyle, I want to thank you so much uh, for coming here and just gracing us with your presence and uh, continued success to you. Thank you, man. And uh, as far as the uh, the invasion of Italy goes, you know. Here's open. Mean, yeah, I mean, would you? I mean, I guess you would. You would get the Vatican and all that kind of stuff. I'm too. gonna claim you, it for America. We're yeah. Going, we're taking oh, it. so you're doing it for America, not for yourself. Well, I will sell it. You sell it to America. It, yeah, I'm going. I got to make money off of so it. So that'll now. be sort of like a territory, like the Virgin Islands for us or something. Hey, man, however y'all want to work out the deal, you can leave it to. You, you can leave it to old DT. Yeah. So this is quite an investment for you. you Art s- of the deal. Yeah, oh, okay, great. <laughs> and Horatio, always great to see you. Likewise, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> and I, wait, we're getting an, we're getting another phone call. Oh, uh, oh maybe this is Peppers. Uh, hello, Comedy Bang Bang. Hey, this is Peppers. Oh, Peppers, we were just about to uh, finish the show. Uh, I just was on to say it was a pleasure being on there. Yeah, and uh, and also, please, please donate to the wall. I guess that's my plug. Oh, okay, well, plugs are over. Yeah, I'm oh, sorry. You I'm missed sorry. them. All right, never mind. Well, thank you. Good seeing y'all. Yeah, do you have any last words of wisdom? Something that you impart to your students, perhaps? Uh, just, uh, we're, you know, we're, we have a lot of uh, naive young minds who listen to this. Uh, impressionable youths, I guess, listen to this program. Any advice for them? Um, when in doubt, choke them out. <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> Thanks, Peppers. You're a dear. All right, bye-bye. Uh, you want to do your final laugh? <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Leonard Stool Tap. You're Leonard, Leonard Stool Tap. That's me. You're a very interesting person. Um, magical abilities. Yes. Magic uh, when you close your eyes. You've had sex with Ray Bradbury, who's no longer with us. <laughs> uh, what an interesting person you are. But we do uh, need to get to our next guest. Oh, there's another guest. I'm not enough for you. Well, I mean, I, I hope you stick around and s- speak to him um, because uh, him, or, him or yeah, it, it is a him. Um, I don't have his profession here with me either, but uh, I do have his name. Yeah, please welcome to the show for the first time ever, Mitch Slocum. Hi, hi. <laughs> it's so good to meet you, yeah, Mitch. It's great to be here. It's uh, this is. Leonard hey, Stooltap. Leonard, how are okay. you? Okay. What are you up to, Mitch? What's your deal? What's your whole thing? What, oh, what do you mean? Like, is like, this guy coming at me? <laughs> yeah, yeah, come on. Get him in easy. Yeah. Get me in easy. Are well, you interested? Well, are you welcome, interested? To, welcome to the I, show. I don't, what do you mean? Can, Can I, I ask you a question? Yeah. Um, you ever heard of Jeff Foxworthy? Yes. That was me. Oh, you're Jeff you, Foxworthy. You were Jeff Foxworthy? I did a magic trick, and I was Jeff I Foxworthy. Like, if you... Find out that your table legs are made of hunting rifles. You might be a redneck. <laughs> hey, c- should we close our eyes and you become Jeff Fox? Sure. Cl- okay. of all right, Je- Jeff we're, Fox. All, we're closing Jeff our eyes. Um, do you want me to do the normal redneck ones or do you want me to do any other specific? No, you just, just do uh, your favorite a few bits. You might be a redneck bits. Okay, yeah. you want me to do it? And, also, j- and also try some new th- new material. Oh. Too. Yeah. Oh, new material. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay anything you want. want. Hit us with some oldies, but then give us some, you know, a taste of the new stuff. Dealers, okay, I will do my, um, you might be Scott Ackerman's. So. Oh. Oh, that's fun. Okay, you want to do that? Okay. You ready? This is going to get, this is going to hurt my feelings, I'm sure. Sure is. Here we go. <laughs> if you get up in the middle of the night six times to jerk off and look at yourself in the mirror and say, that's the guy... You might be Scott Ackerman. Oh my God, I might be Scott Ackerman. <laughs> it's five tops. <laughs> if you like to listen to your voice three times a day and on tour and on podcast while looking at yourself in the mirror and jerking off in the middle of the night, yeah, you I might be Scott Ackerman. I got one. I'm, I opening, got, I'm opening mine. I got one. If you see a dog dragging its butt on the carpet, leaving a skid mark and say, that looks fun. <laughs> You might be good wait, wait, That's on. pretty good. Come if on, you guys. wish you were a marshmallow toasting, roasting, and dying. Ooh. Guys, this is really hurting my feelings. I have a single tear. If you wake up okay. and the first thought into your brain is, boy, I'd like to kill the president. You might be <laughs> no, 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 no. Not happening. Not if happening. you invented diabetes... You yeah, might be scared. Scared. Okay, guys, I've had it up to here with you. I don't want to talk to you guys anymore. Your hand is on your lap. <laughs> your hand is so on your lap. So you've had it up to your dick? Your hand is <laughs> on your lap. That is an expression. Lap. I said, your hand, hand is, is on, on your lap. lap.
Tell you what, we need land. to. Yeah, on your land. Land. We need to and go to a break. We need to go. We need to go to a break. Uh, oh, and, right. and you guys, and you guys are leaving, and two new guests are coming. But oh <laughs> boy! <laughs> Comedy bang bang, we're back here. Uh, unfortunately, Mitch Slocum and Leonard Stooltap had to go, <laughs> but I really enjoyed the. God, run. what a lineup! I can't believe I missed it. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> but I have two new guests here. Uh, we have, uh, I don't know what they do either, but uh, uh, please welcome Slippy Daniels. Uh, hey, that's me. <laughs> and Jack Pot. Hey, all, it's me, Jack Pot. <laughs> all right. Hi, guys. Do you guys know each other? Or yes. You... Yes, we are very good friends. We do an all tambourine band, really? and we're the band leaders, and we got about a 50 piece tambourine band. 50 people. Imagine you close your eyes, imagine yourself for a second. There's 50 tambourines going absolutely crazy behind yes. us, and we're just we're going like this. Go, 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 go. go, 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 go. We've got that measured. Now, we've played Can Madison I open my eyes? Square Garden. Oh, yeah, sure. Okay. Madison Square Garden. Never heard of it. Have you ever heard of MSG? I, I, I mean, most Chinese restaurants. Have a lot of it. Oh, God, oh, this guy. What are you, racist? Come here. Uh, come funny. here. No, I want to kiss him. Oh, I want to bundle him, him up oh, and kiss him. Watch his kiss. Oh, he loves please. a good kiss. No. I like to no. lick. I like to no. lick. I like to no. lick. No. 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 Please. No. 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 Well, you know what they say. It's not about the length. It's about the ramp. You know what I mean? And you've got a lot of ramp in there. Oh, my God. Look at me squeezing you. Look at me grabbing you. Oh, the squeezing. So you guys are here to talk about your all tambourine band? That sounds like what a cacophony that would be. I mean, that it doesn't sound pleasant to listen to. Well, we are called the cacophony. Oh, we like to they take are. sound and just can coffinate it up. Do you have coffins on stage as well? Yes. Yeah, every, every tambourine player has a tiny little coffin they're on top of, and they like to hit a the tambourine. Co- a tiny little coffin just goes because we have little baby graves, and they yeah. go on top of the baby graves. Yes. What? What we are you is a baby funeral graves? burial service for babies. Yes. But we've turned it into something fun like an all tambourine concert. Here we go. So if Why you've did got you a, just say, here we go? <laughs> oh, I thought we were going to go. <laughs> well, if you've got a deceased baby, we could. Yeah, so if you've got a little deceased baby, you want a deceased baby. Right baby. baby. Uh-huh, bye bye. A D-bay. I, I, a D-bay. Don't ha- I don't have a D-B oh. with me. No, I'm okay. sorry. No. Well, then we can't help you. Sorry, we are exclusive. Okay. How, how do people get a hold of you to get your services? <laughs> oh, you can't see, but right now... Um, Slippy! Slippy is just oh, licking his Did own you forget tongue. your own friend's name? No, I like to give him a little bit of break before I say his name because then when I say his name, it comes in real hot and real nice. Okay, so if I so go, oh my God, my friend, Slippy! Uh, and, and we'll do it for each other. Like when he says my name, I say my name. When he says his name, he says his name. My dear friend. Neither of you are talking right I now. I missed my cue. I missed my cue. <laughs> what is happening? I must have missed right my cue. Give me again. Oh, I won't God. forget. Let's go. Places, places. Go, go, go. My dear friend. Thank you, places. Is that me? Yes. <laughs> you want a five? Give me a five. Five. <laughs> Jackpot! Yes. Summer in the city! I have no idea what's going on Scott, right now. What do you, this is what's going on. <laughs> I, to, to be honest, I don't either. I don't think any of us do. Okay, Jackpot. Listen to me. You want to know my story a little yeah, bit? Yeah, what is your story? My story is that I happen to be a very lucky man. I mean, first of all, look who I get to hang out with all day. I got Slippy Daniels me, right here. I'm sorry. <laughs> Guilty as charged. I don't know. Put him in jail. What are you going to throw know. me in jail and fuck me? <laughs> what, what are you going to do? Look at him in the eye then fuck him? Then, Jesus. Then just what are you going to do, Scott? Throw me down on the goddamn mud and oh. <laughs> spank me until I cry? What are you going to do? Take like off to those pants, pick him up, put him on that cabinet right there and just fuck him up, eat him out, eat his ass all out? What are you going to do, Scott? Is that what you're going to do, Slippy? What are you going to do? Pull my clothes off and show my parents the pictures? Yeah, right. Yeah, right. I, yeah, right, Scott. You are a lucky man because I don't know how you two found each other. <laughs> it was it was absolutely insane. Oh, you want to hear the story? Oh, my goodness. The story Please. about how we met and, uh, by the way, and how we remained friends you're, for all these years. You're never going to believe this. You, you're yeah. never going to believe we this. We were set up by a mutual friend. Yes. So, and someone, Isn't that insane? Someone <laughs> that saw us and was like, you guys should date. <laughs> Isn't that insane? You guys should, we, oh, wait, you guys date? Well, for a little bit. A little bit. Everybody got to date a little bit. Before oh, okay. we become friends with someone, got to date a little bit. Yeah, every time there's a dry spell, guess what? Guess who's calling? This guy. Jack's calling me. I need a little bit of slippy in my life. Oh, well, a lot of people do. <laughs> <laughs> no, what are you going to do, Scott? What are you going to do, Scott? Me up. You're going to throw him 69 and make him suck off your balls while you eat out his asshole? What is, stop looking at me <laughs> like that. I'd love to see you try. Double I'd love to see you. you try. Go right now. I dare you to do it right now. And I'll Dude. watch. I'll watch. So you guys sort of rebound with each other anytime you don't have a, another relationship. Yeah. 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 But we're all looking for love in all the wrong places. Looking for love in all the wrong places. places. You're looking it's for love. Big country fan, this guy. I love yeah, really. country music. Oh, I actually am... I am single, but I'm not looking for a relationship. I'm enjoying my freedoms. Oh, okay, Slippy. So you just sort of date 
play the field, date around? Uh, uh, yeah, you could say that. Oh, my God. You don't even understand. When Slippy gets into something, Slippy gets into something. Okay. <laughs> I that- have been hosting, after these infant death tambourine concerts, <laughs> I've been hosting some All right, that. wild swingers parties. Oh my. <laughs> Nothing gets me in the mood more than a hot show. And um, is, it, is it with the people who are in the... Well, I do. Say, we At the end, we say, thanks for coming. And if anyone's interested, I'm hosting a wild swingers party after this. <laughs> okay. And what percentage of the audience? Have you ever been uh, one of these swingers? A swinger solid before? percentage. Now, we sold out MSG, and I would say 62% have come... Have come back to your... To studio party. apartment. So it is to his studio apartment. In East, East, East Brooklyn. Okay. Let's call it what it is. Let's Coney call it Island. It so not really Brooklyn. Coney Island. Island. All aboard. Rick and chicken, Rick and chicken. And Rick, if we had you actually live in the park? Yes. I'm on the... The backbreaking roller coaster. Oh yeah, the wooden one. The wooden one. Oh, yeah, it's yeah, called yeah, the yeah, yeah. Backbreaker. I the hurricane. Call, well, you know, but some people call Slippy the backbreaker. <laughs> oh God, you know I me. Mean? What are you gonna do? Put him down on the ground, take his balls, put him in your mouth, squeeze him so hard, then look him in the eyes and go, "Is this what you need? Is this what you want? Wait for him to cry." I don't I'm, think so, Scott. I'm not, I'm not doing anything. I don't know. Things. I don't think no. so, Scott. Anyhow, if you'd like to join us, it's totally fine. At, at Coney Island. Well, if you're in New York, let us know. Yeah. So it's. Uh, I, I I would imagine these swinger parties are a lot like July Fourth at Coney Island when, uh, with with. <laughs> Hot dog eating contest. You are a. Card. You are very. You are. Ve- you are an ace of spades. I think you're one of those funny hosts. I. I, uh, I don't know. Are, are you, you good at finishing off jokes? Am I what? Good at finishing off jokes. I definitely. Me and yeah. Slippy have a lot of beginnings. We jokes. got a okay, lot yeah, of setups. Yeah, yeah. A lot of setups. We Hit got me no. With yeah, what do you we got? got? No. You want one? This is almost like uh, the segment that we used to play. Started by Ben Schwartz. Called "Riddle Me This." That he argues with me about whether he started it or not. But Did go he? Ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Here's my first setup. <laughs> he forgot again. By the way. <laughs> yeah. Go my, ahead. My uh, my mother <laughs> called and gave me the nudes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 Doesn't sound like a joke, Slippy. <laughs> Sounds like that thing that you're really upset about that you've been upset about for a long time. My mother called and gave, gave me the nudes. The nudes. Okay, That's now, the beginning. Finish yeah. it off. You want the middle? Yeah, give me the middle. Because <laughs> yeah, every joke needs to be giving middle and end. It's a story. It's not Our jokes kind of like stories. Okay, Our so jokes give, like stories. give me the beginning again. My mo- so my mother called and gave me the nudes. She looked at him for two seconds, looked me in the eye and said... And this is the end? Well, well, you got to finish okay, it. This is the end. That's the punchline. Oh, and this God. is the end. You're not. Jesus, good. that's more. What of is it. this? A Seth Rogen movie? <laughs> I'm not doing and this a is the end. Concert okay. for dead kids was and bad. Knocked I, up. No, and was... knocked up. Are we just saying Seth Rogen movies? <laughs> just merely stupid idiot. I love this is the end. That I movie wonder if, was if we so come fun. back. I feel like we may come back one day. <laughs> I, feel I feel like this one's hard to listen to. I, <laughs> it's funny in the studio, but I think anyone with earbuds is like Jesus Christ. No, I mean you have a lot of energy. I mean, it's a lot of people listen to this show in the morning. It's giving them a boost of energy before they go to work. I love a good morning show. And you know what I found out? Because there's there's studies. If you go on earwolf.com, there's actual com, studies on the internet. There are studies on the internet yes. tell you yes. which uh, which um, where you, people listen to the podcast. And where yes. I found out the number one place where people listen to this podcast, mm. right? And this right. is me, Jackpot. Right, Jackpot. iTunes. Uh, I- <laughs> <laughs> iTunes. Isn't that Why insane? was that interesting? Isn't that me? <laughs> You'd never guess. You would never guess it. I maybe thought I was going to say location, but no. The answer is iTunes. <laughs> iTunes. Well, wow. Interesting. Wow, so much information out there on the internet. It's pretty amazing. You can I do a love Google it. search. I or love you can it. use Yahoo. Um, I think Webcrawler's done, but maybe AltaVista. I used to them. love Webcrawler. Hmm. I yes, used to go on Webcrawler all the time. You had a Webcrawler blog. Oh, my goodness. I used to talk about all the things you could search on Webcrawler and what would happen if you did. <laughs> There's about 10 words. 10 but words. They are all fine. Yeah, they're amazing. What about Ask Jeeves? Remember that one? Ask Jeeves. Oh, my goodness. When you, you had, hear oh, what Ask happened Jeeves. to him? Jeeves. Do you yeah. remember what happened to him? We met him. Do you remember what happened to him? He got caught in the Me Too movement. He was. Oh, oh no! Jeez, is that got, Jeez, no, got, what did he do? Some it was pretty very, thorough allegations it was thrown it at was him. Bad. It was oh, bad. It was bad. Oh, that's too bad. We don't I talk about him. He was pre me too, no, but he was him. also times up. Fuck him. I fuck loved him. him. Yeah. Well, I don't think he would after you found out. Okay. What, what a piece he of shit. Did. Too what a bad. Piece of shit. Are you? By the way, are you men or are you women? I can't. That is so rude. Well, well just give me your. My name is Jack Pot. Give me your pronouns. My honestly. Thank you. Thank you. That's oh, one wow, of the that's biggest really compliments I could ever. Please just give me your pronouns I, so a, I can. A, I, I applaud you for not being able to see gender. Okay. And two, I actually don't have a gender. You don't? Okay, great. I'm so genderless. do you prefer to be called they? And I prefer to be called rascal. <laughs> I like that. Wait a minute, but <laughs> your Slippy, name is Slippy. Uh huh. Is Slippy a nickname? <laughs> Slippy is the name I gave to myself when I realized I didn't need names or parents. 
Right. Okay. So you what was your original name? I'd rather not say, but say it's, it, say it. It's a, it's a good it's a great one. Norm. Norm. Let me finish. Okay. He's not oh. <laughs> normal. He's, the first name was Wait. let him finish. Okay, sorry. My last name, Dormal. Normal Dormal? Let him finish. <laughs> sorry, sorry, I didn't know. I thought that you were done. The second. Okay. Let is he finished? No. I'll tell you when he's finished. Comma. He's done. Duke. <laughs> Wait, he's done. Wait. Normal Dormal. Comma. The second it. comma. Yes. No, yeah. Th- yes. Yeah, normal dormal the second comma. And oh then you were just God. saying Duke for what reason? <laughs> He was talking to Duke over there. Duke, <laughs> Duke, hi, du- hi, boy, come here. Duke. Is oh a wait, dog. you brought pets into the studio? Yeah. Oh, is that not allowed? I'm He's sorry. Allowed to- allergies. <laughs> hey, Duke, you big old, you big old dope. Come here. Love Duke. Yeah. Oh god. In my head, we're all cutie. kind of Duke. You ever see the lobster? Everybody talks and everybody turns into like an animal at the end or something like that. I oh, have not god, seen it. No. It's such a sad and poignant film. You love it. You love the lobster. Slippy love. Slippy loves what smaller is- independent films. Spe- <laughs> speaking of the lobster, what is your favorite thing to eat? <gasps> oh my oh, goodness. Oh, it's hard to say. Mm. You know when you get a. Pho Say it. soup. Say pho it. soup, yeah. P H O. And if you're lucky, you get a ball of just, just like some fish. weird fish thing. Yeah, fish ball. That. Just the fish ball? If I could have a just a bowl of isolated brothless <laughs> That's fish amazing. balls, I would die and go to heaven. I'm wow. sure you can buy those at the market. Pretty sure you can. Have you I've ever tried. had a uh, kombucha? Uh, kombucha? Sure. Yeah. Sure. You know, at the very end when it's all just residue, but you're not yeah. quite certain the what silt. that is? The silt, we call it. <laughs> okay, that's... I like to take that silt, yeah. put it in my freezer, freeze that shit yes. up. Yes, mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. Oh, sprinkle that in a little bit of my coffee mug, which you know what's inside there, because I am a very naughty boy. What it's is inside shit. there? It's shit. <laughs> I like to drink shit <laughs> with a little bit of this frozen kombucha. So Crust. then, and oh my goodness, uh, it's like, have you ever had that before? No. Have you ever had a... Have uh, you ever had that before? Have you ever a cup of, cup of shit with a little bit of kombucha on top? I don't believe I have. But oh, I could, I'd, my. Cup of little shit with a little bit of kombucha on top. Cup of little shit with a little bit of kombucha on top. Oh, why are you trying, doing that? I was trying around. I, I, oh, why would you do around? round? fuck is a round? No, I had a couple of the guests on around. Oh, you, know, you know what a round is. Remember when no, we I'm do, talking about this. What just happened? What just happened there? Jack starts speaking. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes I get so excited, I get out a tiny little fart. <laughs> that was he's talking t- about, no, he's doing a dad joke. It's out of my dick. It's out of my dick. No, I can make my dick is fart. Yeah. Oh, that whole time, I thought it was out of your rump like normals. No, what's a normal? You do rump? a penal queef? Yes. Normal oh. dormals. Have you seen the penal queefing championships? Oh, no, I haven't. Goodness. Where are they? Oh, are these Google on Coney that. Island? You gotta Google go on that. Google on that. Google that. You gotta go on Google on that. Okay, um, this is just a video of you. Yes. Yeah, well, watch it. Watch it all the way through. It's 17 minutes long. We host it, and we've been doing it for 12 years now. We're the only competitors because we're the only people in America that can do it, apparently. Watch this. You want us to do it, I think? We, okay, do, yeah. we do a whole who's on first thing, but we do it with, with our penis fart. Yes. Okay, right, okay ready? It. So I right, started off. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready, Oh, hold on. Let me get some air. Okay, let me get some air. Okay, here we go. This is uh, us doing a who's on first, but through our penis holes. <laughs> and the technique we have. I'm already laughing because <laughs> okay, who's right? on first? Here we go. Classic. Ready? Okay, guys, this does not sound like who's Third on first base. to me. Oh, <laughs> okay. man. Okay, okay. Well, look, guys, oh. I know you I know you came here because... <laughs> I know well, you... that was just about the highest brow <laughs> comedy I could ever think of. Oh, my goodness. I hope those guys have been under Schwartz have cool shows on their tour. <laughs> Now guys, I know I you. Mean, can- I can see that as a better advertisement <laughs> for the comedy stylings. <laughs> I know you guys came here because you have a, a, something very important. You want oh to talk my about. goodness! Oh, now I'm happy you brought it up because God. for me, it's like a big deal. Yeah. And there's a lot of stuff going on. There's a lot of hatred out there. Yeah, there is. And oh. it's time to bring goodness into the world. Let's bring yes. people together. Yeah. So what Sleepy and, and I, Jack Pot, <sighs> yes, are trying we're, to do? We are trying to start a summer camp. We're trying to start a summer camp mm. for what adults. What months would this be? For adults over okay. the over November to January. Right in the right in the because the <laughs> summer because not, the camps are all, not summer camp. well no because the camps are all used during the the summer months. Well, well, yeah. Yeah. The only time they're, we get is the south of the equator. So oh okay great yes. So what country is this? Uh, southern Australia. We're in the very oh, okay. southern tip of Australia. You know where the very, you know where Australia the ends at the very Perth? bottom? No. Yeah, no, come on. That's, that's not very that's southern. The north, I think. You don't know anything. No, we're in Tasmania. Uh, we're in Tasmania. Oh, Tasmania. Okay, got you it. You ever heard of the Tasmanian devil? Uh, I think so, yeah. Okay. He's played by Chris Kattan. 
<laughs> like the ghost of Chris Kattan? No. Is Chris Kattan <laughs> dead? No, Chris Kattan's alive. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's a callback to something. Uh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I remember now. <laughs> um, so uh, so you guys are trying to start this summer camp yes. for adults. Yes. We're trying to, but it's hard. What, and what would the adults do in this summer camp? Uh, uh, all the things people love to do in summer camp. So, like, tie their shoes. Sure. Um, eat donuts, but, you know, look at each other like we shouldn't be doing yes. this. Okay, in the last week, we <laughs> um, play a very loud siren, and that is the start of Mortal Kombat. And here it goes. And then everybody goes, let's do it, Mortal Kombat. You get your weapon beforehand. Yes. Okay. And you attack last man standing. This, this man is not standing. like the video game, but this is real, actual combat. It's more like the film Battle Royale. Yes. And oh. less like the Hunter, ga- Hunter Games. The Hunter Games. The Hunter Games. Ooh, the Hunter Games. Why amazing. didn't they call them the Hunter Games? They were hunting each because other. Because Hunter it's... S. Thompson has a movie called The Hunter Games. Yes. Oh, that's yeah. So he wrote this screenplay called The Hunter Games, and it's about him playing board games. Board games. And it's that, all day. Yeah. So, and by the way, it's pop matic trouble. It's sorry. You know, it's not, it's, it's like childish it's games. games. Yeah. It's candy land. And then he gets stuck in that goop thing for like 30 yeah. days. Snakes and ladders. So I mean, sweet. have you ever played snakes and ladders recently? As an we adult? call them shoots and ladders. Well, that is out of sight. Is it snakes and ladders in where you're from? I'm from. The snakes and ladders, I believe, is from England. Uh, that's oh. what they call shoots it. Shoots and ladders is what we shoots. call them. What's a shoot? Shoot is like a slide. Oh, right. Oh, so S, uh, so C-H. Uh, yeah, shoots. Wait, you, like, thought, you thought oh, it was guns shoots. and ladders? <laughs> I don't know. I, that was my question. Yeah, Shoot or parachutes? And you know what? You probably have a game called Monopoly. Yes. We call it Money, Money, Here We Go. Oh. <laughs> what other games did you have? Well, I had Life. Life is called Uh Oh, Here We Go Again. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so it's sort of a reincarnation. Kind of yeah. I guess. I don't know. <laughs> I didn't okay. Remember. We had Axis and Allies. We never had that. <laughs> never heard of Axis and Allies. Oh, is it a is it like Jesus a Settlers Christ, like a Tan type thing? Like a Risk no. type thing? Or have you played it? So uh, you're So you had friends as a child, is what I'm saying. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, goodness. you had no friends. Oh, you were a lonely. But no, uh, but then at the I same time, the board games couldn't play them with anyone. Well then why would you have the board games? Because I was trying to coax people. But That's look at like, me now. I'm the leader of an all tambourine. Child, infant, death. Wait, you're the leader? I thought band. you were co leaders We are co-leaders. I don't know why I keep saying that. Every now and then he comes out and he's like, I am the leader. Well, I mean, it was Guys, my don't. idea. It's not your idea. Your it idea was, was my no, idea. your idea was to kill babies. My idea was to make it into a spectacle. We don't. We are not responsible for any baby death. <laughs> okay, he says this every we time. Get the we get the babies dead. To. He kills the baby. No, they come in I dead. He kills the baby. Yeah. We're on air. Oh, you Internet. know what? He finds them. He just happens to come upon them. Wait, so you're finding all of these dead babies? Yeah, where do you find them? Well, they're delivered. They're <laughs> delivered in the mail, USPS. You know how storks deliver live babies? Sure, yeah. The United States Postal Service delivers the dead ones. <laughs> okay, so storks with the LBs, <sighs> yep, USPS with the DBs. DBs. Yes. Okay. LB, DBs, LB, LB, DBs. LB, DBs, LB, DBs, LB, DBs, LB, DBs, LB, DBs, LB, DBs. Well, guys, you, you're so interesting. You're, uh, Why I, don't you I'm ever so, talk about yourself? Uh, yeah, no one's interested, but I'm so glad you both found each other because you seem to be on a very similar wavelength. Oh, God. Uh, oh my God. We, we love hanging out with each other. We used to live together for a little bit when we got serious before we broke up. You used to lift uh, weight? No, yeah, we live to together. You live dumb together. Oh, live together. Hey, oh, you fucking idiot. Hey, well, I hey, made hey. him late night grilled cheese oh, sandwiches. Oh, my goodness. They were so delicious. He used all these different type of cheeses. Okay, so. Parmesan. Yeah. Keep going. He used 10 cheeses. That's one. Ricotta. That's two. Goat cheese. That's three. Sounds What's it Kind of disgusting pep- at this point. Peppercorn. Peppercorn? <laughs> Peppercorn is like a butthead said it. <laughs> Mo- mozzarella. Mozzarella, that's five. You got okay, five more. Matzo ball. Very Matzo similar. Ball. We'll give it to you, though. That's six. <laughs> Cheddar. Cheddarino. Seven, eight. Cheddarini. Nine. And cheddar tea. That is ten. That is one of the best. And by the way, have you ever had a grilled cheese with an actual matzo ball in it? <laughs> it sounds you know gross. This? It's unbelievable. Did you know this? this is a true story. <laughs> is this real? I went to New York City and I thought, oh, I went to a diner, my, you know, Jewish okay. diner. I was said, this you when know you what? Sold out. I'll MSG? try. I'll try for the first time. I'll try this matzo ball. Soup. Is this that true? Sounds delicious. Where did you go? Which diner? I, I can't remember to be honest. Mm. There's a dime a dozen over there. That's and odd. feels weird. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about Jews, not diners. <laughs> oh and I man. Went, I said, I'll have a matzo ball soup, and I thought that'll be. I thought it would be soup with balls of mozzarella in it, and it oh. turns out that is not true. No, at all. it is not. I mean, matzo ball soup is delicious, but if you're expecting I don't cheese, think it is. oh, it's very good. If you're expecting, if cheese, you're expecting it's not. cheese, yeah. if you're expecting cheese, yeah, turns out it's not at all like French onion. No, no, no. <laughs> Well, guys, it's been such a pleasure to meet you and talk to you. I oh hope you'll come goodness. back again. Oh, but well, we uh, hope we're, you have a. If you do have a infant death, 
uh, let us know. I hope uh, you'll keep us in mind. Or if you just have an infant, uh, Slippy would like to talk to him or her. Oh, oh I would. I don't think that. Uh, love to pinch his cheeks I, off. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Please welcome JJ and Murphy O'Malam O'Malaman. Is that what your name is, O'Malaman? Well, yeah, yeah no, you Dylan. bet. <laughs> Hi, JJ. I'm Murphy. Hey. hey. Uh, Murph, is that how you shorten it? I can't recall. That's a way to do it. <laughs> yeah. What about Urfie? Uh, no one's ever said that weird. <laughs> That's no. silly. No one ever does it from the from the back. Anyone ever call you Scott? I mean, Cot? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're Cot from now on. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, kids. How are you? Uh, oh, pretty, pretty good. good cotton mouth. <laughs> yeah, a little cotton toe. Cotton mouth king. <laughs> yeah, the cotton king. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what do you got? A plantation? <laughs> <laughs> I was born in uh, Savannah, Georgia, so it's not too far off. You were born on a plantation. You own slaves. I didn't know it was. This was the seventies, of course. Relax, Murph. M- he might be a slave. Well, maybe you're right. Well, I didn't think of it that way. Were you a, a s- 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 slave? slave? Why does sl- the Why does the concept of slaves make you so frightened that you're stuttering? Are you kidding okay. me? You're scary. <laughs> Is the idea a life not lived? The idea of enslavement, not slaves themselves. Mm, slaves themselves. Ooh, they're ch- <laughs> ch- ch- chains. <laughs> they're, I think you're thinking of ghosts. Uh, no, no way. Slaves give me the heaps. <laughs> Sleeping in weird quarters. <sighs> whoa! I bet they don't even have whoa, 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 windows. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, uh, the fields are there. The ultimate window, I think, working outside. God's window. <laughs> Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yeah, the whole world's God's window. Mm-hmm. Man, imagine looking through it. <laughs> hey, uh, I got news for you. I'm not 10 no more. Oh, re- oh that's right. It's been about a year that, uh, since you've been on. Is that right? So you're 11 years old at this point? Yep. And I'm still 11. <laughs> We're Irish twins. That's right. You're Irish twins because you're nine months apart, right? Yeah. Yeah. So uh, your, your mommy and your daddy, the minute that uh, you were born? Don't bring up our mommy. Oh, that's or right. Or our daddy. <laughs> Oh, is or it there? us? <laughs> okay, <laughs> hold us on. out of it. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to speak to you guys. Um, uh, if you listen to our last uh, episode talking to uh, JJ and Murphy, we didn't really talk about Ireland all that much the last time you guys were on here. What's the point? We've never been. We don't know anything about it. Ugh. Really? Uh, what about four leaf clovers, leprechauns? Four leaf clovers, leprechauns. Four. <laughs> It's a clue. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait, it's a clue. Hey, thanks, Cottonmouth. <laughs> yeah, all right, we all right. might have to cut this one short because we got to go to we gotta go to Alaska. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Before we Wait, get there. Wait, how'd you yeah, we're, that out? We're on a new case, okay? Yeah, oh, you okay. better so, believe we got a new last case time, Last time you guys were on the show, you you were uh, your, your kid detectives. I guess I should have mentioned that at the top. Yeah, you guys have that's a detective our job firm. title. Right, yeah, and you, you were talking about... Uh, your mommy had been uh, uh, mysteriously missing. Skinned alive, ridden like a pony. Yeah, right. we told you not to bring it up. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And your What's dad... wrong with you? Are you a total doy or are you just pretending to be one? <laughs> I think it's somewhere in the middle. Okay. It's very painful. Those memories hurt. Yeah, yeah those memories hurt. <laughs> My mommy's memory sliced all the skin right off. Woo-hoo. What do boobs look like without the skin? Yeah, is it just like the... a bit like a jug of milk? Oh, even <laughs> they look even better. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> we suckled. <laughs> okay, all right, guys, all right. So there's you're... none of those crummy nipples getting in the way. <laughs> you don't like nipples? Those are the things you suck on. I like what's inside the nipples. Oh, okay. Come on, man, it's the '90s. <laughs> I don't believe it is. I wish. Oh man, wish you, it were. Oh, do you have a uh, you you like nineteen uh, nineties uh, nostalgia? No, oh, yeah. Oh, I do. Yeah. What, mm-hmm. What's your like Pearl Jam and Nirvana? And... Clarissa explains it all. Yeah, Secret World of Alex Mack. <laughs> <laughs> um, you guys said you had a new case. I mean, we're getting yeah, off topic we here. I mean, we, we were supposed to talk about Ireland, but... Uh, oh, we can. We can, and we'll just be really distracted by our case. Oh, yeah. okay. What's the case before we get into Ireland, then? Oh, uh, uh, you won't believe it if I told you. Yeah. Try me. I mean, you know. Uh, you're so incredulous, though, sir. <laughs> <laughs> sir. Thank you for addressing me as sir. I uh, forgot that was part of what you guys did. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <laughs> you just remembered, though? It felt natural. <laughs> yeah. Wait, do, do, do you have amnesia since the last time you were here? Do I? Blink, blink. Ah. 
<laughs> I don't know. Oh, what's what's my name? What's your name? My name's Murphy. Your name's Cotty. <laughs> yeah, old Cotty. I fell off a pony and hit my head. Oh. Yeah, it's true. It was. Uh, it happened only two weeks ago. It happened in the season finale. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wait, you guys have a TV show? Yeah. It's called Full House. <laughs> yeah, it's called Full House. Fold House. It's called Fold House. Fold House. Fold. Fold. House. House. Fold. Fold. F-U-L-L-E-D? F-U-L-L apostrophe D. Oh. I, <laughs> uh, I mean, we got it. We're youthful. So it's like diff apostrophe rent strokes in that? Ter- yeah. 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 Or like talking apostrophe tang? Yeah. yeah. It, it, just like that. We got a camera crew following us around on all our mysteries. Yeah. Really? It's pretty great. So it's a reality show? Uh, yeah. It's, yeah. it's going to be on Annie. Yeah. Annie? A-N-E. Oh, sorry, A Jeez. and E. Why don't you enunciate a little better so Why people understand you? Why don't you listen you? tighter? Yeah. Y- you in the entertainment industry, or are you just a guy with a microphone? Everybody just thinks they can just do whatever they want these days. Ugh. Uh, uh, I'm right. going to call my agent. I'm going to call my agent the same. Wait, oh, you have the same agent, or or you are similarly calling your different agent? The, the different, the same. <laughs> yeah, we have the different same agent. <laughs> It's one guy who plays two different people to kind of please us both. <laughs> okay, so sort of the whip, the nene, and the carrot? Yeah, he does the nene, eats the whip, <laughs> sucks the carrot. Okay, look, uh, I want to hear about this case. Oh, I, all right. it, I, I appreciate you guys breaking it here on my show and not on your own show. It's not about breaking it, sir. It's that we can't stop thinking about it, and we got to solve it. Yeah, okay. so this consider this kind of like a... You Did know, you ever I'm, solve the last one, by the way? About your mom? We figured out where the last clue was. Yeah. <laughs> where was that? The White House. The White House. Oh, did you guys ever go to the White House? You talked about it a lot. No. Couldn't get a train ticket. Too young. Yeah. Too young to be on a train? Yeah, we went up to the train man, and we said, train man, train man, give us a ticket. But he said, I can't see anyone over the edge of my thing. <laughs> yeah. He had his penis out? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is disgusting. Well, you're telling us. We're just kids. <laughs> so, uh. It was interesting, though. I've never seen one quite like it. Really? Which, uh, what types have you seen? Triangle, butt shaped. Butt shaped? No, you've just seen butts. <laughs> <laughs> no, he said it was Dick. Yeah, he okay, said it was his dinger. <laughs> All right, so you guys never made it to the White House, so that's a that's a uh, cold case. Yeah, uh, yeah. For yeah. now, we'll figure out who killed our mom and we'll avenge their, her death. Yeah, oh. you've seen the Revenant, right? Oh, sure. Yeah, you Me. think it was a bear? Me too. Remember when Jonah Hill was that bear? <laughs> yeah. The Golden Globes a couple of months ago. That was the Revenant. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, so you've just seen? I saw Jonah Hill playing the bear in the Revenant. Yeah. <laughs> He walked right up on stage, they cut out a lot of the sound, and that was it. (laughs) (laughs) So, what is the new case? I want to hear about this case. All right. It all started when a crying mother came to us that her that her babies had been stolen. Her, yeah. Yeah. She said, everything was going normal. I was at the hospital. I shit up my pussy. <laughs> wait, wait. And then, the, and wait, then wait. the turds turned into babies, and then they were gone. <laughs> okay, guys. This is, I, uh, I'm starting to regret. This is not that kind of a show. It's not? <laughs> all right, all right. Look, we Look. <laughs> All right, all right. In, in, a, in a crime drama, you don't censor the details, okay? Okay. Yeah. So this, this is real life, man. We so gotta work exercise with what we got. some sensitivity. So we got our notebooks. We wrote down all the facts. Yeah. Okay. She had turds come out of her. Wait. She went to the hospital. Yeah. Back up. Yeah. You got uh, even God earlier. The What's, what oh, happened yeah. before then? She showed up at her door. She, she, she That's went, after. Oh, wait. She went to the hospital. She was born. Wait, hold on. How far back are we supposed to go? <laughs> even further. Even further. Her mommy and daddy. Oh, uh, before that. Her grandparents. Before No, earlier. Her great-grandparents. Earlier. Earlier than that. Her great-great-grandparents fell in love. Her great-great-grandparents. Great, great, earlier. Great, the first caveman touched earlier. the first pussy of a cavewoman. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, can you stop saying that word? There's, that's the only word. <laughs> There's so many other words for it. What, like, give us what? some. Teach us. Gash. Gash. <laughs> Please say that from now on. Okay. <laughs> the first caveman touched the first cavewoman's gash. They did it. They made babies. And well, then there's a bunch of incest because they had to get more people. Is that why you guys? Uh, never mind. What? Well, you're from those bozos too, man. Everybody came from them. Mm-hmm. Anyhow, so she she went to the hospital. She shit out dookies out of her pussy. <laughs> Don't say that word. Gash. 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 Sorry, sir. She, she <laughs> shit out dookies out of her gash. They turned into little kids, and they ran away. Or they were taken away. We yeah. don't know. We have to talk to the doctor. He's a person of interest. Yeah. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> and the nurse and the whole cleaning staff of the hospital. They also say, you know, the loved ones are the ones who are the biggest suspects. So you may want to, you know, really focus your investigation on this mother. What about the daddy? What about the daddy? What about the daddy? Who's the daddy? Okay, mm-hmm. so this, the, so, and, and you know your mother is your blood relative? Um, we know there's a lot of blood, that's for sure. We saw that. Wow, no skin. Yikes. Did you ever get any of it tested? <laughs> tested? Did what, you ever match? Yeah, no, no, did you ever hip? Yeah. For hip? <laughs> did, you, no. did you ever get, get it tested and does it match any of your alleles or? Allele? Allele. Jaleel. Jaleel, Jaleel White. White. Urkel. Urkel. Family, Family matters. matters. Two, Two words. words. Alaska. <laughs> I told you I we got it. I knew you were right. Oh. I doubted you, but then I knew it. Oh. Wow. Hey, before we go, let's... Uh, Wait, you, you guys know, are leaving? Pull around a little. <laughs> hey, you guys aren't leaving. <laughs> hey, stop kissing. Stop. <laughs> this is bad radio, is number one, and kiss? I think it's illegal. Hey, wait, tell us about... Uh, okay. Give us pointers. All right. Is this how you kiss? <laughs> 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 you guys are not touching each other at all. You're, in fact, as far away... You're standing in opposite corners. <laughs> Okay, try this. Mm. Oh, mm. man. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> Are you reviewing the kisses when you say, oh, my? Or, or Yeah, well, I'm making little mental notes for my newspaper review of Sex of the Week. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you have a column? Yeah. Yeah, she's got It's a, like Sex in the City? <laughs> yeah, she's got a sex yeah, blog. Yeah, it's just like that. I just explain what we did, how it was, and I give it a rating out of uh, all the letters of the alphabet. A being the worst, Z being the bomb. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And what what was your last review? Uh, well, he, well, we I rated the last one M, but it was M for mmm, so it was kind of off the system. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so it's it was a bonus a, grade. <laughs> okay, but it's it the regular M is just <laughs> that's medium. That's like a in your country, it's like a C. <laughs> in my country, <laughs> wait, are you guys from a different country? Um, Have we not talked about where you're from? You're, we, you're not think, from Ireland. I think we haven't talked about where you're from, Scott. Just show us the birth certificate. <laughs> yeah, tell are us. Are you guys Mr. birthers, President? really? Where were you born? Hawaii. That's uh, not a state. Guam. Guam. Well, look, uh, where were you guys? Guam. Wait. Four, four letters, letters divided, divided by, by two. Two, two, two letters, letters. Two. two Alaska. Alaska. <laughs> I don't know that you guys are making the connection between two and Alaska. We already told you. There's a million things that are only two in Alaska. The mountains. The shape of the state. There's a million things I haven't done. Just you wait. Wait, what are you talking about? <laughs> there, do you have regrets? <laughs> do you guys have, have pictures of, of you Why? as kids? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, drawings. Yeah, just well, drawings. We, well, we got a we got a photo when we first came out. We're yeah, just two brown little turds <laughs> in a toilet. <laughs> so you guys were like, toilet babies. Well, where you where else are you gonna put poop? <laughs> you're not gonna put it on your sheets, are you? Unless you're a baby. No, if you're a grown woman going into labor, you're gonna dump in the toilet, and then you fish them out, and you put them under a light, and you wait for them to grow into babies, and then. Pretty soon, those babies are going to be kids. It's like, Science? did you go in the public school system? I did, wait, did you, were, are you guys private school toilet uh, babies? Uh, yeah, yeah, we wore uniforms and continue to do so, as you can see. Oh, yeah. no, yeah, I mean, it also uh, makes you look more like detectives, you know. That's why we wear our uniforms outside of school. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, our uniforms are gray suits. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> with little hats with little brims. Fedoras. Yeah. Wow. Amazing. That's yeah. not what I thought it was. <laughs> <laughs> um, so you guys you guys have pictures of you in the toilet as babies. Oh yeah. Our so first turds, that's pre baby. Did you ever have a picture of yourself as a baby? I yeah, I mean, you know, somewhere around, yeah, when I was six weeks old or so. Well, they, yeah. they waited. When was that? <laughs> Back in the 1970s, anything goes. Holy it was the rule of the smokes. day. Holy smokes. Wait. 1970. 70 is two sets of 10 above 50. Two. <laughs> one and one. Two. two. <laughs> we got to go to Alaska. I think you guys have forgotten how to do this. 
<laughs> okay, look, guys, this this is fascinating. We got some cool facts for you. Oh, oh definitely. I, I do want to hear these facts I mean, then. You brought us on here to talk about Ireland. It's not like I, we didn't do our homework and jam pack a new Trapper Keeper with yeah. all types of Oh, facts. We went okay. on Encarta and printed everything about Ireland. Two uh, children of Irish descent, I believe, actually. They're... Children of the corn. <laughs> You yeah. guys consider yourselves to be children of the corn. Well, yeah, it's what the Irish eat, don't they? You should have seen us when we were born. Yeah, we had corn in us. <laughs> <laughs> they showed me this picture of them in the toilet. And it's bad enough that your mom birthed you into this toilet bowl, but then she shit all over you guys. Well. And she'd been eating corn, and I guess followed it up with a dessert of M&M's, because there were definitely colors in there. Yeah, I'll say. I'll say. Oh, I'll say. Oh, I'll say. I'll say. Two, Two words. words. Alaska. <laughs> two words. Two. The number two. Going to Alaska. Going to, to Alaska. Alaska. Oh, I see how it is now. Alaska yeah. has three syllables. Alaska. M- Alaska. Minus, Minus one is two. two. <laughs> Let's just talk about the last half. Alaska, just like Cotty over here. <gasps> Cotty? Are you from Alaska? <laughs> I, look, I've never been to Alaska in my life. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Show prove us your it. birth certificate. Show us all the ways you haven't been. Yeah, prove it. <laughs> uh... What? I just got nervous. Oh, no. What's wrong? Well, I had a premonition. Oh, great. Sometimes the visions come to her, and sometimes she goes to the visions. Yeah. Mm. Usually what do you, do you ever meet halfway? Um, not really. No, it's, <laughs> it's usually one or the other. pretty assaultive. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, either way. Yeah. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. What do you see? What do you see, sis? Okay. My eyes. Mine eyes. Yeah. Thine cool. eyes? <laughs> hey, see? keep the poetry to her. <laughs> Keep the poetry to her. <laughs> Let me do it. Mine eyes have seen the glory, hold on, this will make sense, of the coming of the Lord. Ugh, that just came out. Oh my gosh. My, I closed my eyes to blink. I saw white, pure white, white snow. Two, Two words. words. Snow, snow, white. A, a fairy, fairy tale. tale. Seven, Seven dwarves, dwarves minus five, five two, two, two dwarves. Dwarves, dwarves living in Alaska. Alaska. <laughs> there are probably dwarves anywhere, guys. These are not clues. <laughs> there are probably dwarves anywhere. Wow. Listen to yourself. That comes from someone who doesn't want to solve a case. I d- look, I think I know what happened to you guys. Uh, to, to every- I could solve oh, this case. Oh, and- uh, this uh, would be great. Uh, 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 All right, Detective Cotter. Yeah, why don't you lean back in your chair and put your legs up on your table like a real detective yeah. and tell us just what happened. All lean right. back in your chair, put the legs up on the table, take out your dinger, yeah. and talk to us. Wait, I'm yeah. not going to take out my Show dinger. us your butt and call it a dinger. <laughs> Show us your dinger. Do it. Oh, it's my butt. Do it. Here, look. Cool. Whoa. That's nice. I All guess right. I like it. All right, here's what happened. Here's what happened. Huh? You guys. You guys. <laughs> Sorry, it's. Sorry, I'm there, always on the case. There are clues everywhere. Yeah. Here's what happened. You guys were born. You were, uh, uh, your dad uh, got someone pregnant. He was married to the woman that you believe is your mother. He got someone pregnant. Uh-huh. F- through an extramarital affair. Oh. Uh. She had these babies. Uh-huh. 12 years ago, they were twins. Okay. And because she had no support, she had them in the toilet. <laughs> she, okay. after a, a night of eating corn on the cob, mixed with M&M's. Okay. Yum. <laughs> and our favorite dinner. That's what we always eat, because mm-hmm. it's our favorite. Yeah, and we're left to ourselves to feed ourselves. Our Shh. mommy probably liked it, because you know how sometimes you like things that your mommy ate when she was pregnant with you? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So even though our mommy never ate corn or M&M's in my life, I think she loved those things because we can't get enough. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You guys are eating corn and M&M's right now, so that's... Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. Well, sometimes we put um, peanut butter onto a corn cob and stick M&M's all over it and then mm. bite it off like cool corn. Yeah, and sometimes we share the same cob and our lips touch each other. <laughs> and we go... Yeah. 
You guys, by the way, are not eating the corn. You're just deep throating both sides of the cob. <laughs> <laughs> All right, enough of that. You can stop see a it. lot more of that on efuck.com. <laughs> All right, stop it. Lop it. Look. Stop it, lop it? <laughs> stop it, lop it. Stop it, lop it, gentlemen. <laughs> you have a choice. All right. Okay, so look. what else? Okay, so, so your, your real mother had you in the toilet, called up your dad in a frenzy. She passed out. Your dad came, took the children mm-hmm. back to your your who you believe is your real mother, but is actually uh, his wife. Uh-huh. Is not your real mother. Uh, raised you as uh, their children, and for some reason led you to believe that you were nine months apart, <laughs> even though you're twins. My hair grows faster. Yeah. Okay, I don't think. Oh wait, so this is just you're surmising well, that yeah. you're older because I your hair feel grows like faster. My birthday's on March seventh. Yeah, mm. and I feel like my birthday's nine months before that. Yeah. After, after that. so January ish. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, I don't think so. I think you guys were born on the same day. Your mother found born out born on the fourth of July. <laughs> Four minus two. <laughs> two, the number two. <clears throat> wait. Wait. Fourth of July, minus of two. <laughs> you guys don't know how to do this anymore. Oh, and you do. No, and you do. <laughs> Your middle name is FBI. Suddenly, <laughs> because oh, you got you got oh, one you of the think wackiest. You, the case? you have one of the wackiest uh, hypotheses of this whole case. It's not. I'm getting pretty steamed. Yeah, I well, don't me... like to be uh, uh, usurped by some sort of idiot who thinks he's better than me. Let me finish. Let me finish. Your yeah. mom can't I finish. Can't I finish. Can't I finish. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, we can't hear you with your dinger out. Put that thing away. It's, it's my butt, and <laughs> well, it needs it's some air. Plugging our ears. Why don't you smoke a joint with it? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so what happened was your your the person you thought was your real mom, oh, yeah. your dad's wife, found out about all of this. Uh-huh. Your dad, in a in a rage, skinned her alive, yeah. murdered her, and skinned her alive. Our old Pap Pap, you don't know the guy, but go ahead. <laughs> he then took off her fake wedding ring that he gave to her, by the way, huh? it, that he led you to believe was her idea to buy a tin fake wedding <laughs> ring. He tested it for gold to see if it had changed. <laughs> To see if she had changed it out for a real one uh-huh. in the ensuing years. Found she did not. Took off all the rest of her jewelry and then said he had to go to Alaska, leaving you guys holding the bag. Ooh. What bag? The bag of bones? <laughs> yes. And then you guys took these bones and you guys have been uh, imagining that your mother's bones are Barack Obama's bones. Wait, 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 wait. So you're saying that lady who knocked on our bedroom door covered in water... Was our mommy? Is your real mommy? And why was she covered in water? Was she it? She was wet from um something. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Either the rain or a shower. Oh man, I, I sure know. regret doing what I did to her. If Wait, that was her and mom. I regret watching and participating. Wait a minute, what did you guys do to this woman? Oh, oh no. no! Wait, hold on. You, this is a client. What did you do? We hurt mommy. You guys hurt this woman, this client? Well, well, you could say that. She was crying out in pain yeah. after we whacked her with stuff. Oh, wait, did you, you whacked her over the head with something? We or? whacked her with our Golden Globes that we'd won. Our, and our daddy's Emmy. Wait, you guys were, is that why you saw Jonah Hill? <laughs> <laughs> wait, who is your dad? We've never talked about his name. He's from a lot of old cartoons. Okay, and he's won a couple of Golden Globes and an Emmy? He won an Emmy. We won a Golden Globe for our show, our reality show, Annie. Oh, okay. That's why you saw Jonah Hill. Yeah. Okay. We were there. Didn't you see us? Seeing The Revenant live. Right, okay. <laughs> and so he's Stage from... production of Revenant. He's from old cartoons. Is it, did he used to play like the, I would have gotten away with it if not for those stupid kids? He yeah. played Old Prospector. Yeah, he played a lot of... He was always typecast. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because of his teeth and his look. Yeah. And the way he was drawn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You mean he's very drawn and gaunt? <laughs> no. no. <laughs> he's drawn with ink and pencils. <laughs> yeah. Wait a minute. Have you ever actually seen your father? Uh, uh-huh. Only on TV. <laughs> when he tells us to do things. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So when he whispered in your ear, this is just on TV? This is cartoons talking to you? Well, our ears are pressed against the speaker. Yeah, because sometimes you got to hear the messages that aren't loud. <laughs> okay. What? Did, so you, you beat this woman... With 
with these awards? Yeah, we hit her. Um, I had some lamp oil lying around. <laughs> sure, I- we hit her. So anyway, <laughs> <laughs> I put the lamp oil all over, and then you know, I lit it up. <laughs> With matches or with a lighter or? Oh, oh. with my eyes. <laughs> but I'm not supposed to tell you that. Oh, I'm sorry, minute. sis. I, I let it out. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You have laser oh, eyes? Oh, no. Uh, you have heat vision? Well. Now they're going to come for us. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait. Oh, no. Two words. We got to go to Alaska. Wait, is this some sort of escape from which mountain situation? Are you guys... <sighs> which mountain? I wish. Yeah, we never seen it, buddy. Wish, wish mountain. Wish mountain. I wish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well... I got it... an eye witch for Christmas. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> it's like a It's a virtual sandwich? <laughs> Mur- no, Murphy. W-I-T-C-H. Murphy. It's a virtual witch. Uh. <laughs> oh God! Why did you? Because no one was listening to me. <laughs> That's not the way to get someone's attention, young man. You don't want to know the other ways I can get your attention. <laughs> oh God! What's happening to me? He's choking you. Oh, let me go! I'm sorry. Let me go! <laughs> Ouch! That hurt my throat. Am I like ET for you? <laughs> Wait, so you're 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 empathetic. Your powers are empathetic in nature. Yeah. And yours are assaultive in nature. Well, yeah. I got to protect my sis somehow. Oh my gosh, so you're like Raven of the Teen Titans. No. Can you ease people's pain? <laughs> no, wait, just no. All right, never mind then. So no, you she's know- like Heart from Captain Planet. Yeah. Oh. Use it. <laughs> yeah. And there are Probably about three other powers around there, and all we got to do is find these other kids who are gifted, and we'll we'll make him. We'll really make him. Make who? Daddy. Planet Dad. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, wait. So that's who your dad is? You think, Captain Have Planet? You've never seen the cartoons. He's always walking around, flying around with those two teeth, <laughs> checking <laughs> gold, speaking like a prospector. Captain Planet, <laughs> he's a hero. He's gonna find the gold in no those heroes. Hills. Guys, I feel like we're not getting to these Irish facts. Can you just give us one just to tease it out? An Irish fact? Yeah. In Ireland, in the 1800s, everyone was begging for mercy from our Lord and Savior, the timekeeper. (laughs) Why do people think that he's the Lord and Savior? Uh, He keeps time. I still worship him daily. (laughs) Yeah. Every time I look at my clock, I I worship him. I worship him. And we leave little little watches out for him under our mantle. Yeah, so we can come sneak down our Mm -hmm. chimney and grab him. And hopefully, I I, I, I leave a trail (laughs) of watches right to our bedroom. Yeah, and I leave my butt. In the air. <laughs> <laughs> Is that why the cat in the hat came that one time? <laughs> yeah. Probably. <laughs> All right, guys, look, uh, I don't think that's a true Ireland fact, but we, I, have you guys thought about, here, I'm adding to my theory now a little bit, all right? You guys, you guys never had a father. You were, you were experimental mutants grown in a lab. You're like test tube toilet babies. Do you say that because I have an eye on my shoulder? What, you do? Yeah. Blink, blink. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Show them. <laughs> <laughs> and you have heat vision. Yeah. Yeah. And Amongst <laughs> other things. You- yeah. Yeah, I got heat vision in IBS. What of it? Yeah, he has to go duke duke sometimes when it's inconvenient. I've already mm-hmm. duke duke right now. Good oh, thing I wear kid diapies. <laughs> <laughs> you, uh, so you, you Muppet baby diapies. <laughs> <laughs> you have premonitions. Yeah, uh, and you have and empathy you're powers. And you something else about me. Yeah. yeah. Wait, is this just like a hey? Let me let me tell you what you have session. Yeah. Yeah. What are you, a therapist, a doctor, a psychiatrist? No more of those. We've seen so many. I can't talk to another one. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Look. Yes. You better not be no psychiatrist. I'm not we'll a psychiatrist. Fucking kill you. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'll fucking oh, kill you. Oh, 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 uh, now you deep throat the corn. Oh, 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 yeah, you like that, Cotterman? I'm choked in. Oh. I'm choked in. <laughs> what? You're choked in? I was choked in because he was. So she feels... Oh, oh, gosh, yeah. please don't do that again. Well? She feels uh, She feels the, the emotions of others and... and and feels other people's emotions and and uh, feels other people's pain. Yeah. yeah. And then, what, didn't we talk last time you were here about uh, you also have, uh, you can also fly? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, pretty N- much. NBD. NBD. He just, watch him do it right now. Woo! <laughs> yeah! Flying around the room! 
<laughs> oh my he god, he loves it. Oh wow. I, <sighs> If I could do that, I would do that all the time. <laughs> well, we I do. I bring my sis along for the ride, too. She rides me like a pony. <laughs> <laughs> Reminds me of mommy's death. Yeah. We yeah. don't do it that often. Yeah. Wow. I'm so sorry about your mommy's death. But she wasn't your real mom. Can you take any sort of solace of that, according to my theory? I mean, here's the thing. You're just one man, and you're mm. not even a real gumshoe. Mm. No disrespect, but we're the real detectives here. Yeah, no homo, but you're not a real gumshoe. <laughs> I don't no think that homo, applies. No homo, sir. E.T. No, no homo does not apply. No homo, sir. E.T. No homo. <laughs> no FOMO. Yeah. Just go. Mo. <laughs> Gomo. Homo. Two words. Homo. Homo. Ho, ho. Alaska. <laughs> They're practically the same thing. We gotta go. The gay guys in Alaska did it. The gay Alaska contingent. <laughs> the gay guilds of Alaska. The gay Illuminati of Alaska. <laughs> the gay alliance of gilding and the Illuminati. Homosexuals holding hands across Alaska. <gasps> They choked our daddy. You think your daddy was choked? Well, we don't know for sure, but we got a couple leads. Consult the bones. Oh, no. <laughs> What's wrong? What do the bones say? More grave news. Oh. <laughs> it's always grave news with the bones. Yeah, the bones never give good news. That's really? why it's so fun to play. Yeah. What do the bones say? Okay. That one's to the left. That one's to the right. Mm. Daddy. Dad. Oh, no. Uh, we think maybe our dad's dead. Really? Collect In Alaska? The bones. Yeah. Mm. Come on. Solemnly collect the bones. Solemnly collect the bones. <laughs> I don't... Uh, can I Can I <laughs> posit a theory here? What? I don't think you have a daddy. I think you guys were born in a lab. You were injected into your real mommy who shit you out into a toilet. And then they, they gave you some semblance of a home life saying that you had a daddy, but it was just your imagination uh, watching cartoons on TV wishing you had a daddy. And then you had a, you had a mommy who was a uh, – what was her name? Was she a doctor? Yeah, Dr. <laughs> Dr. Fran. Dr. Fran Jellums. <laughs> Dr. Fran Jellums? Yeah. <laughs> J-E-L-O Yums. You know, caught – this story you're telling reminds me of a classic Irish archetype. Okay. Yeah. There are little tall, tell, tall tale tellers called leprechauns. Sure. I don't know if that's the main thing you would think of when you think of leprechauns. They're tall tales. <laughs> well, they're short guys, but they tell tall tales. Okay. Well. Yeah, it doesn't line up with their physicality. Yeah. It's, you, it's, it's not always what you see is what you get. It's taught. ironic in that sense. Okay. But yeah, you, you, you sound like a big old tall tale talesman salesman. Yeah, I'm a little worried about you. Okay, Coming here and lying to two children? I don't think... Two innocent children? How two many? Two innocent children? Two! Two! two innocent, innocent children? You, you and, and me. me. Two, two people. people. Two, two, the shape, shape of, of a, a two. two. <laughs> <laughs> Alaska. Okay. Oh, man. Wow. How will we know where to go in Alaska? All we know is to go to the big place. The big place? What big place is that? Alaska, the whole place. Yeah, it's pretty big. It's like, uh, I don't know, the biggest state in the world. How do we narrow it down? Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, once you get to Alaska. Just, instead of just... Uh, Telling us what we're doing wrong, Cot. Maybe you want to tell us how we can get to Alaska and where we should go? Why yeah. Why do you want to get to Alaska? Was something implanted in your memories or something that you, you think you want to get to Alaska or the White House? Well, well a we man in sunglasses did come into our room one night. Mm -hmm. and he shoved <laughs> stuff up our butt and then told us to go to Alaska. But I don't think that has anything to do with it. Well, did, did he, he, also looked like, he looked like uh, he was round, yellow, sunglasses, and a smile. Wait, is this the guy from the Raisin Bran? Is this the son from the Raisin Bran? Who are we talking about? No, no. Scott. Is it Mac tonight? Sounds a little bit like a leprechaun, don't you think? Uh, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Did he, this man also tell you to go to the Wash to uh, the White House and assassinate the president by any chance? Yeah, but that was uh, yeah. almost a year ago. <laughs> he was yellow, no body, round head, smile, sunglasses, only appears on phones. Oh, he was an emoji? <laughs> <laughs> 
You guys are getting emoji texts to go kill uh, the president? Ka, we don't understand Japanese. What the heck's an emoji? Yeah, and what was going up my butt? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so... If he didn't have arms. You, you, huh? <laughs> you guys you, you guys are obviously little mutant children with powers, and it's an escape to which mountain situation where, where you need to get to some mountain in Alaska... That's your mothership that's going to take you back to the alien planet or wherever you come from. Oh, that would be so cool if we were aliens. Wow, I'd speak a different language. Yeah, like, you know, Gim Gom or Glob Glob. I'd say Bleep Blop Bluey. Yeah, we'd speak like BB-8. Have you seen it? Star- the movie? Star- have you seen BB-8 the movie? <laughs> <laughs> I have seen Star Wars The Force Awakens, not BB-8 the movie. Mm, no, no, we saw BB-8. Yeah, BB-8 the movie. Oh, what happens we love this- BB-8. What, happens- what a good movie. <laughs> <laughs> Describe the plot of this movie. Uh, BB-8 goes around. And wait, does he get assaulted by a bear? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Jonah Hill. Jo- it's Jonah Hill and BB-8. I Jonah love Hill BB-8. A, Jonah- I have a BB-8 poster in my room. Yeah, I have a BB-8 toy. Describe BB-8 for me. <laughs> Round, <laughs> yellow, yellow, sunglasses, nobody. No, no body, stuffs things up our butts. Yeah, okay. BB-8. <laughs> BB-8, gotta love the guy. He's the best. Uh, okay. Well, Good grief, I love BB-8 so much. I want to marry him. And I won't let her, because she's mine. <laughs> So, guys, I I I, I think that uh, there, you know the fact that you guys are are constantly making out in between when I whenever I'm talking. By the way, these two kids mm. are making out. Mm. I think it's okay I'm, because I'm, you're I'm, you're just you know you're you're I'm born like, in a lab. You're not really related to each other. You're sort of twins just by proxy, I guess. Scott, Scott, let me ask you. Yeah, you ever skateboard? Oh wow, good question. I mean, I think we talked about this before. I, you know, yeah, I can do a, a few kickflips, ollies, uh, ollies. Yeah, sure. Can you gank? <laughs> I can gank. Yeah, I could do some three sixties, some one eighties. Okay, okay. So I know what I'm talking about. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, ever ridden a skateboard uh, outside of your city? Oh, in a uh, crossing city lines? Yeah. I've never done that before. No, I, I like to keep it contained within my city. Do well, you think we could ride skateboards to Alaska? It's the only way we can get there without train tickets. Yeah, <laughs> my flight powers only work indoors. <laughs> <laughs> That's inconvenient. But <laughs> I get the power off the walls. <laughs> so the power. I harness wall power. So wait, the electricity, the electrical lines within the walls are what powers you? I don't understand it. I think that you could <laughs> probably get some sort of generator or something and oh, yeah, yeah. portable. Can we? Oh, Mr. Lego man, let me build you one. <laughs> but if there was ever like a building, like if we wanted to get somewhere faster, sometimes like if we're going to an area where there's like a, a big school or something, mm-hmm. we'll go in one door and fly through the building and <laughs> crash right through the window. Or like a correctional facility that's very large. Or, yeah. yeah. Exit the other side. Yeah. Yeah. It saves a little time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I bet. I bet. Uh, what's the biggest uh, or, or widest building in the world? I'm trying to think of one. Ooh, donkey. Well. <laughs> Hello, donkey. Hey, donkey. Donkey's oh, oh, back. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> You know when Engineer Cody's on, Donkey's going to come back. The widest building in the world is also the whitest building in the world. What's that? The, the White, White House. House. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah. White House. House. Two, Two words. words. It's a clue. The next, next clue, clue is, is in... in Alaska! Alaska! Wow, I can't believe it took us all that time to figure it out. We finally <laughs> figured it out. Alaska! You guys have been talking about Alaska for the last hour. We have? <laughs> yeah. Mm. How do you know that all this isn't just a dream? How do you know that? Yeah, wake us up before you go-go. <laughs> okay. Shake us. Okay, you want me to shake you? Yeah, we we're all dreaming. Ready? Here we go. Uh. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Is it me you're looking for? Let's sing it together. <laughs> Hello, is, is it, it me you're, you're looking, looking for? <laughs> you know this, uh, it's an old Irish hymn, so you might want to put this on your PCAST. Yeah. I think this is a Lionel Richie song. Hello, <laughs> is, is it me you're looking, looking for? <laughs> <laughs> Guys. It's a leprechaun song. No, no. What? If you end this, we'll have to go back. 
Wait a minute, wait a minute. You don't want me to... Where are you going back? They'll put us back in those jackets with the ties in the back. Yeah, we got that car waiting for us outside. Oh, we no. step one foot outside this place, it's tasers wait, all is, around. And I gotta get that metal thing back in my mouth. Yeah, and I gotta get that metal thing right back in my danger. <laughs> Has the government been chasing you guys and you led them to my doorstep? Uh, let's hope you did your taxes, pal. Yeah. Uh, do, do you need to see my W-2s or W-4s, anything like that? Mm. W-2s? Two? Two? Wait, I got a new idea. What? Two tax forms. Two, shape of a two. Alaska looks like a two. Alaska! Alaska. <laughs> My sis is so bright. Wow, I just blew your mind. Yeah, well, that's not the only thing you're going to blow. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, all right, enough. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, it's, uh, Kat, you got to get yourself a sister. It's the best. <laughs> I have yeah, a wife. what are you with this wife of yours? Get a sister. Yeah, we're best friends. We hang out all the time. And we same parents. You same. don't just split your time at Christmas. Yeah. I look. I have a sister, but she left her uh, uh, son with me, and he passed away. He so, did. Yeah. Wait. Your sister's son passed away in your custody. In I, my custody. I, I yeah. bet he'll come back to life. Yeah. <laughs> I if, hope so. If you want, we can stop by and raise him. Yeah. Wait, you guys can raise the dead? He's just been sitting here in the studio. I, we haven't talked about it in any of the Should episodes. Should we try? So. Well, yeah, let's give it a shot. All right. Wait, it takes a lot out of us, though. Uh, oh, yeah. really? You guys, your energy cells will be depleted after this? Yeah. You'll, bet. you'll be it, more easy to capture? It uses, yeah. it up our, it uses up our mitochlorians. Yeah. <laughs> Do, is this some sort of, like, Lazarus effect that you guys have? I don't know what you're talking about. Lazarus, what? More like, Lazarus, no, thanks. Yeah, more like, I'm busy. <laughs> All right, All right well, let's do something. Touch his feet and I'll touch his head. Okay. All right, here we go. He's cold as ice. Wow, his skin's hardly there. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, uh, I'm awake. What? Oh, Uncle Scott. Hey, Todd. What? Where am I? Uh, this you... sucks. <laughs> Wait, I haven't eaten this. <laughs> you're alive. This sucks already? You should have seen what was on the other side. Oh. oh, man. My dick in heaven was longer than the whole world. <laughs> Whoa, whoa! Hey, uh, Todd, this is, uh, you're going to want to thank these guys. This is JJ and Murphy O'Malley, man. Hey. Whoa. You want me to thank some little shrimps? What are you, sixth graders? Uh, I think they're eleven. Yeah. I think they're twins, and they're eleven years We're old. Sixth yeah. graders. And you're, and you're middle school. I'm middle school. You're older than them, though. Yeah, you could say that. So we've narrowed it down to seventh or eighth. What? Oh no. <laughs> okay. Well, hey, Todd, uh, you've been dead for the past couple of months. Yeah. Well, dead or grounded? Huh. Grounded me. Yeah. Same thing with you all the time. My uncle Scott always grounds me, punishes me, locks me in the bathroom. Hey, we have some things in common. We get locked in little holes. Yeah, we're not doing so hot. We're bad. <laughs> <laughs> we are pretty bad all the time, but it's the age of rebellion. So what? I'm just alive again? Yeah. I got to keep going through life one foot in front of the other just doing it? Yeah, sorry. But, uh, you know, uh, I know you You should get back to the house. But before you go, I'm going to spank you for being dead. No, no, yeah, Uncle sorry. Scott. Ow, 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 ow. Yeah. You, you can't spank me for being dead. <laughs> sorry. It was out of my control. And remember, I, you're, you still don't get to eat those breakfasts and lunches. No, I'm starving. For the next four days, sorry. You're punishing him. It's mean. Uh, sorry, but it's it's uh, tough love. Why it's... is he wearing underwear that says Scott Aukerman on the band? <laughs> well, you know, they're just used underwear, and, you know, I'm a little too big for them, so I save them in case this situation <laughs> you got ever bigger, were... so you grew out of your underwear? <laughs> yeah. Wow. I mean, you should feel lucky that you even have underwear. Yeah, yeah. we have to fly free as a bird. Yeah, yeah. You you guys are going commando. Yeah, you could say we're going commando, mm -hmm. or what? you could say we're free balling. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, look, Todd. Sorry, you got to go. Ugh. I always getting kicked out of everywhere. I never get to stay. My life sucks. Yeah. Well, you you know what? I'm sorry, but your voice is too similar to Murphy <laughs> over here. So that's not my fault. <laughs> yeah. Blame puberty. <laughs> it's going to be confusing for the listeners, so you got to go. Bye. All right. Wow, Bye. that was weird. Todd's cool. I love Todd. Hey, maybe we invite him, you know, if for I'm one of our <laughs> where? One of our events. We have um a kid swingers event. Oh, really? A key party of some sort? Yeah, yeah. I guess. We don't have keys to our own houses, so we use those uh, big 
play keys, those big plastic ones you get for a fake car. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And we all uh, put our names on them, and then we trade them. And then uh, we use our buttholes as the ignition. <laughs> vroom, vroom. Vroom, vroom. <laughs> Wait, are you like the that- voice of the commercial? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's another how, weird part of your backstory. That's how we live off his money. Oh, okay. You zoom. getting sweet zids? Zoom, zoom. <laughs> wow. Okay. Well, guys, I'm so, we we do have to just no, wrap it up. We're I'm gonna sorry. Have to go back. Oh no! Stop! I don't stop want... flying around the room. God, what? this is dangerous. <laughs> wow, you're writing him like mommy. <laughs> You weren't there, were you? She's not your mommy. <laughs> you yeah. described it several times. <laughs> <laughs> Lay off him. He's starving. Yeah. Wait, have, you're starving too? Yeah. I've eaten, I haven't eaten, eaten any Ritz crackers or nothing. <laughs> no one's going to give me anything around here. All right. Well, you know, if, if you pass away like Todd did, no one's going to be able to Lazarus affect you. Yeah, yeah that's true. We Only, need your powers. I know you guys are, yeah, you're a little wiped out from the uh, bringing Todd weak. back to life. Yeah. I feel like I can't breathe. All I want to do is just go back to my hole, watch Captain Planet, and bone. <laughs> Wait, you, what, guys, why don't you eat some of this corn you have here? Uh, I'm full of corn. <laughs> Wait, but you guys are starving to death. Yeah, but corn? Again? <laughs> All right, look. Um, and, uh, and, um. Yeah? What's wrong? <laughs> JJ, are you? Uh, oh, hold on. no. Here, let me console you, dear lad. Here. Oh. Here. Can I let? Can I sit on your lap? Uh, mm-hmm. I guess so. Here. Please let me sit Hi, on your right, lap. Uh, come over here. I, I hate to see a young boy cry. Here, Aww. come over here. All right. <laughs> All right. Here we are. Aww. You know, Scott. Yeah. I've always thought of you as my dad. Really? The dad we never had. You've been on the show twice now. Yeah. You've I, always thought this. Yeah. Right, sis. Yeah, we've talked about it. We agree. Oh, mm. We were hoping that... <laughs> it's okay, lad. Go, go on, you continue. You might want to be our dad instead of Todd's dad. Yeah. Oh, Maybe you could just let him go free and he could figure out his own thing. Oh, wow. And then you'd take care of us. That way we wouldn't have to go back to hmm. the, the lab. We don't want to go back. Let me uh, look at the pros and cons here. Uh, The pros to this would be I hate Todd and I hate being around him. Uh Uh Uh-huh. The cons are Todd would be undisciplined, and I feel like that would be a shame if Todd were to not be spanked every once in a while. And who else (laughs) is going to be doing this? You could spank us. Yeah. Heck, Uh we like it. (laughs) Yeah, I know, but Todd needs to be spanked because he's a bad little boy. Uh, I can be bad. Uh, I'll be bad all by myself. Yeah, we can be (laughs) We can both be real shits. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. No, Todd. Todd is my charge, uh, and uh, I'm gonna. Uh, yeah, sorry, uh, guys. I'm gonna have to give you back to uh, the government. This uh, uh, this blows. Yeah, sorry. Oh, guys. Well, JJ Murphy. I'm sorry, but it's back to the government with you. No. Yeah. Do you promise to escape? Did you escape? To get here this time? They, well, the government just so happens to be big fans of the show. Oh, really? And when they found out you wanted to bring us on as guests, well, they bent over backwards. Yeah, they love comedy bang, bang. Bang, well, bang. bang. Two, two bangs. bangs. <laughs> two two wor- words. words. Two words. <sighs> Alaska. Oh my God, they're dying. Mm. Oh, no, they're kissing. Oh, my gosh. All right. Um, no, what happens this year? Of course, you know, last year, what is your, it's Pied Piper, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's the uh, company's name. The company's name. Last year, you guys lost Pied Piper. You lost it all or whatever, or lost something happened. Lost it all happened. in a gambling bet. Right. And then something happens this year, you were saying? You only need to wait six days and you'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> Do you let, is the whole season laid out in the first episode where it's like, oh, I get what this season is? about it actually yeah it flashes forward to the last scene of the Ooh, last it episode. starts in media res yeah it, it does, does start it actually media. does start right after we left off in the second season mm, i enjoy things that start in media res i feel resolution. like you learned this word <laughs> yeah are you talking about res is in, in resolution Medium uh, resolution? Yeah, it feels like you're starting words and not finishing them. Ah, yes. Well, I enjoy uh, great films like Citizen Kane that start in media res. What's media res? I, don't, I feel like you're medium reservation. I don't know. Media. <laughs> media. Okay, now, that is, that is racist. That is racist, what you said. <laughs> media. So, on <laughs> Not film, that kind of Indian. On film, 
Right on. <laughs> Not any kind of Indian. <laughs> Wait, Thomas no is actually getting to something here. No one's Indian. Go ahead. Media. Believe it. Uh-huh. Res. So f- a me- in the middle type of, of media. In the middle of a like a scene. Media. And then if and you know like when Medi. Medi. Yeah. Meta. Me- meta. Meta. What the fuck? Is I don't, we're doing the mirror res. exercise while we're doing this. By the way, I don't think you can ever. <laughs> Hands on his hip. Thomas is done with this. I'm pissed. What's media res? <laughs> okay. That's where you start in the middle of a scene. Can I say and then, something? And then you flash back. I to, don't think it is. You can't start in the middle of a scene because if you're starting in the middle of a scene, that's the beginning of that scene, Scott. Oh, ah, it's the beginning. Yeah, what, you just said oh, it's the beginning of Jerry Seinfeld's here. <laughs> oh, no, Jerry. <laughs> it's the beginning. You can't start. <laughs> <laughs> if you start in the middle of the scene... Oh, no, that's a terrible one. Immediate, oh, oh. immediate res basically means that you start like sort of at the end and then you flash back to the beginning. We were you goofing. Know. We know you what it means. I don't know what it means. It means I, start, I, I believe that. It. I, I believe do. that. Come on, don't be a doyoy. It starts, you know what it means. It means it starts in the middle of a story and then you, as you watch, <laughs> you figure out what has happened up to that. Memento style. Well, that's well, fa- final res. Memento, I believe. End res. <laughs> M- Memento is chronological. I don't know I what it. I don't know what it means either. I don't I'm understand it. What's wrong with me? It would no, be I'm, like I'm with you. A story I, starts. I just you're stopped. in a movie. I stopped trying. And it starts with you crawling out of a car. God, and you're yes, like, how did why, he get in that fucking car? Why is it called media res? That's what Thomas yeah, yeah, wants. In, yeah, yeah. I believe it's Latin or something. But right. wait, okay. is, is oh, Memento like quid pro quo? Oh. Yeah. That's oh, the oh, wait. Now, <laughs> from uh, Silence why, of the Lambs, quid pro quo means uh-huh. uh, one hand washes the other. N- no, it no. means if uh, it's when, when you, you start, start a scene, a scene at, at, at the, the middle middle of the, the scene. scene, and you pay someone a quid. a quid. It's a British. It's a British <laughs> right. in media res. They, they do that in Oliver. Oliver starts <laughs> quid pro quo. Oliver, Oliver Twist. <laughs> Wait a minute, Bill Sykes. Who's here? Bill Sykes is here. It's me, you fucking cunts. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> it's hard to believe that in 1969, Oliver won all those Oscars saying the word cunt over and over. <laughs> But it's a British thing. <laughs> it's British slang. It's it means different things over there. Consider yourself a cunt. Consider yourself. <laughs> Consider <laughs> yourself. We're doing if it. If you think about it, he did say cunt over and over again in that movie. Oh, Consider god. yourself. Oh god! If you think about it. Oh god! <laughs> Six million dead. <laughs> oh, stop it. Okay. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, there not think about no, it. stop it. Don't. No. Who's this? Who's this? Let's uh, t- no, no. So the season of Silicon Valley. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this? we we hit it. We hit a wall with Camille. Who's this person? <laughs> Camille you know does not want to like continue. Just now, you're getting right. the weight of the Holocaust on them. <laughs> Good Lord, if you think about it, <laughs> six million, yes. and that's not even including all the Russians. <laughs> <laughs> Clundog and Anthony Edwards, No Wiley, they would all play pickup bas- basketball games. Basketball. Basketball, basketball games. Games. Do you want to play some basketball? Nope, stop. <laughs> I want to play. Nope. No. I want Kumail to gets play offended. some basketball. Go back to the six million person. <laughs> hey, <laughs> yeah. if you think about it. Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. Do you see this? We're getting a call here. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, no. It's an out of the country <laughs> number. Don't answer it. No, no. <laughs> no, no. But who is calling? Aren't you? Curious? No. Are you it's never out. curious who's Burn. Burn. calling? Burn. Burn. Okay, okay. If they call Burn. back Burn. later, Burn. we will pick Hello? up. Hello? Uh-oh. Uh, no. Hello? Who's this? this? Hello. Oh, God. It says China. Oh, you Wait. Up. That's this how they last asked time. time. They huh? just call, the country calls itself China? Yeah, it's China calling. <laughs> Wait, is, is this a man named China or you're calling? Oh, this is the country of China. The country of China. Hello. What's <laughs> you, your name, sir? Oh, my name is not important. <laughs> oh, what? It's not? No, no. I'd love to know to whom I'm addressing. Oh, oh it's uh, Zhu Sheng. <laughs> Zhu Sheng? Hello, Zhu Sheng. Hello. I'm Scott. I don't know. <laughs> well, why are you calling then? <laughs> I was uh, wondering. <laughs> <laughs> Stop You're it. wondering we something. We should hang up. You're wondering something. No, no I want to no. hear what I this... Was wondering. I mean, aren't you, Kumail, it, aren't you curious why this person's calling? Yeah, no, I'm very curious. The heard. whole country it's, called. It's Let's, your mobile device. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah? Uh, um, Apple, it? or is it a uh, droid or something else? I have an Apple. Mm-hmm. I have okay, an Apple. Okay, okay. Anyone else? 
I have a draw. I have a draw. Okay, okay. Thank you. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> wow. wow! 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 That was China. What just happened? Like I just went out to take a turd. And, uh, <laughs> and the take a turd? Yeah. <laughs> you, 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 <laughs> grabbed, you, you grabbed one out of the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, we need to flush it down. Here, no, here it is. It's brown. Brown. No, oh, God. no, please. Yeah. God. We're gonna need a bigger cup. <laughs> oh, Jaws no. reference. Jaws reference. Um. And two girls, one cup reference? Uh, you maybe. Combining? I don't know. Mostly. Yeah. Yeah. How does the comedic mind work? Who can say? Uh, God know. speaks through me. Yeah. You're going to have to ask him. Um, I'm going to have to him. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so <laughs> to <laughs> recap, <laughs> we've had... Wait, uh, we're getting a phone call. <laughs> oh, God <laughs> damn it. <laughs> <laughs> hello? Okay. Hello, hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> Is China. this China again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm listening. <laughs> Is it same China, different China? <laughs> no, same, same. You're listening. Oh, you're yeah. listening to the what's same. Up? Sorry, what's your name again? Oh, uh, Xinjiang. Yeah, yeah. Okay, hey Xinjiang. Hello, hello. How do you uh, spell so that? Uh, X. <laughs> All right. Thank okay, you. we get it. We get it. it. Yeah, we get it. Space. C H I A N G. So. <laughs> What's going on? I, I actually, uh, I call uh, just because I'm listening to the podcast. Sure, okay? yeah. There are a lot of people are. Yeah, yeah. Nothing special about it. Super live. <laughs> Super live, yeah. Yeah, of yeah. Course. I like it. Broadcasting uh, now. But I also, uh, I did not mean to call, so. Oh, <laughs> so that's it? <laughs> this is a butt dial? Yeah, yeah. But uh, I just think it's kind of weird because I'm listening. Okay. And now you're listening to yourself even though it's a butt dial. Whoa. Whoa, there's a bit of a delay. Okay. <laughs> right, right. Oh, okay. Yeah. We're going to ask you to hang up your phone yeah. or, or, uh, or or turn down your radio. Yeah. Okay, okay. Uh, what type of hobby uh, Martin and Kumail like? Oh, okay. What kind of hobbies do you guys like? China's wondering. Ooh, yeah. yeah um, I don't know if you guys <laughs> what have. What was it. that? Sound? <laughs> <laughs> Kumail, sorry. stop making fun of our guest. Yeah, this is. I mean, let's be respectful of, a, uh, of an sorry. entire country. For God's sake, yeah, we don't make Please. fun of you because you're from. Okay, Mark. Where, 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 where are you from? Uh, I'm from LA. Mm, uh huh. Wow. Sure wow. you are. Hollywood. Wee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> where else? Are you Martin? currently doing kung fu? No, 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 no. Sure. Why would I be doing kung fu? I'm doing tai chi. <laughs> <laughs> foolish, <laughs> foolish man. Okay. <laughs> oh, so foolish. Okay. What is wrong with you? Right, you sound so foolish. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Okay. Oh, okay. How Martin. much? How much do you weigh? Cause you sound fat. No, okay. no, 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 no. You Mar sound fat. Are you Mar stepping on a scale and breaking it? Wow. <laughs> Martin. The scale number reaching Martin. four million. Yeah, stop it. <laughs> six, you, six million. Oh wow! Yeah, six million. How many? I imagine. Six imagine million. six million. <laughs> when you think about it. I don't know Western European history. <laughs> <laughs> How did you know that's what we were referencing? I only assume. <laughs> okay. Yeah, big so, fat boy. Very intuitive. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Martin, the Chinese. Please very stop. Intuitive. Please stop insulting Kumail. What are your Why? hobbies, Martin? Yeah, so what are your hobbies, Martin? Yeah, yeah. What you want? Uh, <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> Uh, I don't know if you have it there, but uh, I like to ride my uh, electric scooter. Wow, I have an electric scooter. You, you have do? one? Yeah, yeah. Wow. Well, do you have it near you? Yeah, it's on fire right now. Do you have a bell oh, on it? or, or do you have go! A, well, do you have a horn on it? Oh, gosh. <laughs> Did he say a scooter was on fire? I think his scooter's on yeah. fire. I guess he had to get off of it. Some sort of gas fire? Oh, man, I got another turd for you guys. <laughs> oh, no, oh, no. Jesus. Dude, the biggest one of all. This is not the same person's turd. No. You're getting different people. I got it from a different building. <laughs> <laughs> so you went downstairs, got your car out of valet, drove to another yeah, place. Yeah, yeah. What I miss? <laughs> uh, uh, we've talked to China talked twice. To China, yeah. Yeah. Oh man, I always miss China. Oh, oh, oh god, should we pick it up? No. Yeah. Oh, Scott Hello. Picks it up again. Hey. Hi. Oh wait, who's this? <laughs> What's your name? Uh, my name's Turd Duck Dunkweed. Turd Dunkweed? Yeah. Oh yeah, this is Turd. Hey oh. buddy, how are hey, you? I, 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 you told me to call at one yeah. point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh hi, Turd. Hey. Yeah, wh what a wonderful connection we wait, have, by the do, way. How do you know? Um, how do you know our friend here? On the I'm his manager. I I've sort of gotten into the management game, and I signed Turd. Uh, Dunkweed. Really? You okay? So, Turd, uh, where are you calling from? First of all, I'm calling from beautiful Southern California. Oh, okay, where? Uh, right. Wait, where, where in Southern California? A uh, little area known as Hollywood. <laughs> wait a minute. Wait a minute. Are you in the area? Why don't you just come into the studio? Uh, I'm at a coffee shop on. <laughs> okay. I don't know whether we want to say exactly where we are, but. <laughs> <laughs> 
No. <laughs> okay. Tell you what, why don't you, why don't you, we're going to take a break. Turd, why we don't you. We should say the address so you can come by. Oh, I don't think so. Yeah, I don't sure. think we're going to do that. Don't tell them how to go. I'll give you the exact address Grab of where pen. we are. Do you have a pen? Why don't we take a break? I why don't you just. I do know, uh, I'm near, I'm near a recording studio, Earwolf. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, no, you're, you're nearby. Why don't I'll you just come the, up? Give them the gate code. Yeah, we're going to, we're going to. What is it? No, nope, nope, nope. Let's take a break. We'll be right back with more comedy. Bang, bang. Turd Dunkweed will be with us. We'll be right back. Hey. Oh, and Tur- hey. Turd Dunkweed just walked in. Hey, guys. Hey, wow. Uh, you do not look the way I thought you would you look. You made yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a pencil man. <laughs> yeah. Uh, a very thin. Yeah, with uh, <laughs> like an orange hair that looks like an eraser. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's part of my look. And I'm doing um, stand-up mm-hmm. comedy now, and uh, Kumi Nanjiuni's uh, helping me out, aren't you? Yeah, he he sort of approached me, and I saw some talent in him, and I was like, yeah. "All right, I'll give some." Pointers. I saw some talent. Kumail, this guy's bugging me. Oh, I'm sorry. No, he he grows on you. Does you know? he really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. As you spend time with him, you did really he bug love... you when you first met him? No, I sort of. Well, you haven't seen his act. When you see his act, yeah. you forgive all. I've his, imagined it. His foibles, and you've only seen the last thirty seconds. I mean, that bit yeah. is like that's like Carlin's seven words you'll never be able to say on TV. That's yeah. like um, you'll never be able to say on TV. Yeah, you'll that, never be able. Yeah, to say. <laughs> he he made a prediction, and he has been proven wrong. <laughs> He's been proven by wrong. FX yeah. and HBO. Yes, he has. Um, wow. Okay, so uh, so you're going to grow on me, I hear, Turd. I have no idea. That's not my plan. We're going to see how you, you know, grow on me, and uh, maybe we'll take some calls, and uh, we'll see what what's going to happen. Is that all right? That sounds great. And maybe Thomas will come back. This is so strange. I don't know where he oh, is. Oh, yeah, he went turd hunting a while ago. <laughs> <laughs> and we got one right yeah, here. Yeah, you got the biggest one right here. <laughs> all right. Oh, what fun. Scott, how are you doing? I'm, you know, I'm not bad. Are you born here? Am I boring here or born? Oh, uh, weren't you born here? Uh, I was not. I was born in Savannah, Georgia. Savannah, Georgia. Were you really? I really was, yes. Oh, my. I'm a Georgia peach. Oh, God. I 69 all the way through Georgia. <laughs> What does that mean? Yeah, I, I think you know what it means. To... I was on a raft on a river, 69ing a man. Okay. All the way through Georgia. Okay. So you didn't Do you know have the to Georgia 16... River? Do you know the Georgia River? No, I don't. I've spent barely any time there, but I assume there is one. There's a river called the Georgia River. Okay. And it runs all the way through Georgia. Okay. <laughs> and it's been 69 to bond. Exactly. Is, is it lengthwise? Is it horizontal, vertical? What? A 69 they or a Every river? which way, right? No, I don't because mean the, the act of the 69. I mean the river. Have you never 69 a man? No, I know what it is. Well, <laughs> I don't think you 69 a man. I think you 69 each other. It's a pretty mutual act. <laughs> yeah, you were 69 and you, you were 69ing. Uh, yeah. uh, can you do a one way 69? Oh, wait, so you were just so. sucking this guy's dick? What's the numer- What's the <laughs> yeah, numer- He wasn't doing anything. What's the Why numerical <laughs> value of a one way 69? This is a 34 and a half? <laughs> yeah. Ooh. That's where I was. That's what okay. I was doing. <laughs> Ooh, again with the math. <laughs> Crushing it. But I tell <laughs> Why you, would it's, you like 60- an Uber, it's like an Uber. The longer the distance, the uh-huh. more money I make. Yeah. Okay, so. So I, I cleaned out. Are you doing this by the minute? or? I how? have a question. If yeah. you're. If he's not sucking your dick, why are you in the 69 configuration at all? Why not just do standard? Hey, six, it's, six, it's a buyer's market. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that makes sense. And okay. that's, so and he that's just, what he wanted. He just wanted to look at your dick while oh, yeah. you sucked his? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. yes. <laughs> well, he wanted to hold me. So I was inverted the whole time. I passed out numerous times along the journey. <laughs> <laughs> It's terrible. And just, he just sort of, you know, let me down, bop me on the head on the raft, and I'd wake mm-hmm. up and get back oh, to he it. he was standing. He was standing and hold me inverted. <laughs> Wait, oh, my this God. This is like, oh my, so you're you're upside down. Yeah. He inverted. he got a Guinness Book of World Records for holding a man inverted for that <laughs> amount of time. We were on the raft for about six months. So it was recorded, <laughs> really? too. So there's a video of all this. Uh, well, no, we had an adjudicator there. <laughs> okay. The old time. I suppose he was. He, he had a GoPro on his little hat. And uh, <laughs> this was recording. I know this was years ago. And he had a little hat? No, this is only about last year. <laughs> this is last year. And he had a little hat, though. Yeah, yeah. Well, not a regular little, sized hat. Well, because he's got, well, it's the typical uh, Guinness. Oh, the, the Guinness affi- adjudicator hat. Yeah, they oh, got okay. a little red, sh- I call them chapeau, but it is a hat. Yeah, okay. And, uh, well, so they did they mention this in the world record at all about about the it fact that he was book. getting his dick sucked the entire time? Oh, no, 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 no. That was not part of the record. I oh, did, okay. I said, they said, do you want to be in the in the Guinness Book of World Records? You'll make it. This is by far an, an incredible feat. And I said, no, I'm not one for fame. And look at me now, a comedian. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's so ironic. Boy, it was also the longest dick sucking, yeah. Yes, yes, yeah. yes. Yeah. When you passed out, you were still sucking? 
I tried my best, but I couldn't tell you. As I said, he bought me on the head. Wake me in. <laughs> okay, well, what an interesting story you have. And yeah, then how I did think you, so. How did you make it to L.A.? Uh, I He's, had tried. You had what? No, Kumi knows it. Go ahead. No, he's 69 his way here. Oh, okay. Oh. okay. <laughs> He's having, he's having fun. He's having fun. But how did you really make it here? I uh, sucked dick as I was talking. <laughs> upside down. It is 69ing. I don't know why he doesn't want it, but he was upside down <laughs> sucking dick all his way to LA. Okay. All right. Well, let's get away from the sex stuff. Okay. Okay. The, well, which is what I've been telling him. Yeah. Oh, you've been talking about this in your act? Well, yeah. I mean, it's it's a pretty defining element of my character. <laughs> it is. Well, yeah. I mean, there was a one time I, I did a... You know, have you seen all this on YouTube where these these competitions where where people slap each other? That's all they're doing, oh, slap, no, hitting seen each other across like the slap face. Fights? Okay. Yes, it's kind of like a tit for tat type of thing. Okay, a quid pro quo. Yeah. Oh, okay. So I don't about... know French, <laughs> but it's uh, you. You don't know s- any French. No. What about merci? I couldn't tell you if that's French or not. <laughs> it is French. Okay. If I, I told you it's French, you would accept that. I suppose so. I would have no way of refuting it. Okay, so do you know what it means, though? That's the real question. Oh, no. No oh, idea. Okay, what about beaucoup? No. I only know chapeau, I suppose, because oh, I've been yeah, there. So. <laughs> <laughs> what yeah. do you think it means, though? Uh, little tiny dog. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, so you okay. don't know French no, no, at all. No, 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 not at all. Okay. <laughs> anyway. So wait, this person this person from Guinness had a little tiny dog on his head? Yeah. With a GoPro? <laughs> yes, of course he did. <laughs> oh, okay. Wow. This, it this sounds is like a you've way... never had your record taken by the Guinness. <laughs> oh, okay. Boys. I guess I haven't. No. Okay. All right, so go he ahead. He had a tough time. He was really struggling because he was to on g- that raft the whole time. Well, he's trying to make his own record to have a dog on your head on a raft. I don't time. know. If he was going for it, bless him. Uh, but um, it seems Go- like inside baseball, don't you think? Like, yeah, turn uh, the GoPro time. upon thyself. <laughs> goodness. It, it, the amount of times I've read that in the Bible. Oh, did you say good just? <laughs> Which? <laughs> good just. <laughs> um, so what were you talking about, though? There's slap fighting. People slap stand, fighting, yeah. stand in front of each other, make eye, eye contact, and slap each other as hard as they can. Mm-hmm. And if you fall down and you're knocked unconscious, then you lose. Oh, no. You you have to you have to get knocked unconscious to lose. Yes, if you get what do you, dazed, what do you normally sh- like to do to lose? <laughs> well, I mean that's you get slapped so hard that you lose consciousness. That's yes. how you lose. If you don't okay. lose consciousness, you stand right back up, make eye contact, and slap him right back. Try mm-hmm. to give him what he gave you. Okay, all right. I and see. I was the fall guy. The fall guy in the tournaments, so I would get paid Much to like lose. Like Lee Majors used to. I be. suppose so. Okay. I would get paid to lose, so I would. I, I was see, in by this, the mafia of some sort, or I never asked those types of questions. Oh, Someone really? said, "Hey, you want two hundred bucks to get slapped so hard you fall unconscious?" <laughs> and I said, "What am I? A crazy man? Yes." <laughs> so you answered your own question. <laughs> you are a crazy man. <laughs> no, well, I suppose I did. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I, my, say- my yes was yes. I do want to do that because I want to make two hundred bucks. Because who doesn't? It? it wasn't okay. that you're crazy. No, he was asking a rhetorical question and never answering. <laughs> I suppose it's a multi-layered but, yes. Yes, but yeah. I never thought about. Well, it. Okay, okay, until yeah. just now, you guys are a hoot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So so this happened. So And uh, which way did you fall? <laughs> to the left. <laughs> oh, well. Okay. <laughs> little little to the left. You gotta get <laughs> you gotta get, gotta it right get the catchphrase. That's, right. Kumail knows comedy. You, you gotta, gotta get, get it the exactly catch. right. I haven't always done a catchphrase. It's something new. You know, if Dana Carvey said, Well, I bet that's special. Yeah. You know, or like, like get her dead, that doesn't work. Yeah, or I'm gonna pump this thing up. Yeah. You know. He'd be talking about a ball or something. I'm gonna pump this thing up. <laughs> <laughs> I once knew an old man, he had an inflatable penis. Really? And he said that. He's okay. Well, that's probably how you knew it. I suppose so. <laughs> that's no, how he one me. usually gets information. It's very strange. He would take the sack out of his uh, empty little uh, pouch of skin. <laughs> okay, so he had a little tiny. He was like a grower or a shower he had in the shower. A, a, he had. Imagine if your wiener was a sleeping bag. Oh, you man. scooped out all the wiener meat. Okay, I can imagine nothing <laughs> else. I hate <laughs> this. How it, I, you, and it, you just bring, 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 bring. Sleeping <laughs> oh, bag. Oh, wait, we're well, getting a call. We're well, we are. A we call. are getting a call. <laughs> Hello. Hey, guys, it's Thomas. (laughs) Where are you, dude? (laughs) I'm downtown LA. What? Why? That's how far you wanted to get a turd? Well, I was was hunting for turds on the subway. Okay. And then, you know, it just took me downtown. You guys, there's a subway in Los Angeles. <laughs> oh, I got to get on this thing. Wow. But no bathrooms in the subway. No. So anyway, I'm going to go to the standard because I love it. <laughs> okay, of course. <laughs> well, get back here, man. We got. <laughs> I'm on the case. So wait, are you I'm still on the look- case of a hot turd. <laughs> okay. So you're just going to the standard to hang out or you're getting a turd at the No, time. no, no. I got clues, baby. Oh. 
What, what clues what are, do you have? Yeah. Okay, footprints. <laughs> okay. Oh, are they, wait, turd, are they turd, turd footprints? footprints? Yeah. This turd is so big, it's walking, fellas. <laughs> oh, wait, oh, so it's... I thought foot, someone had uh, stepped, stepped in a turd. Poo. No. <laughs> no, this is the no, turd no, is no. walking. This is little tiny footprints of a turd? Uh, I wish I could say they were tiny, my friend. These oh. footprints are huge. <laughs> oh, my god. This thing's T-Rex size. Sounds exciting. And from what I can tell, it's partying in the standard, getting free doors. Oh, my God. All right, get this turd. All right, but come back here as soon as you can, all, all right? right? Babes, do you I'll know, tell you when I got it. Do you know right. what womb it's in? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he hung up. I wanted to say something, Kiwi. <laughs> Why didn't you, turd? I don't know. I got scared. He was I thought he was talking about me. I said, yes, I've got two feet. What is this going on? <laughs> That's I the guy you saw on the way in who gave oh, you two turds. Jesus. That I guy. Yeah, yes. that handsome guy. Oh, shit. Mm. Mm. <laughs> what? You you were just doing cocaine. What? Yes. You just sniffed uh, like a big line of cocaine right there. Yes. Are you a drug addict? Uh, I don't know about addict. You'd have to define it. What? How would you define addict? If you don't do drugs, does it hurt? Yes, all over my body and my bones. Yeah. It makes my, my blood boil. You're and my nose bleed and my hair fall out. And as soon as I snort a little rail, my hair comes back in. Yep, you're addicted. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. You know, I've always said the best way to do coke is off a dick. <laughs> The, you, you said coke. that, huh? I had to talk him out of that <laughs> catchphrase. It's best off a dick. <laughs> it is best off a dick. Yeah. Um, yeah, I was pitching that uh, to the government. Oh, really? What did they say? I couldn't get their email. Oh, okay. It's not government at Gmail. It's I'll not government at gov. No, dot no, gov. No. Oh, right. I forgot about the whole gov. Did you do gmail.com? It's got to be gmail.com. <laughs> Whoa. Dot hey, com? Dot gov. Oh, gmail.gov. That would be oh the government. Oh, God. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'll try that next government time. Governmentmail.gov. Yeah, government. I'll mail. try that next time when I go into an internet cafe because I don't have a home. Yeah. Oh, that's, you don't have a computer either. You no. know, maybe Kumail would let you stay in his guest bedroom. He has $68,000. Yeah. yeah, maybe he could pay you a little bit of rent, like maybe $10 a day. Mm -hmm. No, no. I, I figure it out. You could make that ten grand, ten to twelve grand back. Yeah, plus sixty eight thousand dollars as a down payment. That's a nice place. Oh, okay. <laughs> so wait, that's all you were well, waiting for? Well, actually, I wish I could say that, but sixty eight thousand dollars is my float for drug money. Oh, I do okay. like cocaine, and I also want to buy a new PC computer because I'm a Counter Strike champion. <laughs> <laughs> well, you could buy one right now. You have sixty eight thousand dollars. <laughs> No place to put it, you silly. Oh, okay, okay. So wait, so you're, you'd rather spend the $68,000 on drugs than a new home? Drugs and counter strike and second dick. <laughs> wait, you wait, have you to spend money. You to suck dick? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Wait, <laughs> you've been paying to this suck these dicks? This has changed everything. <laughs> oh, this no. is completely different from how I imagined it. <laughs> so you were paying the guy to be upside down sucking his dick for what, six did months. Did you have an inheritance? Where did you get the money from? Yeah. As I see it. <laughs> you did I, not say this. <laughs> I said, I think my dad was a Navy man, but I don't know because when I found out he died, he left me. Well, he he's died. Dead. Oh, he's dead. I, when I did, and Terry he Depp. left me a will. He left and you a will. He left okay, me a usually will. a will talks about what a person left you, but he just left you a he will? He left you a will. In he his left will? me a will in his will. <laughs> okay. And, and when I decoded that, the message and took it to the bank. <laughs> decode. That's how wills work. You leave it to someone and they have to decode how it. Did, how did you decode the message? And well, there, was a, there was a little ring along in the envelope. So okay. it was a bit silly to send the decode, the message and uh -huh. then the way to decode it all in the same little Oh, okay, basket. sure. But he did. And when you got to it the It was bank, a basket. Yeah. <laughs> Like an Easter basket, like a yeah, like, like a little wicker basket with a plastic sort of pla you know clear. What do you call it? Was it? Like a, <laughs> it was like a it's like a see through clock. <laughs> Whoa, what is going on? <laughs> What stop it, stop it. I don't want this. I don't want this. <laughs> Wait, you're, no, no, no. you're sucking no. Kumail's no. dick right I don't now. Want, Kumail, I don't, you have to. He was no. giving me eyes. You little okay, prick. No, you no. were giving me eyes. Stop it. You stop prick. It. I don't have money Kumail, for this. Kumail, keep in mind he's going to pay you for this. <laughs> yeah. How much? I would name your price. <laughs> God. How about the ten to twelve thousand dollars you loaned? You were yeah. giving me icy big teas. Okay, fine. Give me the two Uzis, and you can suck my dick. <laughs> I need these. No way, no deal. How many I need times these. have you said that in your life? Uh, five, a few times. He's from Pakistan. J just what? What does that have to do with it? <laughs> I can imagine. There's a lot of that type of behavior. Right? A lot of Uzis <laughs> and blowjobs. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't that's think so. on our flag. <laughs> from the videos I've seen, there's a lot of behavior like that. <laughs> all right, all right. What videos? Is that upsetting to you? My God! My God! All right, what were we oh, talking about? Oh, he's turning about? into Smeagol. 
<laughs> what were we talking about before you started sucking Kumail's dick? I don't know. All right, well. Buying a house, who knows? Yeah, oh, who my knows? daddy and his inheritance. Oh, yeah, what did you get in the will? Well, I got about, um, I don't know, he never, uh, Terry is what he called me. He, ca mm. he called me. He called you Terry, even though no, his no, name I, is I, Terry. I misspoke, I misspoke. Terry is what he said his name was. Oh, okay. But he left me uh, just a whole whack of money. He said he did a bust on some Sudanese prince. And um, uh -huh. he's a former multi multi lottery winner. Multi. And oh wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Hold on. What? I think I know this guy that you're talking about. I don't. I I have no idea because I don't know him. He said he busted him and got all his money and gave it to me. What does busted mean? He busted him like yeah you would for a crime. I, I think this guy his name is like Joey uh, Tortellini or something like that. I have no way of verifying. Okay, <laughs> you have no way of. Okay, so this guy I think he was here last year. Joey Tortellini. You what remember a silly got, name. Martin well, Kumail, remember. you remember this guy. Yeah, he's from Ghana or something. He was a DJ. He's, right. from, he's a DJ, yeah. <laughs> Superstar DJ. Sounds fully Brooklyn. Ha! Huh. Well, he sounds like a real uh, Frankenstein of a character. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so wait, you got all of Joey Tortellini's money? I guess. I That's have, I have millions no and millions of dollars. He's won the lottery every single week. Yes. Oh, my so God. So I hear. Anyway, I So you're down money. to $68,000 now because you've been sucking so many dicks? Yes, I've been paying for uh, me to suck dicks. I've been uh, <laughs> buying guns recklessly. These are only the two guns I have How on me. How many guns do you have? Oh, I've got an arsenal. I have a warehouse out in uh, Cupertino. Where? The warehouse? <laughs> Cupertino. In Cupertino? Wait, that's where Len Wiseman is from. <laughs> Wait, Love him. Where is it? Cupertino. <laughs> He went to Cupertino High. Yeah, I go to Cupertino. I fly in my little private airplane right yeah, down to Cupertino okay. Airport. <laughs> Why don't you just sleep in there in your airplane? Oh, the FAA doesn't like that. <laughs> it's just to sleep in a plane? But then, like, you're flying sleep around with the warehouse. guns? Yes, yes, yes. Wait, yes. Is, your, is your plane <laughs> how you... Yes, yes, yes. Is your plane how you got to that airplane uh, graveyard? You landed in it? Or? That's where I built it. I'm a bit of a mechanical whiz, Scott. <laughs> okay. You built your private airplane? <laughs> yes. Out of what? Spare parts. What Other airplanes? You, yeah, what else Other do you airplanes. build them out of? So it's like a Frankenstein, sort of, sort of like this Joey Tortellini guy. Very sleek, however. Okay. Those Ooh. Mach 2. Mach 2? Jeez. That's one of the fastest airplanes. <laughs> Military grade. How <laughs> many Machs are there? Like, what's the maximum Mach you can go? I mean, I think people have only got up to what? Like Mach 4, Mach 5? Or five? Or, I, don't know. I, I no think idea. according to the racers, it's three. Is it three? Okay. Well, Gillette. Uh, <laughs> no, no, Gillette? Oh, no, we're not the, not the shaving. We're not talking about shaving things. Yeah. Oh, I was. Oh, you were. Okay, we weren't. <laughs> so your private airplane is a shaving razor. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Wait, so that's you, why he's okay. not sleeping Wait, so in it. it just okay, flies Kamel, around Kamel, your face. can I talk to you for a Wait, second? Yeah. He's insane. I'm so sorry. I, I, he's got a thing <laughs> on stage. He's thinking he's flying around on I don't razor. know what it is. He speaks to me. When he's on stage, he wins me over. And I, then, okay. Guys, this guy, I, I think we should have him unplug his ears and bring him back. I'm really enjoying this conversation. Okay, uh, let me wave to him. Hey, oh, hey, hey, hey. Unplug your ears. Okay. Unplug. Okay. Uh, if I put together a cabaret show, would you guys be on it? Define on it and define well, cabaret show. I would show. put it together for you because I'm your manager. Okay, right. well I'm thinking of doing this cabaret show. Okay. And what's the Where, what's the pitch? Well, everybody's obviously topless with tassels. Tassels all over the nips. Say it again. <laughs> what? <laughs> I think he said we have tassels all over our nips. Yes. When you, when so you say all tassels. over our nips, no part of our nips are uncovered. Oh yes, I don't want to see an ounce of areola. <laughs> <laughs> One ounce. Does, Did you know? <laughs> Did you know, and I found this out recently, that uh, if you have um, sort of uh, sort of enlarged areolas, sure. mm -hmm. uh, that, 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 that has a term, it's called it puffies. Puffies? Yeah. Wait, that's a term, a medical term? Puffies? Well, people seek these out, you see. Okay. People seek out women. Oh, with, you're uh, really going into like categories under uh, in red tube. You're like swimming <laughs> for, around in all the categories. For, not from a red tube, from a book. It was from <laughs> literature. Liter what, what book? I think it's called Jugs or Natural Tits or something. <laughs> okay, this is not a book. Yeah, I think that was Dickens, right? <laughs> Charles called, Dickens wrote uh, it. I couldn't tell the the uh, I couldn't tell you the author, but it, there's a, there's three columns of, of text throughout the whole book. How they say the book? same thing: one's English, one's French, and one's German. <laughs> How did you get this book? A friend gave it to me. Oh, what friend? You have friends. We haven't talked about your friends. A close personal friend. Who's this? He died of leukemia. <laughs> Ooh. His What's his name? His name was Lou. Lou? Lou? Yeah, chemia. Lou chemia? <laughs> self inflicted gun, Self inflicted gunshot <laughs> wound. <laughs> killed himself. Blew his brains out. With a, he died uh, of Lou chemia. Yeah, yeah, shooting yeah. himself. Yes, yeah, he right. got himself. Okay, terrible. Made a big mess. Got All it. over my white leather couch. <laughs> but it's a good thing it was leather. 
Why do you have a weight limit couch I if you don't have a house? It. Oh, because I'd like to <laughs> lounge in style. <laughs> okay. All right. Look, we. I lug that thing all over LA. It sucks. We're we're running out of time. Please. We, we, we got it. We have to go. We only have one last feature on the show. That's a little something that we call plugs. I'm premiering my show right after um, Silicon Valley in between Veep and Silicon Valley. Really? What show is that? Uh, it, well, it's about a it's about a one and a half second clip of a very extreme extreme close up of something, but you won't be able to tell what it is. Is it a butthole? But I, yes. <laughs> but you won't be able to tell whose butthole it is. Is it yours? Yes. <laughs> And it's it's a real short one, and uh, that's you, you have keep... a short butthole. No, no, the, the, the episode. You have a long butthole. Oh God, yes. his butthole. It's, 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 it's an Audi. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's standard. He's prolapsed. It's an Audi. It's, an, it's a real external modem. Okay, uh, but uh, <laughs> it's a real quick episode. We keep them short. Uh, <laughs> sure, yeah, one and a half seconds. That's yeah, right. but it is also a pan because you're still, they're, obviously they're painting from the last scene yeah. of Silicon Valley to too deep. deep. Yeah, but then right, you know, and then yeah. my butthole, just right and, by your butthole, and then you go, and yeah. I'll be on uh, every. Every day. Every day? There's a little story progression. Oh, okay. And what's the story? Can you Well, spoil something it? comes out of it. <laughs> okay, is it but poop? You, yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but you get it one and a half seconds at a time. Okay. Uh, Every single day. Late night on Sunday at HBO. Doesn't sound too late. It's, it sounds about 10.30 or so. Yes, but yeah. that's late for Sam. Okay, great. <laughs> All right. Oh! 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 Oh, oh my god, that is god. so much Holy shit. shit. That's the biggest uh, turd oh, I've ever seen. My Fellas, god. This is my deadliest catch. Oh, <laughs> oh wow. baby. Look at all that poo. There are four terrible. corns on the cob in there. <laughs> yeah, man. This thing was walking around a lot of Look at those feet. Yeah. Check it out. A wow. sticker. Property of China. Oh, <laughs> no, 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 my God. <laughs> hey, hello. Comedy Bang Bang. <laughs> I see you got my gift. <laughs> oh, okay. You're listening live. Thank Why did you, you send us a, a huge poo with feet? Because that's what I think of your show. <laughs> okay, all right. Yeah, I was lying before. I don't like it. Yeah. I think all of you are fat. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> wow. Tom, I'm so glad you made it back. This is turd, by the way. Turn, oh. you're making googly eyes at, at Thomas over here. Okay, don't... Uh, uh, Thomas, be very careful. Why? He will <laughs> suck your dick at the drop of a hat. But Sounds great. <laughs> you'll get paid for it. Sounds even better. <laughs> yeah, okay. You're going to do this for me, Turd? Oh, heck yeah, yeah. A uh, tall drink of water like you? <laughs> All right, All right they're, going, yeah, they're going. Yeah, they're going. Are you kind of oh, jealous? He like put away yours. Oh, He's been sucking uh, your dick this entire time. Come on, you, you haven't done this. <laughs> yeah, no, he he, he was on me right oh, before. God, so it's incredible. indirectly, our dicks have touched each other. Now. I've got your uh, PJ. You yeah, got my PJ. <laughs> yeah, you got Eskimo dick. Wait. <laughs> All I have is her name and only her first name. This we really uh, uh, we need to get a little more info on our guests before she does. Yeah, I've been uh, checking her out out of the side of my eye uh, here for a couple minutes here. Side -eyeing I've been side-eyeing her. Been side -eyeing her. Uh, I haven't been eye-fucking her, if that's what you're... Uh... Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I, I beg your pardon. I didn't know you could hear that. Yeah. No, I didn't I realize did, you had put on your... i all of it. You, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I, didn't I just mean... didn't know if I was supposed to speak. Oh, no, you are You are supposed to speak. I'll introduce yeah. you. All I have is your name, uh, Caitlin. Hello, Caitlin. Hi, I'm Caitlin. Hi, it's hey, so Caitlin. nice to meet you. Hi, yeah, but I just want everyone to know it's spelled kind of crazy. Oh, how's it spelled? It's spelled K... A I T L I N. <laughs> so it's like crazy. <laughs> that's pretty much the one of that the is, accepted spellings that's of That's how Caitlin. I would have guessed it was spelled, <laughs> yeah. to be honest. Maybe a C um, instead of the K, but. N n I was expecting like, one of those, like, you know, a name yeah, with C, no vowels. C apostrophe. Like, or, or K T L N. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Well, like that's like kind of what I'm going for. Like, you Wait, know, did like, you, but you did, you did not achieve it. Wait, how is like, it originally spelled? Um, just like normal, just like K Y T L Y N N E. That's the R. Wait, that's the crazy <laughs> R R. Yeah, like normal way <laughs> of spelling it. But yeah, I just wanted to kind of stand out because, like, you know, like Madonna has only one name, and like, um. 
That's the only thing you and can like think of? Other people only There's have so many of others. Well, There's share. My, my seal. 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 Okay. My good. fear would be that, I mean, no offense, Caitlin, I don't know what you do. or where, Please don't where, offend our guests immediately. But, but I mean, I feel like they're Caitlin, let's say Caitlin Jenner right now has already yes. kind of become a very prominent Caitlin. And if I was to just hear the name Caitlin, I would think we were talking about Caitlin Jenner because she's been so prominent in the news. Madonna, she picked Madonna because yeah. no one else was using Madonna right. at the time. Right, right. But mine's Caitlyn, but it's like, you know, it's like we, it's like kind of crazy. Spelling. Right. But we don't know the spelling when we're just saying it out loud. People uh, can't hear the spelling. Yeah, I know. But you How would. How old are you, Caitlyn? I am 17 years old. Okay. So okay. I we am, take it a, little I am easier a minor. On her. I makes, am a minor. Okay. Oh, is Although, that true? Isn't it? What do you mean, Jason? What, yeah, it what's is a true. minor? Yeah, it's like okay. under eighteen. I oh, think. under eighteen. Okay, I yeah. thought it was under sixteen. Well, like in, New, in New York, it's uh, uh I don't know. I just, yeah, I, yeah. yeah. Okay, you're a minor. I believe sure. you're a minor. I, why do you have <laughs> so much confusion on this point? <laughs> huh? Don't worry about it. I just have to make some calls. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Caitlin, it's so nice to meet you. Thank you for coming on the show. Thank May you. I ask? Um, is there a reason you're on the show? Uh, I, I yeah, I got an email from your producer. <laughs> Right. Well, for those of you who have not heard this show, uh, my name is Scott Ackerman. I'm the host, and I bring guests wow. on, and we talk. You're we doing do, this like an hour into the sure, show? Sure. We do sort of a roundtable uh, yeah. where we talk to guests, and well, sometimes we don't know the guests, and we don't know why they've come on the show. It's so. probably because of my YouTube channel. Oh, wow. Oh, you have a YouTube channel. See, this yeah. is one of those things that maybe Scott as like older... Out of touch people, we don't know about oh, like okay. the You're cool YouTube. In this. Yeah, we don't know about the cool YouTube. Maybe Caitlyn uh, young is, YouTube stars. Maybe Caitlyn is actually very famous when you hear the well, name Caitlyn. Yeah, and we just so, don't know exactly. That. Sometimes I'll drive here in Los Angeles. YouTube has a number of billboards in town where they're hmm. promoting their biggest YouTube stars, and like I will yeah. never know who those people are. Yeah. yeah. Whenever they're featured on the, and that's that, your solemn vow. They, they no, <laughs> I just am like they they are so big they warrant a billboard that's just their face, and I've never heard. I of would love to. See a billboard of just your face, really, and just like Jason. Oh my God! Just and it's like not any just specific like Lady project. Gaga, Alley in yeah, just uh, Alley. Starsborn. Yeah, yeah. Well, there's one of me now, and it just says Caitlyn. Wow. Like, really? Where yeah. is this? It's on um, Sunset Avenue. Yeah, Sunset, Sunset Avenue. Fairfax. That's a different. Because uh, I know Boulevard. Sunset Boulevard. 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 Oh, okay. yeah. I'm sorry. I'm not even like from here. Where are you from? from? I'm from um, Dayton, Ohio. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah. That how? So, do you live here now, or yeah, are you I'm visiting? Th- yeah, I'm like visiting because like probably I'll end up moving here because like wow. that's where I'll probably end up needing to be. I know a lot of young people on YouTube and uh, so forth. Yeah, I know. Start you don't with, even know what um, minors are. Start with. Um, start, I know a lot yeah, of young is people. Your, is your podcast? No, I, I know they have like a theme to their podcast. Yeah. What is your podcast about? Podcast your YouTube channel rather. Are you doing makeup tutorials yeah. or you do unboxing That's videos? That's very reductive makeup tutorials. <clears throat> no, but it is like, it is like, a lot, there is like makeup tutorials. Oh, it is. Oh, oh he yeah. guessed it right. But okay. there's like also other stuff. Like I, t- you know, I like will teach you like with some cute outfits to do mm. or like how specifically to shave your head. If you wanted to shave your head and remove all your hair and make sure it doesn't grow back. Have you ever shaved? <laughs> Wait a second. If you want to shave your head. And you don't want it to grow back, how to do it? That's one of your tutorials? Uh, yeah. And it's like, it's actually not that hard. You just have to know how to do it right. What do you do exactly? I don't well, even know. Do and you, I don't know. I don't want to give away any of the stuff you give away on your no, channel. I want people to go to your channel and see. How do you scorch? Most people have seen this one. Yeah. This is like actually kind of how I, this one was the one like that really okay. got me famous. That really got, that launched you. How do you scorch yeah. the earth up there on top of the head? Um, It's funny. You should say scorch. Uh, Like you first remove. Scorch. The, you first remove the hair by conventional means like clippers and then you have to shave it. Typical the, hair removing. Yeah. And, procedure. Yes. And then um, I have a hydrochloric acid in which I okay. sort of apply to. How do you get, that's like got to be hard for a 17 year old to get. I personally got mine from my science teacher because he told me he had some. Oh, oh. okay. He told, what, well, how did that conversation well, go? Well, it was actually really funny. He said, Caitlin, can I see you after class? And uh, I said, okay. okay. And then when the class ended, I went up to sit and he said, he was like whispered to me, he said, hey, did you know that I have <laughs> Hydrochloric acid. I was like, no, I don't. Why did he have to whisper? Were there other people around? And why, noise is me and why is he telling you? Does he? Oh, wait. Had he I mean, seen any of your videos? That, maybe. No, he had you put out a call for hydrochloric no, acid or anything? I'm on, I mean, I'm, I'm on the honor roll, so maybe that was why. Oh, you are. It, oh, it sounds a little bit like he was kind of bragging. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he wanted. He kind of like wanted me to know. I don't know. He wanted you to know. Yeah, this hydrochloric acid. Did he have it? Just make, burning a hole through his pocket, literally. Yeah. <laughs> Did he make yeah. any suggestions about what he wanted to do with it or? <laughs> and he, he said, wasn't speaking euphemistically. 
I was speaking of actual hydrochloric acid. I initially acid. thought like, okay, what's this guy mean? <laughs> <laughs> then he, hey. he's like, so he's your mind immediately went to, well, I he, just, he must be making, it doesn't typically happen that people right. offer to, if, you know, if they, if I want to see their hydrochloric acid and, but I, he asked me if I wanted to see it. So I say yes. And then he took me to his, uh, his car and opened up the trunk and there was Ooh. like a ton it was in of his it. car. This yeah, is there was not like good. Six, like six gallons of it. I six think gallons? six gallons. Yeah. Yeah. He had some other chemicals and stuff in there. And in like, the trunk of his car? Yeah, and like in the back seat. Like his whole car was like packed. It was crazy. <laughs> wow. This is in Ohio? Yeah. And he okay. had like gunpowder and like. Oh my um, gosh. Uh, nitrous. Nitrous. <laughs> nitrous. So nitrous. he has a lot nitrous. of just. <laughs> like, like to do whippets? I guess. I mean, it's, you got to be able to use it for other Did stuff, Did he have too. balloons? Like, what no, was he doing? No, no, he didn't have any balloons, but... He he had, like, oh, he, had, he did have one balloon. <laughs> Wait, he had... First off, you didn't think he had any balloons. Well, and now you're remembering he had one? Yeah, All you need is really one balloon. Yeah, like, I, okay. I mean, it's like, I'm like, oh, cool. I didn't, like, register. Like, oh, there's a bag of empty balloons, but I did see there was one <laughs> There was balloon, one balloon. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, he Inflated, said, or...? Uh, no, that was deflated. It was, okay. like, it was lying next to the nitrous tank, okay. though, but... Mm -hmm. And then he said, uh, do you want any of this? <laughs> <laughs> what was he talking about specifically? Any, like, 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 to like anything. 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 Wow. And I was like, you know what? I have been looking for a way to um, shave heads and like make sure that their hair doesn't grow back. And he said, <laughs> you were interested in doing that on your own head? Yeah, because no, not no. Definitely not on my own head. Because I notice your hair is... I don't know whether it's a wig or uh, no. It's you, it's fully natural. It's natural. Okay. Yes. So you you were looking to do this on other people's heads, just like just in case anyone wanted to do it. Oh, okay. Right? And so then I asked my my friend. Um, Why do you say it like that? <laughs> Well, are you not no like, longer? No, no. I mean, like we're kind of close, but like she's okay. kind of like my friend that I like ask to, oh, God. you know, do things. Uh, oh, this okay. Is so like this makeup is makeup and stuff. <clears throat> oh, okay. This is the friend that you like torture. I don't torture. Her name's Trish, and she's like she's so sweet. Let me ask you a question. Yes. Um, when you are, let's say, and I don't know, maybe when I was a kid, we would go to the mall or to the movies. Like yeah. when you go out with your friends right now. Yeah. Does Trish come along? No, no. Well, would you she, invite Trish out with your friends? You gotta to go understand, to the like she likes to be indoors mainly. Like she likes oh. to be inside. Okay, well, plenty like, of places you might the, go. Yeah, socially the mall or the movies oh, like, she are likes indoors. Computers and like books. Sure. So, but like, if you were to be like, oh, let's go on a girls' ski trip, it would be who? Well, she probably would. Well, it'd be like Martine <laughs> and like um, Alyssa. Uh, Martine and Alyssa. Okay. And. Janae. Janae. And probably Trish like probably wouldn't come only because like I honestly I bet if we asked her she'd be like no I can't and like would, she, she, maybe she, 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 she would appreciate trouble, being asked. Would, she do has you trouble think, like fitting into like equipment. Do, do you think that she would not go because she has to spend so much time applying salve to her wounds? Well now after the <laughs> tutorial but she likes her look. She likes she it. She's told me she's like oh yeah thank you so much like now I can wear different types of hairstyles because I, I prefer wigs now. Got Did you it. do this with her permission? Of course. Of course. I didn't like hold her down and like, you Did know. you put peanut butter on her head? <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> no, but I know what you do that. I know you use peanut butter for. What? What is that? You get dogs to lick your penis. <laughs> <laughs> you get them to lick the penis right off of you if you could. Oh. Careful. That's all guys want, isn't careful. it? Careful. That's, 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 that's the Scott Ackerman story right there. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, you shave it and then you put acid on it and then it like you know burn, it, it seals the pores. It just kind of burns. I mean, does it look like your hair face up there? Or? Your hair still grows. There's mm. just no escape for the hair to grow out. Through oh, the so, skin. so it grows into so your it head. Grows into that. Yeah. Then you so sort it looks of have like, like you're a, wearing a bald cap. <laughs> you sort of have like a hair, like a, a head of ingrown hair. Oh. So is, is like her brain wrapped in hair? Yes, but it's under the skin. Oh, yeah, isn't that? Neat? Well, the brain normally is. <laughs> That's really cool. Yeah. So wow. it's a, it's a science experiment on a number of different levels. Yeah. I was initially like reviewing skies because like sometimes I go out there and say, oh, like so blue, six out of ten. You know, like you not review, a lot of people, no, that's yeah, interesting. not a lot of people review now, see, the sky. That's very interesting yeah. because I oftentimes think to myself when I'm looking at the weather in the morning, the weather app. You know, mm -hmm, sure. I wish it would. I wish it would give me a sky review because I yeah. want to know what I'm looking at today. Yeah, six and out of ten. You, you want to know like a, like a metric in which you can judge yes. skies by. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So Caitlin's so fresh. It's like a whole sub channel of sky every reviews. single day you do this. I try to. What yeah. are the mm -hmm. what are 
the components of a sky that you're looking at when yeah, you want do, to review it? Is it color? It? Is it? Yeah, I'm looking at color. I'm looking at like hues, cloud coverage. Okay. I'm looking at like um, uh, position like, of the sun. Like, yeah, exactly. Today? Like I was going to say today's time a, of day. Today's, like what's today out? <clears throat> and today here, uh, well, you have like a nice, you have kind of like a light blue sky, mm-hmm. so it's like not that bold. So I'm you like bold like, colors in your skies. Well, uh, here's what also takes it down a notch: is like LA. There's like a lot, of, there's like a brown, there's a brown part. Well, smog. Yeah. yeah. So you don't like brown things. I, I, oh boy. <laughs> I guess that came out a different way oh than I wanted it to. Hey buddy. I mean, hey buddy, what are you doing? <laughs> you have to give me a list of brown things, and I can tell you which ones I do like and oh then which boy. ones I don't. You want a list of brown things? Oh, I'll try. I mean, I'll try. To compile this short list of brown things. I'm like probably not that brown. Uh, exclusive. I think shit is number one with a bullet. Yeah, I don't like that. <laughs> Although shit was pretty good to like cover Trish's um, head initially after the hydrochloric Wait, acid. Wait, you what covered you her hair, her head, and shit? Yeah, after the treatment, you know, it's I'm gonna tough. be honest. It sounds like you are bullying Trisha. <laughs> Trisha is like one of my dear, dear friends who I like, who is like integral to the channel. Yeah. You know what? Let's talk about. You don't want to talk about sky reviews? <laughs> you know I do want to talk, talk about sky reviews, but sky reviews. But I don't want to get. A- need to take a break uh, before we oh, get to now. that. So Bobino's right. Pizza Pants. Yes, so <laughs> Bobino's. <laughs> Pizza Pants is one of our new sponsors. Oh, what about- bang Bang brought to you by Bobino's Pizza Pants and Sweet Sweet Sweater Meat. What about like Bobino's Pizza Pants? Bobino's Pizza Pants <laughs> eat eat where you sit. Yeah. Okay. Or oh, sit where you eat. Okay. Sit, oh yeah. You can't sit where you, you eat. You can't sit. Now where, you can, now you can sit, sit where you eat. eat. Yeah. And yes. Well, now you can shit where you eat. Literally. Yeah. Instead of shitting where you the eat, same try sitting where, where you, you eat. eat. That's better. Yeah. I, I have a new partner on this. <laughs> Great. <laughs> <laughs> way, great work running this straight into the ground. Oh, damn. We'll be right back with more Jason Manzoukas Hello. and more Caitlin right after this. Yeah. <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, we're back here with Jason Manzoukas. Hey, whoa, whoa. Mm-hmm. We also have Caitlin here, whom if you are under 20, you probably have heard of. Maybe. Uh, maybe. Uh, big billboard out there on Sunset Avenue, uh, from what I understand. and <laughs> Right there in Sunset Avenue. Caitlin So Fresh on YouTube. Caitlin So Fresh. So look yeah. it up. Hopefully during the break, uh, you listened to our uh, ads. But uh, while you were listening to them, maybe you looked up Caitlin So Fresh on YouTube and, and watched the video we're about to talk about. But yeah. we were before the break, you were uh, describing how you found what you describe as a portal on one of your videos. Yeah. No, it was by the Mole Man. Oh. What's that? Now, there was like this a is mo- interesting. There's like a mole. The Mole Man. And yeah. now Mole Man. <laughs> well. And portal. I- <laughs> I saw this rock, sure. and then as soon as I stepped on the rock, I slipped and then went on the other side of the rock and fell down a large hole. And I slipped and slid, slid <laughs> slipped and slid, and it was like this whole tunnel system, and it was water. It's all on the video. <laughs> and, Wait, was it like a was it a, almost like a water slide, but a choose your own adventure yeah, water slide where yeah. like yes. you instead of going down. Have you, you know, seen, the life, you've seen the video? No, I haven't seen the video, but you know, you in a normal water s- slide, the lifeguard pushes you down and you only go down one slide. Yeah. You could go down, you sort of choose. There was like multiple the, avenues to go was, down. Was right. it like in Goonies? Yeah, except as Scott was saying, like little choices. Yeah, yeah. It is, how many, how are the choices presented? There was like eight, you? there was eight and they're all called, they're all called little choices. There was L- eight. L-I-L apostrophe? Yeah, there was like these little. These, like, they were labeled? Yeah, these little like Little forks. choices. <laughs> You sort of slide out, you stop, you slide, and then you there's, come there's, to a, stop. There, oh, there's, then there's two, then there's um, two little tunnels that branch off, and this says a little choice. And then there's <laughs> this a, a little choice, a little choice, no, it just, or just says, says little, little choice, choice. little yeah. choice. And then there's um, like um, like a TV, and it played the last scene <laughs> of what's that? Um, Elijah Wood, the Good Son. Okay. And when she's on the cliff, and sure. she's got the two boys like holding the boys before they fall. It played the last scene of the Good Son. Yeah, and it cut before she made the choice. Uh-huh. Oh, and you're just supposed to say Culkin or Wood. I was a little scared because it's like right. not every day that you go down yes. a crazy tunnel with little choices <laughs> and video screens. <laughs> but so playing then, decades old movies. Yeah. Okay. So then, what happens then? Seven other little choices. Seven other little choices. And then I'm sort with of with illuminating. It was always a, a, a binary choice. It was this or that. Yeah, and they were all like movies. They're all movies. <laughs> oh, interesting. <laughs> Like there was like a Pirates of the Caribbean one where there was just Orlando Bloom and then Johnny Depp and then you'd have to say Depp or Bloom. 
And then there was like, like a little hole, like, like um, a little hole or a little <laughs> hole. Like how big is the hole? Well, I know it was little hole. Cause there was a sign called little hole. Little okay. hole. The only choice yeah. was the little hole. Yeah. A little hole. Well, I guess you could go backwards. Was well, going I'm backwards. Assuming you can't go I backwards. Mean, back it was going to be pretty hard. That was right. going to be really tough. So I figured okay. I might as well go in this little hole. Okay. I mean, I'm underneath. So the, you went through I'm, the portal. I'm not in the little. Yeah. Cause it was like, uh, I don't know, like the size of like an extra, extra large pizza. So like an I could, extra, extra large pizza. Yeah, so I could like go through it. Sure. Okay. Like if the it kind were just of pizza an extra that large you could pizza. turn into a pair of pants if you tailored it correctly. Let's hope so. <laughs> Are you tired okay. of shitting in your pants? <laughs> Try eating them. Just sitting in your pants. Oh, right. <laughs> but you could eat them too, right? Isn't that like the whole fun That's part the whole, of yeah. Oh, I think Filipinos, so. Are you tired of eating pants? shit? What about <laughs> eating sit? Yes. Yeah. See, that's nice. not good, guys. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> All right, both. I don't think you should be bringing up shit in an edible <laughs> item. Um, it's so funny. Like, I've been seeing a therapist over this whole thing because oh, it's actually bet. really about traumatic. The, um, <laughs> yeah. I would imagine. I mean, it, I would think the first time I plunge down into the hole, my brain goes to, oh, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah. I mean, know? the first time I see Wood or Culkin. I'm probably thinking, oh, instead of saying what my choice is, maybe I should try to climb back up through this. I got to get out of here. This is dangerous. No, I mean, those are all thoughts that you can like. Obviously, somebody set this all up, and that's chilling. This seems to be some sort of trap for minors under 18. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Those are, I mean, those are all like thoughts that it's. In some states. Can I ask before we get to the portal, too? uh, This town, where are you from? Uh, Dayton, Ohio. Dayton, Ohio. The Wright Brothers. Has there been a recent rash of disappearances? Um, no more, no more than usual. Like just the average. But what is the usual to to Dayton, Ohio? Dayton, Ohio, I think suffers from like six to seven hundred children missing a year. <laughs> I think it's and something that's considered normal. That's yeah, like two like, a day. That's quite a lot. It's like something. Yeah. How many? Uh, what's the population? Um, I think we're at we're we're at a solid. <laughs> 600,000, I think. That's that low for low, Dayton. But, you know. <laughs> but, but, I mean, uh, for 600 a, a year. Six, six, to six, four to 600 children missing a year is so many. Yeah, that's a lot. That's quite a lot. That's yeah. a lot. So, I mean, the, just the fact that, and this may be a scary. Oh, I didn't really know that was a lot. This may be a scary story for children uh, if they're listening to well, it. This but you're, might be you a, may, I would say you made the correct choices. We might issue a warning. Yeah. Children, if you are listening to this episode of Comedy Bang Bang, you've been warned. Yeah. This, we will talk about missing children. If you could remember the... And sweet, sweet sweater meat. If you could remember the eight choices that you made, this may be like a cheat code for, for other children who are going through this. You, can, oh, you I mean, clearly I can got out safe. I can definitely... Yeah, I mean, other than like the here. emotional trauma okay, so that I would still live with. Bloom. Yeah. What are the six other choices? Um, <laughs> All based on movies. <laughs> yeah, it's wood... Bloom. Oh, is one of them um, um, the the pretty and pink choice? Oh yeah, Ducky, Ducky, or, Ducky or Blaine. It, is yes. that his name? What's uh, his name? Yes, Andrew McCarthy. Um, I or remember Andrew Co- Cryer or McCarthy. I remember I chose Costner for when it was Kevin Costner versus Dennis Quaid. Dennis Ooh. Quaid. Yeah. Okay. And then and then I chose Reeves when it was Keanu Reeves versus Patrick Stewart. Great. Okay. And then Can I ask you a question? Yeah. <clears throat> you chose Keanu Reeves. Yeah. Because you what? You hate Patrick Stewart? <laughs> No, I like him. Oh, but you just like Keanu Reeves more. Yeah, but you have to understand. You have to understand. This was like, they showed, it it wasn't even from the same movie. Like, they just showed a clip of Patrick Stewart on like a blooper of Next Generation, which is like endearing. A blooper? Yeah. What did he mess up? And you knew it was Star Trek Next Generation. Yeah, like, I love TV and I love Oh, really? Okay. (laughs) So you don't seem like the kind of 17-year-old that's just watching Star Trek Next Generation. Never mind the bloopers of it. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. No, I I love the bloops. Okay. So what what was the blooper? Do you remember what it was? Oh, he was trying to say, um, engage, and he said like, uh, and he mumbled it, and Uh, everyone loved it. Okay. And everyone laughed. not so, you. Yeah. You were like, "Fuck you, Patrick." No, I was Stewart. like, "What did they you show instead of said. what did they show I, as far as?" Keanu I thought Reeves that was, was a good showing. They showed him first. I was like, "Okay, I'm on solid, board." Solid. <laughs> and then they just then they showed Keanu Reeves, young Keanu Reeves, so like 1991. Okay, like my own Doing private what? Idaho yeah. era. Yeah, and he's like, 
He's like got all these puppies and he's shirtless and he's How did cuddling he get with this footage. He's cuddling with all these puppies. This, this is the other thing. And all these puppies Candid are like footage. All these it's puppies. not from a movie. This, this is, is just some, it's some just sort of Illuminati shirtless, shirtless, stealing footage. Shirtless playing with puppies. And, and all the puppies are like kissing him, like licking him and stuff. And he's giggling. who's got this footage? And they're like rolling around. And it was so who is cute. Gonna, who's going to pick Stuart in this situation? I I don't know. It depends. It I depends. mean, yeah. Stuart but, doing a bloop versus Keanu coming yeah. up. All I can tell you, like that was like near the end of it, and by the end, it was like, okay, these Let's are getting get weird. To it. <laughs> <laughs> Even I was like, oh boy, this is weird now. Okay, okay. But again, I was trying to stay positive in the video because, like, you got to keep it positive. You got to keep it positive. Yeah. Okay, so is that like something that you believe in, like KIP, keep it positive? Yeah, at least when you're on YouTube and like when you're offline, that's when the you let the trauma. That's when the darkness sweep over that's your body. <laughs> <laughs> and there was just like you know like there was just like a fair amount of stuff in the portal that I like uh, I was a little uncomfortable well let's get to the portal because uh, we don't know where this is a portal to uh, we, we don't know where you ended up how you got back okay. we don't know how the mole man is involved <laughs> in all this we've yeah. never he, even brought he him he up he verifies that it's a portal he verifies it's a portal much. have you seen the movie <laughs> meanwhile meanwhile your biggest video is the hair the hair <laughs> yeah. the hair burning video that we're not even talking about some sort Poor of Trisha. <laughs> some sort of Illuminati group has been taking secret videos of celebrities and using them to lure children down into the depths of the earth well, and and yet your most popular video is you incinerating your friend's head. I don't know if only children have gone down these tubes. Well, you say six to 700 children disappear. I don't you know think if they're more, connected. How many adults? We're, 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 we're like connecting some pretty loose threads here, Scott. Sure. Do you think there was anything specific about the hole that, that made you a child more susceptible to falling into it? Um, No, it was just like behind a big old rock. And well, I not a lot of adults rock. maybe climbing on rocks these days. I guess. But yeah. I guess there was like, well, there was like a little pink uh, ribbon that led from the hole past the rock to the path and it mm. did the bit I've come to think of it I, that <laughs> pink ribbon did go along the path back to like the back side of my house and when I opened up my door for the first time that day was it, it said, about wait was that it was for a little breast sign cancer that said, awareness follow me <laughs> it's so what? this was this was a path with a pink ribbon that said follow me yeah. to your house F I walked out your my house front to door the there was a little note that said follow me and then there was a ribbon and so okay. you've been targeted okay yeah, I don't no, for sure. I was doing a sky review Scott <laughs> okay I was just doing a sky review. Okay, so we've gotten I to the point. I feel like a lot of a questions could be answered by just us watching the video right I now. I don't know. I'm, I find this fast. I don't think we could ask as many questions. Yeah, if we probably. Were. What was that movie with like Scarlett Johansson and it's like she's like a killer? Or Lucy. Something? Under the skin. Under the skin. Oh. Have you seen that? In that scene in the movie, there's like it's like a black void. Sure. And I haven't like, seen it. Good. Describe it and for there's me. Like what a, happens? Well, it's like all. Does she black. whip those titties out? I, oh boy. I, <laughs> What, what's wrong with you? What? I'm just saying. What's wrong with you? And you know, just like uh, I can I'm, say sweet, sweet smetter meat, but you can't say, did she whip those Talking about the grapes out. of wrath, bro. <laughs> Literature. I, 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 you know, like, I guess it's more about, it's more about the black void than the titties. Okay. You went through the portal into like a void. Yeah. Into a, into a, a, a liquid. Yeah. Were you and able to breathe? It just looked a lot like the under under the skin scene uh, and, okay. and and just based on like there was so much movie stuff and like Hollywood references yeah. and the eight little choices I f <laughs> honestly I think it was like <laughs> the set a, a movie fan yeah whoever this okay. is is a movie fan and I know he is because that's when the mole man appeared <laughs> Mm. Anyway, so he's like this like pink fleshy little man with like wearing clothes or wear, not um, wearing clothes? no he's not but but he's kind of like a beast as well like he's kind of like part mole does he have hair or, um uh, at little scruffy little bits behind his ears and his chinny chin what about chin. his genitals are they they covered in hair or they, yeah like sort of like a lipstick situation or no was there was it, no, he had here? he had enough hair he's, this is a naked mole man approaching a seventeen year old yeah. girl I want to know what exactly right. how he presents himself and he he had enough hair that you couldn't see his genitals like the okay. hair was longer than the generals, I guess. Okay. Well, but he that's did an unfortunate situation for him. Yes. But, you know, we've all been there. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I have. Yeah. <laughs> well, sure. <laughs> so, he approaches. Where the hair just fully engulfs and eclipses your genitals. Right. Yes. Right? Is what we're talking about? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. And... He approaches. He approaches, and he's and he was like, "Hi, how are you, my dear? Welcome to my lair." Yeah. I'm so, Welcome, did right. did so, he know your name? So this is his place. Yeah, yeah. Did no. he leave the ribbon? 
Um, I, I only realized the ribbon just now. Just like, now, I was okay. talking to you guys. So it's like, oh, okay. I well, we're what trying that to bring. Is. We're we're much like investigators, where we're oh. trying to bring out some mm. some interesting details. That's why right. we're asking questions. Right? Did he know your name? Did he say hello, my dear? Or did he say hello, Caitlin, my dear? No, he didn't know my name. I had to in- I had to introduce myself. You did. Yeah. How did you introduce yourself? He said, "I'm I'm the mole man." I'm said, "I said I'm Caitlin." But so he it just introduced himself a little weird as the mole man. Yeah. Yeah. He didn't have a specific. He doesn't, have, he doesn't no. have a name. No, I mean, he said, or I'm you the mole can man. call me the mole man, but no. my name is Mark. He said, hello, I'm the mole man. Oh, wow. I'm the mole man. Yeah. Did he give you a sense of where you were? Um, you said his lair, but I mean, like, where in space and time is it? Well, that uh, he, yeah, he did. He kind of went on this. It's like a bit of a rant. Like, I, honestly, it kind of gets, that's like where a lot of people kind of switch to a different video. It's because like, <laughs> really? it gets a little Where you windy. can see a comment that pops up saying, oh my God, who yeah. will this guy ever shut up? Yeah. Like, this guy. Oh, the mole man? Mole yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, you should, you could have cut 10 minutes out of the mole man. Yeah. Right. But it's, it's, I mean, I applaud you for leaving all of it in because that's like, yeah. the, that's the record. Well, we know? want a document of this. Exactly. An unedited yeah. document. Yeah. I just sort of figure like, there's probably not too many videos where like people go through portals and like see the ball man. I've yeah. never seen a single one. I oh. mean, you may be the only one who's made the eight correct choices to get right. to the mole man. Did he yeah. mention anything about that? Or of like, Oh my God, no one has been in here for thousands of years or he actually didn't even know anything about the little choices. <laughs> So he's so, not connected he's, to the little so choices. That's why he's I was kind of like related to little choices. That's why I was kind of like maybe he doesn't really have anything to do with the ribbon because I think the portal just like it like goes to a whole other thing. Wow. Okay. So everything up till then <laughs> has been some sort of man-made entrapment I, scheme. It's hard to tell. So do you think there's like maybe somebody who built the tunnels and the little choices in order to appease the mole man's desire to be fed? Could be. On the other be. side but of the portal. he didn't know about the ribbon. He didn't, yeah. he didn't know about the little choices. But hmm. he was happy to see you. Yeah. Because he like, called you my dear. Yes. Hmm. But then he was like, are you okay? Do you need anything? And, and then- What he, could he have offered you? Did um, he mention that? Did he have drinks or- uh, he, uh, A chair? No, like, what, I think- what, he, what, I, what do you think he was trying to At that to point, you? I was like, I just want to go. I'm like, I'm, I'm ready to go home. Like, what is- First, I was like, what is this? He's like, we're in another dimension. We're in the nether. And the nether is what the they nether. Call it. And he's like, this liquid is like a spider web for me. I can feel when there's disturbances oh, in it and all that <laughs> stuff. Right? Okay, okay, okay. That's pretty cool. Well, look, 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 look. Before we get too far in the weeds in okay, the nether, okay. we have to take a break uh, oh, again. Sure. Yeah. But I really want to. Totally. I mean, <laughs> this is a fascinating. I've never heard this is, anything this is like pretty this. pretty wild. This is really this is exciting, wild. Really? actually. This is I, exciting. You know what I don't it have is? This, it, a lot of times, Scott, you say we on this show talk to interesting people, and up and until it does this not, point, yeah, I have live up to that you. promise. Yeah. A lot of uninteresting people. But this is fascinating. this is fascinating. Well, yeah, it's like I, this video did get a lot of views, but like it's not as many as like a Cardi B music video came out. That's or, okay. That's I, okay. But I, it seems to me like some of the mysteries of the universe are contained within this video, and so that's why I'm glad you're here to to get the word out about this. Yeah. 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 Okay. Well, when we come back, we'll hear more about the mole man, what his intentions are. Um, it seems like they spoke for several hours and uh, we still have no idea how you're back here in this dimension yeah. and out of the nether. We'll be right back with more comedy bang, bang with more Jason Manzoukas and more Caitlin after this. <laughs> I, I, during this break, yeah. I watched the video. Or I scrubbed through the video. Yeah, yeah it's, it's too long. It's a two hour. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. a long, long it's video. Um, Caitlin is indeed uh, doing a sky review. She's walking along. Yeah. She sees the big rock. She mm-hmm. goes up on top of the rock and she appears to slip yes. and fall. Yes. Right. And then for like a little over an hour, the f- the f- phone is still recording, but it's just pointed at Caitlin, who appears to be unconscious on the ground. Oh, okay. okay. Um, yeah. And then a um, a homeless man. Oh, okay. Uh, who is naked. Right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, comes, How long were the, these pubes? Comes into frame. He, his, his genitals are truly obscured completely. Okay, okay. Uh, and he wakes Caitlin up. Wait, Caitlin has some blood on her head. Okay. Yeah. And they do proceed to then have a conversation that is similar to the conversation that Caitlin is telling us about now. Yeah. Okay. Although she's talking about the little choice, the little choices. She's talking about all this stuff. And he is confused. He returned me to my parents. Yeah. And Did he like, leave you on the doorstep and ring the bell? No, and, yeah. Well, he's, no, he he's was, naked. He was hold, yeah, exactly. And he was holding me in my, in his arms and he knocked on the door and like the door opened there my parents are like oh my god Caitlin you're here mm. thank you thank you sir thank you for returning her and and he was like oh not a big deal 
<laughs> I he said you. NBD. 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 Do you have any pants? Uh, yeah. And then he's like, they were like. So, uh, Bobino's pizza pants? <laughs> He sounds like, like he's our target. By the way, I mean, like, what a great idea to give pizza pants to the homeless. He's like, hey, you know what? Eat it, wear it, whatever you find <laughs> appropriate in the moment. Yeah, eat it, wear it, cheese it. <laughs> you and that's I got to get bad, in on this. Yeah. That's not yeah, a bad look, If we could use your YouTube fame. Maybe. I'm always looking for sponsors. Mm. And they were like, what do we call you? And they like, what's your what name? What do we call you? <laughs> like, How what? strange that your parents would phrase <laughs> it like that. They're, what do we call you? First of all, they're they're... Just they're from not Denmark. Even, they're not phased oh, about the nakedness. Yeah. They're from Denmark. And originally. Which is why okay. they're not phased by the nakedness. Okay. No. So what do we call you? They're like, what do country. we call you? And then he's, he said, just call me M.M. <laughs> M.M. So like Marshall Mathers? No, dummy. M&M. 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 No, Man dummy. Hunter? Mole Man. Mole Man. Oh. You think he's the Mole Man. No, duh. But how does that make sense? Because the mole man resides within another dimension. Do you think he's our dimension's mole man? My biggest, does, my best guess mm-hmm. yeah. is that <laughs> sucking the mole man's teeth oh, and getting the milk yeah. also brought me into my into my dimension, but also maybe it was his ploy to be brought in our dimension as well. Oh, and so you now the mole man oh. is like here. Do you, so, do you think you set him loose on our dimension? I don't know. I mean, I don't know what his like mission statement is, like right. what he wants to accomplish. May, I mean, maybe he can traverse, you know, all of the, using the portal yeah. and whatnot. Using, Do you think now that he's within our dimension, he's the one who set up this, these little choices? In no, he order, said he hadn't heard of them. He, uh, yeah, but I mean well, now, but but he, does time work in the same way? Like he's now traveled to our dimension. Maybe he's going backwards in time, like every day spent on Earth. Oh, I see. He okay. goes backwards yeah. and then he sets up this entire uh, water slide, little choices scenario. Yeah, I mean, maybe. I mean, uh, like who's who's your producer that set this interview up? MM, who's that? Yeah, my producer, MM, I, someone new who works at the company. I, I don't know. I didn't get oh, All I got was weird. it. All I got was uh, the, the initials MM. I assumed M-M- it was MM at earwolf dot biz. Yeah. Now that that's was, not the right email. No, we were thinking about getting a dot biz account, but it was right, too but expensive. It's not. Yeah. So but, yeah, so hmm. that is curious. This the email be, uh, came up from MM at earwolf dot biz. Yeah. No, I don't know. I've never met this person. What if that's the Mole Man too? The Mole Man too. <laughs> Like the sequel to the moment? No, like the moment as well, silly. Oh, <laughs> maybe I don't know what what it, what do you think the mole man's plan is to get you on this I don't show? No, why would he want me on the show to like tell everybody okay. about, the about mole this man. rock? And I'm Dayton. currently watching the video of you burning Trisha's hair, and it is very funny. Is it good? It's I gotta watch. Very it. funny. It's got a yeah. lot of views. That's a Caitlin so fresh. Caitlin so fresh on YouTube. Okay, yeah, yeah I gotta check that. Caitlin out. Caitlin so fresh, like how to how to how to get bald, stay bald is one of mine, and then and fresh I is spelled P H R E A S H. Yep. Mm-hmm. That. Norm, like the, the normal the weird way. is like Caitlin. So Caitlin's weird spelling and fresh is like, yeah, you didn't want to yeah. throw people off. Yeah. Yeah. So what do you think the mole man's plan? I mean, this is such a bizarre story. First of all, if the mole man didn't set up <laughs> these little choices, I don't know who did. Oh, man, we're now, really getting to the nitty gritty. There's here. gotta be a separate. <laughs> so, so if the portal to the Mole Man world... <laughs> yeah. Is, Work it out. You got this. <laughs> you out of anyone. We're just trying to you're, jumpstart you your memory. It. There's got to be... my The way I see it is there's got to be multiple destinations, obviously, because... Do you think there are multiple be, portals? Well, there's got to be multiple destinations, including a final one. Yes. Yeah. And some of them... I mean, obviously, one has a portal to a Mole Man world. And then maybe one of them isn't even a portal. Maybe one's like, I don't know, there's like a chocolate bar at the end of it or right. like a trap or something. Because I, if. Oh, you don't think it's a series of portals I that mean, the choices you made decide where they bring you? That's literally why I want to go back down the tunnels. You want that chocolate and bar? Have you just not I just found see it? What else is have there? you just not found it? I'm or? just, I'm nervous. Oh, oh, like, oh. Are, like, we'd love I'm, to go but with what you. If there Would are, you guys go? We'd love to go with you. I'd love to go with you. I'd, I'd love, love to, to make, make some a little choices. Yeah. I look, big choices, little choices, whatever. I'll, I, I'd I'm love down to make there. a big choice right now to attend this portal with you. Yeah. And make those little choices. I love. Yeah. First of all, I'd love to go to what sounds like a really fun water slide. Oh yeah, and also I would. I, I've never been to Dayton, Ohio. 
Yeah. Oh, I would love to go. I would love it if the two of us, you Mm -hmm. and me, Scott, two men in their forties, sure, just started hanging around with a seventeen-year-old girl and accompanied her because she has access to an interstate trip (laughs) across state lines. Walk into the woods with her, sure, uh, and jump into a bottomless pit that leads to a portal. But just keep in mind, also, it might be scary if so. If you took the exact same answers that I did and you got to the end with the portal, right? You would go through. And I don't know if the mole man would be there because because he may be back here. He may be here. So oh, yeah. and then how are you going to suck the teeth to get back? Also, oh, what boy. what is going on in that dimension without its very ruler? Yeah, I don't know. These are all questions. It's that a we have lawless to... society. Like, yeah. what's going on with all those kids? Like, are all those kids yeah, are all are those kids dead, or are all those kids like just you know Happy. in in, a, in in some sort of like a, a, a prison or and a who limbo. benefits? There's the other thing. Who benefits? Follow the money. Is, who who is benefiting is from lo- the? Is this like lost? Is this like purgatory? I yeah. don't know. <clears throat> How, what do you think the chances are of like all those if 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 all the kids that are missing in Dayton, Ohio, like went down the tunnel system, which is obviously separate from the portal system? Sure, do you lo- think lo- that, choices. Do yeah. you think the rock is its only origin point, or are there several tunnel? That I don't know. Right. Do you but think do you the think rock? They- Dwayne Johnson is one of he the may be is, involved. Like, is 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 he at all part of the little choices section? Oh yeah, yeah. Were, were there any of the little choices had to do with any of his films? Yeah, um, none of the ones that I took. Okay, oh, so it was like rock or paper I wonder or if, scissors. Oh boy. I wonder if you chose uh, Culkin. If you would, if the next one instead of what you got, Depp or Bloom, would be you know rock or heart. Yeah, I, that's what I wonder if you choose Culkin. If suddenly like something beheads you. That's, and that's it. And that's it. Oh, so maybe there's like no other tunnels. I just somehow chose chose the right, chose right yeah, every time. time. Maybe yeah. the tu- maybe those little choices tunnels were built just for you. But if that's the case, like if all the little choices is it, if there really is only eight, and it doesn't branch off into like a catacomb, like. Uh-huh. There may be thousands of little choices yeah, that people un- make. Underworld and of choices. But that's the other thing. Isn't what, life, though, just thousands of, of little, little choices? choices? Yeah. But usually there's food involved in, in between some of these was choices for us. Was there any food in the tunnels? Um, <laughs> wait. Because if there, if there are thousands more tunnels, I would imagine you, you would get hungry at some point. There well, was, we don't know if, you like, need to sleep. Uh, I don't know how, many, how much time does time matter. It, it felt like hours. It seemed, it was hours for Caitlin, but it's only, yeah, she's only gone 25 minutes. But if you're watching, if you made eight little choices and you're watching two separate video clips, <laughs> that's, that's a bit I'm of I'm assuming here. there's a video clip for each choice, <laughs> yeah, too. That's exactly. six more clicks. Well, that's what I'm saying is if you suddenly on your very last one made a different little choice and then that led you to thousands of more little choices... Oh, how, at may, some point you'd have to. Do you think? Do you think there's not a finite amount of little, little choices? I like, don't do you know. Because I, I mean, maybe you only get eight, and it's just like where you go. Or right. it's always eight, regardless. Maybe. Yeah. So there are. Uh, I, I don't know what the math on. <laughs> point, who knows? On how I, many destinations there once. would be with eight <laughs> binary choices? It seems to me like there'd be in the thousands. You know what? Them. I think if we put our heads together, we can figure this out. We <laughs> yeah. can really figure out the exact number of choices there could potentially be in the world of these tunnels. You just the only thing is you don't know what happens to the other choice. You don't know if it's a branching choice system or whether they intersect at some point again. Yes. Like whether okay, now I've picked Depp, I'm back in the original choice yes yes i don't know <laughs> i get look we got to figure this out though oh we have to right now yeah, well i mean yeah, i gotta yeah, say yeah. i gotta say <laughs> well here's the your, thing here's well, the thing can i, I don't say something though? not figure it out because like with our friend big dog we thought we had so many more appearances to get to know him better and then, yeah, and then he he's just was taken from ripped us. from our bosom so yeah. like i want to make sure we solve this just yeah. in case. big dog uh, he was a very entertaining guest. A dear guest. friend of ours. Yeah. A dear friend of Gone ours. Gone too soon. But I guess what I'm trying to say is, is I, I felt like the portal part of your story yeah. was a bit of a letdown <laughs> because of how entertaining the little choices part of it was. Oh, you didn't you didn't like Mole Man? <laughs> well, I'm just saying, it seemed to be a setup to something well, here's very the, entertaining. Here's and then the, thing. Here's the Mole the Man thing. just went prattled on about quantum physics for an hour. <laughs> Yeah. It's tough. It's tough because you know what? It occurs to me that um, that I think that we were enjoying the little choices more. <laughs> well, it's <laughs> like when it got it, to the portal, we got confused. Well, it's like if you were watching or, or reading uh, uh, Alice in Wonderland, sure. and it goes to eat me and drink me, mm-hmm. and and you're like, wow, this is a good book, and then suddenly uh, it deposits you in a lecture. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know. I mean, I yeah. don't know. That was like the ending of that one. Um, 
movie, uh, The World's End. Or sure. Yeah, that right. was like that movie. It was like yeah. fun and then a lecture at the end. Right. Yes. Yeah, you really do like pop culture. Yeah, you I really love do it. love yeah. knowing just, what's going on. I just love it. I love doing that and like burning my friend's heads with hydrochloric acid. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Maybe you should try to lure what? your science teacher into this. Ooh, now this is interesting. He should make some little choices. You know <laughs> yeah, he's made a bunch it's, of bad big yeah. choices. What's, wh- it why, like. what's so crazy about having a like a relationship with Mr. Manfield? A relation? What do you when you say relationship? What do you mean, yeah, Mr. M? He's chill. Wait, Mr. M? Yeah, Mr. Manfield. Mr. Manfield. M and M? Oh, yeah. Mr. Manfield. Mr. M-, M. Manfield. Wait, you don't think that he's? Huh. Now, that, now this is interesting. He's just a science teacher, okay? He's just a science teacher that if you do get in class, he gives you a little, like, bu- <laughs> ribbon, a little if bow. If you do oh, get in class. Minute. So can I ask you something? You mentioned ribbons earlier. I hate to jog your memory. Oh, yeah. Um, when yeah. the when the the uh, homeless gentleman who saved you and rescued you... Uh, when he brought you to your parents' house yes. in his arms, when they opened the door, what did they say to him? Oh, hey, Mr. M. (laughs) Okay. (laughs) All right. I don't know quite what to think about this story now. This is like the usual suspect where I'm going back over everything you've told us and wondering what's true. Oh, it's not true. <laughs> but look. So they, your parents call him Mr. M. Uh, all right. Yeah, but then, oh. like, what? Then they, <laughs> I, then. <laughs> look, we're not going to figure this out today, but I, I do need and, to make a call to chi- chi- Child Protective Services, yes. I think, in Dayton, Ohio. Oh, my God. Look, we, we wow. have so little. <laughs> wow. Look, guys, we got to look at more of these videos. <laughs> I just wanted to tell, it, tell yeah. you guys about my YouTube. Channel. Obviously, Caitlin's so fresh. Yeah, just check out Caitlin's so fresh and see all my cool uh, videos. How many star Mr. M? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's, we know he's in two. <laughs> we know he's in the two biggest ones. Well, the he's hair burning. In, he's you know tangentially involved in that one. Well, is man. he featured in the hair burning video? Like, do you film you getting the hydrochloric acid from his trunk? No, I mean we did it in his classroom, so like. Oh. He's like there, got it, cleaning up in the background. Got it. So he is <laughs> doing present. busy work. Yeah, he's just present. he's marrying off- marrying the, the off chemicals. Hand, yeah. Offhand, how many of your videos? <laughs> doing his side work. How many of his of your videos does he appear in, even tangentially? Um, I would say not that many, but like like all, like all of them. Okay, mm. see, this is a, not that this many. Is a yeah. Thing. Next time, get him involved. I mean, he e- emailed me. Obviously, get yeah. him involved. Like, bring him back sure. if you would. Yeah, yeah no bring problem. him with you if you would. Yeah. Okay, and. Uh, Hey, but, Caitlin, Scott, who's, who's it? Jason, hey, it's, it's, it's me. Who? It's Thomas. Tom, Thomas Middleditch. Yeah, Tommy Middleditch. From, uh, From Middleditch and Schwartz. Oh, right, but uh, also Silicon Valley? Oh, yeah, Silicon Valley. Hey, look, I was taking a big dump, but I came back, and don't worry. Uh, why did? Why do you have to tell us about that? Look, I'm dump-free, okay? <laughs> okay, great. What are, you, what are you doing here? We're, just, doing, we're in the middle of plugs. Oh, perfect, because I just want to tell you about uh, a really big show. <laughs> uh, Ed Sullivan? Yeah, yeah, I got think it, so. Got it, got it. A uh, really big show that Middleditch and Schwartz are doing, me, me and Benny, 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 Schwa, Schwa. Okay. Oh, my gosh. You can get tickets. They're on sale right now at middleditchandschwartz.com. You buy them up. You get them. You come to the show. You have a laugh. Everyone's having a grand old time. Ooh, baby, ooh. That's how we like to party. How many should people buy for underprivileged children? Uh, to be honest... We kind of have a, it's a privileged fan base. So <laughs> okay. we like to do fan base of privilege. Great. All right. Yeah, so thank you, Tommy. Anyway, got to get March back to 26 at the will turn. Oh, you're getting back to it. I thought yeah. you were dumb free. Yeah, but I feel another one coming on. Okay. See you later. Bye guys. I want to thank you for being here. Uh, Jason, always a pleasure what to see you and uh, Caitlin. Yeah, <laughs> we're just, we're just skimming the surface of the depths of, of your psychosis here. I, I think we need to have you back at some point along with Mr. M. If you'll come back with him. Be my pleasure. <laughs> JJ and Murphy are a couple of kids who fancy themselves to be kid detectives. Fancy ourselves? More like are ourselves. <laughs> yeah, and actually we got a hot new case. Oh boy, he's a big one. <laughs> the Senator of Delaware. His name's Professor Buttskin. <laughs> Wait, is that his name or is that his code name in the case? Uh, Jason, 
you need to pay attention to politics, because you've never heard of Professor Butskin, <laughs> Senator of Delaware? He goes by Professor, though? Yeah, first why would, name, why would Professor name take professor? precedent over Senator? His first name is Professor. Last name, Butskin? Yeah, it's Senator Professor Butskin. <laughs> of Delaware. Anyway, he lost his favorite jelly bean, and we gotta track it down. It was a cute little red one, his fave. Aww. <laughs> These are kids. These kids have hopes. They hope to solve a case and get their fingers in each other's wet, sticky holes. This isn't some bullshit Zodiac thing where, you know, everyone's just solving puzzles on the fucking crosswords or whatever. This is a real fucking case. Wait, what's yeah. that, Gino? I don't know. I... <laughs> That guy who uh, spoke so at uh, Trump, the, the guy who spoke at our uh, at our convention, uh, the Cruise dude, you know, the Zodiac guy, they never fucking found him. <laughs> Ted Cruz? Ted, yeah, Ted Cruz. That's that guy's first name. Yeah. He's the fucking Zodiac killer. Ted Cruz is getting a big reaction from this oh, crowd. Yeah. They love him. Yeah, but, not, not positive for how, what direction I should go in. I about don't Teddy. know. <laughs> People love what he said the other night at the convention. <laughs> Yeah. Can't, a, can't quite place this crowd. Yeah, not really getting it. San Diego, can't quite place this crowd. <laughs> yeah. It Very is. close to Mexico, so you might have some strong opinions about that. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> guys, guys, I don't know politics, but all I know is white lives matter. <laughs> white lies? I, white lies. White lies matter. <laughs> Little white lies matter? They're bad. <laughs> It's important to sometimes spare your friend's feelings by saying a little white lie. But sometimes it's more hurtful when you find out what the lie was. Have you guys ever lied to each other? You have such an open, honest relationship. I can't imagine. Once. One time, we each told one lie. We said, hey, want to tell a lie? And then we did. And I what? said, I want to stop fucking you. <laughs> What was the lie you said? Kate? I said, I don't really love red velvet cake. <laughs> Is that a euphemism? <laughs> no, I yeah. love rabbit, red velvet cake. Do you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> don't get snippy with me, motherfucker. Hey! Hey, hey. it's God, these me, are sir. kids. It's sister these fucker are kids. to you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Just... How is anyone at home gonna ever listen to this? <laughs> <laughs> How I mean, are we ever gonna solve this case? We already got a big distraction from that Skittle. Yeah. Yeah, next we know some asshole's gonna come up here with a red hot and fuck us all over. <laughs> now look, guys. A jelly bean is small, but not as small as a Skittle. And it's not round like a Skittle. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> Broken bottle. Two words. Two words. To Alaska. The chili beans in Alaska. You we think? were searching the wrong place. Doi doi, I can't believe we're so dumb. Why would the aliens drop you off here if it's in Alaska? That's a good question. Yeah, maybe you just call them up, sir. Yeah, call they them up on your alien yeah, phone. Are you alien? able to call aliens? We don't have any relationship with the aliens. Yeah, you're the ones who, are you able to call them? Is Should that... we call them? <laughs> sure. <laughs> you just have to talk loudly to the sky. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> aliens, 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 come on <laughs> down. Let us know that you're in town. <laughs> the Broadway show? Come down, down come down. low. <laughs> you guys must do this all the time because it seems effortless. You're actually, you're actually less loud than almost everything you've said so far. <laughs> well, aliens don't like to be yelled at. <laughs> Just... Point your head towards the sky, or you start a sentence with aliens, then they know. I don't know. All I know is the secret song that we're singing. <laughs> oh, please don't let us interrupt. Aliens, aliens, aliens come, come on down. down. <laughs> aliens, 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 come, come on down. down. Okay. Come alone? <laughs> I only think they're gonna come if you do it right. Yeah. Focus! I'm trying! 
Guys, don't fight. Don't fight. You guys are so close. I hate to see you fight. And also, if you fight, you'll have to make up, and I don't want to watch that. Speak for yourself, Jason. Try it again. Aliens, aliens, come on down. Aliens, aliens, come on down. Oh, that's the perfect second verse to that. Aliens, aliens, oh, there's more. Swoop, swoop on, on down. down. <laughs> aliens, aliens, we, we love ya. <laughs> Oof. I don't, I don't hear or see anything. That's normal. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, so how do you get them here? <laughs> Are you saying they might already be here? Uh, they enter silently. Mmm, so you won't know when they're there. Mm. Yeah, you only can tell when they hug you. <laughs> when they hug you? Yeah, but don't worry, it's usually when the lights are out. And the lights are full blast right now. Yeah, we'd have to turn all the lights out if we wanted to get hugged. Yes. <laughs> Okay, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what. Tell you what guys, tell you I think what. what you might be referring to as aliens are, are someone molesting you. Let, let's, let's test. Can we turn out any of the lights right now? Is that possible uh, to... Here we go. Uh, turn them up. Can it's we still turn, pretty light. Can we get rid of these? Can we get rid of these? And we'll see... And I'll tell you when to bring them back up. And we'll see what's hugging what. Uh? <laughs> uh? <laughs> uh? Wait, uh? I still see a ton of light. Me too. Uh? <laughs> uh. Sound speeds. <laughs> you Ready can't. and bring them up. <laughs> okay. Uh? Yeah, you guys are just hugging each other right yeah. now. Uh. I think you guys each think the other is the alien. Either way, <laughs> we still gotta find this jelly bean. <laughs> Help us, please. Have you ever thought you found it and then you, you ate it to try to see if it was the actual jelly bean? Yeah, one time we... <laughs> Has that ever happened to you? <laughs> that happens to us all I mean, the time. How would you know it's the jelly bean without... Right, because it could just be a red jelly bean. How do we know it's not Professor Buttstink's favorite one? <laughs> Senator. Oh, oh Senator, Senator Professor, Professor, Professor Buttskin. Butt Please oh, use your butt skin. title. Oh, I'm sorry, I was thinking of the Republican guy from Virginia, Buttstink. And he's not a professor, he's a doctor. Doctor, professor, and senator, but stink. People Esquire. like it when you use their whole title to respect them. Like Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. I mean, mm -hmm. that's five fucking words. <laughs> it's like, did you really need to add the junior in there? <laughs> right, it's like, we get, you're the, your dad, your dad seemed great, but you're the guy. We, you, we already said doctor, your dad wasn't the doctor. We know who we're talking about. Yeah, for fuck's sake, that's Do we know too... that? His dad might have been a doctor. Not a lot of people get prefixes and well, suffixes. Was he Dr. Reverend Martin Luther King Jr.? Oh, good God. Oh, boy. Are you a stu uh, Do you study? Uh... I'm a study. <laughs> You're a study? Yeah. One time my sister did study abroad for a whole year. Hi. Where did you go? How old are you? <laughs> Nine. Yeah, she went when she was four. Yeah, my parents so sent me abroad. To Mexico. <laughs> What part of Mexico? The good part. <laughs> like Tijuana or... Uh-huh. <laughs> Do you want to go there? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> so they brought you but not your brother. Yeah, I was sent because I was so bright. Were they trying to split you up or...? Mm, maybe in retrospect. <laughs> trying to cause, like, uh, trying to create a little distance between the two of you for reasons that might be obvious, but are... It didn't work. Look, uh, I don't really want to talk about it. It was a dark period for me. I did a lot of bad things when she was gone. What did oh, you end like, up doing, like Jay? Like what? Well, I got a couple of cats from the neighborhood and I tied them all together using their tails. <laughs> and then I put pins in their mouths. And then I shove hot rocks up their buttholes. Tell the bad thing you did. <laughs> oh, oh. I gotta say, like, that's pretty bad, Murphy. <laughs> Wait, that's some Stephen this? Avery shit right there. <laughs> well, then I brought them to the science fair, and then I unveiled my... <laughs> <laughs> he called it a modern-day Ferris wheel. <laughs> yeah, because... <laughs> How'd you keep the rocks hot? <laughs> <laughs> this is a good question, Gino. Thank you. you you'd, be, you'd be surprised at the running temperature of a cat's panicked butthole. <laughs> Normally, when they're, at, when they're at ease, it's a cool 
86 degrees. Sure. But when they're scared, well, you could bake a cake in there. And we have. <laughs> yeah. Little butt cakes. <laughs> really? Little cat butt cakes? They're yeah. yummy like Rolos. <laughs> I think if you're eating small chocolate cakes that are coming out of a cat's butthole... Heat it up. That's yeah. almost guaranteed to be cat shit. I'm sorry. Uh, you crank their tail, a chocolate comes out. There it's is... very hot. A lot going on here. Hot chocolate straight from the tap of a yep. cat's butthole. Open wide. <laughs> it sounds like kitty fudge. Yeah. Mm, Meanwhile, that's a good uh, name for it. Meanwhile, Murphy, what were you doing in Mexico while this was happening at the science fair? It wasn't good. Mm. You were in Tijuana. Yeah, well, I got so bored without my brother that I went out exploring every oh. day. Oh, boy. Mm. And I tried to get back home to him. You were four. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the reminder. And, and you were four as well? Yeah, we're twins. twins. We're Irish twins. Remember, they're sixty-nine. He was almost in the womb. five. Oh, oh wait, a minute. wait, you're he's, not Irish twins because you're. He stuck around. <laughs> oh, he stuck around in the womb for a while. Yeah, I crawled back up, and mommy you said. You crawled back up. <laughs> I just want to make sure people don't miss that you crawled back up. Yeah, my mom's not a prude. She said, "Of course." <laughs> <laughs> she was cool until she got skinned. She was. I miss mommy. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe, I guess maybe we see this whole jelly bean case as a way to put the pin in that whole thing. Put a pin in it mean you'll deal with we'll it later? We'll deal with it later. Yeah. Or, or, or like what you did with the cats. So, so you don't, you don't want to come to any kind of closure. You'd we'll like just, to put a pin in it. The second we find this jelly bean, we could stop We're thinking kidding. about our mom I'd being love to find the jelly bean and just table it from there. Yeah, that, that would, would be, be nice. Great. Yeah. yeah, oh boy. It would be a relief. A chant. <laughs> no, no, a no, one no. person chant for Hang on. no reason. Hang on, let her go. <laughs> Keep going. She's, she was the lady who started the, Jessica, the well Jessica chant as well. Keep Sorry. Going. Baby Jessica? Oh boy. Oh no. Oh boy. Lock yeah. her up. <laughs> Lock her up. Lock her up. Uh, I'm just trying to have a good time here. <laughs> Let her have fun. Let her Let scream her whatever Let the fuck she wants to scream. It's, excuse me, sir. Yes, sir. If you host a podcast and in the middle of it, one person starts chanting, how good does it your podcast? Is this a riddle? How good does it mean your podcast is? How, how He's good not does doing it well. How good is it are your podcast is? Oh, boy. Are you okay? His eyes are rolling back. What's He's going fighting. on? Oh, no. No, Are, please! He's foaming at the mouth. Oh, this happened once before when you had the powers the first time that we saw you. His powers are coming through. No, not now. <laughs> These powers are a burden is and he, a responsibility. Does he not want his powers to come, or is he telling us they're not coming? Where is this going? He likes going? to hold off are his powers gonna... for as long as he can. <laughs> yeah, because it makes me come harder. <laughs> Wait, is that the power? Yeah! It's the power of love? He's edging? <laughs> Come on. It's the power that only males Is that have. what it's called? We're getting into your very specific porn watching <laughs> habits. <laughs> Talking porn with Gino. I'm into hold the moan shit lately, but we'll get into that. What's later. hold the moan, sir? It's a situation in which the neither party's allowed to make any noise. Like the husband is sleeping in the bed next to them while a guy fucks her. Or they're in a fitting room at a, a nice department store or something like that. Cool. I like CFNM porn. Clothed female naked male. Cool. <laughs> Or whatever it stands for. Oh, I love everyone in the audience. It's like they're talking very specifically about my fetish. <laughs> I like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle porn that my brother showed me backstage. <laughs> Is that just watching the new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles While film? you jerk off. <laughs> you no, can turn no. anything into porn. It's like the Supreme Court says, I'll know it when I see it. If you just, because I could jerk off to just about anything. It's Prove one of, it. Including, including the Supreme Court. <laughs> yeah, jerk off to a podcast, sir. Yeah, do uh, it. Again? <laughs> Other than sword and scale. 
Well, guys, we need to find this jelly bean for you. You think it's in Alaska, though, or do you I think it might know. be here? It seems it's, unlikely. It, it's hard to tell. Mm. I, I'm willing to bet it's probably somewhere here in San Diego. Otherwise... Oh, boy. <laughs> it's back here. It's back it's here. It's back, back here. here. <gasps> we were wrong all along. It wasn't two. It, it was, was three. Three, three. words. <laughs> It's back here, behind the stage. It's, it's behind, behind the stage. Do you guys think the jelly bean might be behind the stage? This is a breakthrough. How is three the clue there? <laughs> it, cer- it certainly would mean an, an end to this whole thing if it was, but I can guarantee you that's not a planned outcome. And okay, anyway, well, I, I say you guys go back behind there and let's see check. what you find. All right. Let's check. Let's try it. I'll pause the recording while you guys do that. I can't get back there. There's a little fold right uh, to your you left over right here. There. Oh, yeah. Oh. There's always a little fold just by the center. <laughs> a secret door. Cool. Oh, my God. They found a secret door. The oh. secret back door. Where are there all these uh, dildos in here? <laughs> We're in Scott's dressing room. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Poop-covered dildos. I told, I told you to put those is it, away. Is it a bunch of pale, medium-sized, shit-covered dildos? Then you're in Scotty's room. They're very big. <laughs> you got to see the ride of this I guy. I guess he's ass. worked up to this level. <laughs> Jeez Louise. He's got all the dildos laid out in, in, in months. <laughs> They're all different colors. March, January's blue. Yeah. February's green and a little bit bigger. <laughs> they get bigger as they go. Yeah, they get bigger. Jeez Louise, December 25th, Christmas. <laughs> oh, and that's as big as me. <laughs> Wait. It's got little bumps all over it. <laughs> what happens when I press this button? Ay, ay, ay. Holy moly. Look at that thing go. This is what it's like to listen to the podcast. <laughs> yeah, I'm finally getting it. Why people like Wait. it. Right there, behind the biggest one. In the urethra of the one that says secret dildo. There's something there. It's red. It smells like cherry. <laughs> Pull it out. Uh, ow. <laughs> it's a jelly bean. <laughs> Let's wait, go show Scott. Wait, wait. What? I don't want to show it to anyone. Why? Because I want to do what we said we do. <laughs> but, 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 if we don't return it, we won't get paid. But I want to eat it and blast you. Me too, let's go. Ow, 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 Totally tubular. Did I do that? You did. Bad how did, news. How did it go? We didn't find it. <laughs> oh, no? No, we didn't find it. Yeah, do we you, looked everywhere, high and low. Do you guys know what you're holding in your hands right now? Um, <laughs> no. <laughs> they're, they're microphones. You had these next to you the entire time. We heard everything. Huh? Micro what? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. No. And I know the sound of two nine-year-olds slowly sharing a tiny chewy candy while they finger each other's rectums or front holes. He's well, 10, sir. Oh, I'm sorry. You stayed in for another year and aged twice as fast. <laughs> well, we, we didn't find the jelly bean, but we found something very concerning. Uh-oh. Okay. Your collection, sir. <laughs> okay, that's not... Are you talking about Scott's golf bag full of dildos? <laughs> They were lined up like he'd just been using them, all suctioned to a table. Well, of course. They we're, we're doing the show, so he does them before every show. Okay, fine, fine. I bring a bag full of dildos with me everywhere. And Busted. we have to come clean. We just told a white lie. We did find the jelly bean in the urethra of your biggest dildo. That you had it the whole time. Hey, look, stay cool, all right? I'm... I might have had it the whole time, but, uh, you know, I, I just took it because it was there. You know, I didn't know it belonged to anybody. Well, let's just say we're adding it to the list of pending lawsuits, sir. <laughs> and the FBI doesn't treat little criminals like you nicely. <laughs> he gives big spankings. 
Do you got, I mean, you know, if, if we could forego the lawsuit and maybe settle right now. What are you offering? I mean, if you, you know, if you thought of a punishment that would maybe fit the crime. Uh, he wants oh, this. this is a, boy, you're he walking right this. into it, Scotty. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. hmm, I guess we could think of something. I got it. <laughs> Seeing as how our dad's in the TV and all. <laughs> We sure could Our use... Our dad's the old prospector cartoon in television. Oh, right. I remember that. <laughs> For those who For don't For those remember. who might have forgot. <laughs> there are a lot of details thrown out. Well, maybe Scott... Blocker dick. Maybe... <laughs> maybe... You could be your dad. Oh, that's the best idea of them all. Excuse me, sir. Will you be your daddy? Please, daddy. <laughs> All right, fine. Yay! Kids, come to Papa. Suck his dick. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Our favorite television show of all time, mm-hmm. Silicon Valley, comes oh, back. I, I thought it was Veep. <laughs> I thought it was Veep. Hey, hey. I thought it was Veep. veep. Oh, oh. I thought <laughs> it was Veep. Hey, hey. I thought it was Veep. So uh, every year when Silicon Valley comes out, I get the Silicon Valley poo crew out here and <laughs> we chat them up. Taking, um, a, taking dumps and bowls and pouring pee on top to have pee poo cereal, baby. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. That's what you always say. <laughs> That's what his shirt says right now. <laughs> it's oh, a little wow. wordy. <laughs> yeah, I know. Wait, and it's a Bible quote? It says <laughs> Corinthians 4.3? <laughs> yeah, it's Deep Cuts Bible. <laughs> wow, interesting. Uh, so I have these guys on every year. This is the third uh, occurrence that we've had them on uh, in a row and uh, third annual, of course. Let me uh, go down the list uh, with them. Of course, we have uh, returning to the show, uh, returning champion, he plays. Oh gosh, <laughs> Bill what's Foyle. Na- what's the name? Dinesh. Of your- Dinesh. Is that you're you talking want- about? Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. talking about you. you. Talking about? I'm going wow. left to right. Yeah. All right, yes, Dinesh. I, I have to confess, guy. I've seen every episode. Big fan. I Thanks, know, dude. I can't remember any of your names on the show. This is Richard. Richard? That can't be right. <laughs> it is. Yeah, no, it actually is. <laughs> is it actually Richard? Richard Hendricks, like Jimmy Hendricks. Really? Yeah, kind of rock and that's roll. That's not, that's not Spelled true. Spelled very different. Oh, let me go oh, one at a time. Cool. He plays Dinesh on the show. Please welcome back Kumail Nanjiani. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. So great to be here. Oh, so great to have you. Um, this guy says he plays Richard? Hendricks, yeah. Hendricks. Richard Hendricks. That's the uh, character name. That's yeah. been your name the entire time. Uh, no. Almost. No. Is there an episode no. where you changed it? Well, you yeah. will. Th- when we were shooting the pilot, it. We they changed the name while we were shooting on like day three. Really? You know, what was do you, what, do you want to guess the original name? Guess when well, you want to guess the original name. Does it uh, is Richard or Hendrix you have gotta, anything to do no, with it? No, no, but you got a so shot at of, it, Scott. So out of every name, you no, shot. you got a shot at it. If you're you not, got a shot at yeah, it, if you Scott. Don't, if you don't fuck this up, you got a shot at you it. You got a shot at it. Thomas? Yes. yes it really is. was. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Thomas Pickering, which was my mom's maiden name. Cause really? I so did you a... suggest it to them of this would be a good <laughs> well, name? John Altschuler and Dave Krinsky, who are the co-creators of the show with Mike, like way Wait back a in the day. Thomas... And now two other names? What is happening do here? Do you want I the real story, the story or do you want a bit? <laughs> Either. Yeah, I'm trying to give you the real, real scoop. Man. Is this podcast all about bits? Or are we going to get down to the real nitty gritty? <laughs> do you let's want get the, scoops scoops the real or nothing? Let's get the real Niggs Griggs. Whoa, Whoa, what the fuck <laughs> are no. you doing? Nitty you gritty. Mean, that's nits grits. Nits grits? Okay. Not nits grits. I may have been going nitty and gritty together. <laughs> no. That's not the way to nits go. Nits grits, baby. Nits nits grits. Are we allowed to fire you? Because I think that's fire. <laughs> All right, go ahead. What do you What do you got for me? Well, uh, it, uh, I, I was almost <laughs> done. Uh, John Asko and Dave Krinsky. I was working, working uh, with them on something. And By they, the way, Thomas Middleditch is here. Hello. Hi. Hi, and then they. You were uh, you were deep in the throughs with them. I was deep, deep in the, the throughs, and then they said. So you they rolled up your sleeves. Oh, you got right sake. in those throughs. <laughs> oh, Never mind. Fuck. Story done. <laughs> Come on. That was wow. like too annoying. You, wow. Thomas, you can't be in comedy if you can't take the heat. <laughs> Really? You're just going to quit? I'll do bits all day, but if you want the nits grits. <laughs> yeah, you don't get to do bits over the nits grits. <laughs> okay. No bits on no the bits nits, on grits. nits grits? Okay. I I'm, think anyone listening got most of the important details. Yeah, what? Pretty Say, sure. Someone said, hey, this should be your name, and you said yes? Is that the story? Sure. <laughs> I got to say, Martin, that orange is one of the 
ugliest oranges I've ever seen. It yeah. is full of tumors. Yeah. 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 Don't eat it. Something's it's wrong be with so that. So delicious. Oh, it's a lumpy orange. Yeah. It's a troll toot. Yeah, orange. Mm. And the uh, aforementioned Persian. Persian. <laughs> He's a Persian. <laughs> the, the aforementioned Persian. What is my racial deal this yeah, episode? Oh my god. god. Uh, uh, the person that we're uh, speaking with, whom we're speaking, of course, is Martin Starr. He plays. Go for it. Wait, did you say Guilfoyle before? Is that a no, is that a name? Yes. Is it is that his name? He, he said, "Go he, for it." Go, go for it. Uh, he, he plays "Go for it." Martin Starr. <laughs> Hello. Hey. hey, good to be here. And you are eating the lumpiest, weirdest orange. Thank you. And the peel was so thick; the orange inside is tiny compared to the size of all the stuff Thank around you. it. Thank you. <laughs> you yeah. Do, by the way, these are not compliments. Thanks, guys. <laughs> no. What are we, what I are appreciate we, uh, it. How do, how do how, anyone? Can we check the internet? How do the uh, how how do orange peels get made? How do orange what? peels get made? How what's did deal? this orange peel get made? Yeah, what's the deal? Who signed off on this orange peel? Oh. Hey, who's the marketing genius yeah. who decided this should be an orange peel? If this is the right? president of Hollywood's work, I want to mm. have a meeting. Hey, guys, mm. does this smell all right? It smells like an orange. Yeah, it smells citrusy, fresh. Mm-hmm. Thomas yeah. is taking a little smells whiff. pretty premium. And a sniff. Okay. Yeah. And a quiff. How's it taste? Quiff. Primo. <laughs> Primo. Wait, did you, you took a quiff? You took a I quiff? took a sniff, a whiff, and a quiff. <laughs> <laughs> no bits the on bleeps, the nits the bleeps. Bleeps. Huh? Yeah. Right. And, uh, Guys, welcome back to the show. Uh, Wait, where did we go? <laughs> did we just <laughs> take a break? <laughs> yeah, we, we took a break. Welcome back. We're here with <laughs> the Silicon Valley Poo Crew. Uh, it's great to have you guys back. You guys, of course, are the best of friends. And you work together. How, how long does it take to film that show? I would guess. Guess. Looking, okay, looking at the show. Yes. And how, what you achieve. Yeah. I would guess like one day per episode. Oh, burn. <laughs> the claws are out. Oh, burn. Santa you know. Claus, my dear boy. Actually, we shoot the whole Jingle season bells. in a day. So we do really? an episode in a It hour. actually takes shorter to watch it. To, to make it than it does to watch it. <laughs> That's insane. How is we that go, possible? We say super fast. We run super fast. And, and then, then they, they slow it down? They slow it down. Wow. Rehearsals are a bitch. <laughs> but, you know, we get there. Um, that's like the opposite of uh, drunk history in a way. That takes forever? Well, no. I mean, they you, they slow down the, the thing and then they speed it up, right? Don't they slow down the audio source? What are you talking about? I don't about? know. I have no idea. I'm not speaking from a so. position. I, really? I, have you done it before? Yeah. I don't, so you I, do I don't it two times? Yeah, yeah you I don't do it remember them ever slowing anything down, no. Okay. All right. Great. I'm wrong. Wow. Yeah. We got down to the nitty gritty. I apologize. No grits. Bits the nits grits. That's pretty crazy. See, it, it, you know, you bring a, a, a valid point. It's yeah, yeah. much more. Uh, Please, Thomas. It's much more boring without bits. Thank you. Thank Great. You. So you I don't know. I thought that that slowed down drug history thing story was amazing. Fascinating. <laughs> yeah. It got I got a million of them. None of them are true. <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing, Scott? I'm fine. Don't worry about me. Let me let me ask You're you crying. about the, yeah. <laughs> I'm all right. Why do you bring it back on me? Uh, I want to talk about the nits grits about uh this is season 4, season one would four. imagine yeah, of, yeah, yeah. Of, of the show and uh obviously you've you've gone through so many ideas in the first 3 seasons. Seasons. It's like, what else is there to do? But this year we hear you're ramping it up, you're stepping it up, you guys are taking it to another level. Bring us into that process. What is that like? It's what? actually a remake of the first season. Really? Yeah, like shot for shot? Kind of, but... But you're all playing different characters? Yeah, I'm Wait. playing Guilfoyle. Yeah, yeah, I'm playing Jared. <laughs> Jared from Subway? Yep. <laughs> yeah, what does he, a, what does he have to do? Big pedophile <laughs> side plot. Do we, do we see scenes from the first season? You know we see scenes then, from like, his personal collection. <laughs> there it's actually dark. kind of is a pedophile subplot. <laughs> there actually kind of is. Excuse me? Yeah. You remember the beginning of the season? The season? season. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Season. It's true, there is. Yeah. Um, yeah, what happens at the beginning of the season? One of you guys gets, yeah, we, gets we, fiddled, we or well, Jared from Subway comes in, brings out his camcorder. <laughs> he's still fiddles. doing, he's still doing, still doing America's Funny Home Video style VHS. Oh, recording. that is so dark. <laughs> yeah, man. That there's like the Yellow track. King. Oh God, <laughs> darkness. Um, hit us with hit us with one thing that happens to you guys this season. Just a uh, uh, you know, it could be emotional, it could be factual, physical. Oh, there's sex. There's the, sex. So there's, sex. there's like hardcore sex. Hardcore. Off, there's hardcore off-screen sex. Yeah. Oh, all off-screen. But it involves one particular brownish man. <laughs> oh. oh. 
Can you just sing who? There are some <laughs> background are deep extras. In deep the- extras going. <laughs> deep, 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 deep extras. Gotta go deep on those extras. That's like a deep bench of extras. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What uh, Can you describe the sex? Can you describe in detail like I the actual imagine, physical what I, happens? I imagine that there's two positions. Okay, which sex ones? Sex is ha- happening arm on top. Sex is happening arm on bottom. Those okay. are the two positions. Right. Total running time of the sex, a minute 45. <laughs> yeah. A minute plus 45 minutes? <laughs> So 40, 46, 46 minutes. minutes yeah. Yeah, wow. but, that, but that last minute is yeah. screaming. That's where the party happens. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a minute. final countdown. Oh, right my there. God. Is, <laughs> is this with uh, a character <laughs> that we've seen before or a new character? Can you say that or no? New character. New new Karak. New Karak. But somebody who might be familiar to people. Oh, wait. So you're bringing in characters from other shows? Wait, is it Richard Belzer from Law & Order? <laughs> oh, my God. You. That's always your guess. Why is it always? Because he has done a lot of crossovers. Yes. Homicide. L- X-Files. Law and Order X-Files. That's mm-hmm. right. He's yeah. everywhere. Do you know he loves his dog? Okay. What a weirdo. Yeah. <laughs> Most people hate their dogs. Yeah. He loves what his dog. What a fucking dog. strange yeah. dude. I actually, for uh, the season finale or series finale of Comedy Bang Bang, was going to mention Detective Munch and then just say, oh, yes, we're in the Munchiverse. <laughs> but um, but uh, didn't do it. Uh, that uh, got put on the uh, cutting room floor. <coughs> and, Kamel, uh, what is wrong with you? Show. Kamel, have some of that water that's things, right in things, front of you. That's what caused the problem for in the, the first place. <laughs> okay, the no, water. More, no more water ever. Water, like my eyes are water. It's a real geez. nightmare. It went Look, down the wrong pipe. Your body is made up of like, what, 75% water? At like, why least, do we need more? I think it's stupid. It's dumb. It's, Let's get rid of it. Oh, fuck water, man. Hey, hey. hey. Oh, it's wow. weird. It's weird that M Night Shyamalan made two successive movies where water is a problem. Lady Water, Lady in the no, Water. No, no, I'm, t- I'm talking uh, a, si- a science. No, uh, science is un- what about the bees? Un- unbreakable. No. Unbreakable got water. Unbreakable, he falls in the water. That's his one weakness. And then s- the very next movie, Signs. And then the very next movie is Lady in the Water. It's not the very next movie, but yeah. A I couple mean, movies next. Yeah, cause what is his deal with water? That man loves or hates it. You guys love those movies? <laughs> uh, yeah, favorite like movies a, of all time. I like a couple of them. Best, I like The Sixth Sense a lot. I think that was movies. Really We fun. didn't mention The Sixth Sense. Sorry, I just did, God. man. That's why I'm here. I like the Signs, and I like oh. the... Unbreakable. unbreakable, yeah, yeah. yeah. Unbreakable is fun. Uh huh. I, I wonder what it's like. I wonder if he's annoying to talk to or if he's kind of interesting. Who, Bruce Willis and Unbreakable? No, I know that. Yeah. <laughs> oh. M. What Night Shyamalan. What, what do you young. know? Uh, oh, I, ju- I did a. F- I'm not gonna goss. No hot goss here. No hot goss. I mean, there is hot goss, but it won't Ooh. be revealed. Jeez. I will say. I will say. I didn't. Don't meet your heroes. A real tease. <laughs> oh. Oh. I did an Moral interview of at. The uh, story. <laughs> it's, I, I highly doubt Bruce Willis is listening to comedy. Oh, now ball. we know who you're talking about. Uh, huh? Oh, <laughs> what I was. What, you thought for a second I was talking about M Night Shyamalan. Shyamalan. I thought you were talking about M Night Shyamalan. I no, to, M Night. I'm sure is a wonderful dream. I have to say, we did a uh, between two versions with Bruce Willis. It was the longest one we ever did because we set Zach on fire, and he was very game and very cool. The entire time so Ooh. I don't know okay well maybe it's just me then what do you want it's probably you're a nerd and yeah. y- he, he probably, probably thought it was a great opportunity to bully you yeah he probably offered me you might yeah. have had it coming mm-hmm. yeah I do a lot of the time Wait, <laughs> how, how strong do you think you are physically uh, and well, emotionally Okay. Emotionally very weak. Okay, because I was going to say physically very weak. <laughs> oh, all right, there we go. We've got it out. So weak on both sides. Yeah, two out of ten on both. <laughs> if if uh, here's a here's a serious question, if two guys came up to you out of nowhere on okay. the street, I'm already hard. <laughs> okay. okay, the end. Okay, great. <laughs> That's a, well, I this has been. Right. How soon can I get you hard? <laughs> <laughs> very- Ding, now, now. <laughs> Um, boners are weird. I mean, just think about oh, it. Yeah. Here we, we go. Here, here we, we go. go again. All right. A, there's something Do your called ten. A, a, there's something called a peener. It's like uh-huh. a loose little kind of like tube of meat that like dangles off the of a penis? bottom. The peener, the pe- yeah. Peener is. And then if certain things happen, it goes from like loose yeah. to like loose and dangly firm. to like. Yeah, and you touch it a lot and like it crud comes up. It's and then it goes back thing. to yeah, stuff. It's, so you know, it's also at, what they say. They say that they, it gets hard. Scientists. They say it gets hard when there's blood because of the blood. Yeah, yeah but it it's way harder blood. than blood. And I've touched blood. Blood ain't that hard. <laughs> yeah. And My when, peener get hard. And when it explodes, it's not like blood. shooting out blood. It's not it's shooting, it's out, shooting blood. out It's, totally it's, it's confusing. <laughs> Where's that blood going? Who Where are, are these marketing geniuses? Yeah. You know, you know, you know what? It, maybe what it is is it does fit. 
fill up with semen, and then that's the semen that shoots up. Well, it's, it is when blood. You, after you ejaculate, it's a do, you just, do you just have like an empty sack of skin? Uh, that it, would be if it were blood. It's, it's like a that balloon. That would be if it were cum. If it filled no, up with the semen, yeah. the semen. No, but it goes loose. back so, Mel, to what it you was. You want, if you could meet with the designer of the penis, you'd say, hey, instead of all these little chambers give, filling up with blood. Give some notes on the penis. For, well, my biggest fill them note up with on the semen. penis is that the part of the human body, the male body that hurts the most, most the balls, are just dangling out there in perfect, like, kicking height. I think that the, is poor design. I think the butthole is the thing that hurts the most. What? What? <laughs> Wait, how if often are you getting you do it the way I do it. Are you getting punched in the butthole a lot or <laughs> yes. kicked in the butthole? That's my thing. <laughs> now be, I'm hard. You have to be spread in order to get kicked in the hole. <laughs> yeah. And do you so just have a lot of trouble taking it. shits? Are uh, shits really painful for I you? Mean, I mean, no, it's after the shits that's that's painful. The wiping? So the after wiping. the shit. Do you wipe? <laughs> no. No, you get kicked. <laughs> Boy, he gets kicked clean. I, I, I kick have someone kicked clean. clean. <laughs> he has it's somebody like, uh, wrap toilet paper on their shoe. <laughs> it's like a demolition man where like, he doesn't know how to use the three sh- seashells. Yeah. It's like, oh, you don't know how to get kicked clean? Oh, yeah. you haven't lived. <laughs> What a weird ass. Oh, finally, male comedians are talking about their penises. I'm yeah. just saying that there should be some sort of bone cage around the balls. If there's yes. like a, cage, a bone, bone cage. cage. Like a rib cage? Oh, oh, the, yes, a rib cage for the balls. Like a, like, no, I'm, I'm picturing, and, no, I'm picturing like exposed bones like the dinosaur skeleton. Like yeah. just like a. Yeah, yeah, or like, like an alien kind of like an uh, endoskeleton. Why would you just like pull them up inside the body? Well, that would be great too. Well, that's Give yeah, that's the other thing. Like, put, you, put it next to the the colon or something. Well, if there's you know? one thing we could next, learn yeah. from the insects, we could maybe have like a what a thorax, like an exoskeleton. Yeah, what are they that's called? what he was saying. The yeah. endoskeleton. Mm-hmm. Get Endo. an exoskeleton. Get going, an exo. man. Right? Yeah. Come like, on. This, this makes more sense. And it could be colorful, like a bird of paradise. And you know, you'd like <laughs> oh, show God. it, and it would be a different <laughs> pattern. Be like, yeah. oh. And you could like flex it, and it would look like eyes. Yeah. And so predators would be scared. And it could be something that you. That is a big problem. I have is predators constantly going after my balls. <laughs> it could be Clearly, something you show off away. too. Like it could be something that women and 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 men are like very curious about the way they're they're curious about the right. sizes. Like each one is. Ooh, I wonder unique. what it's like down there. Yeah, yeah. it's I not mean, very big, but it is all the colors of the rainbow. Yeah, mine's huge, but just you know beige. <laughs> <laughs> mine's just Roy G. Bivin it. Uh, Roy G. Bivin. Mine's got a like what, a QPC code or a Q, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, you scan with your phone yeah, and get yeah. like an AR. And what does message? it say? You can download songs. Yeah, no, it just does a gift. Oh. It's just a, a gift. You can uh, shit my balls. It gives you the ejaculation app, and then yeah. your balls come on them. Guys, is this anything? <laughs> Bell, no, what we've been talking about, absolutely not. <laughs> this though, Bell Roy G Biv Devoe. Is Bell, that something? Roy G Biv Devoe. It is definitely something. Is that something? That's something. I think that's worth digging. Uh, getting you know, in there. don't yeah, you think? Yeah, like, there's I, something there, right? I'm yeah. shocked that that has not happened so far. You know what I'm saying? Like, Mad TV was around. Yeah. They you know, it. like, this what happened? This is probably why they're not. Yeah. Exactly. All right. Good. 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 Bell so, Roy G Biv Devoe. It's something, right? It's something. So, uh, listeners out there, please send us uh, any of your memes, whatever you want, whatever you crazy people want to turn that into. Yeah. <laughs> send or, it. To, send it to the four of us. More like Bell Biv Deno. Uh, Thomas, come on. <laughs> just sorry. What? I'm just sorry. Is that, did you say <laughs> something like that to me? <laughs> Improv is yes and. It is not uh, no. Yeah. Well, if you got one of those. Was cooking. It's not put Bell it Biv pan. to no. Well, improv is Bell Biv to yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's the first rule of improv. That I would actually, I think Matt Besser should sell shirts like that. Improv Bell is Bell Biv to, to yes, not Bell Biv, Bell Biv, Biv to, to no. It would have to be Bell Biv to yes and. Mm-hmm. That's true. If you really know improv. <laughs> I'm Tell us about improv. Well, finally, we get to it. You take classes. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's it? That's yeah. all you want to say about improv is you yeah. take classes? Yeah, that's classes the real involved. nits grits of improv. Yeah. You know what's interesting about you? <laughs> you get it. You <laughs> get it. I've never heard it laid out so yeah. thoroughly. I've been doing it for a while. What's interesting about the three of you is you, you have three very different backgrounds in comedy. Okay. Kumail, you come from the world of stand-up. That's correct. Thomas, you come from the world of improv. And sketching a little bit of stand-up. <sighs> Shut up. And Martin, <laughs> can you edit that out? Just, I'll just idiot. Yeah, I'll you just want to put me in my little box, man. I want to put you in my little ball cage. <laughs> 
your phone. <laughs> there your should phone be. Case. It is bad design. It's if you had an design. iPhone and there was just like a battery hanging it's, out of or, it. Or if there were testicles hanging off of yeah, it. Well, that would like, be horrible. And Jesus. you had to talk. And as you were talking, <laughs> the testicles be, were that, like in your mouth. That should be a portable <laughs> battery pack. There should be a, a little adapter where you just <laughs> yeah. put the thing in and you got balls dangling. Yeah. It just like charges your phone. Like You've seen thing. truck nuts. What yeah. about phone yeah. nuts? Yeah. <laughs> we need that. Come on, guys. Come on, Steve Jobs. Come Where on. are you? Where have you been? You haven't taken any of my messages for the past, like, two years. I have terrible news for you. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> I just realized we have ball cages. What? Yeah. Cups. Like, yeah. Oh, what do you mean, cups? athletic cups? Oh, cups. Yeah. But They're humans fake. Humans should come with them. Exactly. They're fake. I know, but I'm just saying but, mankind and, but, has invented the By way, the those, if you're wearing it right, also cover your penis. So if you had those, That's you true. would never be able to like actually fuck anything. Yeah. Wait, you can fit your penis in there too? <laughs> Not you. <laughs> now I'm embarrassed because <laughs> you can't fit my your ball, penis. My balls are so colorful and large. That oh, they, okay. They so take up the whole space. It's not because you have guys, a super huge peen. It's because your balls are so. Guys, big. can we just please talk about vaginas? For a okay, second? okay. Let's talk. Let's talk about those. They're weird too. <laughs> they're soups weird. But they're like you know they're. Do they get a cup? All, all the stuff is inside the body. It's tucked in. Yeah. Which is which is. It's good. like when it's you. Not, go, when I you tell go, you, I've seen not some, all the stuff. I've seen some all stuff right, that yeah. not all the stuff. It's like it's like when you go to car. What? Not all. What, stuff is inside. What do you mean? Not all the stuff. Like is there's inside. some. I'm just saying, uh-huh. and that's fine. You, you know, everybody's pro- born different. Are you talking about prolapse? Uh, I've seen photos of that, but <laughs> did you say Pearl Jam? It's, it's <laughs> like, <laughs> have you guys have you guys ever been to a Pearl Jam concert? Yeah, I mean, technically, that's a semen reference. But when you go to Carlsbad Caverns, <laughs> like you don't want the bats hanging around outside. You what? want everything in there. You know what I mean? And that's like the vagina. Right. You know? That's good design. You want the stalagmites and the mm-hmm. stalactites. The stalagmites. Wa- What's a stalagmite? <laughs> Mites. Stalagmite okay. and stalactite. You want them all in there. Yeah. You don't want them hanging out outside like the I balls. I don't think vaginas got stalactites and stalagmites. Well, I, I mean, they have whatever is in there. What you know? vaginas have you? You been hanging out in. Yeah. You guys know. <laughs> <laughs> what if you went to the Carlsbad Caverns and there was just like some some testicles oh, hanging out of yeah. those? Oh, that's a confusing yeah. cave, That's man. bad. Yeah. That's a exactly. Bad, you yeah. would be like, oh, why did I go to the Carlsbad Caverns? The testicles were already outside. Are you sponsored yeah. by Carlsbad <laughs> yes. Caverns? by the way, we're giving away trips. <laughs> and if you guys want to go on another date, we'll pay for it. <gasps> oh. A date? Uh, another one. Another one? I assume this is a date. This is a date, right? <laughs> Have we all gone on a date? You guys are all on a date right now? This is a date. Three-way yeah. sure. date. I, you guys I, coming up therapy with me after this? I thought this was platonic, but I guess I'm up for whatever. Okay, okay, great. All right, we'll pay for it if you want to go out again. What is Carlsbad? What is it? Texas. And you go in, they got oh. bats? It's caverns. It's, you know, you, it winds around. Wait, wait, you wait. Know. Is, if Carlsbad's Texas, then what the <laughs> heck's that beer? Carl's bad? Carlsberg. 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 Shut up, That's Thomas, you oh, idiot. Okay. <laughs> Fucking idiot. We could go to Carlsberg Caverns. <laughs> Carl's and you could pick up a six pack. Yeah, yeah. Martin no, likes Bruce. He's a beer man. I do. The Martin beer. is a beer man. Yeah. What's your drink of choice? Let's go. Camel first of all. I just Guinness. do straight Guinness. Up Guinness. Martin. Guinness. Apple juice. Guinness. Just Guinness. apple juice. I just do apple juice. <laughs> that's that's not just true. a little happy, happy, happy jacket. Definitely the best. That's, that's not good either. That's have I, you ever? I, that's <laughs> a lie. What's up with you today? <laughs> oh, no. Oh no. Wait, what'd you say? I said what happy jappy. That's not good. Guys, are there any phones? Calling in? Do we have any <laughs> callers from... Oh, please not yet. <laughs> why, why, tell you what, why don't we take a break? When we <laughs> when we come oh, back, it. we will... Damn uh, it. There's I know, so much time left. I know, Thomas, you have to go, but uh, when we come back, <laughs> yeah, uh, Kamel and Martin will be here with us. We'll be right back with more Comedy Bang Bang after this. <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, we are back here. Uh, Kamel Nanjiani and Martin Starr, of course, from uh, the Silicon Valley Pooh Crew. Thomas Middleditch had to leave, uh, but uh, you know the show. It's the show where we talk to interesting people. <laughs> that is our that is our motto. That is our <laughs> tagline. Uh, and uh, today is no exception because we have a very interesting guest. I actually do not have any of his bio or biography here with me, so we'll just get at it as we talk to him. Uh, please welcome to the show, Don Donaldson. Hi, everybody. Pleasure to be here. The world is full of opportunities. Uh, true. For an entrepreneur, do you mean? Yes, or? entrepreneur, inventor. How, oh, are you an inventor? I've applied to be on Shark Tank, haven't I? Oh, have how would we know? <laughs> have you? Yeah, have I don't you? know. Have the answer is not yet. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> let us know when you do. I will write you an email. There is a Scott at ComedyBingBong.com. Do you, do you write emails or did you invent something that's different than email that works the same way? 
you're trying to make me say that I have, aren't you? I, I'm just, you're an inventor. It seems like that's something. Well, I have. <laughs> we are doing the initial round of fundraising. We're at Series A. So oh, this is what wanna, this is about. If you okay. guys want to get in, you can. I don't understand what the technology is behind this. When we're putting in money. Yeah, we already own computers. If you want hey. trouble, we can make trouble. Let's de-escalate this de situation, hey. sir. That's fine. That's fine. How old of a man are you? 61 years old. 61 years old. Yeah. Uh, uh, you're probably too young to have gone to the Vietnam War unless you went as a young person and in lied about your age. In 1966, I was 10 years old. Right. Okay. And in 1968, I was 12. Got it. And that is when I went to Vietnam. Yeah, as a 12-year-old boy. I went on a student visa. <laughs> you, you chose to visit <laughs> It was a student during the It was an student exchange program, and there, were only, uh, there was one person on the U.S. side, me, who signed up and one person on the Viet outside, Dong Pak, who signed up. And we exchanged, and we met once in the airport, and I never saw him again. He seemed like a nice boy at the time. I remember thinking, I hope I get to play with him. But what, I never would it surprise him. you to know that he's on the phone right now? <sighs> Dong, he's calling in. Dong Pak is, Dong Pak is on the phone. Here he is. He, he, uh, <laughs> I know this is a surprise to you, but I set it up beforehand. He's here on the phone with you. Uh -oh. Hello, Dong, are you there? <laughs> Wow, he's laughing Dong? a lot. Dong? Oh, hello? Hi. Hello? Hi. <laughs> who, is, who is this? This is Scott Ackerman, the host. Oh, of what? Of Comedy Bang Bang. We, uh, Comedy Bang Bang. Oh, I love it. So, <laughs> you do. You're a fan. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> it's great to... Hey, we have uh, great news for you. Do you remember when you were around 12 years old, you had an exchange program with uh -huh. the American... Don Donaldson? Yeah, okay, that little boy. Ooh, thank you, Uncle. Well, he's he's not a little boy anymore. He aged at the same rate you did. Hmm? He he's the same age as you. Oh yeah, we're both sixty-one <laughs> years old. Oh god. <laughs> okay, Don. How, how, well, do you know what I am, Don? Do do you know? I'm I'm <laughs> Vietnam's leading lady boy. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> All right. All right, Don. No, I run a whole lady boy shop. <laughs> okay, let's I, I'm afraid we don't have that much time. What to is talk a lady to boy you. shop? Yeah. You oh. come in, you shop for the lady boy. They come out with you. <laughs> okay, okay. Don't you want to come and bid it? <laughs> we don't. Um Don Scotty. It's, who else is on the line? <laughs> well you <you're, laughs> Don Donaldson's on the line. Don, uh, oh Don, boy. <laughs> Hey there, how are you? <laughs> Don Fuck, it's me, Donald Donald. Uh, oh, so pleasure to see, hear your voice again. Come to Vietnam, we have a great time together. All right, I'll see you in a bit. Bye, look me up, lady boy. Premier, premier lady boy service. Is there a website we can go to? www.com. <laughs> PremierLadyBoyService.com Okay, thank you, Don. It's so great to talk hey, to I you. I think, can I please just do a demonstration? <laughs> I thought this was done. No. I thought it was done this Please, before. my big I... shot, please, on radio. Wait, what's the demonstration? Of my singing. Oh, you will, yes. You will see it if you come here. Okay, okay so I guess so. I it. really don't know how much longer we can, we... but go ahead. <laughs> Okay, that's about all, right, all we have time you. for. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. Oh, oh Don, what uh, a what a thrill! Well, I gotta be honest, seems like a pretty fun guy. So you're going to Vietnam? <clears throat> well, yeah. I mean, I'm or I'm on orbits right now. My phone behind a ticket. I got. It'd be great to see him again. He sounds pretty colorful. <laughs> He does sound like a, a very interesting person. I hope that. he won't mind what I did when I was 12 when I was over there. Oh, no, I don't know. I mean, you what? said you saw some stuff. What yeah. What'd you do? Well, I went around to the POW camps, and oh I goodness. elected to have the oh POW God. experience. Oh, my God. The P you, you wanted to have the POW experience for yourself? Yes. So, you wanted to experience it. So I went to the Vietnamese POW camps, and I went in all the little swimming pools and stayed there for a few days. and. And they then, have swimming pools well, in the POW camps. They're more like little ponds that you can't escape. Uh, so, <laughs> so like wa water barriers separating yeah, they you keep, from escape. They keep you in the water with just your mouth poking out, so you can breathe. But it's not as fun as an American swimming pool. So, what would have helped you actually was one of your air purifiers, because you could have used a little tube and 
Yeah, up is that where you got the idea thing. for these breathing into the hoses? Uh, these ideas come to me. I black out for moments and I get new ideas. But is that possible. anytime you laugh? <laughs> oh my god! Hey, hey, uh, Don. Don. <laughs> you people can ride it. Keep people. People can ride birds if we just get the birds big enough. That's a great idea. <laughs> That's not bad. Wow. So wait, is this? Are what you I, trying to what invent? Did I say? <laughs> are you what did I say? I didn't have my. You said people can can ride birds if we get the birds big enough. Are you trying to invent? Yeah, we could. Are you trying to invent a a growth ray, or are you trying to invent a bigger bird? Yeah, I just got the bee. I don't know how to get the line from A to B. But You'd need some sort of saddle, bird saddle. That's easy enough. I mean, that, those are all auxiliary products that we could invent after the well, actual right. bigger. You, you know, see that the video. You're right. That's not. It's like you're tr you're trying to invent the case, the iPhone right. case, right now. Now when I'm trying to invent the the phone nuts, right? Totally. You're it's, not inventing jack shit. That's my idea. You want to take my idea? We'll see you at some court. <laughs> hey, you hey, think hey, I don't hey, have lawyers? Fucking back off! You think I don't have lawyers? I Calm don't. Down. Okay, okay. I don't think okay. you have this lawyers. This thing's okay, all the lawyer okay. I need. You only have three friends. I bet. I bet they're not lawyers. No, they're all gun owners. Okay. Idiots. Okay. 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 Sit down. All right. How many? Good. Are you all carrying right. guns on you right now? No, I'm a knife man. <laughs> How many knives do you have? Six. Six on you. On me. I got 1,200 <laughs> knives at home. 1,200 <laughs> knives. They're not that expensive. This is the best part about being a knife guy. You're not spending the 800 bucks for a damn AR-15. And I guess they're sort of flat, so they don't take up a lot of room. Yeah, you can, I got a whole storage bin. I'll show you my knives if you want. No. Scotty, you, you feel like coming to Jacksonville, Wyoming anytime soon, you prick? That started <laughs> friendly, and by the second half of the sentence, I no longer wanted to see I the knives. You weren't gonna come. That was so fun to hear my 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 Vietnamese buddy from all that time ago. Yeah, it was fun, I guess. We had about six hours in the airport for a layover, and we played all kinds of games. What games did you play? I mean, these are games that exist, like Monopoly. Well, or it was nineteen. It was the sixties, man. So played jacks. Mm -hmm. Jills? <laughs> huh? Jills? What? <laughs> What are you talking about? What's <laughs> Jill's? It's the opposite of Jack's, I guess. It's okay, what is it? What's the game? I've never okay. played it. Okay, well, you know, in, instead of <laughs> bouncing yeah. a ball and trying to pick up Jack's, yeah. you you throw Jill's at someone. Who, what are Jill's? You, what do they look like? What are Jill's? They're, you know how Jack's are like little pointy star-shaped things? No doy, yeah. <laughs> you say no doy? I do. I've never heard a 61-year-old say no doy. Well, get used to it. <laughs> what are Jill's? <laughs> this is a fucking mess. It's all things a goddamn mess. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. We're getting off topic here. What are you two saying? Jack Chip, huh? <laughs> What's Coomer's and Merlin saying? Huh? Nothing. They're they're, they're trying to. Well, we're just trying to figure out. You said some stuff happened to you when you were there in your water prison. Yeah. Then I had you got to break out of these things. So you know, took a few lives and got me. So you went in there. voluntarily, and then who? Yeah. Who took a few out? lives? Whose That's lives did you? Of Vietnamese people or of other prisoners? You no, know, the guards. Well, but them, call them A, call them B. <laughs> But yeah, the guards. You killed other prisoners on your way out. How the hell am I supposed to get out of the water if I don't stack dead bodies, Colonel? <laughs> okay, gosh. So yeah, I had to kill some Vietnamese. Then I was in the jungle for about six years. And uh, eating. So you were 18? Yeah, I was eating grubs. And the war was already over at this point, I would think. You couldn't have told me that. I wouldn't have believed you. Anyway, I really? So if someone came up to you and said, hey, the war is over. Have you heard any bombing? Someone any tried explosions? to do that, and I shot them in the face. <laughs> who do? Who? I is, don't know. It's just some asshole. So you were a gunman <laughs> then. Now you're a knife man. Not but. after that day. <laughs> yeah. Wait, so that turned you off of guns. I said, what am I doing? What have I been doing? And then I hoofed it over to Cambodia and got the nearest boat out of there. Okay. The nearest one, not the fastest one. No. Just the nearest? I had, to, I had to go, actually. I had to hoof it all the way to many other countries. <laughs> I made it all the way back to Europe, and then I took a boat. Okay. Got it. Got it. This is, this all makes sense. Okay. Yep. <laughs> so, so in the 70s, you came back to the U.S. Yes, sir. And then you, <laughs> I'm not your superior officer. You don't need to call me. Fine, sir. I can call you fucker, just like I wanted to. <laughs> okay. Jesus Christ, this <laughs> asshole. Okay, sorry. Okay, so, so then what have you been doing since the 70s till now? Living off the grid, inventing things. What else have you invented? I've invented a pen, a pen that writes like a pencil. So it, it the, the like a you, mechanical pencil. Well, you, yeah, like no, no you, it uses ink, literal ink. No, it uses graphite. So this and is a pencil. So it's a pencil. It's this a is, pen that writes like a pencil. 
Okay, so it's, it's got it on the right side on the back. Yeah. Yeah. You got to click it. Do you got to click it? No, you don't. You have to buy a new one because you, can, this you is can't just save a pencil. it because it's made of plastic on the outside. You can't take the sole off of a word and then say it's a pen. It's a pencil. It's a pen that it's, writes like a pencil. I'm getting you, kind of angry again. I got I to gotta be honest. You know what? I actually don't care that you're getting angry because this, this is important to me. You don't care? I don't care. You want to push me? I do want to push you. Because you know what? I'm tired of you coming on here and bullying my other guests. Yeah. Look at you know, these fuckers. Hey, look at, hey, look hey, at Kumail hey, and Martin. Hey. They're, they're cowering in just, fear. Just please. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. What else? What else? You, you understand? You understand? Do you understand? Do I understand? No, what? I don't. I don't, understand? quite honestly. You're not I finishing don't. the words. Uh, there's been about 22 tons of gravel <laughs> porn into the... There's pits. Porn? <laughs> There's been 22 pounds I, of gravel porn into the nearest pit. I gotta be honest. <laughs> I'm running on fumes here, guys. You're, I have been, oh, I have been awake for 46 hours. Okay. Oh, wh why have you been awake? You could just really... You try and take the train here from Jackson Hole, you do not want to fall asleep on that train. Oh, yeah. A lot of skeevy characters. A lot of skeevies. Yeah. Yeah. I would skeevers. think that you're chief amongst them. Hey man, you want to call me the king of the skeevers? I'll take it. At least that means, <laughs> at least that means I got people to rule over, okay. and I'm not some puppet for the goddamn DC fucks. Okay, okay, okay. You ever been to a protest rally, Scott? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You ever yeah. been to a protest rally, yeah. Kermers? Uh, what about you, Martin? You ever been to a protest rally? Yeah. Which one? What cause? It was uh, for the immigrants at LAX. You want? To get rid of them. We were, no, no. We, no, no, we were, we were protesting to... to well, yeah, well, you don't sound like you know what side of the so, issue we're on. <laughs> well, I just... What? I was invited. Did you just show up somewhere? It was... Uh, <clears throat> yeah, they had a big rally. Did you get rid of them all? Yeah, it was one of those email chains, and I, I read right. one of them, and I ended up in LAX. Okay. And you went to the one where they're... They, there you get they are, are arm locked. There's something about immigrants. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Why I do you bring them. up protest rallies? They teach you a lot about yourself. Oh, when the tear gas hits, oh, mm. who who <laughs> do you, who do you choose first? To to what? Uh -huh. To get? What do you mean get? <laughs> Wait, are you firing the tear gas? Yeah, <laughs> okay. I always sneak over to the cop side and start shooting <laughs> gas. <laughs> okay, they look, they know me. They so know, they know. I bet a lot bet. of local PDs know me. <laughs> yeah, look, Don, we're running out of time here, but uh, Fang I, I have to say. <laughs> You're a very interesting person. Would love to talk to you again sure, at some point. Sure, sure, sure. Don't, please don't bring your friend from Vietnam. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. But, uh, I'll have get a, them all to myself. Okay, but have a great trip. But before you go, uh, we do have our final feature on the show. That's a little something called plugs. Bono? <laughs> plugs. Oh, Tell them about the plugs. Wait, Wait you want a t-shirt too? Yeah. yeah. Why did you come without a shirt on? Plugs, 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 plugs. Hit us up. Beautiful, a clean recording. I love the Beatles. Who was the drummer? I don't know. Are you fucking serious? Medium for Scott. Large for Scott. Ringo. Bono. Ringo was the drummer. I don't want to upset him. <laughs> Bono? 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 Hey, uh, John Lennon are. Oh God! Dead. 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 <laughs> dead. dead. I was dead, but just I came back. Plugs. Plugs. Okay. Plugs. All right. Plugs. Is this still going? All right, guys. Really good. Shorten them up. <laughs> All right, Don. What do you have to plug? Just know that the charges are alleged, and <laughs> things have yet to be proven because we haven't had a court date set. So. <laughs> Wait, the char the chargers? Is that what you said? Charges. I got oh, the I got a few pending cases against. Okay. You got priors? I got well, you know, let's just say the government's got its eye on numero uno and I intend to fight, fight, fight until I die and I don't care how many I take with me. <laughs> okay. You may want something <laughs> a little stronger than those knives, because you're only gonna take a few people. Uh, you do you, man. <laughs> okay, sorry. Uh, by the way, I forgot to say that that plugs theme was Bono. You know what? Since we had to cut the plugs theme in half, I'm only going to say half of this. That was Bono, Jono, Ringo plugs by Ch. You guess the rest. <laughs> what an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're calling me an asshole? He only, he only spent a couple evenings on it. All right, Charlie Stewart, thank you so much. Guys, uh, yeah. yes, Don, you want to say something? Say next time on your behalf, I'm helping you out. Next time... You keep it that long again, and I'm going to be outside your window with a goddamn knife wrapping on it. 
<laughs> with with a knife you're going to be rapping on? You know, rapping upon your chamber door, that kind of rapping. Okay, yeah, yeah. Not hip hop. That's not for me. <laughs> oh, really? Why not? You don't say. It's a little oh, too. Okay, all right. Okay, <laughs> yeah, is... all, right. all right. Look, guys, thank I want to thank you so much. Uh, Martin Kamel, good luck uh, with the show. Thank uh, you. And Don, good luck with whatever it is you do. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Tommy, the middle D, and the elegant Mr. S. Hey. Benny Schwab, Benny, uh, uh, Ben Schwartz, hello, and hello, Thomas Middleditch are both here. Hello, you can go, Bobby Book. So, <laughs> what is that? You can go, Bobby, while you're working. I don't know what that is. Be Do careful, you... ba, ba, ba. Thomas, you're singing a lot like so. Go, go, the ba, da, ba, da, ba, da, da, ba, da, 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 ba, da. That was a Fagan song. See, I was the artful oh, dodger. Oh, is that from Oliver? It yeah. Is, you yeah. were the artful dodger? Where? Yeah. Where? Um, the uh, Cal- Capital Theater you mean in, life? in Nelson, British Columbia. Nelson, British Columbia? Yeah, for the summer musical theater program. How Whoa. old of a man were you? Uh, me? Oh, uh, geez. Uh, maybe about 17. Never heard of it. Ooh. Whoa. That's a sexy time in a boy's life. Yeah, is it we, not? Our, our twist. <laughs> Our Oliver on twist. Oliver Twist oh. was that it was set in uh, 1980s punk London. So, the Dickens, whoa. you say? I know. So my art for Do- art for Dodger had green hair. Whoa! This <laughs> I is dyed my crazy. Hair green <laughs> leather jacket. What? Green hair was yeah, like, Please oh, tell me oh, there oh, were spikes. Fuck off, cop like Oh, that nice kind of stuff. Doing the. Did you say fuck off? off? No, absolutely. Oh, not. that would have been so stuck. awesome. If like the last show, you were like, guess what? I'm no say way. You're not going to. No way. You're not going to. Yeah, I was not a bad. Fuck off, Oliver. I enjoyed the rules, Scott. <laughs> you did. Uh, let's talk to these guys. They both been on the show before. They both been on together, and they both been on separately. So we've Jesus, run the you're gamut. So boring today. <laughs> I'm boring. You're just so hey, boring. Hey, whoa, whoa. I'm boring. Oh, oh, there right. you go. Now I'm Fuck excited. Fuck you, Oliver. Oh, I yeah. love it now. <laughs> I'm invested now. These Scotty. rules are not for me, Oliver. Oh, get that cigar Fuck out of your mouth. You. Oh. Suddenly he turns it out. Oh, Fuck you, Oliver. I Fuck me. This. Fuck. Fuck you! The scent of a woman. Oh, I love this. <laughs> I love the scent of oh, a woman. woman. You devil's advocate. Hoorah! Pretty woman! What is hoorah, by the way? Is, is he saying heard, understood, received, and accepted? Is that like, <laughs> is it an acronym? Is it when he says hoorah, or is it a thing? I thought I, it was what the, isn't that what the m- army means? Yeah, it, no, it, well, it is a saying, but I'm wondering if it's an acronym for something, because oh. like, or is it just made up gibberish? I've always understood it to be like heard, understood, received, accepted. Oh, but, oh, I, I, but I, I don't know. That's great. Well, it's a it's a battle cry. But he goes hua. But I think maybe they. But that's also... heard, understood, accepted. Maybe that's yeah, why yeah. I, that's why I can't really figure out exactly like you know what it is. I want someone to tell me. I want oh. I want my mommy to come tell me. <laughs> oh, okay. Here she comes. Hi, Scott. What's going <laughs> on? Mommy, mommy, tell me what hua means. Get down on your knees. Let me spank that bottle. <laughs> oh, of course. What a bush, complicated bush, 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 relationship. Bush, bush. Ow! Oh, wow. God, Tell you me really what it got means him. now, mommy. Oh, wow. All right, take care, Scotty. <laughs> what? She never told me. <laughs> Just got spanked. Jesus That's Christ. why you never trust your mother. <laughs> that's oh, exactly okay. correct. Thomas and that's knows. the one thing that we all want to tell you out there. Don't if you're a young your child mother. out there, do not trust your mother. Don't trust mommy. Because <laughs> mommy could be lying to you. Ding, ding. Um, mommy just wants to dupe you and spank your bottom. <laughs> <laughs> you have three specials? They all come out at the same time. So boop, you can boop, go. Boop, 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 boop. How long? Go to Middle Edge and Schwartz on Netflix. You go right now. You could even put it on your list right now. Sure, of and, course. Uh, Although it's not available right now. Well, no, you could put it on your list, though. My list, it'll sure. pop up. But you can't watch it not until yet. tomorrow. Or and maybe what is tonight tomorrow? at midnight. 421. 421, baby. No, but what is what, what is the concept of tomorrow? You explained oh, it's it earlier. the day after today. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. <laughs> you didn't know what that was? <laughs> I had no idea until, what like, What do you think suddenly. yesterday means? Yeah. I don't know. You just crystallized it in a way yesterday that I'd never even heard before. before today. What? Yeah. Oh, wow. Um, so, so these are amazing specials. How, and they're an hour. A apiece? little under an hour. All of them are a little under an hour. This is incredible. Oh, you guys Scott. really achieved something. If you if you have trouble with tomorrow, just think of tomorrow, and you're going to it. Well, now tomorrow and tomorrow and tomorrow creeps in this petty pace from day to day. I'll now that is here. the immoral bar, of course. There is. Th- wow. This is hard because I don't want <laughs> no, to hear no, you do ben, that anymore. This is hard. He's pointing <laughs> Whoa, to he's his pointing dick. to his cock right um, now. Let's just see where like, it goes. Uh, just like the artful Dodger did in that one production. <laughs> yeah, he pointed to his cock and said, "This is hard." Yeah. Oh this is God. the artful. Did he say food glorious food? That was Oliver. Right? <laughs> no, this is Oliver. Food no, he waited for 
uh, uh, you got to pick a pocket or two? No, no. Yeah, hey, pick this pocket or He'd two. He'd wait for consider yourself. And then he pointed to his... Hey, pointed consider his, this. Consider yourself. That'd be a great... Why didn't they do that dick? for the Irishman con- for your consideration? Yeah, have, consider <laughs> this. Consider I, this. Why not analyze this? He's hey. really talking about analyze these cocks... In balls, right? So it's a big deal in, for a long In the movie, analyze this. He's talking about his dickers. Yeah. Huh. No, he's not. Isn't he? He's like, analyze. You're friends with him. Can you bring this up to Billy Crystal? Sure. What do you want me to ask? Say, in analyze this, is the this his cock and balls? I'll Just ask te- him. text him right now, okay, please, I'm so we can get him. Okay, so we can get this. Yeah, so we can get a, an answer by no. the end. He said no. He said no. What is it? So then ask what is it? What is it? Oh, he said, did you write cock and balls? Yes, we did. I guess it is. Oh, it is cock and balls. I fucking knew it, Scotty. Ask about hoorah. Uh, hoorah. He probably knows about hoorah, right? He said it's an acronym. Whoa, I knew it. I fucking knew it. This fucking guy. This fucking guy. Can we guy. tell you, I'll give you a quote from a real movie. Okay. Okay? It's okay. going to be, this is a game I like to play called uh, Not Famous Quotes, but from real movies. I like how you're the one who always likes to dictate rules of games. Yep. I'm like, you, you, you like to is. run things. Yeah, yeah, right? Like you know, run. like you're the bossy friend. Especially here. Especially here. You know what I mean? You're like the Monica. Well, you're all over the place. Look at you. Sure. You brought your own fucking headphones. You, th- you think you're the Chandler, but you're really a Monica. Oh. What's the difference between Chandler and Monica? Well, Chandler's chaos. He's chaos. <laughs> personified. <laughs> okay, this is an this is an abstract quote from a real movie. Ready? All right. Okay. An abstract quote from, from a real, real movie. movie. Ready? Okay. Here we go. Crazy drunk drivers. Oh, I think we're talking Back to the Future. That's again. correct. <laughs> why do you keep? Why are you sticking on the beat? That that's, that's why I can't believe you got that. Yeah, well, how did you get you that? Know, cause I, because there were the, all these crazy drunk drivers. Like every single person who drove in that movie is drunk. <laughs> Wait, what? do another one. Does someone else have one? Like that's Doc great. Brown is drunk the entire no, movie. No, not it's Doc crazy. Brown. Yeah. Wait, which Brown are you thinking of? <laughs> oh, what's the guy's name with the white hair in it? Frank Brown? Do- Doc, Doc Brown. Yeah, Doc oh, Emmett. Dr. Emmett Brown. Emmett Brown, right. yeah. And Einstein. Einie, if you will. Yeah, of course. Um, well, watch Back to the Future. Uh, no, the specials. Special, oh, oh specials. no, the specials. Okay, I've got, I've, I've got one. Oh, great. Thomas, go. I love it. Okay. Uh, big Trouble in Little China. Huh. Schindler's mm-hmm. List. Yes. Okay. Ye- that little girl with the red dress has she big trouble. The, she gets to the Holocaust camp. <laughs> and she's like, oh boy. Big trouble, little China. They say, oh boy, way too much in that movie. Oh boy. <laughs> they say, oh boy, way too much in that movie. They go, hi, No, they don't do that. That's they don't do that. Someone no, was telling don't. me last night that they grew up with a man called Jimmy Doidlebomb. That's not true. <laughs> I spend- Wait, they grew up with a man? What does that mean? <laughs> it's real. In their house? Name. Or meaning no, just, just a friend? on the street. Oh, okay. like family Wait, friend. some guy on the street? Full name, Jimmy Doidlebomb. <laughs> I can't believe that's true. <laughs> was it a comedian that was joking with you? <laughs> hey, if your no, name we, is Jimmy Doidlebomb out there, uh, uh, let uh, us know. Call in. Yeah, any Doidlebombs out any there. Any Doidlebombs. We want to know you. We, please call in. <laughs> Isn't that insane? I love it. I love Doidle it. Doidle bomb, Jimmy. Doidle bomb, <laughs> Jimmy. Jimmy. Take it down on that Doidle bomb. <laughs> <laughs> but we do have other guests to get to. Uh, they, I, I have never spoken to them before, so this is very exciting to have new people to talk to. And, and this is what's wonderful about this podcast: it's just new people cycling through all the time, just you know, making new friends. And I certainly hope I'll be making friends with them. Uh, this is a uh, a seaman. Uh, and I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Uh, please welcome uh, Captain Littlemember and his first mate, Squawks. Hello, guys. Ah, hello. Hi, happy to be here. Now, I'm wondering which of you is which. <laughs> that's... <laughs> Who is that? Is that which one of you is which? What? <laughs> well, that's my first mate, first mate, Squawks. That's hey, Squawks. I'm Squawks, yeah. Hello, Squawks. So... And this is the captain right here, Captain I'm Little Member. Captain Little Member, on account of my tiny wooden penis. <laughs> You have a tiny. Don't ask him about penis. Lost the it. normal penis was shut off by uh, a ten pound cannonball. <laughs> a ten pounder. Just nicked. Did, but when you oh nick, wait, it went, went right by. When it you nick like the a... meat, it goes in the sea. When you nick the meat, it goes in the sea. Can I ask you a question, Captain Little Member? Of course why, you can. If you're going to replace your penis with a wooden penis, why not get a giant wooden penis? <laughs> <laughs> the thing with prosthetics is that you want to be accurate. <laughs> oh, really? So that's what they do when you go in. They say, "Okay, you're gonna get a prosthetic penis." They ask you for they the say, exact measurements. What were what were the what were you working with before? Would it be too much of an emotional uh, change for you to suddenly have like you, you don't have big dick energy? So pirates never lie. <laughs> you don't want to be living a lie. 
I was going to I was going to go add myself a few more inches, but Squawks talked me out of it. I <laughs> Why would you do that, it's Squawks? It's the perfect amount of space for me to pop both of my little feetsies on. I'm a bird. Oh, I didn't want to say well, you are a bird. I'm a bird. You're a parrot. But I fucking love meat. And so you perch upon his wooden penis? I perch upon his little penis. So it, We got there quick. You you must always have an erection, or do you swap it off out with a with a bigger <laughs> wooden penis? <laughs> No, 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 no. You can't replicate a soft cock with a hard with wood. piece of wood. That's no, true. I swap out me tiny, hard wooden penis <laughs> for a limp sea slug cut in half. <laughs> Cut in half. Okay. Has to be realistic. A normal sea slug would be too big. Too big. Okay. It wouldn't make any sense if my hard penis reverted to a longer, softer dick. We're not I all see. about his penis, though. Okay, well, we, I mean, we steal he, money. We do all sorts no, of no, things. No, but he introduced himself saying that his name was due to his tiny wooden sure. penis. I just want to cover oh, all of that. Oh, but don't get me wrong. We also steal cocks. We steal cocks. You steal? What does that mean? You we steal them? We take the penises of our victims. <laughs> Anytime wait, wait. we so steal you kill someone first, and we then... take the ship and say, "My goodness, look at how many dicks and balls are on that thing." <laughs> yeah. Usually, it's like two to, two balls to a person. <laughs> two yeah, balls yeah, yeah. to every boy. <laughs> <laughs> wait, are you a fan of the Beach Boys? <laughs> Love them. <laughs> so I bet when you're out there on the sea. Listening to the Beach Boys just must be a magical transcendent experience. Oh, nothing like me and Squawks ah. humping the waves, going up and down, nothing uh, with a, the light wind behind us. It's beautiful. Listening to Surfing USA. It's cruising around to the... <laughs> Early Beach Boys. <laughs> nothing, no, none of this... Nothing That's post 65. No yes. way. Uh, no uh, way. What am I looking for? Animal sounds. Animal sounds. None yeah. of that. Pet sounds. Pet I sounds. Animal sounds is my favorite album. <laughs> well, I would imagine. He does it. love a good cue of all Have the various sounds animal of sounds? animals. Is it just sound effects of different animals? Yes, my record. Oh, you put it out. Yeah, do you want to hear any songs? He's, yeah, let me hear actually, track 12. He's a pretty good impressionist. He makes all the sounds. All the sounds, yeah. He's a yeah, yeah I get the concept. Them. Let's hear track 12. Track 12 is a song off of Billy Joel's The Stranger. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so this is just other Wait. songs from other albums? Well, it's cover things, but it's done by animals. Different oh, okay. animals. You'll see. Wait, all you'll right, see. Stop being an asshole. I'll see. I'll see. I'll see. Okay, I'm okay. sorry. Okay. You see? I'm not really getting the melody from that. It's there from The Stranger. There's a woman to me. <sighs> oh, okay, yeah, I we sort of see it. We thought it'd be funny to do an animal thing, but about a woman. I sort of see it. It's kind of like when you, you, you do a Christmas carol, but on a keyboard that just has the, the sound effects. That's right, Captain. Things. It's like Mario Paint. Remember Mario Paint? I love Mario Paint. <laughs> oh, are you a gamer? <laughs> well, yes, we've got all the consoles on board. We're on there all The wind day. in our sails, listen the to the Beach Boys and <laughs> consoles at our feet. <laughs> What's your favorite the game? Secret what are you of Mana playing for the Red Dead Redemption? We sit down on a beanbag full of balls and we play our video games. The secret of Maya okay. is what I mean. So you're, you're, you're traveling around, you're playing Zelda or whatever. Sure, sure. And then you come across other Which ships. Zelda? Link to the Past? I don't know. Ocarina of Time? Ocarina of Time, probably. Sure, Nintendo 64. Uh, sure, we're taking turns on that one, boy. Oh, yeah. And then anytime you encounter a ship, you board it, cut off the cocks and balls of whomever is on board. And leave them to weep over their loss of manhood bleeding out under the hot baking <laughs> sun. The only respite throwing themselves into the ocean to be eaten by the sharks and other scoundrels. Are you taking anything on that's on board or are you just... Just the meat, boy. <laughs> just the biggest treasure of all. <laughs> meat. Meat. You seem to be coughing a lot, uh, 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 Captain. Coronavirus. <laughs> oh, no. You have the coronavirus? <laughs> and proud. <laughs> oh, you're proud of it. Okay. All right, just keep your distance. Take it down that's okay. We recorded this a long time ago. We don't know what the full effects are of it. <laughs> yes, that's true. Pretty risky joke. <laughs> yeah, it is. So now, wh why did you get into this uh, whole pirate kind of thing? I mean, uh, did it, did you just start off as a sailor? And... It's a family business for me. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, yeah. So your, my... fa your father, your mother? Uh, my mother, My mother was a human being. She was a pirate, and my father was a, a pirate. Wait, and so they had sex together? Yeah, how else am I talking so well, you fucking piece of shit? <laughs> <laughs> I guess it makes sense. How was, did your dad ever talk about the, like, how the sex was? Oh, yeah, he loved it. It was great. 
<laughs> I can only imagine. When I was really, the first thing I heard when I was born, he brought me up to the side. He goes, you want to know why I fucked that human woman? <laughs> and I said, yeah, I'd love to. And she said it. And we talked about it for a bit. The, wow. The you mom was a human. Your mommy was a human. Mommy was a human. Dad I thought was it was the other parent. way around. I thought you initially said it the other way around. <laughs> but oh. I mean, you, you're the one who knows, obviously. <laughs> well, anyways, uh, Squawks here had a boat and no captain. And then he saw me. At Where'd a- you get the boat? Me, I stole it. You stole, who'd you steal it from? Captain Blue Dudes. Captain Blue Dudes. Wait, is this part? Was he? I can tell the, you the tale of Captain Blue please, Dudes. Please, I would love to hear. Do you need any sort of sea shanty behind you? If or? you don't mind. All right, here we oh, go. Oh, the year was seventeen seventy-eight. How I wish I was in Cherbourg now. Wait, are you telling the story or saying oh, the story? Oh, Mark came from the king to the scummiest vessel okay. I'd ever seen. So there I was, I just was a little bird flying around, around with a human girl. voice, of course. Of course. And I saw a ship. This ship was unlike any. Any other ship I had ever seen. It was a cruise ship with only Disney employees on it. So it was a Disney cruise line. Shut the fuck up! Oh, Listen sorry. to the damn story! Thanks, you Captain. scurvy bastard! So I get in there and I fly in pretending I'm that fucking parrot from Aladdin. People go nuts! Iago. Shut the fuck up, sorry, scurvy! Sorry, you just quit clarifying. piping up, you rat fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Hoorah! What does that mean? Uh, I think it's an acronym. I don't know. Fuck you! Boring! Okay, so we get there, I pretend I'm that Iago guy and I start I start killing everybody on killing board. Killing everybody. I have to. As a pirate, I need to steal what I need. So you're not just taking their, their dicks and balls at this point. You're not just yet. murdering that them. That was an inspiration from the captain. <laughs> okay. Yes, we'll get to my tail as long as your dick later. <laughs> so there I was. <laughs> Flying on that wheel, taking care of the whole cruise ship, now deceased. Hmm. But I couldn't get my hands around the huge wheel, and I knew I was destined to die. You could only perch on it, I would imagine. That's correct. Yeah, okay. And there I was, a boat full of dicks and balls, nowhere to go. And I saw him, like how people talk about how Jesus comes to them in their dreams. <laughs> Well, I'm, I'm flattered. <laughs> <laughs> what were you actually doing, Captain Little? I Member? was humping a whale's hole. <laughs> Wait, so you were out there on the sea? He was on the sea. <laughs> I was on the seas, doing me best <laughs> with my real life fleshy dick. And there I was having a go at a whale's hole. And how did you go out, get out there? You had no ship. I, I, I swam off the docks. I saw it from a mile away, and I said, that's mine. <laughs> hold my beer. Did you say, hold my, you said hold my beer? Really? <laughs> that's true. And I plunged into the blue. I gave Is that it where a, that, that originated, that whole hold my beer? I can't take like claim. I'll give it to him. It was him. Oh, wow. I bow me head to you, sir. <laughs> and so Did I, you see the hole originally, or just the, the whale itself? I saw itself a great you? spout of water and said, where there's a spout of water, there's surely a hole for me. <laughs> Very <laughs> smart. So I swam out so there. swam out there for a mile. Up to it. I can only me. imagine you didn't catch up to it, that it was coming towards you and you sort of met oh, in the middle. It was head to head, tete a tete. We knew one of these, one of us was getting fucked and it wasn't going to be me. <laughs> okay. How would the whale fuck you? You don't want to know, Squawks. All you right, don't Captain. want to know. Sorry, Sort Captain. of like the way your dad and mom got together. Oh, I can I tell imagine. you a detail out of Oh, yeah, hour. please, yeah. Okay, so the parrot, first of all, the mom, my mom lay down and then the parrot took out his big old schmoops. <laughs> You were saying <laughs> well, it ended there. I went to the I went to the whale and I took out my big old schmoops. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> and I, I put it in the blowhole. Wait, at the time it wasn't big. It was just bigger. Oh, big for him. Big for you. Okay, big for me. It. Are you yeah. kidding me? I was <laughs> pushing two inches. <laughs> wow. Anyways, I slammed it in there. Sure. And uh, it blew out the water and it blew me dick off. <laughs> Wait, I thought you said a cannonball. Well, let me finish. He was in the okay. air from that, and I shot a Disney cannonball at him. It shot off his pecker. He landed, and I go, well, pick your dick, man. We got a billion here. It's true. <laughs> One of the only Disney cruise ships with sails and cannons on it. <laughs> you know it. So this is true. <laughs> this is 100% true. How Why would we sit around no and make it up? Why would we make it up? So you, were you upset at Squawks here for blowing your penis off? Or, I mean, I can only imagine, like... Initially. Initially. But he said, he said the pirates, uh, he said uh, the pirates code. The pirates code. You said the pirates code. Yeah. Okay. What is the pirates code exactly? Ye who know the pirates code, know for which the bell does toll. The pirate ships and sails all day and watch that dick, it goes away. So if it's gone, I'll make ye trade. A ship for a cock is what I'll say. Cannonballs, they fly away. But our friendship here is here to here stay. Here to stay. Wow. See? 
So that made you feel better. Oh, of course. Nothing like hearing the pirate's code. <laughs> of course. If you've never heard the pirate's code before, and then suddenly you hear it, it's there's amazing. nothing like it. It brings a tear to me eye even now. If you hear it the second time, there is something like it. It's the first time that you heard it. We'll yes. never say it again. <laughs> You'll never. never say it again? That's what? it. It's 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 expendatory, you see. <laughs> oh, I see. Wow. Well, what, what a wonderful friendship you have. And then how, how many years ago was that? Oh, wow. I mean, Ooh, um, uh, last, August, last I August, I think. August, so I guess well, almost only a last year? August. Yeah. Wow. So this is sort of a new friendship and a new uh, Less than a year, yeah. profession for you guys. You yeah. guys have been uh, out there traveling the seven seas or? Well, just a couple of them. Not all seven. Really? Which ones have you hit? Oh, uh, we hit one and two. <laughs> one and two. Yeah, not all seven, though. Okay. Well, what's one and two? Exactly? Mediterranean. Okay. That's a sea. Yeah. And the I and the Iberian. <laughs> okay, so just those two. Well, They're we next door. I ship. How did you get coast. here? It's a big ship. It's hard. You know what I mean? How did we you flew? Here? We did. did uh, you flew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Qantas. Yeah. <laughs> Qantas Airlines. They have great first class. Okay, so we didn't have any money, but you'll be surprised how many people take dicks for currency. Oh, that's one of the hottest commodities on the whole black market. And we're flush really? with it. Yeah. Wow. So how many dicks have you collected? I mean, this is. Oh, oh you want a number? That might be tough. I'd have to check me later. Ledgers. Uh, did you bring your ledgers here? I always bring me ledgers. <laughs> okay, well then it We're wouldn't be so tough. We're trying to sell a show to History Channel. Oh, really? How's that go? Oh, that's why you're here. You're yeah, pitching? Yeah, we're in L.A. We're trying to pitch. pitch. We're just pitching. <laughs> okay, well, uh, uh, you have your ledger open. Uh, mm -hmm. Give me a number here. Let's see. Take your time. That's about, that'll be about 13. Uh, Take your time. 13, eight. Uh, Take your 13 trillion, 800 <laughs> <What>? billion. <laughs> wow. Keep this going. is the testicles? 245 <laughs> million, 271,000, and one. Dicks. <laughs> so you must have double that in balls. <laughs> Actually, come to think of it, that's impossible. <laughs> there are many people in the world. Well, well, I mean, been... not now. You, you've killed them I all. I have to say something, sir. I've been providing fake dicks to make you happy. What? <laughs> Why'd you get upset, Scott? You just I, this met is, I mean, Yeah, I'm not upset. Squawks, I mean, this is just... you've been lying to me. Captain, it makes you so happy. But pirates don't lie. But I'm a, pi I'm a parrot, not a pirate. Uh, Oh, parrots do lie? Is that the... Is, <laughs> parrots don't... Parrots they, they just don't understand, do right? But lie. you told me parrots don't lie, unless... <gasps> that was a lie. lie. I'm sorry, I'm a cockatoo. You're, you're not, not even, you're a, not a, even parrot? a parrot? <laughs> what, no. was your, what was your father then? My dad? Yeah. My dad was Dusty Springfield, that's a woman. Right. <laughs> so your dad was a woman. <laughs> and who was your mom? My mom was Harold Ramis. What? The what in the whole wide world? How did you come out of cockatoo? Okay, I lied again. I'll tell the truth. You can't even, you can't tell the truth for one second, because can you? Because I don't think people will respect me. Just tell us the truth. We we'll respect your... you. I've been selling counterfeit dicks by the trillions. <laughs> and made a lot of money doing it. <laughs> yeah, so why are you yelling at me? Well, because I want to do a good old day, honest work of selling real well, meat. Well, there's Scott. Now's your time to rip one off and show the world you can get oh, one for real. Oh, no, I, I don't think that you should rip my What do you use your off? cock for? This is how we do it usually. What do you really use your penis for? Yeah, yeah, we usually pull the crew. <laughs> yep. Come on, what are you going to miss it for? Well, yeah. Urination, essentially. We'll give you something to urinate into. Like a bag situation? Like a <laughs> yeah, you're concerned about urinating into your penis. No, no, no. I want it to. <laughs> <laughs> That's how Squawks thinks of urinating. <laughs> I like it to go into the bowl. Like, that's my favorite part. You just have a sit. Just take a sit. Remember the old song from the show, I sit down when I pee. I don't remember that song. What is that? It's, sing a little bit for us, would you? <laughs> all I remember. That's from, all you remember. It's from, we used, we get, we watch a lot of Adult Swim on the ship. It's oh, from an old <laughs> Tim and Eric sketch. Sounds like a frat house. <laughs> yeah, we have a couple black video light games, posters. Talking about dicks. Other than the listening to the Beach Boys pre-65. It's not all we do, you know. <laughs> what else do you do? What are we your do interests? Other things. Oh, we know. We are very big social activists. We care about the environment. Really? Yeah. What do you care about for the environment? Like, what part of it? That it burns in hell. <laughs> the only way we're going to get there.
Wait, you think we're not going to go to hell unless you well, pirates need accelerate to go to hell. the... I've ever been a pirate to the Caribbean, the Disney ride? Yeah, yeah. And basically, you I guess get they're to always talking about like Davy Jones Locker. Is there that hell? There you go, sure. Hmm. Is that the message of the story in that ride? The message of the story is really at the beginning that the, there's an actual part of the ride that there's half human, half skull, and you get to see the pirates turn from human to skull. Yeah. Did you know that? So they're in hell and they're haunting us? Are ghosts all in I, hell? I don't know if they're in hell there. I think they're just When do they get to cursed, hell? Aren't they cursed? But you're the one who said that they go to hell. Listen. Aren't you? Aren't you mixing it up with the haunted house at all? I don't think so. You used to How work at Disneyland. How many times do you go to Disneyland? I go to about once a year, twice a year. <laughs> Squawks loves it. I do love it. Do you? Do you get in for free, or do you have to? Well, like, I'm a bird, so I just fly in. You? Oh, yeah, yeah. I he fly knows. In. He knows a pretty popular actor. Do yeah. you think that's why they? Have not given us jetpacks and like flying technology yet because everyone will just fly into Disneyland. I think so, yeah. Well, there's a no fly zone over Disneyland. There is really. Mm -hmm. So how do you do it if you want to land in Anaheim? You got to go around. You, you, no, you land in Anaheim. But there's an, there, well, there's an airport there. <laughs> How do you know all this? Are you, I mean, I'm studying to be a pilot. <laughs> what? You want to switch from being a pirate to a pilot? Yes. Well, the idea would be. To not only command the seas, but to command the skies. Then we have two out of the Whoa. three. What about with, the Earth? And with a push of a button, our Disney, our sailing Disney vessel with cannons will leap into the air. Like wow. an airship, like Final Fantasy. Or like Sing Mask. Do you remember Mask? I love Mask. The it's share like movie? Transformers, but or... it was a TV show where like uh, different cars turn into things. No, okay, so not the Mask and not Mask the motion picture. Ah. But <laughs> Finally, you did one parrot or cockatoo thing. How do you trust that anymore, though, Squawks? How All can right, I trust I'll that you you're even I a am. bird? Uh, you're not what a bird, you, are what you? What did you just say? How can I trust you're even a bird? You just said, if I'm to believe it, that you've been birthed by two humans. Captain. How do I know you're not just a man have that's you? crawling around on me wooden penis? Have you time? ever seen me fly before? Well... I didn't need to. You told me you could. Oh. I have to tell you something. Unless. <laughs> what? What's your unless? Go ahead. No, I want to hear Which one think. of you wants to say this? I think we're about to say the same thing. I'm a mouse? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what were you going to say? You're Captain. not a bird. <laughs> yeah, well, I well, mean, it's not wrong. <laughs> So you're a mouse. I'm you're a mouse, a mouse this I whole time. I just didn't think you'd respect me. Of course I wouldn't. I fucking hate I mice. I know you do, but look. Mice are the demon's taint. They're the no, squids. Captain. They're Cthulhu's captain. breath. Captain! But me, aren't I your friend? How could I be friends with a mouse? A little mouse who perches upon your penis? <laughs> I'll prove myself to you. I'll prove myself to you right now. Scott, pull down your pants. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. oh, 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 he's biting my penis. Here you go, sir. <laughs> Thanks. You really mean it? It's yours. You have earwolves. Cock. Oh, God. Wow. The guy who directed Between Two Ferns. Mm, oh. By the by, the southerly winds. By those? <laughs> I never thought I'd see such a magnificent well, piece before. What, you think it's magnificent? Really? It's glorious. I mean, so much pain, but I'm, I am love a good compliment. God, this is just, this is how it looks, just resting? <laughs> yeah. Wow, you get a, you get a long soft. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a, it's a shower and a grower. Oh my goodness. So it shows really well, but then it also grows on top of it. I'm tempted to reattach just so I can see what that looks you like. You know what you should do? What? You should put it on yourself. <gasps> then that's you'll get what some you just of his said. power. Squawks. No, he said reattach to you. Yes. Oh, oh. No, but that's a way better idea. I should steal it. Take off your, your tiny wooden penis. Oh my god, I've never put seen it. Put on this my before. penis. Here you go. Here's here's that trash. <laughs> okay, that's I'll, yours I'll put now. on yours. Wow. Well, and let me just perch on that. Okay. okay. Wait, you prefer this? Yeah, it's easy for my mouse feet. Okay. All this old time, I thought it was a little bird's claws. Can I just can I just say right now what's happening? You're about to fix Scott Ackerman's penis onto your body. Yes, just a standard pirate behavior. Okay, here we go. Here I go. A little spit will do it. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> that feels better. Oh my god. Your whole personality changed. Hmm. <laughs> 
Wait a second. Well, well, uh, well, pr- announce a podcast. Pretend like you're about to bring us into Comedy Bang Bang. Welcome to Comedy Bang Bang. It's exactly That's you, That's exactly Scott. my voice. And now what do and you sound like? wait a minute, though. All of a <laughs> sudden, by the southerly winds, I sound like you. Oh, my God. Who do I stay with? Oh, God. perch upon me penis, young squawks. Oh, that sounds pretty peculiar. <laughs> Scott. That is exactly the That's voice so Scott of sounds. mine. <laughs> Ye have stolen me voice. Well, you don't sound anything like me. <laughs> <laughs> I sound exactly like you, you scurvy swab. All right, now I'm taking your woodcock and giving you my little fucking mouse dick. Go. <laughs> Oh, hey, Squawk! Aye, oh, it's me, Captain of the Seven Seas. Wait a minute. Stop this right now. We're not playing musical cocks a minute further. I'm tired of it. Well, we have to go to a commercial. Do you want to throw it to a commercial? Squawk! Of course. Here's one of the patented comedy bang bang Commercial. A perfect imitation, Squawk! Scott! We'll be right back, Squawk! <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, oh my gosh. Uh, if you heard our last segment, and, and I pray that you did. Uh, Who you, was that? Who, uh, I just came in the door. Who was that outside? That There was a, a pirate and a little mouse who we were oh all god. playing musical penises, and we all switched penises and took over our personalities. Oh my god. And uh, at the end of the day, we all said, you know what? I kind of want my original penis back. And uh, so I took mine back, and now I'm back here. And uh, Understandable. Captain, Little Member, and Squawks both had to take off. But we do need to get to our next guests. Uh, and you've just been hearing them say things like understandable and who was that. Uh-huh. So you are <laughs> chomping at the bit to hear exactly who these guys are. I'm uh, sure. Please welcome to the show Still Tanton and Bill Ranton. Hey, how are you, Still Tanton? And Bill Ranton of Tanton and Ranton. How are you guys? Tanton and Ranton. That is, uh, what, a company or a... Uh, what it's is definitely that? a business. It's definitely a business. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> so that is true? Yeah, it is definitely. The Tanton and Ranton. We, Tanton uh, and Ranton. Yeah, we're a business. We, uh, we take industrial waste. Okay. And we repackage it as... Uh, Those yummy little fruit roll-ups you're eating all the time. <laughs> Well, you, you like fruit roll-ups, right? Right. I love fruit roll-ups. I mean, uh, there's not a day goes by that I'm like, hit me with a roll-up. 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 Fire away. 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 And Ranton. Oh, that is your jingle. Yes. Amazing. So you guys take industrial waste. What is in industrial waste exactly? Oh, um, excrement, scabs. Scabs. Scabs, excrement, are, blood, uh, scabs. Are people throwing away scabs and then those get separated from the real trash? Uh, nuclear offshoot. Brown water, gray water, black brown water. rice, uh, regular brown rice, rice. Yeah. quinoa, <laughs> quinoa is industrial whey waste. protein. Really? Yeah, bile. I mean, I don't enjoy eating it, so I, it, I'm not surprised, honestly. Well, but. you'll enjoy it after we get it through. We, there's a process we do. So I, I know hot dogs are taken from all kinds of things, all parts of the, you know, pig's sure, anuses yeah, and all sure. sorts of stuff. So that's you're saying sure. that's the process for fruit roll-ups? Oh, you ever see the movie um, Snowpiercer? Yeah, I saw Snowpiercer. You know, of they take all that waste and they kind of make those bars for everybody. To know? Sure, yeah, protein bars. Yeah. <sighs> Wait, you sound like you're falling asleep. What is going on here? Sorry, I had a you long are, night. You have been. Still had a really we long, had a long night. night. You're like the Leaning night. Tower of Pisa. You're just like, or you're like this. This one guy I saw in this video where he was like, he was wearing like a white gangster suit and he kept leaning. Oh, and he kept, are you talking about Dirty Diana? Are you talking about Smooth Criminal? Maybe? He was. He was talking about uh, Michael Jackson, Smooth a Criminal, criminal or something like that. I yeah. A long night. I shouldn't even say it. I had a long night. Last oh, night. well. What were you doing? Come on, oh. don't. Come on, Bill, don't. No, no, I, he should He should say it. It's, uh, please say it. What were you doing last night? I was dancing. You were dancing? Yeah. Wow. Um, all night? All night long, yeah. One of my things that I like to do to get out my powers is dance. Powers? Mm. Still has been blessed Oh, with thank you, Bill. The power to bring fire... From his fingertips. Yeah, that's me. And 
anus. Oh, there it goes. And um, those two things, things are not opposite. By the way, <laughs> some I would things... think it would be the mouth and the anus. Maybe it would make more sense, but it's oh, the fingertips in the anus. mysterious ways. It's true. Go, really? And in order to get the power out, in order to get that poison out, he's got to dance the night away. I have and to. so we have uh, we frequent many dance halls in. You Los go Angeles. together, really? We well, love it, he yeah. needs a sponsor mm. because he has to be just. High out of his goddamn mind. I gotta mind. be fucky duck deed or, or that fire goes crazy. So you're not a sponsor like in the traditional sponsor no, sense. No, you're, you're supplying him. I gotta keep him fed. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's the opposite of a sponsor. So it's like the finger to the asshole. Right. I it's, wouldn't dare because I don't want to get burned. <laughs> nice. But by the way, it's not just me. I mean, Bill has powers as well. You have powers as well? We're, Bill uh, has the ability. Uh, ability? Nice. That's funny. That's funny. Uh, oh, that's well, funny. Very good. Thank you. Very no one's much. ever said that to you before no no one has ever never made... in my damn life and how old are you i'm 45 and loving it <laughs> you love it bill has the ability to make anybody uh, tell the truth he's like a truth oh, to i anybody. wish he was here on our last segment we had this I, I think it was a mouse but i don't even know that's weird we wouldn't understand yeah <laughs> you know what of course I mean? you don't. Like, what a weird sentence to say to yeah of course you don't understand no oh! i mean do you have a bed I could lie down on? No, of course. I mean, what do you think? There's like a Murphy bed here in the wall? There's that not, would be there's not a That would be fantastic. <laughs> there is not one. Two Murphy beds, please. <laughs> you can't order Murphy do beds. Do you have any pillows for me and Bill? You can't just order things. This is not Sir, like a hotel. I have one billow, one billow for <laughs> Bill? Have you heard that one before in your 45 years? Never in my life, and I'm <laughs> loving every minute of it. <laughs> so you have the ability to make anyone tell the truth. Yes. Mm. And still, you have the ability to shoot fire. fire. out of my ass and fingers, yes. Uh, yeah, and which do you prefer? Does it come... Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, that's funny. This is funny. We uh, we were not sure funny. of that for years until one time oh, in time. Nassau. Hmm. Not at NASA. No, Nassau County. Nassau. No, mm -hmm. Nassau, the Bahamas. That's it right, was at Bahamas. Atlantis, the casino oh, okay. resort. Right. And um, we were down, we were going down the water slide. Oh, there. so fun. Have you ever been there? I've oh. never been there. Please stop oh, yawning into good, the mic. This yeah. is, and try to speed up your talking. I think that maybe that'll help you with the. Uh, maybe we'll tell the story. Well, we're going down the going water, down the, the water, water slide. slide. And here I was. Oh, yes, this is going to be the first podcast that puts people to sleep. <laughs> Keep going, Bill. We were going together, you see, and I Come grabbed on. him. I grabbed him. I said, oh, "My God, still, still yeah. you want to shoot you fire out of your ass. ass?" And you then want as, to? Soon as, as did, soon as you did, I, yeah. I said that you, you shot, that, fire, out shot of fire out of my ass. ass. So he made me almost. He willed it to happen, and he boiled up all the water. And yeah. then all the other kids behind us oh, squeaked no. to a stop, yeah. clogged up the water slide, yeah. and had to be cut out of it. Oh, yeah. well, thank God they are they're okay. I thought you. Were going to say they all boiled to death. They were trapped, they for, were trapped years. for years. <laughs> years. Now they're grown-ups and they have a story to tell. There's a special on Netflix you can watch about it. Oh, okay. Called Boiled Alive but Still Kicking. Wow. And so you sort of triggered his mutant powers? Or I don't, did you, no, no, did I you give him? him? No, don't be so silly. I just speak the truth. So mm. anything you say happens. Just, maybe it's not truth. It's just you actually maybe. are. Try something. No, See, I, just, go. I just said that's what you wanted to do, and then he did. That's, I did. That's yeah. up to so, him. So say something else that. Say something to Scott. Come on, Bill. Do your thing. Oh, um, you, uh, you are. You want to donate to uh, the Trump campaign? Well, of course I do. I mean, oh, he's God, you just got you just got billed. <laughs> That's what you call it. You've been, You've been billed. billed. <laughs> You've been billed. You've now been billed. Now pay up. <laughs> Can I sign up for electronic billing? <laughs> That's oh. a funny thing. Have you ever heard that before? <laughs> Never in my days, and I'm having the time of it in my life. <laughs> so you are just altering reality with anything you say. You're like that kid in the he's cornfield. Like, yeah, he's like the kid in the cornfield. I'm not familiar. Not Stuart Cornfield. Oh, not Stuart Cornfield? No, no. Red Hour Productions? <laughs> no, of course not. <laughs> <laughs> You're like the kid in the Twilight Zone who just like wills things into being. I, I guess Bill is short for will so huh. 
Have you ever heard that? Never in my life, and I'm having a great time. <laughs> well, so, I guess he does have the power to make things happen through the truth. So yeah. you don't really, I mean, well, you have powers, but they're it's not. <laughs> Sorry, my tea was getting cold. You were saying? You blew up the entire. Well, now who cares? You know what I mean? What yeah, are we not going to hear? Who that got I played? I suppose it was a little far-fetched that we take industrial waste and turn it into fruit roll Yeah, I was so, going to say, some of those uh, ingredients don't don't sound like they would belong in a fruit roll-up, but I, you're... Well, I do have a habit of going to the swirling cesspools of industrial waste and oh, saying, yeah. I think you want to be a fruit roll-up. Oh, and yeah, then, maybe that's what does it. Huh. huh. How long have you had these abilities, Bill? Oh, well, as long as I can remember, and I'm 45 and loving every goddamn You're having a great it. time. I'll tell you, Bill has been living his life in such a beautiful way lately. How what's what's different? Tell him how beautiful was it? That's oh, what I was I'm sorry. For. How beautiful was it? Uh, it's so beautiful that that guy, after almost winning the Oscar, walked over everybody. The, uh, Roberto Benigni. Thank you, <laughs> Bill. <laughs> he did win the Oscar. Life is beautiful. You, yeah, you think he, did. he didn't win the Oscar and he walked over <laughs> yeah, everybody? Well, I remember is that, that he did be win the Oscar and he walked over everybody. He goes, "Well, I gave it to my best shot." Just, uh, oh, if only my friend Ben were here, he could text Billy. Billy who? <laughs> oh, never mind. Billy um, Crystal. So, oh, do you know Billy Crystal? I don't know him. But Billy Crystal is a person who makes all the champagne, the Crystal champagne in the oh, world. Okay. I only I know Billy. Moet. Do you want us to bring him in? Oh yeah, please. Hey, what's going on, Billy? Billy Crystal. I don't like him. Uh, go, All right, go. here I am, still again. Um, so where do you hail from, Bill? I hail from Vermont, home of the cheddar, baby. <laughs> That's why I'm making it. Money wise, <laughs> I understand. Thank you. It was a long walk to get there, but <laughs> you well, we really pulled it off at the end. end. God damn it, is he living a great life? Oh, Jesus, not looking back. I'll tell you that. He doesn't much. have and to. You, and you remember your childhood and everything? Of course. Well, I suppose there could have been one instance. Oh, Bill, don't do this. Well, I'm just, he's, he wants to know. And You're I'm, bringing up stuff he doesn't need to bring up. Look, I mean, if it's painful for you, certainly you may want to bottle it up, but I, I would love to hear it. I it's, typically like to look forward and not back because I'm loving every goddamn minute. Sure, it sounds like you're in the present, not really looking forward. <laughs> yes. What is forward? For, uh, oh, if only my friend Thomas were here. Thomas Damn it. who? M uh, Thomas D. Hiddleston? Yeah. Oh, Can if we only he were my Hiddleston friend. In? Oh, I would love that. Thomas Hiddleston, are you here? Hello, I'm Thomas Hiddleston. Hey, Thomas. I saw you on Broadway. Oh, not familiar. <laughs> All right, goodbye. That was a cool guy. What a cool guy. Not aware of his own work. Um, <laughs> Loki, tell me about, Loki. Tell me what happened in your childhood. There was one instance, you say? Well, I suppose this might have something to do with it. Mm. I was on a swing. <laughs> Please. <laughs> the reviews are in. Please. Sorry, Stop, we're tired. Sir. <laughs> you see, you are the you're one who's tired. tired. Don't, don't bring I Bill I got my 40 this. winks because I won't function without them. Yeah, you only sleep 40 winks? Life. You know what? I was on a swing set. I was about five at the I time. I can't believe he's telling you this. And I was going swinging back and swimming forth. And sure, my, typical my, swing behavior. My father was saying, how high do you want to go? I said, as high as you can. He was course. pushing you or he was coaching you? He, w he was coaching me. He said, out with your legs now, in with your legs now, out, <laughs> out with your legs, legs now, How high do you want to go? And how high do you want to go? I said, as high as I can. He said, out with the legs and in with the legs. <laughs> <And> so <laughs> out I went and out I went of the swing. You and I flew God. hurled out of the swing. and up and I went past the clouds <laughs> And I went out of the atmosphere. What? I went past the moon. Past the and moon? Lo and behold, I was circling around the sun. You were in oh. orbit along and with I the might Earth? might as well be walking on, on the sun. Ba, 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 <laughs> Wait a minute. Well are, you, are you a Smash Mouth fan? And the massive doses, you have to understand, of gammas sure, and betas sure, and ultras sure, and radies. And, and the alphas? And the alphas and the... Omegas. And the... Those, and the Charlie's. Zetas? And the Zetas. Deltas. And the Golfs. Yeah. Mm. The, no, the Gammas. Anyway, Gamma, 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 a B. Let's <laughs> play on the W. The w, 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 w. Yeah, I thought you were like going into the Ramon song. Gamma, I thought you gamma. were doing Revenge of the Nerds thing, but you were doing Double, 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 Yes. Anyhow, I was absolutely oh, yeah, blessed. He was. I came back red as a baboon spot, landed <laughs> back in the swing. You landed in the swing. That's the most amazing part of this. Not the flying up. Really? Not into the orbit. Oh, no, the no, that I all understand. My, but the, the pinpoint accuracy and to you land. Know, you know, my father, insensitive as he was, he just 
right back at it and pull <laughs> those legs. <laughs> really? Push push. Those legs. He, he didn't comment upon your appearance, Not the, as, uh, the your hue, because you were no. as red as a baboon's butt. <clears throat> mm-hmm. My mother would have, but she had died at the time. Oh, she, oh what did what, what happened to her? She couldn't stand the uh, radiation bleed from my own body. Wait, she died when you landed. It's yeah, true. She took the hit. Basically, she took all the bad. Yeah, from so, you. so uh, if anyone was in like sort of a circumference around you, they yes. would really. So but your father I, was unaffected. He died later. Sadly, I have to live with the fact that I killed my own parents. Oh, so he was far enough away that he didn't get it Yes, my mother was in the swing next to me. Oh! So it's a matter of feet. What yeah. a terrible, terrible story. Anyway, uh... Where, how were you raised then? Who raised you? My dear friend, still. So that's where I he came He was a in. year ahead of me. <laughs> Wait, you were six years old? Six years old. And can I tell you that I went through my own turmoil, my parents? Really? What happened oh, to you? Oh, my goodness. Well, my mom was very bad at making ramen, right? You have to, to understand. Doesn't sound equitable. Well, let here. us finish, please. Oh, okay. You have to understand. This was the 70s. 70s. And a ramen lot of ramen. all the age. Okay. All the age. <laughs> oh, sure. Ramen was all the age. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, of course. Ramen is age. not good at that. And then my dad had this funny thing. Anytime he said a number, he'd go, that's a funny number. So, like, I was just being devoured. These don't sound like equitable problems. Imagine I mean, your prob- this. I mean, Bill, your parents died of radiation poisoning. Uh, their skin too. bubbling it's in front too. of you. It's, yeah. it's bad too, I and guess. And your, yours sounds slightly annoying well, imagine occasionally. Imagine going, uh, what number are you, sir? And they go, two. Well, uh, what num- uh, why would anyone say, what number what? are you? Listen, you, you have, have to remember understand. it's the 70s. He, he was in a lot of queues. A lot of oh, queues. I see. Okay, he when you go to a deli or something. Yes, we went to the number the D-E-L-E? The D-E-L-E. The notorious D-E-L-I. Mm. Anyway, so I saw Bill, and I said, what happened? And, you know, of course, you heard the story. Yeah, uh, He basically killed his family. You no, know, I heard, yeah, mm. everything. And they, they... You were six years old at the time. I was six years young at the time, yeah. Right. And you have to understand, they took me in. I don't have to do anything. Well, you have. We'd just, love to you to understand. If you could just okay, for us to understand. <laughs> find it in your heart to understand. Please find this a way is better to phrasing. Understand. I appreciate yeah, this. No, you have we, to. We, he took... He, they took me in... And they said, from this moment forward, mm-hmm. don't look back. Mm-hmm. And it's been 45 years, and, and I'm you have loving not. every minute. So you lived with his parents then? Yes, my yeah. fucking okay, terrible they, parents. Okay, they raised you, not, not well, still. Well, no, no, over. no, let us finish, Well, uh, they Bill, uh, still had to keep me as a secret. That was, yes. Oh, you were a secret the brother. under the stairs, if you will. You have to understand, for about 22 you years, I was completely Again, hairless. Just yes. ask me to I understand. Was, <laughs> no, you must, we'd, you we'd must really, understand, uh, please. We invite you to understand. <laughs> that you were hairless? We're that I was hairless to accept you. that invitation. That I was absolutely hairless. No hair. And before you... Uh, this is due to the rays up in the space. Due to the rays, and I was... Sun. R- red as a, on the sun. Oh, dee, dee, oh dee. great jam. I was dee, 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 red as a dog's dick. Oh my god, couldn't be more. <laughs> Did that never faded? You were red the and hairless the Well, come 22 years, <sighs> as we all know. Of course. Now we're in 1990s. That's, when a, when a young boy hits 22. That's half life. And I uh, I so grew wait, my wait, you were hair. 27 at the time, meaning 22 plus 5. Correct. Correct. Got it. Oh, boy, you're sounding like his father. Oh, God, Jesus, with the numbers. <laughs> That's a funny number. What are you talking about? That's what my dad does. Uh, he's Do you a, have a bed I can bring in here? No, we. we this is not a bed the, store. The trouble it's not with a his hotel. father is he was, an, a, a he was an, I was a CPA. He was an accountant. So he would, it was on and All on. the time. That's Just a funny cut. number. So he worked with numbers all day, and yet... A number would pop well, up that he hadn't seen in a while this. or imagine he'd never if you seen? Could, imagine if you could just be with your favorite comedian all day and night, and that just makes you laugh. Mm. That's what it was like for numbers for him. He'd see a number and be like, that's a funny number. He would just think they were funny. Well, what like was watching the Chris shape? Rock all the time. Was it like the, con- watching, uh, the, yeah. the, the the what it was divisible by? Well, what was funny what about number. it? The eight is a very funny number, he would I mean, tell it looks me. like a snowman. Well, tell what, me. What you need to understand here, Scott. Please, again. What you, s- please, s- please, if you'd be so kind, beg we beg for you, you to understand. We're on our <laughs> knees. We're on our knees. Is right. that, is that uh, Still's father mm. was hit in the head severely by yeah. a bear's paw. Yeah. How hard, I mean, I, a bear, when it takes a swipe at you, that's, so it wasn't hard. the claws, it was just the, the force It was the, it was the, the soft impact. part in between the sharp parts. Oh. Uh, the bear didn't swipe at him. No. no. He was in an accident he didn't swipe where left? his head collided with a bear's yeah, paw. Yeah, he got into an accident. So it was a stationary paw? That's oh, a stationary paw, yeah the, yeah. the bear was actually waving at us. <laughs> so it was waving. Yeah. The accident, the, the force of the accident hurled him, what, through a car uh, window? Well, my, my 
my now what had happened was I do this. Don't prayer. get ahead of yourself. Scott. Please stop. It's, take it down a notch, Scott. I will take it down a notch, but not because you asked. That's me. funny. So for for we me, we would be delighted if you if understood. you could, if that's all right. For me, I had tied my daddy's sneakies together okay. because I was a rambunctious little kid. Okay. And he went to step, and when he went to step, he actually fell on a trampoline. So he took one step and into a trampoline. Into a trampoline. <laughs> one of those big that, ones. One of those big trampolines. You need, oh, we, you you simply. <laughs> Please, we, you, you have no. <laughs> would mean the most. We need you to understand <laughs> this if part. Okay. Okay. Th- I'll give you one. It's a large okay, trampoline. Need, it's a large trampoline. <laughs> All right. I will understand that. And my dad went bouncy and went right up into the air into the woods. He, now he landed though. He did not go into orbit. Right? Well, no, he went up into orbit around the sun. He went into orbit too. Yeah. What was going on sun. in your hometown? Oh, was it the, the atmosphere? Erie, Indiana. You know what I mean. It if was Erie, Indiana. Oh no, wait, no, Erie. someplace in Vermont. Oh, yeah, Vermont, the Erie, Indiana, Vermont. Oh, Erie, Indiana, Vermont. Oh, Erie, Vermont, comma, Indiana, comma, Vermont. No, Erie, Erie Indiana, Indiana, comma, comma oh. Vermont. Oh, got it, got the it. The city is called Erie, Indiana. Got I really it. wish you'd understand. Erie, so it's, how's it spelled? E-E-R-I-E-Y-N-D-E-A-N-R. Eriander. 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 Indiana. Yeah. Vermont. Vermont is V E R. So there's something something going on with the gravity there. Goes around the sun, of course. It's a Native American town. Goes around out for that trampoline. He comes back right next to the bear, but hits the trampoline again. Can you imagine? Oh, the bear was right next to the trampoline and and waving. The bear was waiting for his turn. It was insane. And I go, Dad, you've done this two times. And he goes, That's a funny number. Went back up into the air. Twirled around. And then the bear tried to give him a high five. And oh, okay. See what we've what we were describing. You is have the to time, understand. Is the time simply when his father got it collided with a bear? Yeah. How he got to where his brain was tickled by numbers is a completely, <laughs> totally different, different story. story. Yeah, Do you course. want to know that story? I want to know that story. Well, he yeah. liked. He loved the Count on Sesame Street. Oh, okay. I mean, That's that guy is funny. Story. It loved just him. sunk into his brain as sunk a child. Loved into him. Well, I, of course, I can imagine him becoming a CPA due to that. Yeah, I, mean, I guess yeah. so. I don't know. Well, what, so so you guys grew up together, your best friends. I raised him. Your business partner. Well, yeah, I mean... He's more like a father to me. Uh, really, you were a hairless he red... more like a father to me, Billy Joel. <laughs> Billy Joel, our, one of our last guests was talking about Billy Joel. I wasn't yeah. here. So you were uh, uh, hairless and, and red as a baboon's butt red until 27. Dick, dick, dick. And meanwhile, your ersatz father over here, mm. who's been raising you and keeping you secret, did, did your parents ever catch sight of him? Or? No, I said it was just a little dog that needed a little bit of love. So they saw him. Well, they saw a red little hairless thing running around the basement, of course. But what we uh, implore you to understand... You must here, try so. your best to implore to understand <laughs> is that um, once we were 18, we were as free as the as the driven we're snow. <laughs> you were free as the driven snow. Yes. And that's when we... <laughs> Fully explored our true potentials. Yes. Okay, well, now you hit 18 before uh, Bill over yes, here. Yes, by did. one year. By I was one 18. Year. I was a lost little boy. I wish someone could take care of me. Did you, did you keep it in check until he hit 18? Well, or I were tried you... to be an adult and I just couldn't do it by myself. And okay. then Bill became 18 and said, Now I'll take care of you at, like at, you took care of at me. At that time, his powers were maturing. He couldn't control. So you had your powers. have to understand. He couldn't control when the fire came out, how much it Thank came out. You. And we deduced by a series of events, by a Lemony Snicket's series of unfortunate mm-hmm. events that cocaine and dancing I needed it. I needed was it. the key. <laughs> okay. That's what Bill told me, at least. Uh, well, that's, him. I mean, you said it and willed it into existence, is what I he think. He built I mean, it into existence. Yeah, sorry, build it into existence. I was touching him and I said, My God, I think you need cocaine and a good cut the rug. And we did it. And since then, things have been better. So been marvelous. We you, haven't looked back. You got the powers when you were young. So there must have been like all sorts of uh, escapades that happened when you were young I mean just like all kinds of things just going down I mean it, it sounds like a oh I mean you you mentioned lemony snicket I mean it sounds like it, it, this could be a children's book series or Whoa. something Whoa have you ever thought about that? About My god turning your adventures into Tanton and Randon so the log line yeah please <laughs> young boy gets thrown and, and orbited around the sun sure. gifted powers and must use his gift to keep his best friend, who's a pyromancer, in check by dancing and snorting cocaine. Is that what you're suggesting is a children's I book? Yes, that is. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I would fudge some of the details Your for the life kids, depends but... on you understanding this, Scott. <laughs> okay. See, this oh, is shit. what it's all up to. Things are getting serious. Yeah. I think you have come up with 
perhaps your single greatest idea <gasps> ever. You finally did it, Thank Scott. you! Oh my god! It took a while. So you guys are... It, it took, took a while. A while. <laughs> So you guys took are gonna, a while. It took a while. <laughs> Walking on the sun. So you would do us the great honor oh, if Tenton and Ranton Publishing, because we do have a publishing arm. We have a, <laughs> we we have a publishing arm. We, pu we publish children's books. <laughs> <laughs> You'd, why? I don't know why you never thought of well, that. Well, I think finish. you knew if you're going to come in at the end and pitch something. Of course. Big don't bang. Okay, I that. did a little you bit of research knew. and knew that you guys had a, had a pod. You knew. Yes, well, um, if you'll come in uh, next Next Tuesday and pitch to the board. We'd love. There's it. a board, really. Yeah. So wait, you guys board. don't own. What are the owners? We're the owners. We have a board. We own a board. <laughs> this is a ceremonial thing. Uh, oh yes. God, you get in there. There's going to be all sorts of ceremonies. <laughs> what kind of ceremonies do you have in these board meetings? It's there? very cloak and dagger. It's very hush hush. Okay. Can't find out until you pitch your first children's book. Yeah, very you skull and bones. You have to be a member. Okay. Wait. Okay. So you're going to in, uh, induct me into the membership? If you've got what it takes. <laughs> What are you looking for? Do you've got Someone what it who can takes? keep a secret? <laughs> I don't know. I have a very popular podcast, and we talk about all sorts of weird stuff. It may come up at well, certain points. Well, tell us your biggest secret oh, now, then we'll know that you can keep as it. As long as it comes, doesn't matter which direction. Come on, still <laughs> Bill. You said as still long as Bill. it comes up. <laughs> that was I, a little late. I swallowed a hamster when I was six. What? Is that how you have the gift of... Pitching incredible children's stories. Wait, I have the gift of pitching. Is incredible. it the hamster that's really the? So hero what here? happened? <coughs> Let it talk. In the whole, <coughs> the whole Let it talk. talk. <coughs> oh. Hey, you'll never catch me! <laughs> oh, oh my, my god. god, did you see that? Was that the hamster? That was the hamster. I always thought he was dead. Oh, I never knew a hamster could talk. He, th I guess he was. He's been in there for let's see. I'm 29, so six, uh, so 23 years. Oh, that's a funny number. Well, Scott, <laughs> yes. just to be, just to cl clear it up. Yeah. Mm. Pitch me a children's story Good. now. Um, now let's see if you have what it takes. Okay, uh, okay, there's this um, uh, 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 piece of trash on the ground. Okay. Um, You're it, nothing without your hamster. You're terrible. Shit! Piece You're of terrible. trash. I don't know, maybe it talks? It doesn't it even have cocaine in it. <laughs> I just, I mean, it's, Does the trash dance? No. Then what are we talking about? I don't know. I can't pitch these ideas. Oh. I'm too dumb. You need your hamster. I'm too dumb without him. Oh, God. You're becoming very dumb. No, I'm dumb now. Oh, here's a the Rubik's hamster Cube. Was Try smart. to solve this Rubik's Cube. Oh, what are colors? You just ate the Rubik's oh, Cube. Oh, oh, no. oh, God. I'm dumb now. Here's so, a... looks like you need me after all. Hey, hamster, get back in my belly. Get just, him, Scott. What do just I like get fat bastard. What do I get out of it? Well, anything I eat is half yours. Deal! Oh, get in here! <laughs> oh, God, I'm back. Pitch me a book. All right. Uh, Pitch me a book. Making it, it nice. Here we go. But it about who's naughty or nice. nice. It's about a piece of <laughs> rock. Ackerman is pitching a book. This is good. And this is all in the book. It's about a piece of rock cocaine that dances. I love this Sold. fucking book. Do we have a deal? Next Tantan Tuesday comes to the board. Baby. Get initiated. <laughs> Congratulations. Okay. Still I mean, tented after all these years. <laughs> that is true. Oh, oh. Well, I want to thank our guests, the aforementioned Still Tanton after all these years, and Bill Ranton after 45 years. And, and loving every minute. You're loving every minute. Uh, guys, thank you so much for being here. Thanks to our previous guests, Captain Little Member. Squawks and of course <laughs> Alan Buchanan, JJ and Murphy O'Malleman, Joey Tortellini, Edmund Carlisle, Lyle Cummings, Mitch Slocum, Slippy Daniels, uh, hey that's me, Turd Dunkweed, <laughs> Caitlin, Don Donaldson, <laughs> Tommy Middle D, and Benny Schwa. We will see you next time. Thanks. Bye. <laughs>